<laughs> First match for the What the hell is happening? What the hell? What the hell? Oh, what the hell? My 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 my, 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 my French people? No, no. No, it's mud, it's why? What's is mud. it? Is it actually mud? Okay. Is it muddy, muddy yes. men? It's mud. It's not that muddy. It's well, not muddy. It's no fucking shit. The, the second map was oh. muddy. I mean, the yeah, second but... map was bad. Oh they, really? On they Lotus, were, they were adapting really slow. I mean, for, look, take a look on VLR and look at Footscom. Well, they ran literally no yeah. initiator. They ran no initiator on Lotus. On Lotus, Lotus no initiator. Yeah, Sage. Oh yes. god. They literally just fucking aimed them. And they just aimed at them. And Dude, they, now that I'm yeah. back, you're allowed to win, Common Core. <laughs> just. You're allowed to win the next five <laughs> rounds in a row, Common Core. I did call the map at 4-2, saying Common Core were going to wrap this up. Because they looked like they were really well drilled. But then Adol, J Trippy, they... going wrong. Thank you for the resubs. Going wrong, thank you for the, really thank you for the tier two. Like, they've just been... F they Attack side were frying Tomasey. Tomasey was kind of feeding with his positioning on the B site, and they were just abusing the shit out of him. Uh oh! Yeah, as soon as they realized Thomasy was a weak point, they just fucking yeah. Abused. They were just knifing every time they farm up Hunter's Fury. They would knife Hunter's Fury, get a kill on him in two separate rounds. Other rounds, they would just send it with Util and players. Yeah, I don't have the jersey on yet, but I mean, if they start making a comeback, I'll put the jersey on. We're going full superstition. Oh uh -oh. no, Martin's died uh -oh. twice in two rounds. I've been okay, watching. that's a captain. Yeah, I mean, the pit's down, but Thomas is also down. Um, Do they realize Mr. Fallen's here? Oh no, Mr. Fallen. They no. Yeah. Oh, oh no. Heck is coming in. The tweet is coming out. It's Finny. Yeah. I did that's say that this was gonna. I did say that this was gonna be a weird week for Comic Core because they've got two matches this week. It's difficult to prep for two like good teams. Because they're playing both, yeah. like, they're playing two upper middle of the pack teams. That's, yeah. that's, better than that's quite the foot, My foot stocks are finally here. Yeah. I think I turned up too late. If I was here on time, they would have won. <laughs> uh, what were you doing? Were you house shopping? No, I had a meeting with my accountant. Oh. Ah, oh. business. Fascinating. Yeah. I was, yeah. I was, I was borping. I was businessing. Can't prep for the foot comp. You don't need to prep against that Lotus foot comp. You just read the comp, see they don't have an initiator, realize on your defense side that they don't have a good way to clear a rubble, fight over it, post a player there every round, and then stack them towards BC and then win. Which they didn't. I mean, well, it literally was that simple. Like that should be something very simple to adapt to. Really. Consistently being able to reach international events. It looks like they're back on form with a two to zero start to the season. If they can get Where's this one go? These next five rounds. Aligning it with the constellation. Again, they're probably going to fucking exit like way before it gets there. Though. Yeah, there you go. Um. Well, oh, dude, there's no way you have to clear it. Get a jade, surely. Dude, he is his entire. The recon is just down. landed right now. Yeah. Oh, and it, oh, and they just get and the energy killed four of them anyway. Dude, it's not looking good for Carmen Core. I didn't see what happened. I'm gonna pretend it didn't happen. <laughs> it did happen. It wasn't looking oh, good. The jersey's coming Christ. off. I'm a fake fan. Lou, hey, thank you for the 16 Let's months. Let's go. The tweet. Ah. I can't wait to tweet that out. They played. We all predated. They played worse than KC last year. It was bad. At the yeah, no but that way. one. I don't want to agree. There's no way no, they played did, worse did, than KC. No, I'm KC asking. Last did we all predate? Oh yeah, I think you did. Yeah, I think it was a plateau guarantee. guarantee. It was a guarantee. That was also a plateau guarantee. Yeah. yeah. Ah. Uh, I've never watched a Valorant uh, match before. It was over fast, not gonna lie. Well, that, that was probably not a good one to begin with. Oh, Christ. That was a good one. I quite literally just watched you guys guarantee this on YouTube when I realized the game was ongoing. And it was match points. Oh, god damn. I was away. I can't believe it. Sliggy look like I mean, he's withering away <laughs> watching Lotus. And they could have won map one as well, to be fair. I'm going to have to do a VOD review of that. One, map one was like, winnable. And they played the no game. duelist on buying. What's the next one? Vitality plays against somebody, right? Heretics? Heretics. Good game. Oh, it's a good game if Vitality actually turn up. But they didn't turn up in the game against Navi. 
The ideas were good, but the actual execution of it was was cowardly. Did you see the Lotus comp? I mean, I'm gonna go and look at the VLR page. What what is going on here? Common Core versus Foot. This is a tough to read tweet from KC. Yeah, the top of EMEA is interesting. What the fuck? Stop linking. Stop linking me Martha Stewart tweets and baiting me into reading them. This was not a Common Core tweet. This is Martha Stewart. <laughs> God damn. Okay, so unbind. All right. KC had a lead. They won pistol, lost the follow up, and lost. Oh, no, and won the map. Okay, so KC win bind. Despite doing a little bit of bag fumbling almost. Oh, they're running a no duelist comp on bind foot. Yeah. Wow. They didn't go B. They yeah, I mean, th this comp looks like it's great for pressuring back site, but difficult to actually get into the site. Literally, on they only went to B when they went to A and then TP'd. When they realized everyone rotated. Huh. It's the only time they went deep. And then on Lotus, they run Jet, Sage. Dude, how is Crax and CNED both on Sage, top of the scoreboard, map one and map two? The Sage players are dominating. What world are we living in? Sage is like one of the least meta agents currently. What an unusual comp. How on earth did they make this work on Lotus? How are they winning they, uh, honestly, nine rounds on attack side with this? It's got, no, they, it's got no exec power. It's got no nope. re-clear mid-round power. Nope. It's got no exec power. <laughs> nope. How what you does don't understand it win? Is Yeta J runs down C and just gets three kills. He just runs it onto C and get, kills three. It's a simple strat. Very what effective. What the fuck? I mean, when when Foot <laughs> obliterated Liquid by just winning every single aim duel, maybe we should have saw, seen this coming. We said that during Plat Chat that it was a... Um, that, oh, you know, if KC lose all the aim duels, then maybe it'll be a big problem against Foot, but they're not going to do that. Meanwhile... Yeah. Meanwhile, yeah, if, if... this happens. I mean, I do think that Kamiko, their approach versus that comp was not very good. They were too passive on, on defense. Yeah, I'll do like a review of it afterwards. Yeah. Oh, God almighty. I mean, to be honest, it looks like the first half of the breeze didn't go that badly until the end, but... Oh, God. Geçen senenin fanatik pearl mapi gibi full ban 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 gitmesi istiyorduk. Ama demek ki bir yerde bunu yapmamak gerekiyor. Apparently silent. Thank you for the resub. Grubs, thanks for the resub as well. Commend, thank you for the hundred bits. It is looking quite red right now, the color, to be honest. Yeah, I'm back. The jersey's off. The text of speech person Big cannot fan, yeah, even fan. fathom Ingerland. Uh, you have Fridge Stone in your chat, bro. I want to listen to this. Mm. Players' main character in Breeze, like Y2J, Cypher, CNET, Jet. These are our main characters, so we all gave them and do something in three days. Oh, comfortable. Vlasi, very, very quickly, I'm glad you mentioned CNET, Jet. Do you think that is his best agent? That is that something that you need to keep doing for you guys to keep winning? Yes. <laughs> I mean, we agree, we agree. Uh, thank you very much, uh, guys. Congratulations once again. Once again, thank you, Mo, for translating as well. We have another great match coming up. Uh, we're going to go to a quick break, and when we come back, Team Vitality will be taking the stage against Team Heretics. Let's... So, unfortunately, they didn't really say anything about stuff, maps that weren't Breeze. It looks like those other maps were the most interesting ones. <laughs> I do really like those outros from you, Mia. This comp get a, we get this much value, but the sage trolls were kind of fucking them up. And they were trying to flood defense and trying to trade each other. That's fair enough, but just a fundamental misunderstanding in terms of how to play against a comp with no initiator. I'll tell you what, the color's still blue. 
The color is still blue. I know That's it's fucking it's pure great. cope for someone. No, who's it's never not. It's not pure cope. It's not pure cope. I don't give a. I don't give a fuck what happens in the game. I don't give a fuck. I turned up. I missed the entire match. The color is still blue, goddammit. They're gonna come back, they're gonna shit on gentle mates, and they're still gonna do really well in the yeah, playoffs. They're gonna shit the on color is mates, still blue. In spite of everything. The color is still blue. But this, I think, is the worry that, like, the top of EMEA, like, could you, like, there is a chance that they miss Shanghai because Heretic's foot and fucking Navi or Fnatic get it together. Like, that's the worry. Yeah, but then they just need to turn up in playoffs. You don't need to worry about, yeah, but... like, this game. You just need to worry about them turning up at the end. Beating gentle mates is a weird flex. <laughs> Dude, foot top of the group would be crazy. Yeah, if you what? have uh, if you have oh, an alternate oh, transition, man, the top of that group could be crazy. That, the top of that group could go crazy. It really crazy. could be crazy. Perfect foot, Navi, and, and Heretics all competing for first. Game. They they man, lost against good. Foot because they're prepping for the French rivalry match. Oh, I'm, Jesus. I'm, Look at the cope. Like, this is just <laughs> actual cope. That is pure cope, but you did say that on the podcast. Yeah, but I haven't watched the game. I'm just spitting out the same narratives. <laughs> uh, like, why would you spend all your prep time on the worst team? What do you think of Boo's glow up this year? After. It's pretty incredible, isn't it? Ooh. I mean, apparently the, the rest of the team still really believed in, got BBL believed in, Boo. in their group. And... So, what I think happened, Oof. Robbie was that the previous Heretics team was so horrendously was dysfunctional. And if I had to read between the lines, it's probably because Mixwell was already on the way out to retirement and didn't really care. And... What did they do to the wilderness? In they had time? massive personality clashes with Zeke because they just, like, the way that Zeke exploded out of the team um, seems, 11 11 seems like very mind. bad vibes so what, ideas to me. So, I would imagine that the... Atmosphere was just impossible for Boo to play around. First loss, you and guys it's not are like afraid. You don't understand the color is still blue. Exactly, still that's what I'm afraid. fucking saying. That's what I'm, I'm saying. Still fucking afraid. Have some, have some faith in blue. Okay. I would love an interview. I'd love to hear from Eng about what they thought. That Bren, when has Carmen Core ever let you down? When has Carmen Core ever been a bad team Madrid? or a bad organization? When have they ever lost? When have they ever bombed out of tournaments? When have they ever been a bad team that used to run bad compositions? Never, never. Last year didn't exist. That's not a no. me when I've woken up from a fucking coma. Like, <laughs> what is this guy saying? <laughs> uh, guy said that they overcooked on Lotus, rubies. but it was for a good reason. He said like they like cooking new comps, but it's much better if it works. Of course, they wouldn't need to play Breeze if they haven't missed a flash through a smoke on Bind in round twenty three. Huh. Well, I mean, I didn't watch Bind, so that doesn't mean anything to me, but I will do later. Yeah, Breeze was comfortable since we're all I'm trying to get Siege yeah. chats. very difficult. It's very difficult to get to get Siege. I've been trying to get my farming up because you guys were fucking Dude, flaming me. I think it's so funny you know, that we got Sliggy to look at 36. 3D Gooning. Thank you for the 12 months, Cavalry Archer. Vanity called you out. This is going to be Martha Stewart again, isn't it? Leafs KJ didn't look good, by the way. What is this? What is the... Uh, where's this come from? This is, these are from, these are yeah, from where, stats where like... Come from? These are from stats years ago. Watch the clip. I've been a massive Leaf believer, but from... He played... Um, hmm. Only three maps of Killjoy last season, last year, and they all didn't look very good. Uh, yeah, I mean, I can respect Carmen Corm if they want to put their fucking full prep into Gentlemates so that they don't lose to the other French team. Okay, wait, but this is just wrong. Vanity's pulled it from a different roster. Vanity, okay, why would Vanity pull out receipts that he knows are just gonna get counted? Dude, it's like. This is crazy. You look at what... Okay. LCQ. And then during the season when Cloud9 actually played with that... With the roster that wasn't uh, the one with Vanity on, right? Where are, where are the games? Welcome back once again, everybody. There it is. Um, there it is. Where's the other one? 
before he gets here, I just want to... Uh, I mean, it's not even... Mm, where is it? Leave. There it is. Okay, so he played here, here, and here with the, with the actual C9 roster from last year. And he was bad in all three of these maps that they played. And these are the three that I said. And then Vanity's just brought out two games that I wasn't talking about. <laughs> What's the fucking... Huh? Hello? Hello? Look at the first reply. Only three first bloods? Yeah, what? For example, what happened with Lotus, but um, I love how they're doing, how they went from testing stuff into relying to such... Every time he played Killjoy yeah, with that version, the, like, version of Cloud9 that played stuff, the full time, it, kind of it looked bad. Surprising to see them running some of the comps they ran, like... Vanity's the comp replied to like, that? Oh, okay, what? But he, he said they Baiting sack yeah, of shit? Agree. I mean, <laughs> that was a definite... What? I, mean, <laughs> I don't understand. Okay in the end, right? <laughs> I think when it comes down to it, though, it, it's so crystal clear that they are a momentum team and they just win oh the reply below that chat i'm not just gonna scroll through twitter just, comments it, it's like they level up in the game it's like they're like a moba <laughs> but yeah i don't i don't think that's a good counterpoint because i was talking about the game progresses and then the games that we've seen from him such a funny and name. i thought There's that killjoy no was his weakest role previously <laughs> that is but I guess, so funny this i mean if they thought blog post called goon watch 420 i also i talked to leaf and he said that he wasn't feeling comfortable playing Killjoy last year on Pearl. So that's why I was surprised that they put him on it. Because his stats weren't good across three, the three maps he played with the roster. And that... Um, Dude, for farming! And uh, yeah, and I talked to Leaf and he said he wasn't that comfortable playing on Pearl. But... Like I said in the rest of that clip, it might have just been map related. That they were playing there looked really good, and then here it's like they're running in a straight line. They're not clearing the boxes. Like multiple times they're going to retake B. They don't clear behind the uh, the half wall thing where where the tall box is. They just like run in a straight line to the back of the site and get a shot on the side. They're not clearing basic things like CNET on pistol round is able to shoot three of them in the back. Like oh, none of them look down. That's so beautiful. I it's beautiful. beautiful. You've never like, hit it. those three bullets yeah. in your life. But, <laughs> yeah. but, the, but the, <laughs> We will have a chance to talk about Casey again because Kukuku just again. calling out Steel. Let's move on to our second match of the day, of course. Uh, it is funny as well because one of Steel's most famous up, iconic plays ever is failing to shoot people in the back. And play a game of truth or cope. I'm gonna give you guys a statement, and I want you to tell me if this statement is the truth or if this statement. 3D gooning got banned. That's very funny. It's raining. Very, very. Right off the bat, and we're seeing. There's something called plugins these days. I want you to get involved. Nokia explaining exit from Giants. Congratulations, by the way. I love seeing you so much on the show. Yeah, yeah. We're saying you can come every day. You're one of us now. I'm gonna explain the game to you real quick. All right, what's this? Okay. Main reason, role difference. That's the main reason why I love GX. Also the reason that yeah, the team stagnated yeah. hard and we couldn't get the results we we'll wanted to get. And the third one, I think I play better different roles and I need to play those roles instead of filling on something I don't know how to play. I agree. Thank you for attention. Be close okay. Yeah. I mean, the, the role that Nuki was forced to fill in the like most recent seasons it's not it's not him yeah but i i did think it might have been something to do with like ideas clashing and he didn't mention that so i suppose maybe that doesn't have any weight to it at all it's the sage yeah <laughs> what, what, uh, why why do you think it's a uh, foot uh, esports why do I believe that this is... Okay, this is either going to be another Martha Stewart tweet or it's going to be us predicting Carmen Core. What do you reckon? It's us predicting Carmen Core. Of course it is. Of course it is. So I'm thinking it can be played, but it will not be meta breaking. I think it's Omega Cope because... <laughs> Omega Cope. Omega Cope. I'm trying to, you know, use some more Zoom or lingo here. I think the reason why it's Cope is because the way that they played it, especially on their defense, was no different than they would play with, like, a Cypher. And if you're going to, you know, use a deadlock over a Cypher, you're losing the camera, you're losing, like, being able to get deep trips. We didn't see any 
sort of synergy between, like, one time they tried to do the net with the, the raise nade through the teleporter to do a hookah trap. That's one time in the entire game. That's Bullshit. The time, like, passive B player. Why not just run Cypher at that point, you know? There was a couple of they ran the... They, they, <laughs> that's <laughs> that's not true. Also, uh, you know, the um, exit from hookah that you can do with the grab net and a lot of damage, especially on, like, the pistol round. Yeah, they... They, here and there. they, but again, I don't think they ran it way more you know, than course, once. Uh, but they also had more really stuff for their attack side than their defense. Play in an official in EMEA uh, so far. No one else has uh, gone there. CNET, I know you, you just said that you guys uh, have practiced with Deadlock. Is this something that you think you'd be confident to show? Dude, this music is... This music is so I mean, funky. It's like the music oh, is more yeah, powerful than surprises. them talking. I'm getting carried away. What the hell? This isn't clown music. You need to be experienced to play it. And it's, I think it requires a lot of experience. So how do you compare it to play in no duelist Sage on Bind? How? It, it's how seen would you compare Sage. it? Ah, how yeah, it's gonna be good no matter yeah, what. Someone's bussing with this playlist, yeah, but it's very distracting. Uh, how I will compare? Like, <laughs> did you did you like uh, what happened with your composition today on Bind? Is ah. it what you expected? Uh, Why don't you scrutinize teams like, during casting? I think we play good. But the, Do you think that I don't? Was, I think we didn't play too much together. It was the missing part. If we will play together, I think it would be... Do you think I only say things that are positive about them? Uh, and I think I'm actually quite uh, negative. I think our bind is still good, so... <laughs> Not like yeah. steel? So I can expect no. no. I agree, I agree. I really That's true. That. Uh, but let's move on to the next truth or cope, and this time it's Team Heretics. I'm just going to throw it out there uh, with this statement. Heretics are nothing without Mini Boo. Uh, how do you feel about this, Kukuka? Is that a truth or a cope? Definitely don't so compare to CS we casters if that's a comparison. That would not play, um, with him when he was, uh, mm. going for, um, do you think they do it while casting? I feel like played. there's more criticism on the broadcast no, but generally, very, but like most of it is um, coming from the analyst desk, from my, from what I've heard. You you agree, Sina? I'm saying like everyone no, in Valorant in general, not just yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? Why do you think it's perfect? I mean, like, one I'm not sure that is true. I think most of what people like, watch are the international tournaments, where it's the absolute best teams in the I world playing against each other. Like another good duelist. But um, I think they will play the, when you see like, these level of teams playing, there's a lot more to criticize. So are you with Kukuka or are you with uh, Sina? Look, I'm, I'm thinking like Minibu. He does a lot of good things for the team, and he creates a lot of space. He gets a lot of openings, but it's really just like a, a full team effort. I feel I like teams could benefit. That's what Finesse might was be saying. Like the, the first step or the catalyst of the, the whole thing. I guarantee that if we were much more critical than we currently are, the teams would be getting more annoyed about it and people would be saying the casters don't know shit, leave it to the coaches to improve the teams. It th There is a balance to be had and either way you strike it, people want people think the grass is greener on the other side and so we'll just complain about it. It's a it's a pointless thing to try to care about how people think other roles should be done. Bam on their A defaults a lot. And we literally just saw vanity, but you're objectively wrong on Twitter in response to your take on Plat Chat. Yeah, yeah, like, well, not objectively wrong. I mean, he was bringing receipts from the previous Cloud Nine roster. I mean, that was still in the year. It's just I wasn't including that because it was on the previous roster. But I mean, I did say he only played it three times all year. I mean, I, I didn't clarify I meant with the uh, the roster that he played with for 90% of the year, you know? So it's not like Vanity's wrong. He's just using a different data set to what I was using. But gets the info on where all these players are around the map. He did say these are two of the three maps the he played all year in a response. Oh, well then, yeah, I mean, that's wrong. It was, those were two of the five maps he played all together. year. But he just didn't double check. Yeah, again, like, he he just hasn't looked into it as much as I have. He's just seen those maps and thinks that I was I didn't look into it, basically. Whereas I did. I looked at all five of those maps, but only cho chose to really care about the three when he played with the team for a long time. But, yeah, anyway, yeah, you using that as an example, yeah. I mean, people just... People have different opinions so, about so stuff. A, a cope and Omega cope, as you were saying, you I also think being the I, I've listened to a lot of people who have a more critical personality. 
And I think a lot of the time, they miss stuff. Like, for example, actually, let's use Steel's example there. He he really didn't like the deadlock because I think he missed a lot of what it was doing on the defense side. Because he's got... He's working on a live broadcast. He has to analyze a lot of the games that are happening. He probably hasn't done a direct VOD review of what Vitality was doing, which was what I did. I didn't watch it live. I did a VOD review of it. And so I think he's just missed some of the stuff or misremembered some of the stuff that they were doing on defense. And so he's presented it very critically of like, they only did this one round in the whole defense half, which ends up actually being just objectively incorrect. The stronger you make your takes in terms of like, this is bad, the more you open yourself up to like, you might have misremembered what happened. You might have mis uh, misunderstood something. You might have, um, yeah, like, the you know, you might not have... Uh, noticed it in the moment or if you did notice it you might not have remembered that you noticed it and then you have a take that it doesn't really make sense because of you being human so the more the more harsh you get the more critical you get the more you open yourself up to also just being wrong because of your human nature of not being able to perfectly photographically remember everything that happened so sometimes it's better to have a little bit of cushion with what you're saying. Team Vitality, we've heard their scrim bugs. You know, like for example, if Steel said, I don't like it, it didn't feel like they were doing very much on the defense side, then yeah, that's fine. It's just the more precise you make your analysis, the more you open yourself up to being wrong if you accidentally did misremember something or whatever. But this is not going to be easy because look at who they're going up against today. It is team but there's, you know, there's plenty of different uh, ways of approaching analysis stuff. They took down Fnatic on this very stage and they could potentially be one of the toughest opponent anybody could face in this league right now. But hey, we saw an upset. I think it's also about the community. Valorant in general has a soft community, so that's how the casters and audience are going to behave. My question is to you. I don't think Valorant has that soft of a community. Valorant's got a very young community, but they also, they roast the shit out of the players all the time without understanding the game as well. I think what is actually the case is that the Valorant community is much closer to the pro players than in Counter-Strike. In Counter-Strike, the audience is more closely attuned to the broadcast. It's a shame that the broadcasters don't bring have been around forever. For this team huddle. The, the broadcasters have been around forever in Counter-Strike, and the players don't do as much constant streaming, constant fan interaction, whereas there are more content creator players in Valorant. There are more people paying attention to the players and less people paying attention to the broadcast. The broadcast has not been around for as long. So if, if a broadcast talent criticizes a player and there's some kind of like disagreement between the two in counter-strike it's it's kind of 50 50 like people believe both sides i think in valorant people would just believe the player and just like take the player side in most stuff generally speaking not that that's a problem but some people are scared to criticize the players because of that maybe yeah, yeah, some people have been watching CS players for 10 years, yeah. But they've also seen them through good times and seen them through bad times as well, right? So, when you criticize 10s? Yeah, I mean, I don't know what the reception to that was. It was kind of both. Yeah, so we should be getting a new map, and then hopefully they do a map rotation as well. Get rid of Breeze and Icebox, or yeah. Ascent, and then we're cooking. Valorant becomes watchable again. If you post any map, criticism well, about anybody, people that don't know, agree with no it will come out. Times people who agree with it, like, they don't like that person, no will just come out the woodwork and happen by uh, uh, yeah, Where the fuck like, do you make changes? Yeah, I think... Uh, what they might do, you know like how they released Clove after... Um, Madrid. I do wonder yeah. if they're just not going to do releases at like a normal time, like when an act starts, but instead just like base it on like where the esports events are. Mm. I think they've basically done that for the last few events, haven't they? There's always been an announcement with all of the previous esports events. But I feel like all of them kind of coincided with an act before. Whereas this the trouble one is if you do it 
Uh, After Shanghai, you you're gonna I get think so, yeah. Worst. Worst. No, we, we played that Clove, Clove we just came on a random week, basically, and didn't it? It was good, but I think it's hard to Like, the act already now. begun, but then Clove yeah, came out a couple weeks after. Whereas well, before, I think all the... Excellent. We got double Yoru, at least. Yoru, okay. Uh, what do you think, Josh? They're running the yeah, Astra Whoop with it, so... Astra... Yeah. The fucking FBX. Yeah, it's the FBX comps. I think there's a lot of cool stuff you can do with it, though. How these teams... Yeah, it's like not quite the, the FPX yeah, one though because you don't have the you don't have the jet too, right? I think FPX run the double duelist with this, don't they? they? Do, yeah, they run double duelist. They yes, don't run they the, run the cipher. cipher, which is yeah. even even worse. Yeah, but yeah, also, it, well. it makes your attack side really powerful if you have jets, uh, jet Yoru and the Astro because. You can be teleporting yeah. or dashing into smokes all over the place. Yeah, you can't really hard anchor effectively. The, the problem is that FBX have like one exec that they use on both maps. <laughs> they don't mix it up enough. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, I just... on Astra safe on Cypher. So why are they running kicks on Sentinel for every map apart from Breeze? It, the the roles seem so weird on Vitality. I would love to see them sort this shit out. Oh, Michael. Hello, Michael! <laughs> he can't hear you. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Oh, oh Jackson, Jackson and Jessica! Motherfuckers! <laughs> Oh god! The part of that video that really made you me laugh was when, uh, when, when he just points at Brennan and goes, "He doesn't talk much, does he?" Yeah. <laughs> that was so funny. Why is Josh so loud? He just is. He's loud. Saturn Resurrect. Thank you for the two months. Please hit the partner plus. Don't let my money go to waste. I will hit the partner plus. Don't worry, Saturn Resurrect. I will do that. Hypox video is so good. VJ Dragon. Ah, oh, nothing like old contact play in towards elbow. He's got a big head-to-head -head here up against Miniboo, yes, for example. Yeah. That's a very it's good it's going to be awesome if I can't win this one. Neither of them were true. They were both a lie. Uh, uh, change. Thank you for the 78 months. Of Mike as well. this is oh, sorry for running the ad break. That's yeah. deep lore right there. Who was on the first one? deep lore. I have no idea. I can't remember. Clutching onto that as an opportunity here, and we haven't seen Heretics lean towards this for quite some time. No, obviously, previously, Vitality, the 1 1 overall on Breeze, Coy, and Gentle Mates. I think Mr. X. Yeah, yeah goal, it might be Matt. Potential new look. Pass. It was, it was called Clutch or Kick back then. Shinobudaki, Clutch thank you for the tier kick. one. Me when I'm CS build. Yeah. Well, the Valorant community hadn't made its own uh, memes. Do people say clutch or kick in this game? Not really. I've, no, I've occasionally heard it though, like in a joking manner. A more fitting thing would have been like 50 gifted. <laughs> yeah. He's just going and going at that. <laughs> oh, Trex is back. Oh, couldn't have been a better timing for that. This is classic Vitality. They're going to do what they did last week. The first five rounds are going to be beautiful, and then they're just going to fall apart. Well, yeah. It comes to be done as well on the back of four kills from Trex. Beautiful timing. The swing onto the die. Bring back Matt for an episode. I. On default here. Maybe just a little so, I don't think that was wise. Clutch or gay? I don't think I've ever heard that in a game. That I don't. What servers are you playing on where people are just openly homophobic like that? But yeah, what I'm curious to see is, 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 is really yeah, I'm anti Long Island. I really so don't hear that. No, typically, we're going to see Trex in that sort of position, ready to rotate. And I guess you. I mean, people are saying all sorts of servers, so I guess it's just from Rian. common. Yeah, really I just haven't really heard that. They're cooking. Like Hold on. They're cooking. They're cooking. Do, do it's a love good idea. I'm telling you, it's a good idea. And by the outlaw, yeah, because look at them. They're all half armor. Bigger results from them, even individually, right? And as long as they save the gun. How is Mini Boo's Yoru? You you I would assume them. excellent, but we'll see. Well. Well. They're, they're gonna take this whole slide. Rian's set up, show me Rian's. Yeah, Rian's, ooh. He, he spotted Trex, but Trex also saw him. Could give some over. Trouble is, as well, you he don't know if he's got an outlaw or if you don't know if he's got the Marshal. He might be a Marshal. Now oh, yeah. Bloody hell, through the box. 
Yeah, now they know, but the problem is, it's like, well, now you're just against an attack side of us. What do you do? <laughs> I mean, they're fine. They just know, so they're going to play a bit more cautiously, right? They have an all right composition for it. With the cipher trip over to the Preds open for uh, like 30 minutes. <laughs> that seems reasonable. Yeah. It's this area, I think, that gets pressured the most when you're worried about peeking into an attack side op. It's the A, like, not letting people lurk out AMA. Yeah, halls is a problem as well. If you don't want to. But halls you can watch from, like, very... Uh, very, very deep, safe angles. He must have heard us. His ears are burning. Benji. Don't know where he is. Fine send up. Thirty seconds Everyone be left. Side. Not necessarily open just yet. Safe still here. Yeah, he's got a little gap. No, not anymore. So worried about the cage here. Really careful, safe. Oh, okay. Careful Outlaw down. Oh, he was got for the trip <laughs> yeah, he was going for the trip oh, player. I think he hit Paddy <laughs> through. Yeah, he did. Um, That's through insane. Rian, so through Benji, sorry. Me, though, little, oh, they can't pick it up either, either they're on that one. Yeah, someone's going to be stuck on a sheriff for the next buy. Oh, not if they win. Yeah, not if they win. And runners oh, 4 HP. Uh oh. Oh, oh, oh runners 4 HP. Oh, it's, oh, it's fallen oh. apart. It's perfection. Wow. Oh, God. Alright, how did, how did Paddy and Benji get their kills? Like, Benji's walk in kill was nasty, and then how does Paddy get one of Able to flip it on its head. God, that's disgusting. Look at this opener. Yeah, that's it's ridiculous. That's a 145 too at that range. The tag in the background with the recon. It's actually Benji that falls right it's in so front funny. of the head. I got really confused for a second. Yeah. This is Patty's egg that's revealed. Cool. You take him when you get him. I yeah. guess luck is on safe mm. side today, but not so much not on enough. Benji's. Yeah. Yeah, yeah not Benji enough around good. though, right? So this is a bit of a turn of events here. This is going to shatter the progress vitality we're making with the economy and everything else. So I, I close the Preds. Basically I close deal the what's friend. dealt with them this round. Time for heretics to maybe get the lay of the land here. Josh, I had the um the sideshow expats in my chat today for the first match. And yeah. the amount they of behaving themselves was off the fucking charts. <laughs> oh You've said you said an awful flash. culture. I I it was not me. Opens up a side a little bit, but it is <laughs> I mean it probably is you. Ever, ever since, I once ever got since told that the chat reflects the stream. It's been yeah, everybody's been behaving themselves. It's not me. It is you. They're attracted I, I, to the debauchery. I... Alright, from now on, you get permaban for anything horny. <laughs> me, you brought up a really gooning on the Platchat episode. Me, me, new rule. No, 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 no. Oh, God. Not the back to back ecos. Straight away. No. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's done, isn't it? It's done. Uh, oh, he's trying to send his own them. Uh, wait. Oh. Sorry, what? Rian's actually might have this. <laughs> yeah, he's just figuring it out. Oh, what the fuck oh, is this guy sorry, doing? Pause it around a second. I just need to think about the geometry of the map. What the fuck was that guy doing? All right, from now on, if you say anything horny, I'll give it to you. Yeah, he said geography. Yeah, he said geography. Geometry. Simple geography. With that fucking lineup. That was a simple geography lineup. He wasn't lining shit. Huh? He's gonna get perma banned. Tell him about the sex toy camera. Okay, but that was like. That was from 2020. <laughs> Wait, don't actually ban them, Alpha Crash. No! Unban them! <laughs> Unban them! <laughs> He's gonna have no viewers. <laughs> <Exactly. laughs> <No fucking viewers. laughs> this is how you ruin your own uh, success. Jesus, Jesus. Jesus is on the way. Oh. Holy shit. The lower. <laughs> yeah, dude, the lower eco team. There's no way. You got permit out of Josh's chat? <laughs> Who is it? I'm not saying. They're safe here. <laughs> you know that anyone... He did say earlier that if you got permit from, from Josh's chat, that means that you've probably done something very bad. something terrible because they don't ban people? Yeah, but now they're like actively banning people. Ooh, no time. No time. No time. Well, the team with low econ wins the round again.
Um, because I, I said like that Josh's chat is just full of horny posters and he encourages it. And he says, from now on, I'm banning anybody who horny posts. And then the mods just started banning everybody. Yeah. Straight up into double doors. That's a wild interaction yeah, so between Miniboo so and Runner. Yeah. <laughs> one TPing as he gets up. Yeah. Hey, Brin, can you help me? I tried to ban a horny poster inside your chat, but it didn't work. I got the message, you cannot ban the broadcaster. Can you help? <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, that, that individual you're trying to ban actually um, is the, the owner of the channel. Mm. You can ban them in other channels, though. You can ban them in other channels. potentially. I don't know, but that's going to have to put in a lot of work now. Surely this is where the team with better economy wins. Oh no. <laughs> it hasn't started well. It hasn't started well. Surely. Magamilo, thank you for the gifted sub to Kadrill. What's the problem? Yeah, maybe it was Kadrill that started the horny person in this chat. Of course, heretics to reconsider their approach for a moment. Surely. would have spotted Rians. You see the pings coming through here, maybe to invest the Viper. Are they really going to exec into yeah, the, the Viper the with Dude, the, the double the trips? got broken. These kill trips might get value. Here they come. They oh, 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 the oh that, that wasn't kill trip, so that was the... And again. They know it's a fake. Walk into the trip. Nope. There is another trip there, though. There's a trip. Anybody There's one. Box? Oh, yeah. yeah. They what? They won the 20. Trip. The mini boo got the trip kill. No way. Not or is again. that the one? Not or like is that this. the 145? Actually, five the that was the oh, 145 from earlier. Like, oh my god! Dude, there's no fucking way. This is so not silly. Like this. The team with most economy has won every single round. The fucking W. That's so funny. So that was the 145 at the beginning of the round that turned into a trip yeah. kill. Yeah. Wow. This might, we might have found our mud ball of EMEA. Hate to say it. It shouldn't be this game, though. It shouldn't be. It shouldn't be this God damn, it is. I mean, the problem, I think it's the same problem that we're seeing before, though, from Heretics, where they don't do enough uh, defaulting. They do like a, they have a preset idea of what they want their round to be when they begin. So if they run into the A stack, they haven't actually gained any info about it. Yeah, they're just going to go B. And they got the answer. The same strat that they had last time, though. Yeah, but B, get some kills. Let's see if they hit the same shots. The Shark has like got the trip, though. So. Sender's like taking first contact. Dude, he is just in. Oh, the oh, oh, no. To relieve the pressure. Oh, no. There goes Boo. Oh, oh there goes Benji. Surely this is where we get it. Surely this is where we get it. Trex stayed alive. Trex stayed alive. Trex stayed alive. No. Come on, please. Here we go. Here we go. You won't. You won't. He can pick up a rifle yeah, with the ultimate as well. He's doing it. He's fucking gate crashing, running. He didn't get a gun. No, he didn't get a gun though, and he can't save to get shot. a gun afterwards either. Okay, save one shot. Dude, if he if he gets a kill, he could ult to pick up the rifle that he gets no, by killing that, somebody. I mean, you could though. There they go. They all run there. He hears footsteps. I think he flashes this corner. Oh, he can't no, get three here, though. Check he can't get three, he has no gate crash. Oh, oh God's sake, yeah. checked it. We, we, we did it, we did it. I don't really understand how that was going to win the round. He had to... I think he just getting the plan. He had to let all three go past him there for a chance to win. Yeah. First time we've seen the team with the rifles actually converting the round here, it feels like. It's been so unstable, and you saw the danger in this round. God. I've got to say, in my mind, I mean, there was still punch to God, this. Yeah. what a game we've had. Kicks and tracks kind of whiffing really during that round. Being the player you'd want there is your All right, so now we've got some normalcy. 11 kills. <clears throat> it's a big performance <sighs> from him. 
Getting one of the longest standing players now in EMEA. Still yes, wild win Su yeah, Su They're taking a tactical timeout because they again, didn't that's, win that's the, the eco round. Gauntlet. It is right Guys, now. something <laughs> went very wrong. Well, we I came mean, in with Sheriffs and we didn't win. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I am too yeah. weak of the mud ball. You can't force the men into the mud. They must lather them, lather up themselves. <laughs> that's so true. Benny, thank you for the prime. It's right in my mind, but it's absolutely yeah, it's, true. Um, I mean, there have been some good shots. It's not been like all mud. No, it hasn't been. No, like when Benji's just hitting your guy on B with it's insane shots like it's not necessarily mud it's been a lot of like uh Heretics just pick a site, and they either they get that for kills. Yeah. Haunted God hands for you for the tier one for three months. Is that what your name is referenced to? Yes. Yeah. Um, again, we were discussing. Nico got hands. It feels like heretics, I guess, in terms of the. Did you hear about S K Rossi talking about gaming with the Prime Minister of India? In floating maps. Uh, no, you're going to have to elaborate on that one. You met him in the Mumbai <laughs> servers. <laughs> That's a nice reference. We're talking about how to fix G. What happens if Woot isn't an upgrade? I assume they just go back to Pai. That's kind of the beauty of the situation. No, we just go back. Huh? Um, huh? What is that based off? I don't understand that. Dar getting broken down holes. Yeah, but he didn't know holes. He ulted like into the outside of cave. Yeah. Oh, safe oh, lose. Oh, and then safe swings to try to find another because he's stuck. Oh, he lost. Maybe three. God, looking whiffy from kicks today. The last two rounds have been a bit dodgy. Try and find some information on the back side of this. Planted. I think Mini Boo as well clearing with Yeah, we got two Euro at the same so time. We can go on the map. What space they've got to work with. And do have the numbers advantage here as well. Mm. They need to find someone soon. Trek still has two stars. There's one. That's a good find. Great patience from runner. runner. And this is a great smoke to threaten like a lurk through from tunnel. Oh, what? Wow, he did, but he didn't get the play that made the noise. He just got Rian's kills. Uh, Trex got half. Time to come in, is If he gets the kill quickly, though. Why is it happening there? But truly, you stick for the only chance to win. He's got half. No, no it's, you, you got to stick there. Yeah. Uh, the old play to go for the stats. Classic. There's some dodgy rifling happening here. The yeah, second attempt from Kicks looked pretty horrible. And then Runner shooting looked really dodgy as well. Very relatable. I, I, always, I always struggle with rifle and breeze. Yeah, my, my aim looks horrendous on breeze as well. But I expect better so relatable. One round separating now. Sender and Boo, both with pits available. Oh, this this outlaw could go big for safe. So they go for this round, seeing a variety coming out from Heretics. So I have to see how they adjust accordingly on the other side. God, it must be annoying when you're playing against like KO like Patty, who just had their ults for multiple rounds, and you're having to just play anti KO. Let's yeah. <laughs> play anti KO setups every round, just running around the map. There goes the trip that was helping Sender take uh, space inside of his. Oh, oh no, he's really screwed. Your pit goes down, down surely. Yeah, that, that's, that's a dead pit. Nice free push on the other side. They, 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 they did a walk down hole at the same time. They didn't kill Sender. We are doing an exec. The spike is miles away. Hey, you don't have the bomb. Way! Drive by from safe. This is so sloppy. They just got the bomb. They wouldn't just got the bomb. They just fucking ferried it all the way back. Sender, how are you still alive? Yeah, he would get Patrick back on his feet, though. Sender still looking to do some damage. That's a spike. It's just out in the open. Such a weird round. Oh, we just they're all, all swinging. Wait. Uh, why are they all swinging Wait, when the spike's dropped in the open? But it looks like again, what is going? This looks chaos. dreadful. Yeah, it's, a, it's a number of rounds now. Look at it. Doesn't this look like some poo Valorant? Test. It looks like they're, they're really not showing much yeah, that was a yeah. It's looking, it's looking like they've been dragging themselves down. The, the mud is being lathered up. I feel like there's there's, there's prep work in place. They've created a fucking arena. 
They're it's waiting for the rain that, and they're getting prepared. Yeah, that is so. It's getting oily. oily. He do it again. I mean, there was a player holding contact oh, from here, and maybe to be a, generous, the others are trying to swing off. Kicks taking contact from archers, but it is getting oily. It Mostly between good. Jake and Jaws. That's I didn't want to know that. What? Sorry. What? The the. Don't worry about it. Just Jake the fan and Jaws are involving. Oh no, I don't. No, I don't know if they're oiling themselves up. They might be oiling themselves up in the fanfic. I just don't want to know it. Yeah, I don't need to know. If it's fanfic, Jaws just give off very like very twinky vibes though. So I can understand why people would make fanfics around them. I mean. Yeah, I can see why people would make fanfics about Jake as well. All right, so heretics again go for like small default into a B exec. And what does it look like this time from Sender and Safe on the defense? Can Safe do anything? Oh, it's a lot of damage. Oh, too much so damage, much damage. surely. Oh. They don't they really have a trips, though. Oh, they broke one. The center will layer it. Clear it. back side, maybe? Now Hello? The, the ward's down? The oh! oh. oh. Position at the back of the site, so they could go for this palm, but we know the vitality like that midway pressure almost, right? But out. I don't like as well that they're committing five players to site instead of having anybody... Like, now when they... Ah, well, they are. They do have enough fuel to be able to reset. Yeah, okay. They find they find their way into a beepot, a proper beepot spot. Your excitement for oil to men is bizarre yet palpable. <laughs> it's a very nice. It's a very good comment. Utility layering is just a nightmare for vitality. So hard to find the right timing to go. They've been caught again. It's not getting that springboard to I'm how heretics are playing in this pit. They're gonna make it so difficult. Yeah, I mean it's a, it's a one round. Sloppy because of the stealth fight in there. I don't it's so weird watching them. Think so. I mean what is what is the stealth fight nerf actually affecting here? Just how long the wall can stay up? I don't think that's really affecting how the teams are scaling. Comfortable approach back onto site here. I don't like Breeze. I'll say it, hot take, don't like watching Breeze. I don't think that's don't like making a difference. It. I think... I'd show me one good game of Breeze. Maybe stabilized a little bit. <laughs> this, this year. Uh, this year? Navi. Yeah, three rounds back to back is enough to kind of... Navi yeah. Heretics. The Heretics forward. cooked them. This the year? Yeah, that was this year. That wasn't... That didn't feel good. When I was watching that game. As well, leaving, I mean, Navi versus Liquid. Side, uh, Navi cook Liquid. And he's been let there was a lot. So there was some nice like, rifling in that game. Made it this deep in no, but but that doesn't mean by good. Do you want? Do you want? Do you want a game where both teams are playing well? I want to see some new shit. I want to see both teams playing well and they're throwing in new ideas I mean, and forcing. I quite like the watching Loud play against. You're gonna have to go back to Gambit. Damn, who did NRG uh, Loud? Who did Loud be here? Lots to work and no. NRG Loud? No. No, that wasn't. Give me a sec. Who were no. who Loud playing against? Yeah. That was. I thought that was like the worst NRG look. And they won, I think. I mean, it was fun watching Ethan support Demon 1 on the defense of this map. Yeah. That was, yeah, that wasn't that was anything fun. cool about it. I was just him lobbing and flashing ball and then peeking off of it. Yeah, but the timing was really good and the coordination was nice. Oh, it was Loud Gen G. Yeah. Heretics had some good ideas to start. Loud Gen G was also good. Yeah. I forgot who the Loud were playing against, but that was, that was quite a good game. Loud were very good at being able to work the map against Gen G. Yeah. But again, that's not both teams playing well. But then again, Gen G. He's comp against what Loud are doing doesn't work. Yeah, it might just really be a spectator bug, Goblin God. I think I know what you're referring to when he, like, get okay, crashed out or something. No stress, just do the things we do. No stress. No stress? I mean... Hasn't felt that way watching. No? It's been pretty Maybe stressful. Maybe you want to need the reminder. Uh, yeah, yeah. But no, I... I right, 5-5. Mm. Five, five. Mm. Run it with Yoru ult to try well. to flood defend. See him level-headed. 3-2 split again. Is this the first time we see this test here? I don't think heretics have seen this yet. This orb is about to go down. And they're all about to have their backs towards it. 
And a one for one trade. Safe still standing. Ooh, goes back okay. to the Had to turn the flash either way. He was you could, probably dead at that point. But you could really afford to slow it down if you're heretics, but they just started a fucking barrel through anyway. Yeah, I think that's heretics' problem. They are just a, a go team. Spike they remind me. Do you remember how Finesse used? Oh, oh. He's, he's seen him. Yeah. Yeah. Do you remember how Finesse used to call where he would go default into exex for almost all of the rounds? He would throw like default utility and then group up and go for a big execute on a site, and then that would let him do fakes when he like default fake, or sometimes he would just default to default. But that team actually gathered info on their defaults to indicate where they should end. And I feel like when I watch Heretics, they just throw default utility and then pick a site. Yeah, that's how I feel about watching bad teams, except... But Heretics, like, all of their preset stuff is so good when they get yeah, to the so site. They have, other, they have other traits to make up for it. Yeah, they have, like, extraordinary um, coordination. The utilities and retakes, and they're re-clearing a space. Yeah. But I, I don't think they... I don't think they're that great at using the information they, yeah. they gather. I, I, yeah. I mean, I just... I, I put it under the category. I think Kamiko has a similar problem sometimes. Well, I mean, KC have the famous moment where they <laughs> lost the Sentinels by just grouping up outside mound against them. He didn't get that. He didn't get that kill. I felt that was going to be what a one v three. He was dead on the site. There was no way out of it. Even with the pop flash, he needed the kill as well. Sent has seen at least one of these players dropping from the window. So, let's see how he responds. I think he's already calling over safe. And now Heretics have the round where they've worked out that there was that mid pressure coming out, that mid information. Flowing through the vitality side, but tracks actually with a little bit of adjustment here. I like this, but who noted anything on that? Ooh, the Fuga. We'll, uh, remove one of the trips on the way nice. In. Trex has got a really deep push down holes here. Oh, the and Boo spotted it. That seed of doubt once again. Is there any kind of reaction to that? Finding value here previously. Trex looking to apply further pressure. What's the protocol? Nobody's coming to help Just Boo to, to clear Trex out of this spot. Yeah, and Boo seemingly aware. I think previously he they was are... one that was Oh, isolated. wait, no. Now Mini Boo's coming. Yeah, drew the shot earlier. Now confirmed. They're running it as a fake, so what do Vitality seconds. think? I guess maybe a little bit of a red herring. I mean, they're going to they're going to be. Yeah, they're going to TP to be and come B. Thirty seconds. I mean, it's, it's the Viper, so maybe reading there's the lurk, but you're absolutely right. Left. Vitality seemingly still aware of the possibility it's a fake. And, and safe seems to be the one reading this really That's well. That's the timing pick before they're actually on site. Yeah. Very early. Now, do they get the success on the site? They're not going to have as much of an easy time. This is still tough, though. Seconds. There's only 15 mm -hmm. seconds. They've got to go through win. the cosmic they, divide. They time. You don't, no, you don't win. Over. Whoa. They okay. took they took ten or fifteen seconds to get oh. Mini Boo over to clear Trex out. They took so so long yeah. to respond to the fact that Boo spotted Trex. It took them forever. And again, they they had already come up with where they were ending by the time they called for Mini Boo to come over. They knew that Mini Boo was going to be fake pushing Trex away before they even did it. It's so odd. They like they they figure out the end of the round before they before they get the information. Somehow. It, yeah, this game has been... It, it, the it's so strange watching Team Heretics attack side, because it still so, works. You know, hot and cold at times. We've seen rounds and uh, moments flipped all over the place. There's been very little stability between... Who wins, side, then? The fact it's 6-6. Six, oh. six. I think Vitality's yeah, attack yeah, half, they had great side. ideas on bind, and I think Vitality. they probably still will. The opportunity on this yeah. map <clears throat> so i'm i'm expecting vitality if they win the pistol to to win this if they don't it's probably going to be crazy close thank you for the gifted sub to mud wrestle me irl <laughs> tis slothrop thank you for the nine months and i'm dougal thank you for the new tier one sub my dog is called Dougal. Like, horse to fake like they're splitting horse. They're not, they're not actually faking it. They're doing it. Yeah, they are just straight up safe is up there. They have a double lurk, though. No progress made yet. No confirmation yeah. on the side of Heritage. They have safe with the split and then a late lurk from the Astra. Oh, but I'm looking at this mid-progress between oh. kind of tracks. I guess you could argue safe as well in tubes. Oh. So they can get out of this. Runs fallen. Door open. Distraction plays. Tracks making a lot of noise. I thought he was going to catch the rotators. Nice. 
They're just trying to contact through here, double face. Paddy Tech's screwed because he doesn't expect people to contact onto him while he's playing. Oh, he shuts the door back. Oh. That's quite a nice mid-round call by Vitality there. Yeah. They're down in a 4v5 and they just call to walk through the smoke at the same time as Paddy's worried about the door being open. They fight left at the same time. Good kill. For me? Thank you, Bobby. Is that the best way of playing the 2v2 there? It's, they're so weak. Oh, what a perfect what angle that? for that. You couldn't ask for it to happen better for him there. Pressure mounting in the Red Bull clutch to confirm the first and the second. They double wow. face through, and I guess they were trying to go out different parts of the cage, the but he's on enough of an off angle here. that they actually line up. I think they were expecting him to be aiming. But surely we were the spikes by you got to Because you can't see it from here. Yeah? <laughs> That was a very British way. Let's fucking have it. Three rifles. Get in, you bastard. Those are the kind of celebrations I want to hear from the Brits in VCT. Get in, lad! Ooh. Wait. Grab, grab her on Goon? Gooning mentioned. <laughs> Apparently that Twitter account got banned, according to some Yeah, it did. Sad days. Sad days. Good job I saved everything. <laughs> I mean, maybe with a bit of work from Boo, but... Well, I mean, yeah, Boo <laughs> does have Util. He's got snake bites to slow this down. <laughs> <laughs> thank, God, thank God for my four terabyte yeah. backup drive. <laughs> what are you going to get away with here? <laughs> Great deal, yeah? <laughs> but by the way, chat, you get banned for horny. <laughs> trying to play him in. Yeah, it's yeah, going to... Well. Yeah, couldn't get the dark quick enough. He still gets one. I don't know how. The uh, problem in the defense wall there from Boo seems like a weird decision because that just allowed Vitality to isolate. Ah, getting a Bugatti way. Yeah, this. I really like the way the Vitality are approaching this. It's even though they have danger to navigate. They have much more of a, um, it's less of an exec and more of just a let's segment them off one at a time and kill them. Maybe that's the reason the dart's not dealt with before it pings out. Patty Tech. This is peak EU Valorant. Yeah. Despite what you may think, this is what peak EU Valorant looks like. <laughs> Such turncoats. I mean, we I mean yeah. NA is not we're just looking, too good. Just looking, looking too good either. Yeah. yeah, but these are top teams in EMEA. The top teams in America are still looking pretty three. decent. Top teams, Lev. Well, yeah, Lev. <laughs> yeah, but Cloud9 are never teams. supposed to be a top team. Uh, yeah. But Lev Cloud Nine was dreadful, yeah. Puts a lot of veggie fishy here, especially with that ult to boot runner. Can we clear him through? Spots nothing so far. Hey, you say that though, but this is almost the ideal situation here to get no True. real. Oh, and rum, Benji, rum. He's made it out. So yeah, runner right probably desperately pinging Benji's location out. But it Whoa, we're the playing the post plan. This is the best game. scenario. It's a full five v five. Miles now, away. Actual, actual Narnia. Yeah, you're absolutely what right. What is going on here in this post? I mean, they have they have the pull for the spike. This is crucial, so, yeah, this is awareness off the fucking charts. Don't know why he thinks they're yeah, like like well. I mean, maybe with a silver ult, you can do this, but... They have Shock Molly, they have Pull, but this retake is coming through quite quickly. All right, they don't have Shock Molly. They use... Oh, they use the Molly. They didn't use the Shock. They still haven't used the Pull. Pull is going to deny. There's a... Oh, Boo is owning them. Oh. 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 oh my god. god. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, Heretic yeah. played that about as well as you possibly can. Yeah. Yeah. They caught the mid lurk, they took a really fast side take, yeah. and it still wasn't enough. Yeah. But also, that's a breeze moment right there. But compare the way that they're playing the post pants. This is why I didn't like the fact that Team Heretics were putting five players into B site. Because controlling that window area is like how you play post plants on Breeze. You force yeah. the retakers to take site, and then they also have to 
pushing to be main. A massive win though. I thought he should. If I thought he don't win this map, now it'd be probably a throw. To be honest. Oh, then just going for a classic A split here in this round. Oh. Here comes the door opening. Swinging Brutus. Wow, choosing to fight Spike super don't care. Just literally don't care. Spike down. Alright, but now these players are going to get pinched if Paddy dies. This is yeah. really topsy turvy. Unlucky observers. Good luck. Pick, pick your fights. Let's see how well they do. No pressure, Zilf. Paddy's got to survive, otherwise, Boo's fucked. Yeah, but Mini Boo has to survive. The runner now has to survive as well. Runner's so low here. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Runner. Yeah, not Mini Boo. misery here. Left to his own devices, the spike left deep. Mm, well, this is how it starts. It's always an eco. Mm. Position, but especially in this game, it's always an eco in this game. Yeah, enough time will pass. <laughs> There's mini Buddha got the kill. Oh, Sender yeah. times that peak well, though. Okay. How do you get in? How do you get the spike? Kill them. Just win this fight. You don't have so split. In a 2v4 situation. Why? You're taking a fight when your teammates oh. are Maybe not, on the not great coordination from Sender and Trex. I wanted to see Sender Trex. go for a jump peek no, there to set up Trex to wide swing. You know what I mean? Sender goes for the yeah, little yeah. jump, yep. Trex wide swings, and then you come in with the shallow swing afterwards. That's what your boy's calming call would have done. Well, maybe not today. And then it would have got destroyed by CNET and Arthur Captain anyway. Having an indicator previously that heretics are playing a little looser towards B, maybe Cypher's playing off site and just relying on the spy cam for, for information to stack up elsewhere. But <laughs> <laughs> definitely wasn't that shocked up. <laughs> the other one, but uh, yeah, I don't think it was a good game from Kyle and Cordell Chat with Foot winning. On the way in. Foot, foot was shooting really well, but so, yeah, we don't necessarily see. Uh, I don't know. And now, actually, on the back I, of the army, going to be pretty unaware of uh, the shot dart, potentially, but now I have two players stacked I mean, Brent, towards you, me, the TP. You, you of all people, well for must surely also. recognize foot as, you now. know, they just fucking aim you. You get Whoa. shot, you die. Yeah, you get shot, you fucking die. Whoa, what is going on here? Runner is under so much they pressure. They tried to, there. again, play for like a really passive post one and the trip the Runner TP'd in with the spike as well just to try to get the the spike down and leave. Mm -hmm. And he didn't feel safe doing it. Oh, the reflash. That's a fucking Heretics classic right there. Yeah. That's such great pressure from Heretics in this round. They didn't actually at any point threaten Runner directly. They just spammed through utility and threw a clone at him. So there was a lot of footsteps coming towards him, a lot of utility, and he shit his pants, didn't want to stick the plant. That's the thing, though. Now, Heretics, after his team to losing scale. that one round, they're, they're going to fucking send down these retakes now. Yeah. yeah. There it is. Awesome. They ain't stopping now. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't get me wrong, I love that you get shot, you die. Happy. Mentality with Valorant, but also you, the way well, you if, you if you're not yeah, playing yeah, well, like Lotus was a frustrating <laughs> watch as a Carmen Core fan. I'll give you. Yeah, it's just annoying to watch when I, I don't know. I, I felt like the solutions were pretty obvious, but maybe I just don't know enough because the meta is shifting more away from early rubble control for a lot of teams. But I think it's. I mean, is it on the defense? Yeah. But let's see if they can not, not defense, but the attack sides definitely don't want yeah, it. Yeah, the attack sides, yeah. yeah. Well, I don't think it's that they don't want it, it's that they can't get it a lot of the time. They don't want to They don't want to risk it. I think it was the impact really You'll you'll see it when you rewatch the game, Josh. They just yeah. weren't really fine for control of a rubble at all against the combo no initiator. That's the same problem that I had with um, T1 playing against Paper X. They're playing against a team that's running Jet Rain or Cypher, and... They just refused yeah, to fight for rubble control on the attack side. You just mm. look at Mini Boo's ult time and time again. It's never an overheat situation right. without your ult. He's happy to sit there. Okay, Heretics, we're back. Just sets. like that, we were gone. That, you know, the reaction. Now we're back. Yeah. Let's go back. <laughs> well, I mean, running a nice little fake round, the round the here the seems like a good idea if Team Heretics are trying to rotate quickly to get set up for the flood fast retakes. Yeah. 
guaranteeing value from that sort of yeah, situation sure. where Wayne Especially with Yoru as well. Either a fake or something where you like A split and take a lot of sight control. What else do they have to work with? Continuously. Do they have Yoru Sova? That would go crazy right now. I don't know what they'll do. Anonymous Gifter. Thank you for the gifted sub to... To a valued member of the chat. And, uh, this level, Busy the kid, thank you for the prime. Well, that's the thing, yeah. For 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 a youngster, it's it, you almost expect him not to have that discipline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Calm there's there's no way of pronouncing this. Yeah. That does, well, I mean, it, it just it just so works every time. Miso. So, I mean, we, we, if you look on this server currently, right, you look at the, the players Knee. who are in front of us, we've got some real heavy hitters. I mean, Thank you for the gift and stuff. Nigel Farage yeah, Gaming. Like, Thank you for the Prime. Right? The That's not even a gifted I mean, sub. Madrid your is your right, account is actually like, called is Nigel Farage like, Gaming. Yeah, look at the last four Why? Yes. Like yes. That's not even... That's it's not like even a gifted. The eventual winners of the event take a map off of both of the opponents, if I'm not mistaken. Do correct me if I'm wrong, but again, a very impressive squad. Yeah, like, as it stands, sorry, it's, it's Fnatic, Paper X, Sentinels, Carmine Core. Not bad, eh? That's not even that. Tory. That's like, well, isn't Nigel Farage working with the, what are they called, the Reform oh, Party or something? Yeah. Getting value. With, with where Heretic sat from Look at that. Year, Look at the bounces on that dart. I didn't see where that one. I was looking at the minimap. Enough, it's a uh, Kix is throwing a right bounce right dart that Again, like really it that bounces off the pillar and breaks yet, the trip at B mate. Nice adjustment. Maybe just gonna bring cool. it out here. As it looked really head. fancy. It looked funky. Deterrent going no, forward. Just gonna pose the right. prospect of it. Well, something to actually indicate some sort of you know tempering of the aggression. Things slowing down a little Could bit. Could the team so Liquid play this week? Uh, uh, they have two matches to play. I can't remember. Liquid? No. no. Uh, it's yeah. common. No. There's two matches this Com week. Only one team uh, a week clear, plays two in EME in China. Is this... So, yeah, a little bit... I'm still up and leave rather than, rather than getting the ult. Well, they forced out the ult from Boo just by tapping the ult orb. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah, but now they're, they're rotating across the V though. Yeah, they've got, they've got the read now. They're not really using the Astro utility to set up. Uh, no. runner very well, are they? Struggling until then. Trek's gonna start removing some of the players on the side itself. Fifteen seconds. Uh, that's, really that's nice, but I mean, time, right. me criticizing the Astro. Meanwhile, Trex runs in and gets two kills, <laughs> and then gets <laughs> Cosmic Divide to win the round. Luckily, looks away. Off flash through doesn't swing off it. They wait. Uh, the kicks has so roll. Oh, the window. The window with the ult, though. Oh, this looks, oh, this looks, oh, this looks really big from Boo. What a nice and play, play by Boo. Did he see the second guy? Uh, this put kicks in such a bad position. Oh, Sender's finesse this. Yeah, it's all on Sender. He's done well. That clock so low. Both of them are playing really well. Paddy. Oh, half. Yeah, no time. Nice try. Very wow. well played by Kix and Sender in difficult positions there. Yeah, no panic there, unlike me from Kix to throw the Hunter's Fury out. It looked a little dicey on sight, but... Um... I mean, Hunter's Fury also wins the round. <laughs> Quick to once again to find this on the same well, what a response yeah. from Trex. Once Kix has yeah. dealt with Boo, it took him a kills. long, long time to like deal with Boo there. Yeah. Nice. Nice, boys. Come Great on, some life. Some life. Vitality. Good job that we calmed down. Good. Uh, well, an indicator right. maybe of actually things feeling a little frantic so far on this half. Well, I mean, so now they've got the Yoru Walt Sovereign right, combo. So, like maybe just that bit of a break, so that they go and take Tube Control, then the Yoru Walt from in. Switch? No, nope, they don't combo it. That's. Oh no, they do. Sorry, that's the defense side. Here comes the attack side. Wait, massive ult, surely. The two run? A distance, I think. Uh, too far yeah. away. Oh. Dude, why, why aren't they combo Why aren't they comboing, why aren't they comboing the Yoru ult with it though? They, that could have been devastatingly good in the post for them. 
See where it ends up coming yeah. down here. Benji Fishy. Imagine having the ult now. Imagine having the ult now. Look how much value it would have gotten. This would have gone yeah. crazy. Very, very late for Benji Fishy on this. Somebody's got to watch the back lines here. If Rana pops out of this. Oh. <gasps> oh, what? Benji. No, Benji. Again, post fight lineups. Line up Larry. Line up Larry. The, the pull is late. Oh, it's not even a pull. Yeah, it's a stun. It oh, oh, still clears the pull prior. Right? Two fights uh, to win the round. Uh, <laughs> I'd love to see if actually this is the reaction on the back of runners' information that actually double invest behind this lurk. Yeah, yeah last time they yeah. tried that A split, Vitality had just randomly decided to fight aggressive A main that round, and so it descended into chaos. This time they were running more of a classic A defensive setup, and the A split worked. God, why are we still getting crackly audio? Was that a moment? That was an RJ special that I removed. What did I tell you, chat? On the attack side, Vitality have good ideas and the game ends up looking better. It's just their defense side looks like it's a bit half-baked. And Heretic's attack side is a bit unusual too. But the, the attack side from Vitality, they always have good setups. You know, they were jumping the gun, maybe misreading yep. some of the sets. Sonic the Hedgehog. No Sonic, were... sorry. Shadow the Hedgehog. Passionately defense. kissing and Shrek. Yo, should I allow people in my chat to start saying things like steamy gooners? Steamy gooners? Steamy. Steamy gooners. I don't even understand I don't understand the concept. Like, just, just, you know, language like that. Just generic... Kind of I, just, just I, I would, I would say put goon in the band word category. No one's allowed to say gooners in my chat. Okay. If I mean, if it's not in your chat, then yeah. Can someone test it? curious to hear that. All right, game back on. Heretics do want to get banned. Time out as well. Wanting to check in. Ah, uh, it was already banned. Wait, it actually is banned. I didn't even realize. Wait, it literally is banned in my chat. My mods run a tighter ship than I realize. Whoa! Okay, sorry. I thought we were watching that from Miniboo's perspective. I thought he'd gone for the fucking crazy TP. Go for something like this out of the timeout. It's a very, I mean, as soon as you see this, uh, my brain was just thinking about gooning and I, uh. Wait, he is going for it now. Something. Yeah, he is. Wait, right. he's going for the they exact they same TP. They fucking saw it. They saw it. They saw yeah. it. Wait, no, he went for it. And he's going for the Eumaniac. Runner literally saw it. I, <laughs> I thought Miniboo had gone for a crazy play, and then he literally went for the crazy play. What? And it's giving him the rough F so they know exactly where to go. What? It's giving him a body so that they can just immediately go into the A here. Big info here if that connects. Oh, the overwhelmed Paddy, though. Makes irrelevant, and it's just oh, the please, run a TP back. Dog, this might be, uh, this might be this the series because of that. Not, not the series, but the map. Yeah, yeah it might be. Vitality should be the easiest uh, day taken the world. What, what a way to lose is that game. play? What are they doing that based off, though? Maybe just assume that they had already rotated off? Of a timeout? Uh -huh. Yeah. And this, this but, be 12. Vitality, like, look, how really, you don't have really info well that this is safe at all. So, is that just because there was so much... Are they expecting that there's a big clash over towards A main, so that'll be free? Like, nobody will be watching that because everyone's focused about the fight in A main. Because they did throw a lot of util A main, and they knew that Vitality were looking at it. But, like... But still, that's a crazy wow. play. It is. I mean, even if someone has just wrote, like, one guy for a back or wherever. Or, like, that's the thing. Like, the TP has to go past them so they hear it. What a ludicrous... Yeah. The fact that the TP has to go past you is what really did it. That's fucking bonkers. I think it did, if I'm honest. I may be wrong. Yeah, I believe so. So this has come straight through main, yeah. Just seems uh, Woof. maybe maybe not maybe Benji having a rough game as well. I mean, if, land, if you get Harvey Atlas, thank you for the gifted sub to Gloomer. You know that. And Ranger Buffalo, thank you for the five months as well. This is a heater. It's starting to heat up. It's like a TV dinner. And now, poison's off. One more round of vitality. Probably cause I don't want to say an upset necessarily, but maybe caught a couple people off guard here. 
Heretics. Is it though? Yeah, I think it's Walking this this half has been better than the previous one. I mean, we also I mean that was a fucking ridiculous play. Heretics aren't that like good. Yeah. Fnatic really are that bad. Putting on a show for us. I see some of this real tangibles we were looking for here. I just think most teams don't really play Breeze very well. Like almost everybody that went to the Almost everyone that went to Madrid wasn't very good at Breeze. No. No, they were not. I come back yeah, there was a couple. It was like everyone, like that's that's the thing. Like everyone was like wanting to play like Split and Lotus and, and Sunset and like. I don't know, it's just like Icebox and Breeze, but it's like 30 seconds. Forward, yeah, I used to do Overwatch casting as well, none of this price fly. Oh, the trip. Oh. Oh. Good trip. Good trip. They know that Benji's around there now. Flash for Benji to peek. Yeah, you're right. 13 seconds. I thought they just had that down, but it's not the case. Can't spam this one yet either. Old body. Vitality just win. You have to, it yeah, feels like it, yeah, but they, the they, don't have they don't have snake bite. They don't. They can't stay in the pit. They don't have snake bite. They don't have shock. They like they didn't get pulled out. Uh, not half. Oh, he didn't quite get half. This is gonna be a weird one. No one's on it. No one's on it. No way. Oh, kicks. Who got half? Yeah, oh, and got headshot through the wall. Wow. 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 Kicks really played those post plant situations really nicely. He looked he looked quite shaky at the beginning of the game, but he really closed it out beautifully. I want to see Vitality's defense side look good though, because their their attack side is just consistently looking better than their defense. I mean, we're about to get a fucking sunset. Everyone into B main post man, so get ready for that. Oh, but heretics are really good. Heretics are the fucking masters of that. Yeah, heretics are really nice in this map. We'll go we'll go to three surely. Yeah. If we don't, yeah. then it'll be impressive from Vitality, I think. Yeah. All right, I have not done any of the, like, Tradle Wordle thingies, so I'm about to pop the fuck off with them. I'm in a Wordle today. I'm going to do Wordle. All right. Time to... Well, what, what do we begin with? What do we begin with? Tradle. Tradle's a good start. And then Wordle, and then wor wor Wordle. There we go. Hello, Tradle. Pokadoku? Yeah, good idea. Pokadoku. Uh, all right, we'll start with the Pokadoku. Why not? Um, Dragon Electric. There is a Dragon Electric Pokemon called Zapdos. No, it's not a dragon. What is a Dragon Electric Pokemon? It's probably something from the newer gens that I don't know about. It's called Electro Dragon. Electro Dragon. Uh, Elective. Uh, red, red. Oh, wait. What's the one that like looks like a fucking uh, stealth plane? It's like a dragon Pokemon that's really, really fast. It's called like Catapult. Dragapult. Dragapult. Are you? Are you Dr Dracozolt? Wait, if you're not a fucking electric dragon type, I don't know what is. Dude! Pluck that one out of thin air. Dark Dragon. Darko Drago Dark. Drago Dark. Zoroark? Reggie Drago? Hmm. Hmm. Dark Cry? Hmm. Um, dark dragon type. That's a, that's a strange mix we got there. Dragalja, I don't know what that is. Dracloak? Dracloak? I mean, cloak, darkness, dark cloak. That looks like it's the precursor to Dragapult, though. Um, hmm. Not sure on that one. Not sure on that one at the moment. Um, dragon, but evolved by an item. I have no idea. The last, like, y t three years of me playing Pokemon games, I've been playing without these. They just all evolve via level. So I have no clue. Evolved by an item. Let's move on. Electric from the Sinnoh region. 
What is Sinnoh again, chat? What gen is Sinnoh? What gen is Sinnoh? I think it's called Bag Dra Bad Dragon Deal, though. Don't think it is. Gen 4. <laughs> gen 4. What's an electric type from Gen 4? Um, electric type from Gen 4. Electivire? Is that Gen 4? Because Electa Buzz is Gen 1. That's probably Gen 2, though, isn't it? Electivire? The... A lot of the baby Pokemon were added in Gen 2 or Gen 4. I suppose Elekid might be Gen 4. I reckon Elekid might be Gen 4. Elekid is not Gen 4. Alright, electric Pokemon evolved evolved by an item and it's an electric Pokemon. What is that mythical Pokemon? The 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 one that has different forms. You find it in a TV or something. And it's it's got like motor. It's it's got like a motor form. Rotom. Does that count as an evolution? Evolved by requires post evolution Pokemon. Does that count though? Rotom. Is that an Evo or is that just like a different form of a mythical or something? Wait, Zekrom. Dragon Dark Pokemon? Zekrom? Ooh, ooh, Zekrom, wait there. Fuck! Hoenn, Hoenn, which one is Hoenn again, chat? Hoenn is Gen 3, isn't it? I think, I think Hoenn's Gen 3. What is the bloody fish with Volt Absorb? Fish with Volt Absorb. It is called Elect. It is called Volt Fish. It is called... Sparkly fish with a anglerfish looking ass. Got a light bulb sticking out your forehead. Um, volt absorb fish. Volt. 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 You little motherfucker. What are you called? What are you called? You little piece of shit. Um, oh, Rotom Wash, Rotom Heat, Rotom Frost. See, these are the ones I was thinking of. The Rotoms. I don't know whether that's going to count. Electric, what, what, what is this fish called? What is this electric fish called? Lightning, light, fish, swim. What word have they used for it? Lantern. It's called lantern. What? What do you mean? What do you mean? Gen 2? No, it's not. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. God damn it. Son of a bitch. Joltik. Gen 3. No! No, the worst Pokonoku I've ever done. No. That's Gen 5? Okay, Colossal. Oh, we got two out of nine. Wait, have we still got more? We still got more guesses? Remaining guesses, three. I thought that was my final guess. Oh, I'm overreacting. I'm overreacting. Chat, I'm overreacting. I thought I'd run out of guesses. I thought I'd, I thought I'd lost my fucking mind. All right, we can still, we can still pop off. We can still get more than half points here. Hoenn Dark, Hoenn Dark type. When I, when I was five years old and I played Ruby. What was the dark type Pokemon? Dark type Pokemon. Murkrow? Was dark type even in Gen 3? Trick question. There was no dark type. Dark type Gen 3. Um. Dark. It was in Gen 2. Oh, God. Dark type, dark type, dark type, dark type, dark type. Think Elite Four. Think in the Elite Four. Houndoom. Houndoom. Dark type. What? It's a dark fire type. It's a dark fire dog. Gen 2 again? 
There's no way! Alright, what's the wolf one called then? Wolfiena or something. P Mightyena. <laughs> Wolfiena. Dude, I'm so dumb. Mightyena. That's Gen 3. Oh, what a... Absolutely horrible. Absolutely horrible. Hoenn evolved by item. Must be a usable or holdable evolution item. Pokemon must originate from this region. Melotic? Isn't Melotic that ugly ass fish? The like ugly rotting fish that you can only catch on like three tiles in the entire game and you have to give it some kind of item and it turns into a Melotic? I think? I'm not sure though. I don't know if I should press the button that says sure because I'm not sure but I'm gonna send it. Oh, let's go. Well, we kind of fucked that up. I only got four out of nine. What were the other ones then? Most common? Zekrom? Zekrom is electric? Then why did you paint it black? What are you doing, art designers? What the fuck are you doing? Hydreigon Kingdra? A Kingdra needs an item. Magmortar. I do remember that, actually. I do. Now that that's mentioned, I do remember that. Um... Darkrai. Darkrai is from Sinnoh. Pachirisu wouldn't have got that. Huh. Ludicolo needs an item. Didn't know that either. Didn't know that. Okay. Well, fuck that one up. What? This 124 million... Very small place. Well, not not super small, but very small. And it exports 28.6% of its export economy is cars. And then recreational boats, passenger and cargo ships, and then 20% oil. Precious metal watches. Precious metal watches. Base metal watches. I mean, the only country I know that has watches is Switzerland. Does Switzerland make cars? Does, surely Switzerland has a larger export economy than 124 million. Although maybe it doesn't really have a large export economy and maybe most of it's like financial district stuff or something like that i don't think switzerland makes any sense but i'm gonna pick it because it's kind of central europe as well and it'll give me a good idea of where in the world we are okay so it's a thousand southwest of switzerland a thousand kilometers southwest of switzerland and it's got cars, passenger and cargo ships, and oil. And watches. A thousand kilometers to the southwest. So, a thousand kilometers is still fairly far. I mean, we're talking, are we talking like an island off the west, like a Canary Island or something? I don't know what those islands are called. The Canary Islands, Tenerife or something. Dude, what what are they actually called? Like, what, what the hell are those areas called? Um, We're in the pistol already? No, surely not. Wait, they're so fast. Against yeah, Heritage, very, very you know how good they are. But I guess they thought that they had a better idea of how to deal with it, which they might. Is it just safe, killing people? Yep, okay. Well... <laughs> The mega curse. <laughs> yep. Mm. Mm. They just slow it down, pause it down. They baited out the flood defend from heretics and then just killed them with the crossfire from market. Okay. Did they did they path meant to be when they came in, or was that a late look? That was a late look. And Benji was like there, kind of watching for it, and then turned away. I think as safe came through. 
Benji Fishy, this one's not looking like it's for you. Mm. No, absolutely That's the not. round. And keep in mind, they had so many players there, Mike. And a to not consider kilometers market is surprising. And this is the thing with the west of Switzerland. Top mid. Again, the utility's not here. It's invested over towards a site. Uh, to have four players here, kind of exposed you think global? to global? What do you think? Oh, I know what it could be, actually. I know what it could be. Control, and with Benji Fishy not picking up the slack in mid, I'm going to keep talking. I'm just pretending it's not there it on the We're screen. We're going to bring it up but afterwards. But there, there, there is a huge hole in this I know what it could be, Wait. chat. Uh, oh, it's I know what it could be. Uh, I was like, they haven't called a fucking tag time already, have they? A thousand kilometers, a thousand one point six k kilometers to the southwest of Switzerland could be somewhere around the like northwest Mediterranean, um, of which there's like a couple tiny countries there, like Monaco. Now onto the real topic, Michael. You what else? There's like some day. small we'll other countries there map. called like, we'll the dude, the, like Moldova or something. Or? Dude, I don't know. But <laughs> Monaco seems. Oh, is Monaco just a principality? It doesn't count. Thank you. Thank you. No, Monaco's the city. What is the area called? Monaco is the city. The wider thing is called. It's already happened. Over. Fuck, I can't remember. Oh, that's just the first one. <laughs> A series of <laughs> unfortunate <mishaps>. events. <laughs> uh, Dude, I'm so stupid, Jeff. Right, I don't know. First round vitality. I don't fucking know. And mini boot. Well, not I don't know. Get what he wants at all. I'll tell you what it is, Ben, when I get it. I gotta say, this, what, this strat, oh, this yeah. strat needs to be removed from the I, Team I Heretics. This strat needs to be removed from the Team Heretics eco round. This is their most standard eco. So they push aggressively into uh, B main with the paranoia and with like uh, trying to put pressure onto their opponents. They, they like, they flash, they run a player up and they try to fight into B main. And you just overextend way too far. I don't think I've ever seen it work. Maybe it works in scrims or something when teams are not playing as cautiously, but in matches, it, eco rounds where you run in there just never work. As possible. So certainly on the buy Monaco is a city-state? Oh, well, it's chance. not Monaco then, is it? A bit. If, if but it's going to be one of the small countries that's around there. Is there a country called, like, San Marino and or I something? Guess the Viper Wall is San Marino? It's not San Marino. What the fuck is this? But it's it's going to be one of those like small countries around there. I just can't remember which one. I don't know which one it's going to be. San Marino's in Italy. That's in the southeast. Yeah. I just can't remember where they are. Uh, they're fighting. They're making a call to fight out into mid. As the B main players come through. That's nice. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice one here. Exactly the response you call. want to see, and maybe this is just an example of the stars aligning for them. But you can see here Benji's adjustment of utility, a trip inside market here. Mm. Adam, even thank you for the 36 uh, months. I mean, kicks will get a plan. Uh, initially connected onto Benji to to remove that utility. I don't we know have what the game seen. Plan is I mean, that point. we saw Sassy win a ridiculous 1v4 by doing well, something like what down, Kicks is currently doing. Kicks. Getting a free plant on A and then using Wingman to plant so that you are, are really far away from where they think you are. Yeah, he's turned into 1v3. Yeah. See the the plant will come through, allowing. He has to go. Plant is in the deepest possible position. Yeah, he has to try to find like an aggressive position where he can get one at least and fall off. Boo's so aware. If he kills Boo. Boo so away is an off angle. Oh, he's hearing them. He's hearing them. I don't like it now. I don't like it now. He hears at least two, maybe three. He has to wait for them to go past though, surely. Oh, good trade. Yeah, he needed to be patient. Good trade. I was wondering if they now almost have a KO, right? Yeah. I mean, it was yeah, they they've actually got it. Sort of sassy trademark now, but this is the this is the sort of thing that you can really. Achieve. Sassy gets three there. Sassy gets three because Loud forgot what Gecko did. Playing a really really tricky spot, so but after losing like to it once before already. Rotation coming through as Gibraltar as wouldn't be counted as its own thing in this, would it? Who didn't overstep the mark in that regard? That doesn't make sense. Wait, it is. Yo, it's Gibraltar. I was just thinking that aligns really nicely with where in the world I thought 1,600 kilometers was. Pop the fuck off. Yo. Yo. Yeah, deep smoke for the one way. 
I actually push. didn't think Gibraltar would count for Relatively that. Far on this. I can't believe Gibraltar Keeping counts, but Monaco doesn't. Orb picked up. It doesn't mean they can't really keep an eye That's towards strange. middle here. So as you highlighted earlier, I did not see it in the chat at all. Chat. I saw people saying Andorra in the chat, which I don't know where the hell that is, but it, I think Andorra is another small country in that area, isn't it? Dealt with quickly and able to protect the tripwire as well. So even if flash does flash, yeah, yeah, space. flash recon reclear. Vitality playing so slowly though, they're just like... Yeah, I like the fact that Vitality respond to it as well. They don't try to fast react in another direction. They don't play to heretic speed. They're like, no. Yeah. We'll just calm things down. Can you teach me how to cast TF2? Yeah, that's a great Can I? Yes. Will I? No, because I don't have very much time and it wouldn't be... Um, a really important fight to win. It wouldn't be possible to compensate me adequately for the time. It yeah, now Boo knows. It's going to be going on to it. Going to be so topsy turvy because Pat attacks here too. He's going to be 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 and now it's once again, baby Just shoot. Who needs a build here? <laughs> Paddy's T-posing on him. What's he doing? Just standing there. Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah. That was a bug with the KO, right? But yeah, I'm, I'm a little confused as to what happened with Boo here, to be honest. Because obviously the, mm -hmm. the old comes through from Patek and you want him to be the one to take do, do, first do, do, contact do, do, in that yeah, situation. Yeah. Uh, and Boo looks as if he was TPing. I don't know if he TPs up onto the box or. Have there been any commentators at the top level in Valorant who started in Val without casting other games? Yeah, I think Doug started in Valorant. Which I'm pretty sure Didn't has he? smoke on top No, of it, so no, I think he's done other stuff before that. actually. But yeah. I think Valorant was his first, like, big Fishy top, keep this big break. Off. And Vitality. Again, that round felt like it was going back and forth quite some way, but. Sender with a real bailout. Mimi? Here. No, Mimi was doing. Some again, CS. Really well, well, again, I think, oh, I think this was her first big break, yeah, but I think she was doing, doing some smaller CS stuff. Thank you, observers. Thank you very much. But yeah, there's plenty of people who didn't have very much experience before they went into this. Let me have my happiness, Well, sweetly sarcastic. Thank you for the 31 months. I could be convinced. Little flash for Mini Boo to push yeah, into safe. Safe's getting shoved. And they call yeah, the act on the other side really of the map. Yeah, they're not doing that. I don't know why they keep like farming that. up this omen ult. It's both of them. Well, uh, alive, swap it over he's with Paddy. Give him the rifle. That's the first. Oh my god, Kit's almost into the spike, can't I be? Taking the time in Vitality, kind of pausing a little bit, right? Still it's right. Went for that early take, maybe noting the rifle was enough that they want to kind of keep them The trench is so low. Still got options to play with send up. Yeah, Spot Mimi mostly does. Yes, but she has cast it, she does main. cast. Toxins, boys and, ore. and we'll be doing That's it more this year. Safe. Do they expect Mini Boo though? Oh, yep. Mini Boo fancies a go in the... Brothers in arms, laying towards oh, the, no. the middle. And you can see Benji Fisher just catching one on the cross. So they kind of know what's going on here. But the TP as well, yeah. There's, there's not much you can do to stop no. this. Really, Vitality running the map really well, playing towards top middle. Oh. Benji Fisher trying. It. <gasps> oh. Actually, Ooh, nice go, things. Yeah. Possible for Paddy. <laughs> oh oh my God. They nearly lined up. Okay, for Paddy, Vitality yeah. looking good. Vitality yeah, I think again. they're dealing with Racking all of the aggression well. from yeah. Heretics very nicely. They See, baited them into flood defending well. I on the pistol. They like absorbing the mid round reclears yeah. really nicely. Uh, you know, dry now for what we so see they have a very good map. sense of the flow of what everything's uh, doing. Yeah. A bit of safety. And, and I mean, even just here, look, look where it draws heretics into it. Oh, they got four ults as well. On B main or commitment towards a, a, a retake. And if Vitality, you don't really have to burn up too much U2 on the way in, that becomes very uncomfortable. And Vitality looking a lot better with utility, at ready to dump on the, the confidence what? stuff compared to maybe, their game against know, Navi. The Navi, they weren't hitting at all. The no. And they looked scared they as well. A little bit of the kit, but not much. Kicks gets that back anyway in what ten seconds. So 
no harm, no foul for Vitality here. In the meantime, safe. They're not ready. Couldn't really deal with that knife, so has to kind of sit back and be noted. But again, this default. Everybody has to play so far back. Burning down that utility. Just because of the threat of the showstopper now. Again, though, it's not. Yeah. That big of an indicator and at some point revealed, in no, this no. half, Vitality can start running fast hits. A lack of presence towards market. Because. Actually might change or just more contacting stuff as well. Because Team yeah, Heretics are going to be. It. Yeah. Heretics are going to be saved in their utility. Look how much map control it's given. His utility investment. Oh, look at this pathing. They've got the green. Paranoia wow. completely caught them. What a lovely flash from Sender. And now they've got the perfect pinch on the site. They got three people here, though. Yeah, the coordination's got to be good from Trex and Run. They're not. What? They're, they're scaling into the site itself. Didn't actually have very much util. They got picks and then they just thought the the, the, the site would be free. What? What? How does he win that? Is saving this round for Heretic so far. How did I mean Paddy must have had his vision blocked there by Rian's ult? Because that was both players just with it. Seemingly aware initially. See the ping here for the body, yeah. Neural Thep will come out. It's a name fight he wants. It Second ping is going to be telling. Oh! Oh! Wow. Nice oh! Benji shuts it down. Get it in the end. Benji Fishy. What the fuck well, is this math problem? That up, but still, <laughs> heroics from Rienz in that round, it felt like to even get that back on track, it wasn't comfy for Heretics. No, it wasn't. It comes down to one player, I think 900 credits total mm. taken out of this round. Lovely ideas Don't here from Vitality. Oh, beautiful. But as soon as they hit the site, that is not a good way of actually hitting. They needed to slow the round down after they got the picks and wait to have everybody in position. <laughs> Me when I'm talking to my horse. <laughs> come on, boy, come on! Oh, I finally got it. Dude, that was such a hard noodle. This has been the first real challenge we've seen from Minifoo, who's normally... Running, right? this that was not a hard nerd, old bro. I fucking know struggling. I just couldn't. I, my brain couldn't stoop down to the levels of just. What the I can't man. believe yeah. that. How has Safe gotten away with that? What a swing through the smoke. I've been trying to incorporate this tech where you swing sideways through smokes in order to not let your gun barrel poke through, and I gotta tell you, I don't have the aim for it. I can't pull it off. I get the jump on players, but because my crosshair placement is bad, because I'm swinging my you're you're letting go of um you're letting go of D too early. Yeah, maybe, maybe. You need to just keep holding it until just they go start for the firing wide swing? and fuck up their aim. Yeah, possibly. Yeah. That's a that's a good tip actually. I've left heretics guessing. Brent becoming a ranked coach. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, ranked coach on TikTok. Because <laughs> sometimes I see the pros do stuff and I'm like, that's such great tech. Let me pull that off. And I just fumble it because my mechanics are so bad. That's a weird pit. This is not surely what they meant for so much of it to be. I, I think that... Uh, I mean... <laughs> if, they, if they had a flash on any of their players, that would have been a sick pit. Safe died, pits down. Good trade on kicks. I think he just runs into the pit though, like just contain them. Double swing. Oh, oh wow. Box like a fucking fish. The yeah, they, they pitted there without the Trex or Kicks having a flash. So they couldn't... Yeah, uh, that pit looks really good if you can flash yeah, through it. Because sure it, like yeah. it puts a lot of pressure on somebody on, playing on site. But then they just couldn't get out. Yep. Don't know. That is a set piece, or maybe there's some sort of variable here that we've not spotted. Because, yeah, other than that, it looks like that's, that's a play to get up. If a snake really bites your friend's penis, would you yeah, suck the venom out? Like I mean, I'd take them to the hospital. Mana, I, I'm, I'm not confident not dealing, dealing with a snake seven. bite anywhere on someone's body. James Bond? I mean, I don't understand. Yeah, the, that's there's the no thing. hospital well, around. Vitality playing this slow, he's not getting any values when they go for these flash the dart replays that would normally catch teams out. Not finding a way into the game, and I think it's just been somewhat read by 
heretics here. Expecting vitality to I mean, do I... Are we assuming it's, it's in a situation where I know that this is the correct or, course of action? Because frankly, I'm not... Like, if vitality my friend got bit by a snake, I wouldn't even think of sucking the poison out. Again. I would just be thinking of calling a hospital. Also, just to note that as well, maybe this is a reason we see heretics slow things down, play a little more... If I, if I know that it's the correct course of action, I'm guzzling it. Put mini boot in the danger zone. Sent out hunting or exploring anywhere. Very much well, no, you're supposed to spit it out, aren't you? I suppose if I drank the snake poison, the snake venom, that would that would also be a bad idea. Oh. So difficult to cross. Just like heretics. Capitalize on that first player forward, which was a bit of a read. Obviously not going to come through just yet. Ascender waiting on the side to try and maybe be that next layer. Oh, flash. Lovely so flash. flash. And it's a lot of fun. Yeah, and scaling somebody on the right side. Look at the load, though. Oh, the timing here. Who gets here first? I mean, I think safe has got this, hasn't he? Yeah, surely. Yeah, and now, I think he knows. I think he heard Boo. So he knows that he's getting pressured from behind. The gecko ult should. Thrash coming through this one almost puts the cherry on the top of the cake here. I don't know what. Boom. Pretty impressive from Vitality, from Vitality though. Even the rounds that they've lost, they've had very positions. nice ideas here. Snake bite to work with as well. He missed the molly. Really he did. Gonna, yeah, not doing much for this one. Safe, comfy with it. Patek can't even really spam into Yeah, I know I'm getting horny baited, yeah, Ness, but get. if someone offers me a oh, hypothetical, uh, I struggle not to engage. <laughs> oh, it's going to be a bad eco for uh, Heretics as well. I remember him at Tiles, and then he appeared in their spawn. And we also see a fourth player commit towards this rotation as well. It's it's only one player. I don't think pissing on jellyfish stings is a thing. <laughs> I, I, I know that that's a very common urban legend, but I was reading about it recently and I don't I, I think it's supposed do it. to be a thing. I wouldn't do it. They're putting, they're putting the hearts of pigs and the livers of pigs in people these days. They could do the exact same thing with like a fucking horse and they'll be much happier. What, what the hell are you talking about? They're saying if your best friend was in a car accident and his dick was blasted clean off and he asked you for three inches to be transferred from your penis to, to his, would would you do it? Am I allowed to work with negative penis? What am I going to do without those three inches? What are they, they going to do? Pass pass onto somebody's body? Tunnel in? Just like, you find, you find, because the way they did it is like they, they genetically modified a pig so that they would have like again, the heart or the liver or whatever would have human the human genes so, they remove so you the think, genes you think it. doctors should grow human genitalia on pigs to help for situations like this yeah hesitant to continue throwing yourself at the wall like that yeah, I How think often if, the, if, they, if, it, if, it, if your penis falls off though or not falls off but if it gets cut off they can emergency graft it back onto, like, your arm in order for it to continue receiving blood and survive until they're able to uh, do the surgery properly and reattach it. Wow, I didn't know that. Oh, they can with other parts of your body, so I assume they would be able to with your penis. Did you learn that before you got kicked out of the degree? <laughs> I actually did it on one of my friends. <laughs> He woke up really drunk one day and I grafted his penis onto his arm. <laughs> and that's how I got kicked out of medical school. You're sitting there going, John, Vitality have looked really well rounded on this. And this should be a sixth if all goes according to, you know, the economy, um, as we're seeing Stingers and Sheriffs. Yeah, there is the alt uh, for Mini Boo and Joy. If he was feeling more confident, maybe. Did you do a degree, bro? No, I didn't go to for uni. Now. Vitality taking their time again, similar scene. Makes a lot of sense. What would you do? What would you do, bro? If you were going to go to university, um, what would you what do? My plan university was of to... fucking life. <laughs> <laughs> That's brand. I would have done computer science if mm, esports didn't work out. Really yeah. Still might not. Stem -pilled. <laughs> yeah, esports still might not work out. I might end up going to university at the age of 30. Jesus, got that fidget spinner combo. The knife and the sheriff. 30 seconds left. Yeah, that's why I took five years with the Nerdle. No school. <laughs> oh, no. Any no, the Any clearers of the lost art? Oh, and Minibu's going to the melt them with the ult. Two players left alive. Sender has ult if he needs to reposition. Oh, the drone. They haven't gone back towards main. The Have they planted it for main as well? They've planted it on stairs? Oh, and Sender's been taken down. It's all on Doesn't matter anymore. Yeah, this is, this is over. 
The chips are down. Did he, did he think by. he was stunned there? No. Wow, wow, dude! Miniboo's neon is so clean, dude. It is so clean. Yeah. He, the way he pre fires corners when he's gliding is. Uh, he's better tech than any other player. He is definitely the best neon we've ever had in Valorant. Yeah. Oh, that movement is so nice. Show me the end kill here. Probably glides in. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, Cracking him. You know who could use Miniboo? Bleed. In terms of the freedom that they're Give yay mini boo. Yeah, I agree actually. Give him mini boo. Except mini boo will just then uh, flounder. Feel the kills. I'm I'm an EMS worker. Genitalia loss is considered a major detriment to quality of life, so we put a lot of effort into making sure it stays intact. Although exact protocols depend depend on the jurisdiction. So yeah. Wow. If the only part of you that could sustain your penis was your forehead, they would graft your cock to your face in order to keep it alive. <laughs> I, I, re I respect that. I would be very grateful for that. Yeah. That wasn't a question, though. I would want that, though. I would... <laughs> dude, yeah. I, would, I would choose my face, if possible. <laughs> I don't know if Comsai is the best degree to go into late. I'm... I'm Aren't people losing their jobs because of the rise of the rise of AI? Is that is that a demonetization of Flat Jet automatically? If you... Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, that's such a good question. Like, would I be able to appear on any Twitch streams? Wait. Did Senna just catch a timing underneath the cap? I'd have to wear a hat. I'd have to keep it tucked away in my hat. Yeah, I, I just the job market right now is not too good because of a variety of reasons. But oh, there aren't enough blood vessels on your exterior head to do that. On your exterior head. Yeah, I mean they could graft it to the inside of your brain, I suppose. <laughs> just, I mean, when people say that they're thinking with their dick, they don't mean that. That doesn't help matters. Yeah, I agree, Lua. There's a ton of different factors. It's not what happened to the last VOD? Did it not get uploaded to the VOD's channel? How have we gone to the job market all of a sudden? Because uh, we were talking about like a comp side degree being one of the best degrees to start late. Uh, I'll, I'll fix it. I'll fix it. And then uh, we're talking about the job market currently for tech Sorry, being Pazla. dire for a variety of reasons. Yeah, don't worry, Bren. You're in the stable market of esports. Yeah, esports is so stable. I feel very safe here, actually. Yeah, the fact that two rounds just separated us now from it being tied up. And actually, the comfort being there financially. I think we should do a cast one day where we let ChatGPT just write all of it. And we just see whether the AI could take our jobs. <laughs> Just e How experiment. No, you definitely could do that for an intro of like the first thing she said. Yeah, for an intro or for a desk segment. You know, you ah, you know, something yep. like that. Desk segment would go funny. Very funny. Like you know how sometimes they do the fan or fraud thing. Yeah. Bren or AI. Yeah. <laughs> Going to game dev of Alice? I, unironically, that would be yeah, fucking awesome. Really if, if we had infinite money, didn't have to worry about making a successful yeah, game. Yeah. Oh, that'd be a very cool job to have. Here comes the plant, they can't deny the wingman. Sender, I've seen Sender ult in this position, cancel it and kill three people. He went nuts in the offseason doing this. Dude, where's the Sender ult? Sender ult outplay? No, never mind. But you were trying to predict, I didn't think you were it's kicks and tricks. The last two are swing here, it? No, genuinely, he did that in the offseason. <laughs> oh, they're taking the lead. That's a funny comment. Do not go into game dev. I repeat, do not go into game dev. It is not worth it. Yeah, that's what I just <laughs> uber chain copy and pasted it <laughs> into my charge. Yeah. Who gets exposed after Patatex frantically requesting, requesting a rifle? Yeah, and just they're still celebrating the previous round. Well, because I think like Benji Fisher was on like six hit, or at least a couple of players were talking. A lot of parallels between oh, game dev and esports in terms of just companies abusing passionate people. Sorry, Patatex, you're not worth it. Actually, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna keep that mm, instead. Yeah. <laughs> actually, we will pay you three hundred dollars um, today.
He's been blessed. Yeah, he's been blessed. So he's safe for himself. Take a look at one look. Okay. I mean, safe has been going for those looks. He's been playing there alone for yeah. the entire half, basically. Yeah. I don't think they've been putting pressure or punishing me. Wow, and Miniboo's read the reaction over towards top mid as well. Having what was a, this a is very nice. No A main control. Two players market stopping you getting market control. Miniboo watching over towards here, and he's got a stun, so it's difficult to punish Miniboo. They could have tried maybe to set up some kind of flash play with the alt into Miniboo's position. Utility as well, because even that We've just seen extra teams set do that. the spy cam towards mid allows them to maintain these heavy stacks. Yeah. Run, give it a shot. Mm. Are you so really going to be able to punish the omen? Doesn't find it. Does it's it half damage. So 46 HP. But now Boo has paranoia. No paranoia available for sender. One flash on Trex. Are you winning the post plant the here against crazy amounts? Oh, yeah, they have the ult anyway. Oh. Perfect timing on that. Did okay. Okay. Do Benji, fine. Okay, I mean, uh, and you would think Vitality's comp would be somewhat attack sided as well, so. Yeah, Vitality really looked good, but. Heretics kind of figured out how to deal with real sport. TMV, you did football coaching at uni. Uh, I actually did a drama degree, theatre degree. She did a theatre degree. Actor first, and then I did a master's in football uh, coaching and analysis. Yeah, well, that's, a, that's an interesting. Interesting path, like education yeah. pathway. Yeah, you and took the, the you took the boaster pathway. It, it, it doesn't. Is yeah, that what boaster was a football coach? No, <laughs> I think he was a theatre kid like me. He went, mm. yeah, he went from theatre kid into like sports analysis by you know being an IGL. That was what I meant. Back towards a site, the spy cam towards top mid and removing some of that free control. I I don't know. It just didn't strike me that TMB was a theatre kid. Running away with. Like, so you don't give off so theater the kid energy, yeah. You don't. You don't give off the right energy. No, I, I was the black sheep in the, <laughs> in the fucking the wall, theater world. To because I, I did drama in uh, my GCSEs, and it was a un, it was just a unique group of people. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody that I did comedy with, most of, of them were, most of them were theater kid people. Ah, kicks thought he had enough time there. He thought the spacing was so far apart between Miniboo and the next player, he had time to pull out his dizzy and throw it. Shocky. <laughs> there goes Boo. <laughs> I think Boo fuck? ran out of bullets and just tried to run away. It's tough viewing. The x-ray was hilarious. They're just trying to run. Player standing. <laughs> and uh, gonna get Rien. Oh, this is very valuable pistol for Vitality to take. For the ace. 10 HP. HP. Go on, Paditek. Oh, so ready for it. That mm. Okay, really winnable for Vitality. Yeah, 7-7. Seven seven. Survive, but... In <laughs> well, with this, in this game, I, I don't know. In theory, like, yeah, we'll see. Mm. Generally, you kind of get a feel of who's in the lead here. Who's the other kids don't like it when you say that you did a VOD review on that it's, movie. It's very, very <laughs> I'm not going to Temple University. I was watching the tape. Well, thank you for the hundred bits. Oh, he's running, also, away that, running away from the name. Is that, I'm guessing that's in yeah. Philly. I mean, it feels a little better when Boo's not even trying to break the yes, ball. Yes, Temple is in Philly. Yeah. Well, do I sit in this corner and die, or do I try to move? Not for me. Off a pop. The aggressive rumba. <laughs> Pansy's having a good time casting this game. Five suppressed. Oh, and they oh. still die. Oh, safe was no. so flat. Oh. Safe was oh, so like blind <laughs> running into the corner. Beautiful Valorant. Five gets the press and <laughs> safe is so blind. Anyway. Anyway. I mean, Ronnie's oh, gonna nice. make up for it, yeah. Uh, joined by Sender, gonna keep safe the other side of the map, so not gonna let this slip through their fingertips. What I was saying though is, I was expecting somebody to go home and do the homework and look at what the other tripwire kill was, because I'm sure. Did I just read that correctly on the Andalusia ad in the top right, but it's funded by the oh. European Union? Okay, okay. Okay, I'm Sorry, say that again. Why am I getting I nervous? I feel weird. Funded by the EU. Yeah, that's what it said. Well, why are they? Why, why are they picking the ad in the top right? Look at the ad in the top right. 
on the box when it's on the gameplay and then they've had to fit in so much like terms and conditions around the advert <laughs> itself of who they're being like funded by that it, you can't even make out the ad thanks for that beautiful yeah. replay boys appreciate that one i know you're looking in the eu but it's just i just have another replay I mean. like when it's off a replay and it's yeah. the, like, the andalusia oh, stuff yeah andalusia however you say it look at the amount of stuff they have to include in the box alongside the ad like where it's red minute now he's donated across to safe and don't look at the gameplay just look at the top right yeah i'm look just at looking at the top right i'm just looking at the ads you're look actually the shilling ads. better than zelsis currently i'm i'm getting so much red bull in my eyeballs i don't know what that is unilumens the the sponsor that gave them all the led screens for emea difference right? they've got the early work done towards a and i'm waiting to see the commitment there it is hansi was talking about it on the broadcast like yesterday a couple of days ago any minute now here yeah, comes big oh, okay, that there goes the ult that just says andalusia oh, bren yes yes there was something else after i swear to god there was like four things packed in there <laughs> i swear to the you. whole round for this we've missed the whole round for this but it, i swear to god it's there somewhere literally just staring at bren, it just says andalusia show it there it is! Oh! <laughs> there it is. oh. What is that? Co-funded by the European Union? European mini -boom. Mini -boom. Yeah. I, well, I assume that that's like a legal thing that you need to disclose every time. Because it looks like they're using... Um, the, the European Union will give uh, funds to areas to try to boost the tourism in those areas, and Andalusia has decided to use some of those funds to sponsor esports broadcasts. God, that mosh. That was very worth missing a bonus for, yeah, no problem. That's rough. <laughs> I'm here. I'm here. I week. really, really hope that everyone in chat was just staring at the top right. <laughs> I didn't. I did not watch that round. Don't tell me what happened. <laughs> Mini Boo went crazy. Don't tell me. Don't ask me. You've come back cruel. You heard Steel being a bit nasty. You're like, Steel's about to flame people. Then, you know, <laughs> then I should be as well. It's changed the agenda completely. <laughs> oh no, the floodgates have opened. <laughs> We've got Michael gone. unleashed. Well, let's have a little look. What's in front of us now? Sight here always in super deep on this safe is want to catch Boo. Maybe just a shot through the smoke here potentially. I don't know if you really caught much of it. I glitch. don't love this wall that heretics are doing on B. Feels like they haven't had that to work with yet on this side on these retakes. No, and, and actually plenty of utility considering how they found that. Surely when heretics go B, they're just gonna Man. sit and be main. Yeah, but well, it's, fl it's a flood defend wall. I think it can be. Yeah, very... flood, wall, uh, flood defend wall to who? Oh, Vitality is so ready for that. What on B? They knew they were gonna try. Yeah, who's getting flooded on? They're all sitting in B main. No, you, I mean you you do it as they go no, for the um you do it earlier and like as they go for the plant. I think it'll be really good if they go B. Oh, oh, oh my God. God. how the fuck did they win that? Benji killed three. How did they wow. win that? That should not have been a heretics round. That again, that oh, damn. Oh. I think previously catching run off really 45, the kill trip. The fact that the nade Benji split up the... Here, flashed. Who the fuck was it? Raise player. Down Runner. Down God, that is a nice. bonkers shot. God, Minibu is so fucking <laughs> Come on, up. the lads! Come on, the boys! That's a huge round. These are some tilting rounds of vitality too. Yeah. Doctor Double Pump. Is that what they called Benji back in the day? To Benji Fishy in that moment, but if you're vitality, you're starting to get a little pissed off. But the down the sheriff's here. They can't do much more about that. That's just the way it goes. It God, I want so much Benji Fishy. The Benji are the better. The one after is critical. Don't say that. What? I want to eat outrageous amounts of Benji fishy tonight. Just the Benji no, of the no, better. No, no. Well, what is he saying, chat? And I want to, I want to be surrounded by fish. Seemingly not by it. It is a great adaptation of a quality meme. It on the B site. The war is not doing anything. Well, this this round it's an eco, so yeah, so. The one time that they've used it. I mean, they they are a bit too slow with it though. They they should be they should be doing it as the plant gets tapped. Because if you wall up as the plant is getting tapped, people have oh. not retreated back into these beam spots. Yet. 
Just don't need to see him apparently. Oh, what gameplay this is. What gameplay? I love it. My favorite aspect the thing, of Valorant. The thing is, it, it, oh, oh, the TP, 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 TP. No way. No way. TP. TP. No. Oh my god. Oh, oh. oh. still didn't work. Oh. Boo I was literally about to say, I, it always works as well. I know you're done. Boo genuinely ruined the post-plant metagame on Sunset. Yeah, they, they now need to change the site. Yeah, that smoke that he decided to start throwing that everybody else has now taken, it just, it makes it so difficult. I love the silence. On them. A little bit of wiggle room as well. Vitality, yeah. Are you blaming Boo? It was his fault. His fault. <laughs> he figured out how to make it broken. He broke it. Yeah. Mentality. I mean, to be and now fair, he's being punished. And it's 3 and 12. It round two. Is Wingman an axolotl? Right, so is that what Wingman is supposed to be? No. I think it's just a, a thing. I don't, oh, then again, I guess the Dizzy is based on a thing. I don't think it really looks like an axolotl. Yeah. No. <laughs> then seeming, I don't want to say broke, but seemingly struggling well, maybe. the finances. Maybe some of these ultimates could bail them out from their radiant like that, experiments. Yeah, but do we know what the original like saying, creature was before it was experimented on? They're implied yeah, to be aquatic like creatures. One heretics want to try and secure and vitality mm. to really claw their way back into this now. And strip away. Uh, well, uh, even looking at Heretics the other side, they've maybe got a, a, a round in hand other than Boo down at the bottom of the scoreboard. Yeah. The only one really struggling financially here. There, there is a purchase behind. Yeah, Thrash is a shark. Around round loss yeah. here for Heretics. Especially then when you throw Mini Boo's ultimate in the mix. Well, let's see if it's road to recovery for Vitality. <laughs> Timeout. Should have given them some, some yeah. ideas of what they want to do here. Ooh, they spot two players over towards A. Dizzy back in hand, noting that early presence, allowing for the two to clear through. Get that old orb. Now the knife did catch Benji. I think Outside Boo got deliberately tagged by that Dizzy, so that they would keep players Stay players towards, towards a. a main. Yeah. So Vitality well equipped, at least at the start of this round. Because the Dizzy was only about to catch one, and that makes it feel like it's. I was going to say potentially the second wave. What does that look like? The A lurker, but it wasn't. It was Mini. Flash over the top from Trex and Kicks. Again, yeah, Heretics hadn't played back in just yet. So nobody All right, so now that the Gecko has left A, they redraw A. Are you actually going to go there, Heretics? I'm trying to indicate this A piece, but dude, they've already decided not to go A as they gather the info on A. Towards middle, I think they're looking to end towards It's it's every time. What do you think Wingman takes like? Seconds, We've already discussed this. Count. We literally okay, had this sorry, conversation was, last co-stream, didn't we? I think it was on Platchat. Plat Plat oh, was it on Platchat? Yeah. I think a gummy, whoever said gummy bear was. Yeah, no, it, it, it's a gummy. Yeah. This is where the, the flood wall seems crazy, but they've waited for it to go down. Oh, mini boot pre fire in the wrong corner. Oh, fake. Time? Yeah, three Time. players back side. The mosh pit seems really good. <gasps> How does Trex win that? Benji still oh, alive. Ah, well, okay. Oh, Vitality. Maybe not dead yet. Boo fucking that one up a bit though. Letting a one HP tr yeah. uh, no, Trex swing into you and get the kill. Really good mid round protocols from Vitality. Bruh. Honestly, Heretics like said, one. able to evade that. But yeah, they can, they hit the side with 14 <laughs> seconds left. Not they're not really doing anything the with their default, man. They're not taking yeah. any map control. Yeah. They don't. They don't push the player back over towards A for ages. They don't take market. They don't take top mid. It's like it's, it's like they're reading from a script, a predetermined script. Yeah. It's so frustrating because it feels like an, a simple improvement. Everybody committing towards the site here. This one, the clock's very. The the clock is the deciding factor. Back to a fast day, exec. Guys, slow doesn't work. <laughs> Oh no, maybe not. Maybe playing runner off this. Dizzy. Not gonna get any oh, info. But, but yeah. Sender, Sender took a shit ton of damage. damage. Where's he? Behind damage runner there. Yeah. Maybe, I don't know, maybe they were the spamming corner? onto runner's jump peak and <laughs> Sender's the one to uh to eat it up. It looks quite similar to last round to an extent, but I yeah. wonder what the change is now coming back through. Alright, now it looks like they wanna go back over towards A. Now, actually, They're gonna use Boo's paranoia. Sender actually. 
Yeah, identifying that he's probably going to take this. But the question is, do they accelerate straight into an A hit, or do they? No confirmation off the. Oh, the paranoia was just off the drone. Yeah, off the tag. In case there were many. No, I wouldn't flower sign. I wouldn't do it. Resmoking top middle, trying to maybe sell him. I mean, last round they literally droned and then walked back B. Oh, that knife though. Two people that's caught crazy. by it. Don't know how much I got. Just two, Probably I think. Two. Yeah. But still, two. two with a Sova KO wow, pushed up that far. Call the rotation. Now they're walking yes. into the site. We're actually running you know. as the showstopper, and he can post it into this smoke on the choke point. <laughs> he tried to hold out and got KO knife. Hello? Hello? What? What? Hello? Oh, what? Oh God. It's caused chaos, though. This, again, these rounds are so There's only 15 seconds left. Oh my god. Oh, they have to do so much with so little time. How have we ended up in a 1v1? He's heard where safe is. How does he play now? 21 kills for Benji Fishy. Did he see a barrel? What? Oh, what? what? Dude, Benji's on one. Benji That's incredible patience as well from Benji. That really is. Is that the 2v4 that they want? Okay, but yeah, I think so. Again, how mini boot? Mini boot just ran through them all. Elbow. Yeah, so this yeah. is the confirmation here at the start. Yeah, oh, send okay, it to eat on it. the backside of the jump beat, but this was. Oh my god, the they're both blinded. Oh my god, that was hilarious. Wow, that's ridiculous. The fact he still dies. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's tough. But again, even what? Well, that's so bizarre. <laughs> Damage taken at the start of the round, but Heretics now 11, and this is the eventuality that I was talking about. Now, Vitality are in a must-win round. It feels like, see it. yep, and they're struggling in terms of the yeah. equipment. Oh, they might get there in time. I like this mid walk. This is the first time we're actually seeing the Heretics kind of go Where from a B approach, right? This is the first time we've seen that. What do you do when you and hit the you trip, the though? On the back lines, but how do they deal with Trex the ability the bench doesn't have knife earlier on to keep that back line safe they can't possibly turn it off a mini boot get in their face oh, oh, oh so the, the body the shot decay. in very reachable positions Paditech now on an island and now here comes the pinch they're tucked on the side they can't really back to away fight from one or the other Paditech trying to delay at least one side heretics seem quite Lizard. indecisive here who's going to find the shot oh, oh no wiffy ah, from Trex. this is ridiculous and now we're back into the now good old days <laughs> Does kicks. They've made something out of nothing. They've yeah, both got the light armor as well. Right against the wall where it's, it's a pretty difficult. easy spam. Mm. How are they going to get that diffused now? All roads lead Have to one spot. They do. He can't he find it. Desperately kicks is looking for an angle to try and find a cheeky diffuse. Oh. Oh. Rian's going to come through, but send his fan boo blind. That'll do uh, the job. Oh, he's just going to stick it. It ain't stopping. Rian's going to stick it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> kicks gets away with the wow. diffuse. Wow. wow. And he had Wingman the whole time. Must win round. He couldn't find the spike. Thank you. I mean, the proactive play down middle worked off really well. We're not going to Icebox. You, you I cast the crows. You couldn't dream of it going any better. The timing of them as well, just going very simplistically towards that B site. The crunch, everything worked out so well. Oh, ah, I can't believe that that's a kill. How that initial Being kill rocked like a baby. Obviously, no, that, uh, it was kicks, I believe, I can't, uh, I'm, I'm a little bit, bit disappointed with the impact that I'm seeing from Trex. I, I thought that he would pop in the fuck off in this roster. Of 4v3 for Vitality. Yeah, you're absolutely laughing. But maybe he just needs more time. Location, look at Rian's and Boo's ability to reset into main there comfortably. Yes, no utility, but the key piece of utility being the smoke and the recon. This is the gameplay I want really VCT for. <laughs> yes. Or find the spam comfortably. Oh, are you ready? Zero is it is tomorrow the mud bowl oh, of all mud bowls? This, this could be game on, right? This, BBL this versus Koi? When's that? Yeah, the it's come coming up. up. Won't be ideal. Game of the so week. You'll imagine the, I mean, I say imagine, especially after... Oh, yeah, it's tomorrow. The late game Greece. tomorrow. After we watch oh, Navi... Was he? Absolutely <laughs> destroy <laughs> Team Liquid. I was, I was upset. Maybe I just missed the, uh, the impact? I feel like the Astra Util was not actually finding very much value for them. Dude, but maybe I just missed it. They have Jaffa Cakes in America? No, my uh, my nan gave me he had a, a few big rounds though. my birthday in Madrid, <laughs> and I brought them over. You come into the next one with potentially an old command and a Hunter's Fury regardless. Mini boot. Only two orbs away now that itself. now that I have infinite access to Jaffa cakes, I, I don't eat them anymore. The other side of that is, is <laughs> <ultimate>. <laughs> Can't 
Yeah, I can't say I've had a Jaffa cake in a while. Yeah, you only mm. appreciate them when you can't have them. Yeah, in the next round, that's true. Cool round twenty must win. But I They're a nice little treat. Now. We want to keep this alive. So Jaffa cake. How do you eat them, bro? Chocolate sponge. I think Heretics is round kind of pausing. This is what? Trex, please, bro. Trex not helping. Trex not helping you out here. You can't lose that. Uh, looking, do they go further? Yeah, the spam All right, at least kicks us But look who slipped through, Mini Boo. They know oh, the Mini Boo through. Because he this, made so the slide. Here, he's got himself a rifle. They've taken all this space in B main, though, so... Boo looking at the Mini map, maybe? Ooh. Not good enough. Very late Just on the reaction. Yeah, Bump. As soon as I said they're going to Icebox, they start losing. Definitely was. Bren started growing the moustache first, and then I lost yeah, the how do you eat your so I grew a moustache. Bren? Do you just straight um, go for it, or do you eat round? I eat round the outside first. You eat round the outside, I don't and then get do you, that. Like, um, I think do you that's use your teeth to pick off the, the chocolate? Just the one orb missing now. Yeah. To reveal I, uh, the jelly, and then you just suck the jelly off the sponge. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how you, why you had to word it like that. Counter but. Counterpoint, though, to that method. Why would you want... No orange jelly. Why would you want to eat dry sponge for like? Well, you wouldn't. It's just like it's just a nice. It just makes the it just makes the last bit better. I guess. Yeah, it's a methodical process. You're dissecting it. Yeah, but but not every to do bite it with is worse. So I have to do it with Jaffa cake instead. <laughs> no, no, not every bite is worse. The final bit is amazing. But the final well, bit the only is just the orange the, jelly. It's, it's the only yeah, thing it's keeping me off the streets. <laughs> Otherwise, I would be murdering. Yeah. How do you eat a cream egg? Scalpel. Um, half an inch incision around the top. Yeah. <laughs> Syringe. Suck out the cream. Yeah. Eat the... But what do you do with the syringe? Empty husk of a shell. The syringe, I then replace the blood of an animal with it. <laughs> You're left with a chocolate egg with animal blood inside. Yes. I don't know. But maybe just keeping it for. I mean, they have cream eggs in America. The guy has just got like ice. Um, I think so. Pressured by that at all. Even drifting deeper. I think they're they're rare. That was wraps. And now they've noticed two more players. Trex has seen quite a lot of that. They're a rare find. Yeah, Cream eggs no went downhill down though. They used to be very good when I was a kid. The They've just been decreasing the size of them over and over. Yeah. Cadbury's in general just got worse. Yeah. Quorn just the reduced their Scotch sure, eggs from nine to seven in a packet. On the other side of the map. Uh, uh, now over towards they're gonna Tom save here. Devastating. Yeah. Wow, 11-11. Vitality. I mean, next round's gonna go fucking crazy with these orbs. Shrinkflation. Very sad. Uh, like I said, you're potentially looking for maybe the lurker there. If it's Benji on the other side, I think it makes sense not yeah. to invest the pit. But the fact that it's Boo, sure. Does Mini Boo have uh, I mean, his ultimate? There. Right. You may be yeah. reading into that that he's maybe. maybe a late round piece as well. Let's have a look. Yeah, he does. Yeah, to him, so, so their economy's still in a decent spot. And, uh, and but they're going to probably have to do something to quick to get value out of Mini Boo's ult. Of it, and it's not oh, no. Throw it uh, he's got a Guardian. Yeah. That's so impressive. Guardian light and armor here. This really snowball-y round. I mean, look at this, though. Look at all the ults. Runner's still not got his. Sender doesn't quite have his yet. Now, Runner's the one who's missing. Guardian light. Like, yeah, you assume he uses his ult, though, right? Dude, safe is about to get run down this, on A. Right? What a round to have an op when you know that Miniboo has ult and bad economy. Yeah, now you're retaking an op. Especially when you have a pit as well. Yeah, this seems like a bad decision from safe. Well, it is a rifle. Yeah, he's got the rifle, but now they've had to give up sight. I guess they were just planning on playing retake anyway. Dizzy, do we get oh, kill trip? Oh. <gasps> Mini boo. Oh. Benji. Wow, Benji covers it. Benji. He gets three. Benji. Oh. Holy. Dude, Benji's been playing so damn well, actually. Yeah, he has. This map. This year, yeah. he's been one of the best Sentinel players in the world. Mr. Fishy himself. Going down there before the gecko will go and die to a trip. That's rough. Yeah, it is. Oh my God! I didn't even see it. Yeah, boo. Let's go! Suffer two of those Let's now. go, baby! No! God damn. God Which damn. place has better institutions for research-based programs, UK or USA? 
Oh. You're in the right place wow. there, Tanshada. Oh, like yeah, they want to follow through with this. Yeah, Mini Boo never the, the, the recon right still allows them to follow up, even though they're paranoid. Chase down Sender. Kicks get sent oh. Sender's oh. fucked. Sender is fuckoed, and the timing on the peek into there was perfect. We're going map three. Yeah, Heretic's bringing it out at the end. Nice Viper's pit. The pit finally invested. Rip Bozo. To what use? Yeah, to what avail? Not gonna be an awful lot. Not even really giving yourself a, a firm grasp back on the side. Could have got some value one time, huh? Before he finds a kill. Noted, that recon's lovely. That's the stuff that recon popping out. Tag. Oh my god, safe. You might make it winnable. No, surely not. No. No, no, nice try. Wow. What a, what a huge surge at the end there from Heretics to be able to yeah. put things away. Nicely done. Nicely done. I think Vitality's defense, though, there was slightly better than their Breeze or Bind defense that we saw. Yeah. Even though they lost playing defense, it But I think that that's the thing. Like, Heretics, I think... You would assume, you know, in those last two rounds, they just went A, and you would assume against a no Sentinel comp that Vitality were running, they would kind of want that. But I, th I feel like Heretics, they're just like, they're like a an execution-based team rather than like an ideas team. Mm. Dude, the last time So, Michael, Vitality thank you for the two months. Xbox was fucking eons ago. If they pull out a double controller comp, I'm going to go crazy. For who, sorry? Uh, Vitality. What's wrong with double controller? The, the the fucking Viper Harbor is what I mean. Oh, I mean, if they, yeah, if they run. No, they're not going mean, to run Viper I... Harbor, though, because then what? You have kicks on. Kicks what? on the sofa. Kicks will play. Don't even think about it. I don't think. Yeah, kicks yeah. will play Sova. Or, some, or Gecko, like you just did. Yeah, I mean, getting. Play... Safe on Viper? Just play the. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Safe, Viper, Sender, Killjoy. Play Gecko KO. Yeah, it could do. Maybe. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Deadlock? Kicks on Deadlock? Possible. Possible. No. But yeah, these, these late... Not. The longer that Heretics drag on the rounds, the worse they are because they mm. don't actually achieve anything at the beginning of the rounds when they default. So then they just end up execing with like 20 seconds left and they haven't created any advantages or got any info for themselves. They're not a very good slow work of the map kind of team on their attack side. No, I think I think we saw that in the last couple of mm. rounds where just go away, win. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, especially when you have the Neon. But it would be nice to have some slow rounds you can add in where you don't look lost. Bad shirt choice for a Do we know when Clove will be legal? Gap. No, they need to still figure out um, the bug that's happening with Clove, and then they'll be able to be run in the game. Woods apparently playing in the next match, by the way. Hmm. That'll be fun. Yeah, uh, what, I did what, what was I going to do? Boss connection in the break. break. I had something I wanted to do in the break. I said to somebody, I am going to fix that. The VOD. Okay, the Square VOD from yesterday. That won't fit let me have a round hole. Let me have a look. Um What happened with this? My VOD from yesterday. Uh T one versus Paper X VOD before Crew Furia was the last one. Bird that's a symbol of the National Orbidon Society. O Audubon Isn't that the Society. most recent... What the fuck? Isn't that the most recent thing I streamed? Yeah. Chat, what are you talking about? All of the VODs are on my U Sideshow VODs channel. I think I've got this one across wrong. They're all up there. Okay. Worldle. Oh, what is this country? What are you, you square-looking motherfucker? This is looking... This is looking... 
like Africa to me. And I don't know why. It's just giving me Africa vibes. But I, I've got to say, probably got no chance if that's the case. Is that going to be a coastline on the right? Possibly. Possibly. Africa also has a lot of straight lines where the colonists just kind of drew lines on the map. Like, blah, blah, this, this seems very reasonable. Um, which is maybe why I'm thinking that. Uh, so, let's chat. I can see you popping off. And I do not want to look at you. Please do not give it away. Uh, let's go for... Let's go for something in Africa where I know where it is. Those are quite rare. Let's go for Senegal, because I know where it is. I know that this isn't Senegal. I want to make that very clear. I know that this isn't Senegal. But I'm going to guess that so that I have some idea of where in the world we are. Goddamn, we're really fucking close to Senegal. So I've got, I've got it bang on the money that we're in Africa. But Senegal's on the far west side. And we are 1,600 kilometers. So the same distance between Gibraltar and Switzerland. I need to reverse that in my head. Senegal this country right see now i've got a problem because i don't know many countries in africa and what they look like um i mean what does let's name something i mean we've got so it's not going to be on the East Coast, is it? It's going to be somewhere central, possibly even still on the West Coast, because Senegal's on the, like, West Bulge at the North. So it could still be West Coast, but further down in order to be Southeast of it. What do I know that's on the West Coast of Africa that's just further South than Senegal? I'm drawing a goddamn blank. What the hell am I looking at here? Um, I keep thinking of examples that I know isn't this country. Uh, for example, I'm pretty sure it's not Kenya. Kenya's too far east. But let's go let's let's guess Kenya anyway and we'll just make sure that that's the case. Yeah, Kenya's way too far east. But it doesn't say that it's too far south. So maybe we're on the same line as Kenya, but all the way over to the west. What the fuck countries are those? Um God. My brain west all i can think of is east why do i know more about east africa than west africa oh, fuck me I, I, chat i have no idea chat chat don't know chat i'm just gonna have to start guessing random places in africa uh, because i'm too stupid um what's this gonna be let's let's have a scroll Let's have a fucking scroll. Um, we could go for... We could go for... I, I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. I have no idea where Cameroon is. No idea. Central African Republic. Don't have a clue. Don't have a clue. Uh, it's. I don't think this is what Congo looks like. I think Congo is much like wider. Um. Oh. Ooh. 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 Fuck. 
It's east of Côte d'Ivoire. Hmm. But damn it if that wasn't a good idea. So we're 500 kilometers east. So that probably means that it borders? Or at least it's very nearby. Do I have any... Does that help me in any possible way? No. No, it does not. Um... Djibouti. I don't know where that is, but I love the name. Let's send it. <laughs> ah, we've got another one of our classic East Coast places, Djibouti. <laughs> ah, bad guess, chat. That was a bad guess. That was a bad guess. Um, It's certainly not Egypt. It's not Eritrea. Wait, now I'm getting confused. Wait a second, now I'm getting confused. No, I have no idea where Eritrea is or what it looks like. So actually, it totally could be. But to be honest with you, Eritrea could be anywhere in the world. I think it's in Africa though, isn't it? That might just be the stupidest sentence I've ever uttered. Ethiopia is not this country, I believe. But frankly, we could be guessing anything. I mean, there's... N Ghana? Where's Ghana? That's got to be... Is that further north than this? Could give it a shot. Yo! popping off we're popping off chat we're popping the fuck off Whew. from Djibouti to Ghana it's it's uh it's starting Dread everything else bingo uh, I was looking bingo at this, uh, and bango bongo discredit to vitality this is more heretic stonks yeah. being uh, can we run an well. advert oh yeah I do need to run uh, an I? advert thank you yeah yeah, yeah. So to see Ooh. this go the distance here. Bro just got lucky to start to the eighth level in the alphabet. To take breeze, obviously keep sunset as close Any interesting I got, comps yeah, raised? I genuinely did. If it, if it was a country that started later down, down, I would have guessed everywhere that I associate with I like it. West Africa already. Benji Fish in his little corner for about four rounds. Yeah, I kind of fucked with a comp. Hopefully this isn't that. Um part of a map. He's in a little bit of trouble now. He's got support though. Three other players weighing near enough by. Dizzy should see a no oh dear runner has absolutely there goes. smashed Paddetech. There goes Paddy. That's just a glimpse of Boo as well. Pulling back the way. Progress on the other side of the map. Well, I was gonna say, yeah, so the safe is now on fucking the, the kill joint. Do this on dumb right gimmick here. into perfectly guessing the answer every time. What do you mean perfectly place. guessing? That was like the fifth fucking try. I am dumb. Benji Vichy, very, very heads up to at least recheck yeah. on that. Maybe feeling there was no pressure coming. I've also got plenty of them wrong. Well, down to 67 HP has to respect this progress made now. There's no utility you haven't moved yet. No, I got very I lucky today. I will be honest. I got very I'm lucky. I, I, I feel pretty good about the Gibraltar yeah, guess, though, because I worked that out based on the geography. But I did just get lucky with the Ghana. The thing is, with the Ghana one, I could rule out a lot of countries in Africa because they just don't look anything like that. I, I actually thought I was going to be right when it was the Ivory Coast, but it wasn't. Ooh. Safe though, gonna find Benji Fishy. That sheriff now coming into effect. God, I mean, how many pistols is that's a lovely shot by Rio? This just feels like some of these fights are going the way it shouldn't, but now Boo left well, struggling to find deeper impact into this round. A 1v3 will be very difficult here. You've got a nice same try. comps, but Sage versus Ray. Hmm. One of the things uh, that this Heretics comp struggles with a little bit is that because you've replaced your Julius with the Sage, the person that scales off the initiated utility is not somebody you necessarily want taking those fights. Like, Boo is not your strongest fragger. You know what I mean? So they actually, what I noticed when they were playing against Fnatic is that Mini Boo tends to scale the most aggressively. 
while still flashing for himself, which is just a bit more awkward. You can't get as many nice pop flashes for your team. What a stupid What a fucking stupid crossword. Which one, the mini? Yep. No, oh, I haven't done it yet today. Oh, yeah. It was. Stupid. Stupid. See? And, and I was getting roasted for it. Stupid crossword. I did the one a couple of days ago in like 26 seconds yeah, the, or something. I owned it. The, one of them was really easy I'm the other day. Yeah. Sure he's heard the steps backing away from the site, so I wonder how long they sit on this. Or do they commit? Regardless, this time looks like uh, a commitment, but denial on the first attempt of the plant. That's um, you take this in another direction. And safe didn't make the same level of After, progress here. They do still have safe on the other side of the map, so they've got options to go back over towards, eh? I guess there's no real danger with the util has been bled out early. Two players down on ground level here. Be forced into the open potentially, but no wide swing coming through. Oh, this, I, this is weird. No, looking to get safe potentially in a better oh. position. Oh, he gets past the <laughs> turret. The timing of that. I think Benji Fishy might wow, have been so that's so not, unfortunate not for Benji. Again, I mean, not unfortunate, like really lovely by safe. But right caught Benji out. Just continuing to unravel them with a ghost. Thirty seconds. Oh, and he wants a bit more. Not going to get past Boo, but still, it, his job should be done. This, he's done everything yeah. you could possibly Great round ask. By safe. That much with the ghost. I took 40 seconds for the mini, which is a disaster for me. God, I love I mean, this knife so If you took 40 yeah. seconds, I'll probably take three Finally minutes or something. Yeah, Has Taco Bell ever sponsored an esports team? Not that I remember. So if they can do some damage, potentially. Oh, kicks. Just kicks him in the side of the head. Rehens goes down. Boo now. Dude, Vitality have won every spinners, single I'm fucking pistol. Far. Four players against you, and they are wanting to remove you from the server. That, however, is a denial. Have they really? And these yeah. are the three yep. remaining That's rifles, crazy. so you don't want to risk those too much. And no, sender just sprays in, gonna catch him. Is safe dragon potential lowered because of his agent change? Yes. As well, so they he's really less. He's going to be involved in less fights because he's playing safe, just Viper. In these last of rounds. Killjoy here as well. Really, I mean, but he can still have a lot of impact. He just that he, he can't he have kills. as much as he used to yeah. just because you're involved in less fights. Wise, that mid pressure coming out. You, you couldn't ask for a better. God, Icebox is a bore to watch. Yeah, I mean this comes. No, this is going to be good. This is going to be good. I promise. This is heating up. I promise it this is, is heating up. The, the comps make it more interesting because the teams have more options other than just playing fucking offsite retake. Like they can fight a bit more proactively on the defense with this comp. Wrong. Revisit this conversation when we're in like round 17 and you're screaming. <laughs> oh my God. Nice knife. Nice. Fucking one and done. Well, he got his one. You mean one and win? Yeah, one and, and force the other person to Indiana Jones away. Towards safe. <laughs> His looks are just giving me nightmares. I mean, obviously, there's a poison orb to cover the cross here, but. Alright, Kicks just picked up the thrash again. He's got it in eight. You can find value. I think Herod is going to be seemingly aware of the possibility. Oh, I love this. I love this. Big audio bait to see if you force anybody into safe. Maybe it's just going to be sender to try and create a little bit of pressure elsewhere to try and play. Ultimately, safe in on this lurk. Wait. Alone, safe currently is just Are you not going to put the Viper on? Then they just decide to actually go for it. Yeah, fair enough. But safe can tell them that there's still three players over towards A, yeah. Yeah. There is still the utility here, though. That is a factor. But then he gets to try The attack side macro is so much better from Vitality, I think, than Heretics. They should have a favorable site to work towards, but whether or not they can land. Situations like this. Oh, and not flash big too. But they only send one person. They can get it down. Then Time. Seconds. Getting closer. Oh, oh, it's getting close here. Just live. They're still worried about safe. Safe's like got to be the one to win the round. The they haven't, they haven't seen, seen him, though. This is just like a somewhere. potential threat, not a real it's threat yet. It. This time oh, oh that, that, that might change things. The trick. Safe now, got one while they were looking for him. And Kicks has ult. This should be over. Oh, but he's gone for the rotate. The Zane is good, though. Oh, no. That's actually crazy by Miniboo. Yeah. He's safe at playing the time. It's actually to crazy. Perfection. Mini Boo's so good. Away the game too early. He's so good. Doesn't pull the trigger, good. obviously, as soon as that rotation comes off a site. And like you said, the push and pull, that's the perfection in terms of the timing coming through.
Ah, I love the silence. <laughs> Two one now. They play such funky music during their serious segments, and then, mm -hmm. and then during their timeouts, it's just silent. See there on the X-ray how much silence. safe was gonna find on the other side of that peak. Oi! I guess in that position, it does then become the one and done, right? And that's, Have you seen, by the way, that uh, regions are not running? Puzzle, I guess, for vitality, but Play reacts no coming out of rounds. Yeah. No. Uh, two to one Why is now. that? What the heck? Got safe one away from I don't know. Because they're trolling. Well, EMEA does, does, does do it. Does have mm, do they? Yeah. He's gonna have to back away but yeah, it is, it's troll. You just, just cut to the fucking... An early test towards Cut to the camera on the, the stage. stage. Yeah, America's has not been doing it. Why doesn't EMEA have it? Has it? Do, so uh, EMEA's been doing, doing it every now and then. Oh. Opting for the full armor. So it could be effective in this. Interesting. Safe's yeah. given that opportunity. I don't know how much he's going to get God, played into this box is just so poorly designed. No really looking for those sort of no. picks here. Five angles to watch for. But they're very paranoid about a lurk. They definitely are. Exploring mid now, and this is the sort of round where really you want to see heretics try and figure out that sort of thing. Boo! Oof! Give up the space, nearly punished on the retreat. Right, this is where mm. the lurker has to stalled make the play. Here. You've been stalled out, this is where Sender's got to go aggressive and win the round for you. The At least go and break the turret. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least go and break the turret to pull then, people away so that your A players can go in. Fishy, so Sender, you're just baiting your team and making it harder for them. Oh, oh wait, he might have found the timing. No way. What? He fucking dropped and they went to go clear him. God, he got the best of both worlds there. Yeah, he pulled alive. some of them back and he got still a kill. By, though, Vitality aren't really looking away from the site, not sitting deep. Boo looking like he's considering the res here, but who goes for the safer res? Considers the safer. Four yeah. HP on Trex. Time. Back to a three B three. Yes, Trex. Classic Boo down. nepotism chooses down. his brother to res. <laughs> Sender still got utility. He's got time to be. No way. And safe punishing Boo. Time. Benji's also well one shot. On the one, both of these players are one shot to the outlaw. Ooh. 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 He refuses to lose. Oh, Res him every time. Him two rounds. Res him every time. How the fuck yeah. is he yeah. calling out? Call it nepotism, I call it smart. The ability here to really, uh, oh I, I guess, reset God. for just a moment. Yeah, he's literally done both, both rounds. But like you said, the awareness is there already. I think heretics are going to have their head on a swivel now. I'm probably happy to give up initial side control, wow. I guess, unless they're oh, he's so a fast. fight. Oh my god! Burn me! Holy <laughs> 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 Weird, the audio cut out there on the... But again, like, wouldn't that have been so much better immediately after the action? Yeah. Nice or maybe the reaction. Yeah. Audio engineer found a new job, though. Like, instead of running it in the replay, it's... I agree. Don't run it in a replay. Let's go straight to it. Uh, bye, though. Like, what are we making of the stingers and the outlaw here? Ah. Yes, that's what ah. feeling, huh? Mm, that well, good. I mean, they've got themselves on a site. I was <laughs> going to say the initial concern would be finding a ranged engagement that feels comfortable. Oh. Runner still trying to make use of the bulldog at this point, but now actually they're in a position where the lockdown comes through pretty early on ahead. They are pushing well. fast into this. Okay, Love this acceleration, but right where's the player behind Mini Boot? Dude, what the fuck is going on? The fuse. The fuse. The fuse. Love that wall. Love that wall. The wall, you just can't spam it down. Oh, bye bye, mini boot. Through the absolute gauntlet that was that A side. And the wall and the wingman in combination to secure the defuse coming through here. There, there's a moment where this lockdown, I don't know what was left on the clock, but. Not much. It was very much down to the that wire. It almost became really, really awkward. You had the situation where Wingman was defusing the whole time. Yeah. So, yeah, that's when you don't really want to see the assumption coming through that the lockdown will prevent the defuse. Mm. Speaking of lockdowns, Benji Fishy now has his. Kick still with his ult here. I think he's had it for a little while, unless he's actually got it back. The lockdown is right with Wingman, it just doesn't. Right there. That's why they're aware. Be God, it would be funny if he got so if he did the little detain with his arms. Yeah. As it stands, just a test of the nerve over towards the B site. 
They're going to flash very clear. It looks like they want to set up for it. It does, doesn't it? Yep. But this is the yeah, spot where, like, about with it. Yeah. yeah, yeah, just getting a bit proactive. No, 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 but but they don't Bean have mini boo being the one. Yeah, they don't <laughs> have the duelist to flash off it. <laughs> so it's like the, it's the initiators pushing oh, off their no, own no, utility. That's the flaw with this comp. Really but that's the thing. Like that could have been boo. There, he still could have done it. He was just. Yeah, I guess, but instead it was like Rian's and Miniboo taking the peek. Oh, bunny up him. Hello? Kill the guy right below Hello, anybody you want to kill the guy below? There we go. I actually really like the way that they played that. You detain the player below, and then you fight the others first. Just ignore him. Yeah. Doing this in a post plant is going to be rough though. Is it a bad plant, plant to this? The reason it's, it's tough in the post plant here is actually it's a comfortable, safe plant. This does look oh, like it's a nest. Plant. So there's plenty of oh, no, it's nest. Sorry, yeah. Yeah, on the map, it kind of looks like it's... Coming through. That Viper Wall's not really going to give them any... Oh. Benji is frying. Benji is fucking frying. There's no way he's getting two players out. Oh, 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 Benji, Benji walked oh. into the vulnerable. Dude, Brand I the curse is unbelievable today. Straight away, dude. I mean, no shot. Sure. Low 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 crazy low. Though. I don't like the low wall. God, if Benji hadn't, if Benji hadn't got tagged slightly by the vulnerable. And that's the audio you cut out. So, I mean, really, really, really crucial dialogue and context for us there. But whatever it was is enough that they've called a timeout. Yes. Mm. So that is quite interesting. There's something happening. There is some either miscommunication or something not <coughs> quite timed out. Or whatever they're doing they don't quite like, that they pump the brakes. So something heard, something said is enough that they want to just kind of pause, check in. Because that was around back, right? This was three on the trot for heretics. Even though they were, you know, quite close, a little bit, you know, scrappy, it's enough that they want to pause here. We'll see a, I guess a massive overhaul. Of yeah, I'm not exactly sure what Safe is, is annoyed about there. It could be the fact that issue. maybe Sender wasn't snake biting the spike as they swung. It could be that well, there like is a miscommunication there, there in terms obviously. of like how they want to play the post plant, whether they want to swing together, whether they want to play util. Whether they're trying to oh, wait longer while the wall is up. To break yeah. back into some of these sites. It's pretty difficult to tell when you're not in the comms, like, like what's going wrong, because it's almost right surely a comms yeah. issue in that spot. Yeah, the only way to cosplay is Timmy, so I prevent the cast of curse, boot up CS, and start playing at the same time. It's it's not been two timeouts per half, no, it's two timeouts per map, and then an extra in OT. Not an extra, like it just resets so that you have one in OT. See, as it seems... Heretics prioritizing so much of this space here. Maybe put on red alert after the amount that Safe was getting away with. But again, you're trying to make something happen. You're looking mostly towards Riens, and you're looking towards the other side of Mini Boot, right? These two, the the kind of oh, look punch at Riens tucked so Safe deep slowly into this spot. Towards, right? still yeah, he's been set up here with an early KO the flash. There's still gonna be a stack there. Oh, the Safe. He's got a level of awareness Safe's here. Like he must do. Yeah. I I don't think he'll clear this corner properly though. I don't think, I think he will. It, I think he will. I think that's what he's... Oh, he didn't. Wait. He's making noise up there as well, so Rian should know. He's fake yeah, making noise, and now he's going back, he but he's not he's looking. Clear. Yeah. Oh, oh now he is. So far. Now he is. No. Nope. It's on the minimap. He's seen it on minimap. It flashed, yeah. it flashed for just a moment on his screen, and it came up as a question mark on minimap. Denial on the first attempt. 30 seconds left. But the Viper's pit. Perfect answer. That should be safety. Rifle is in the hands of Penetic, though, so they've got an upgrade Good. there, Mike. Good. Yeah. Oh. Safe committed to get the plant down there. Oh. Oh. The what do they have to clear the pit, though? Back to a 4v2. Four people. Dizzy yeah, humans. That's true. They could just run it up. Humans and a wall that they can put in front of the diffuse. You can see the paranoia. He's worried about this, right? Trying to hope something happens. Sender's got to be careful as well. Could be spammed out here, but does he time this? Uh, this is a mad timing. Himself, leaves the pit, tries to find uh -oh. the angle, but he's been found. Benji Fishy doesn't fall for free. And now Vitality tries to The wall, the wall. No, he right clicked the wall. They're both one HP. Vitality. Wow. That's an incredible timing that Sender found, just because they were making noise when they backed out a maze. The one to seal the deal. Ah, I mean, I, I was solo queuing on 
American Northeast servers last night to try to rank up my account so that we could view OQ. People do not understand at that rank that when you run, you give info to your opponents. It's like, it's just missing from their knowledge of how the game works. They're running at the start of rounds and wondering why the sites are stacked. And they're running around when they're in like clutch situations and wondering why the opponent is outplaying them. It's crazy. Yeah. What rank are you talking about? It's like mid plat because my account decayed. They knew that's what he wanted to get back. Let's try to read this team a little better. What's your here, ping on uh, American North? 90 chance. to 110. The guy's been worth his weight in gold in the last couple. But now they don't have any layers to depend on. They've got an ult from Trex. They feel they can it's use quite it. difficult to play with to that much pain. I like this. I like what they're trying to do here. Double that's face. Really oh, wow, wow. they did wow. double wow. swing. Turning the odds. Using wingman Ooh, like that. Jesus. Getting aggressive with Sender. Now what do you do here? Well, very for any dude to just to immediately take that space seeing two players get out of there. Tracks will be seen, but no harm, no foul there. Oh, we pissed. They're not opening themselves up though for the screens player. Nice nade, nice flash. Oh, snake blade. Holy fuck, get out of here. The vulnerable ran out. He can tank a shot. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. Nice try. Yeah, it's true. As if a coach the case, hasn't taken a timeout before OT, part. did they not get three timeouts? No. Very real. <laughs> the timeouts Very don't carry true. over into overtime. Oh. Oh, the flash too. Now imagine being in bronze or silver and you're in my personal hell. Yeah. But also, if you're in bronze or silver, you're in bronze or silver. You know what I mean? That situation where, you know, heretics are looking at it, it's like, come on, numbers advantage. There's no way that, you know, we can have Isn't sticking a high like every round down to a 1v1, 2v1. I mean, it's an incredibly, it's an almost impossible situation to win no matter what. Oh, it does. And I think there's going to be more and more of that. And we see Clove get Broy into play potentially as well, if it gets utilized. To the, you know that again, just kind of I guess subverting yeah. expectations, kind of playing aggressively in scenarios you're not used to. Similar to when we saw you know Neon Boy, it really True. throws off timings and you know yes. expected we outcomes of certain situations. Yeah. It's, it's a really exciting prospect to look into, but not, I, I like what we're seeing here. Vitality, really scrappy in these rounds, but it's working for them. Well, both well, initiators have just been, rotated uh, away just from A as Vitality called the re really, back here. Really so work. it looks like they've avoided the danger here. It feels like this is every really round at this point. Yeah, every <laughs> round. <laughs> Heretics and their half bite heavily follow sound cues. Yeah. Did get punished by safe, but still, you can see them very careful in their clears. Boom, I'm in silver, time. but play like a diamond. We do an A. Give me a We do an A retake. It gets close. Give me a VOD. And Vitality win. No harm, no foul. We'll seen this round before. Silver is actually elo hell. I lose so much when I smurf in silver. Probably one of the reasons why silver is so difficult is because there's a huge range of actual skills in silver because it's one of the largest ranks in the game. Like it has the most people in it. Silver and gold have much, much larger player bases than the other ranks. So some games you're gonna get good players, some games you're gonna get bad players. Time to go away, time to go away, time to go away. Here comes the post plant flying. Very, very late. Jesus Look at the mollies. Constant molly. It's fine. Yeah, just and no, no, quite nice from most, Sender. Yeah. He, I don't think they realised that Sender had done the post plant work there, which means he can do it in a rifle round. I thought he had to change something on that on there. I think we've just seen the panic button pushed. Yeah, unfortunately, I mean, it looks as if. Maybe it's gonna yeah. be is just working them though in the maps like on this yeah. on this particular map because when heretics were going for like yeah. aggression towards a and trying to set up a player there they were slow playing it or ending b and then now that now that vitality condition towards b they're not playing super aggressively for a main they're just getting free plants on a all the time i mean it's, do you think be in split one right team, do you think as soon as calling. do you think even in split one teams like kc and th will cool down significantly um 
They have so many opportunities. Yeah, I mean, uh, the top level of EMEA is going to be quite ready for Vitality to win, so we get another fucking clat track guarantee out of the way. Actually, the top six, I think, is going to be quite close, right? Because it's like Casey. Wait, does that mean that Casey, Giants beat Fnatic? Heretics, Fnatic, Navi, I, I mean, Vitality, Foot? <laughs> At this point, Heretic that would top be six. Mm. <laughs> At that point, and I think a lot of those teams be, look. They've been in investigation. I feel like they have to get dedicated map control somewhere. They, they, it, I mean, it sounds almost counterintuitive because there has been that look, but at this point, you got to try and do something to get, you know, players yeah, in the you, right place. I mean, or you play fully for the retake, you, but again, then how are you disrupting the back line? There's, there's this, something you have to identify. Yeah, it's the lesser of two evils because at the minute, they're kind of just sitting watching this half pass them by, yes. to be honest. Not even slip through their fingers, pass them by altogether. And I'm, I'm looking at what I'm seeing is potentially a two -man See, this is where setting up a bait and switch on pipes or like a flash peak pipes would go so yeah. crazy. But they've, they've taken shit. too yeah, much time now. Yeah, the ults, they can use util to try and dissuade them. Yeah, they needed to catch a timing beforehand. Now they've just got to play... Benji Fishy trying to control that mid-presence for the wow, control. Wow, the double look. Absolutely. Vitality are now just adding layers to this. They found the pain point and they're pushing That was almost a split into A. That's about as close as it gets to a split on A on Icebox. And I think that's because Sender didn't get caught. Sender's found the timing down mid, and he found it on an eco round, but he didn't show them on the eco round. He just let the round be won anyway. This time he destroyed the turret, but then they saw, I think they saw safe, so maybe thought... Yeah, they thought that it was safe. Yeah. They thought that it was safe, and then... God, imagine he ninja defeats this. There's no way you can go for this. Yeah, runner's close enough. Uh, uh, he might be able to get half and kill runner, though. Yeah, it's not happening. No. No. He doesn't have no, it. Doesn't have it would have been quite fun. Has he baited them into It would have been funny, though. It would have been funny. No. That would have been funny. I mean, yeah, we haven't seen one of those in, in a bit. Forever. Forever. I mean, they're, they're not as common, I would imagine, in this game anyway, though, because it's a seven-second of use instead of a potential five-second. Thank God it was an open plant. Oh, where's, where's the spike gone? Oh, good. Yeah, and also the fact that you can... Like the the bingo. sites just aren't really designed bingo like bingo it. Now, you know, maybe not the bingo hole, but the you know, actual bingo. Skegness 2008. <laughs> That's where Mike lost his virginity. <laughs> oh, <God>. What? <laughs> what? What? What is he talking about? I have no idea. But Skegness. Skegness 2008 is just. Tagged on heretics. They just haven't had a chance to use. They've been living in the shadow of vitality, and they didn't really have a good grip on this side of the map either, if I'm honest. And now, continuing, they've got sheriffs. It's going to get a whole lot harder. Runner overwhelming Patatech. Site now available and free for the ball. Trex going to clear Benji Fishy. Vitality are kind of running away with this. I got more the craziest country guys he was. I think the attack side calling here is really nice from. It is. Yeah, it's the. They're doing a good job on Senda. Wingman off and away. Probably going to be denied. Yep. Ugh, boop. Trying to play his life here, but... I think Skegness is kind noted. of... Uh, isn't Skegness in the northeast somewhere? Need one of these or is yeah, that wrong? It's a Butlin's destination. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I think Skegness is pretty close to where I live. And now it actually more. becomes a little problematic, yeah. yeah. I think I might have been to Skegness before, actually. I think There's I went to a... Nothing oh my god, they're losing. The, the word okay. Skegness. No, they're not... Oh, oh. Hello? How many the time? Just the one? Just the one, yeah. One man here. But now he knows that one planted and one detained, so he knows where they both are. Nice reposition from safe. Oh. safe to the right. This would need something monumental. He knows where all the players are. He's got utility still to play with, too. Still has wingman here. The wingman? Mosh, wingman on the defuse? Some safety on the angle. Bait the wingman? Should get some progress. Oh Come my on. god, so this winnable. Oh my god. Swaps it. Oh! oh. 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 Breaks his heart. But keeps things looking golden for Vitality. Oh. Again, with the funds built up and established here for Vitality. No Who is the best that team in EMEA if Vitality right win this? I actually agree with that. I found that it, games in Immortal were easier foot. to 
<laughs> have impact in it might be Narby. than games in like yeah. Diamond Ascendant. Uh, I thought the Narby played Especially the best Ascendant, actually. Team. And it wasn't because of Angels. Ascendant, I kept thinking my teammates were going to do things. Like that. That. So I would expect them to like have my back or smoke something off or something like that because it felt I mean, like they were competent Josh would have done is and it baited me into, into trusting them in spots yeah, where clips, clips I from died and because just cat and car. Whereas, Whereas I feel like in a model that. most of the time That's when I'm like, making assumptions about my teammates yeah, I'm send you mostly cat and car. <laughs> fulfilling them cat and a car so, uh, yeah, I, I had a very similar experience. Okay, well, uh, but I think I play with a lot of assumptions about what my teammates are doing. Well. I think it depends what your play style is. They might be able to win the map. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, everyone's no, speaking all over each other. Yeah. It's I mean, it... still Icebox. Yeah, it's still Icebox. I mean, I was told on round 17 I was going to be screaming. We might not get to round 17. There it is. Position noted and all that utility removed for a couple of seconds. You're going to be screaming, pissing, shitting your pants, okay? Round, but what did I say? Round 16? Oh, round 17, uh, 17 would theoretically be the last round. Okay, well, round 17, you're going to be going bonkers. Or round 16. One of them. <laughs> it was round 17, you said, but that would, oh, right. that would be the final round. Don't worry. Round 17 is going to go, it's going to go wild. Okay. <laughs> round 17 will be just some random eco. No, I'm going to make a note of it. I'm writing round 17 in the corner of my screen. I'm telling you, Vitality looks so much better on their attack side rather than their defense side in some of these maps. Vitality are going to fumble it. Heretics are going to have some really good execs. And round 17 is going to start heating up. How do you pronounce Bren? Um, just like that. Look at the positions. How else would you pronounce Bren? I don't really know how else you would With pronounce it. With a soft it. E. Bron. Bron. Like Monnier. Brenus. Breen. Like the fish, like the night fish. <laughs> well, he just kind of threw the wingman away so. into the Nana Swarm. I think so. Benji Fisher was watching anyway, so I feel as though there's a case. Do they just try and push through here? Wow, they recognize the lore? What the hell is this? Yeah, this is Heretics winning a pistol. Round. Heretics winning a pistol. Oh, Heretics winning what a reaction. Pistol. That is a very rare reaction. Through screens. He's around and around, planting for heaven. What a sick idea. Is awesome cool. protocol from Heretics. Surely no gaps, right? How, how do you possibly defuse this? You win all your fights. I guess. Let's go, Paddy. Okay, they won their first God fucking pistol damn, that's six. nice. That is a first lovely pistol out of six. Yeah, what are we feeling like they can win the series now, surely? Yeah, I'm going to have to get e-code. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The in-game link to this really game takes oh, you to the Twitch channel that, for eSports Finland, yeah. which doesn't show the game. Hmm. Finally, Neil Zinio wins a pistol. Cheerful bunch, aren't they? Yeah. Let's see. took put two Brits in the same room. Make them watch Valorant. Wow. My mental health has not been the same. Happen? What could possibly happen? <laughs> what could go wrong? Uh. <laughs> oh, we got a three in here, so. <laughs> so, like, yeah, so I mean, depressed, are we? What does that say about Dude, us? Pansy's fucking. Pansy's, Pansy's losing like, it. Like, she's got <laughs> such a fucking <laughs> wheeze. <laughs> and then she just wheezed <laughs> and went. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was like it was like a final, like a uh, yeah. what do you call it? A death a rattle. Fucking, yeah, the death rattle. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there we go. The wall, the wingman plant. That's what I'm looking for. The core of Team Heretics' attack side. Exchange between me and some booze out. Yeah, thankfully the macro gets really simplified on Icebox, so they should just win every round out now. Yeah, actually though. Yeah, just go. So, hey, Icebox hey, is hey. such a good map for the way that Team Heretics like to play. Yeah. Info gathering? What do you mean? What info gathering? <laughs> Just hit the site. Glory? As long as they recover any of the rifles they had, it's no harm, no foul, all good. Yeah, it was three bought in, so...
Again, you sacrifice the pistol. Immortal's really yeah. hard right now. They've Never been harder to get to. With, so no, there's not no too much way. Of a problem. That's too in ranked? In a row. Yeah. Now, yeah, it's a bit of a struggle. This is where really? the fun starts to happen. Yeah, I mean, maybe in NA. Maybe, maybe the EU was not. EMEA is not that bad At least it doesn't feel like it What's the current leaderboard looking like in every region? The proportions have gotten small. I mean, it's pretty well flushed. Not a bad, not a bad bonus round. Bulldog Guardian, yeah, but the rest just sitting on nice amounts of rifles, full util. This is an interesting war that they're doing. Vitality. Yeah, they've been doing it pretty much every round. A real resistance. <laughs> I mean, I, I, is, is it good? I think I they're going to. somewhat useful I think they're going to condition that it's not I mean, a Jesper. threat in the it's early round and just use it for post, the and then they're yeah. going to use it one round to like aggro push pipes, yeah. and it's going to catch people off. To reset and relax a little bit. Here. Now, ooh, can buy some time. Slow it down a little. Three of them staying relatively close towards that maze. You can already note that Sender uh -oh. has slipped a little bit closer. Boo gonna be overwhelmed. Mini Boo on the trade out though. Find Sender. We end oh, swings the Oh, nice the get Mini Boo, wants, man. So. It's kicks to draw blood. But now they gotta look towards that spike. Ooh, that's where the ooh, ooh. destroy the nano though. So much post plant cheese. Look at it. Hello. Oh, but the wingman. Oh, the wingman died. Not gonna happen. And again, I got him. This is where oh, it wait. Does he? Does he, he has time. He has, he has oh, it. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, oh, no. oh, 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 I'd like to make it clear, I'm saying Sideshow makes it look easy to make immortal because he is shit and somehow it immortal. Right, yeah, thank you. Appreciate that. <laughs> I make it look easy because I'm so good. I make everything I do look simple. Are there less players in Immortal? I might have said once when someone asked me how hard is it to hit Immortal, but have you seen Sideshow's games? And I didn't even mean you, to be fair. I, I meant some of the people you're playing with. Oh as well. well, that's yeah. Like, that's anyone with enough true, time yeah. can reach a mortal. You genuinely Double could, yeah. If you just Sorry, worked still. on okay, well, that wasn't, small yeah, things you over time, it. no, you'll I get meant there. in my private time. Because some of the some of your ranked games are oh, just that's a conversation. <laughs> they're comical. Well, it's a very slow start to the round, Michael. So <laughs> we can... uh, are on B <laughs> yeah. site already. Round sixteen. Oh. This is the precursor to the one that's mm. gonna make. Thinking man's Valorant becomes close. screaming man's Valorant. Yeah, no confession on the backside. <laughs> Benji, I'm sure All I'm of seen. the thoughts are going to exit his head, and his mouth is just going to start. Wheeze, like pure <laughs> emotion. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're, you're going to be wheezing like Pansy. Right, safe will cast across. <laughs> That's a tag, actually, as well. Oh. Right there. All right. Oh, they're using the gecko uh -oh. on this one. Now you might be screaming this round be because round. Vitality win the eco. Oh, 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 heretics! You made the cardinal sin. We didn't just run to a side. Make it to psych at the information, but no detains here. He ends on guard duty. He's got to try and keep this safe. It's an absolute nightmare. It's an absolute nightmare. Who's got the ult? Ah! Oh my god, this was the round. What are you talking ah! about? <laughs> oh my god. Nasty clutch incoming. Nasty clutch. He's trying to go for the plant. He read the position initially. Kicks go. Oh, does he think about kicks being a bug? He does. He does. I bullets. You've got kicks on one side, Benji on the other. Five bullets for Benji Fishy. Kicks can't get a weapon. The time drops down. It's been heard. Try to toy with it. Go back up. You're at a third time. Oh! 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 Well, just think about that. That was the amuse bouche for the screamer main course. Ow. Kurva! They didn't censor that clip. I don't blame them. Save the audio insane. Yeah, I'd, honestly, I'd be heartbroken as well yeah. by that. Because that was. I mean, you, you can see the. Aye, aye, aye. They're like, cool, we've just been given potentially. 
They're taking a time oh, out. Time out for your special round. Here we go. Here we go. This is what I'm talking about. I mean, I feel like heretics have been doing better when they don't try to default beforehand. <laughs> yeah, just fucking run through a site. Yeah. Genuinely just hit the site. Boo has enough for light armor and bulldog. I know he doesn't because he... Wait, what's going on here? He had 2,500. Coming in here, Boo. Was that before he bought his U-turn? Yeah, you got Mini Boo with his on the other side, quite far away. Uh, Must have been. But yeah, no one particularly knocking on the door of that yet. Still have Mini Boo's as They're going to go spawn to B? They want to try and... Yeah, kick has been great. Mad clutch. Course correct after that round slipped away from them. But to be fair, all the players, as frustrating as it was, you know... Thank you for the 100 bits, Silent FM. Off, but, man, kicks will be loving. Public service announcement. Yeah. Sideshow is the greatest immortal player in rank. True. Okay, here we go. The round of your life. Definitely not. You can stop talking now. You can stop talking now. Just to bring tell TMB to stop being a lazy ass and cast round 17 as per channel points redeem. They're pulling out technicalities on my chat. TMB did oh, me. This is yeah, they're you calling me a fraud because I refuse to cast. Oh, <laughs> the pop flash over 17. the top. Trying to catch oh, them the before they go for it. The no, before, hey, oh, huge not. play. There he is. Love it from Vitality. Right before, oh. right before Mini Boo sets up to go for the A exec oh, with the oh, KO. Don't quite get the kill. Don't oh, worry. No. Don't worry. It's going to happen, TMV. What's happening? Oh, my heart was pounding there. Don't worry. We watched them slowly walk back to B. Oh, my goodness. It's enthralling. No, there's another minute. No, this was the round where I said TMV would scream, and it's going to happen. He's he's taking the piss, but it's going to happen. <laughs> Still haven't shit yet. The game's heating up, man. Oh, what was this? 9-3 oh, at the half. Kailt! <laughs> Throwing the spike! Well, that's oh, nice. lovely pop flash. You did the spike! Oh! Whoa. Safe got bust. Oh, Aim oh, punch. Oh. <laughs> Boo, Boo has res. Oh, Boo dies with the res. Kicks him right up. He's got another nade. Oh my word. Res him! This does feel like a coordinated troll attempt. <laughs> so I got Boo butted at the end as well. Just to add the fucking... <gasps> oh! 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 That's nice, Byron. Tell me, that tell me you didn't let nice out a little gasp room. there, TMB. That's tell me you didn't let a out a little scream. Given the opportunity that was a screamer. And he absolutely that was a little that's screamer. That's gotta be Give after that, that shot. That Talking about the pants are wet. <laughs> There's no way you should have won that. We ends got one just blind there through the crack in the wall as well. That is so nice. Desk slam. Yeah, and frustration because I think there's a chance slam. to maybe wow, what a round. things down in yeah. a two v one there. God, my heart. Especially with oh. the, uh, the utility still being. Icebox is good. You're just a oh, fucking hater. Icebox is well. I am a fucking Icebox hater. It's, yes. It's not good. It's, it's, not it's better good. now. It's better. This meta it's is making better. it more interesting. Wow. What? He just one tapped both of them because they're half armor. As well, Patitek has to cross it behind the orb. But vitality oh, do God these teams can't win after you go show me. Concede some of this Apparently space not. now. I guess the only benefit if your heretics is those guns can't be reached. Easily. Love the idea of playing B retake here right. with safe salt. I mean you're clutching at straws there, you got the lockdown lingering as well. Safe, what a Good nightmare call, I think, to from Vitality. Like too. If Runner can get one, this might be the round wrapped. He 140 would someone. Oh, four five and Paddy. Wow. Little he can he can throw a nade to try and finish that off. Or was that or was he already down to five HP? I couldn't I tell didn't you. Catch that. Mini yeah, Boo's yeah. in a spot to potentially oh, win the round. Hello, Benji. Benji's taken so much damage. Yeah, yeah, is that a reposition? He's forced into an awkward plant though. Yeah, that's not ideal. This is all on Mini Boo in my mind. Oh no. Well, okay, so lockdown. This is actually going to make them clear Mini Boo. He got, he yeah. got fucking. He what? Came on. He, he got fucking came himself. On. The splash back. Kick screamed himself because it was shooting a mini boo and it missed. Dude, holy shit. What the fuck was that? 
safe, gave them that window. But Man, round 17 did change it. this game. <laughs> That's wild! Yeah, that could happen. We've seen that all day today. Yeah. Yeah, we, we saw it a couple of days ago as well, didn't we? Where we saw it. It happened today. When? Uh, maybe the Common Core match. I can't remember. Oh, right. Oh, my God. Look at yeah, that again. Uh, was it NRG? I I can't remember, um, but we definitely watched it recently. Less on Sunset in Market, says the chat. Why does it happen though? No, yes, because Les was tucked in the corner, yeah. Les was tucked in the corner and they used it to clear and it went back towards them all. Look at that! What is that hit him though? It's not even... It's hitting the bridge. It's aiming at yeah. him and hitting the bridge it and like splashes at his It just lands on his feet. feet. Yeah, it lands on his feet and tags him. I see that that's so oh, fucked. He got gooped. Yeah. Oh, he got Heretics. gooped. Uh, that's that's so fucked up. Exactly. Funny thing to happen. So they're just, you know, really bringing it all together. Um, operator is coming out. Runner, opting to invest towards this. We haven't seen this yet. So, oh, look at this. That's going to be more well. fuel Deep in the sliggy game. hating gecko arsenal. Well, does he, have Wait, a does he hate Gecko or does he like hate that? Wingman? I think he hates Wingman. Well, he hates well, Wingman, he he hates wingman but I reckon he probably hates Dizzy trick, as well. Still haven't noted the forward position from the two players. He has an irrational it. hatred of no, cute things. Map, that's the deeper <laughs> sight anchor here on eight. That's why he <laughs> hates me. On the feet just got half of chat going. Is he close to the We were talking about Tarantino earlier. Maybe... Rotation coming through, but force oh. off here, flash, oh. Nice utility to push utility. runner away. This comp yeah. is so good at pushing away oppers even though you don't yeah, have the silver. Well timed. The lockdown. That's good timing on the lockdown, I think. Yeah, wondering what they do with this. El Leon, thank you for the 21 months. Still go for the plant. Oh, oh nice. Down down down. Good punish. Oh, the spike. In on site. Really they did destroy the lockdown. This. Hoping for more Pokemon Valheim DayZ streams? Um, it'll be a while, El Leon. It'll be a while. But I've got some good uh, YouTube content coming for that. <gasps> oh, I thought he got the kill He nearly did. I mean, he's done enough damage. Doesn't matter. Should be good. What? Wow. Big one from Vitality. 4v5 as well. 4v0. Dude, Vitality needs to simplify it again. Just start fucking hard hitting. I mean, they, yeah, the punish on the Sage Wall is... Yeah, imperative I, I i think you could buy an odin here and you'd be in a great spot too on defense looks as if heretics are going to buy all together here force into this purchase just try to make sure the boo gets no value out of the wall through that i'm not sure if it was a second tag but almost looked like yeah runners able to line him up with the operator there big round big round both blades let's go when am i next casting um week three of america's well so in like rifles here in about a week as full an investment we can half looks like it probably is this still doing this again? no way tricks this time going to get the better of mini boo so kill my ally. Yeah, luckily the body drops yeah. down you die in belt there here so they're trying to play for the fucking pit with the judge to clear this now no. It's awkward here because they want to run at a site, get the pit down, and let Patsy Tech. You didn't put an orb in, you didn't put in the orb in mid. They were so committed to running A. With this judge. Looks like they might rethink their approach, or maybe even try and fake with the pit here because we're seeing the spike still. I mean, this is out. actually oh, quite a decent B. spot yeah, for heretics to be in. And they're trying to fake B. Yeah. Wow. Why are they all going B? They, 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 they get the pit out. Oh, Benji's getting good info here on safe. You're still all going across? That's crazy. Double face really to try to clear safe. What the fuck? What? They didn't okay, have no, the clue! Wait, it's not a double shoot. face, it's just a... Oh, no, yeah. Alright, well, he didn't realize that Benji was up to you. So somehow they get they get the win out of that. 30 seconds, runner's got ult. Why are heretics so slow? There's a pit on the other know, side of the map. I don't know, they're taking a fucking sweet time of it. It's really awkward, Lauren. 20 seconds. Dog, they're just going to get And now they can't pit. They can't wingman plant. They can't pit. Planting top, but it's not wingman. Who dies? Rian's falls because he had to actually scale and plant. Oh, oh Benji? No, there's no chance. Paddy's got a fucking judge. Oh, my God. 
Really kicking in now. And such a good usage of the low command. It splits. That's a great. That's a fantastic pit over towards B. I'd say Heretics were in a position there where they could have worked the map really effectively. And as soon as that pit comes out over towards B, they just are forced to go A. It makes the rotate super simple for them. There's not enough time on the clock for them to pivot back over towards B when the pit drops. It's. I think that wins them the round. Sender so using that off noise. I think is somebody sitting in the pit still on B? Have they left? <laughs> Everybody diffused, scrambles for this bro. rotation. Someone just take it. You're all uneven. Huh? Just a fuse. Please. What? Um, I didn't understand now, that. A little concern. I mean, yeah, I don't this know. Feels like hit in 12. I think he was talking about who uh, should get the diffuse, but they're all miles stinger. away from their ult, so. And a bit of a sheet uh, I think he was just saying, like, why does it matter? <laughs> Can find yeah. some value here in round 21. Still got the pit to work with, so maybe they can find a plant. Swing things in their favor. <laughs> you got Grungy in my chat again? The guy who got banned from that just chat. No, he got unbanned again. Oh, did he? Maybe not, actually. We'll be able to get healed up here. <laughs> Gonna be honest, I can't remember. Safe not allowing him any play towards middle now, and you can already see the adjustment. I accidentally Peaches pressed the space bar. Towards tube as well. Maybe feeling as though got away with too much in that last round and actually up to, 12, right up to now, 12, up to 12, up to 12. Yeah, Grand Grandy's saying still banned. Up to 12, up to 12, up to 12. Our Preds are wrong again, our Preds are wrong again, our Preds are wrong again. Giants, congrats on beating Fnatic. I mean, great results to open up this week of BMEA to show that upsets are possible in the region. Uh, yeah. Benji's really going to be given an inch. What do you mean upsets? Well, except these oh were all matches God. that I would say oh, were quite yes, not difficult to predict, but they yeah, weren't guarantees. They were supposed to be <laughs> really good. <laughs> they games. weren't guarantees, as we Platjack guarantees. Well, that's the point of Platjack guarantees. It's funny when we claim it's a guarantee. It doesn't matter. It's not okay, supposed to be a fucking guarantee. <laughs> Oh, they're not getting 12, what? Fred. Wait. They're Hold not on. getting There's 12. No oh, wait, maybe they are still they getting are 12. Oh, man. Paddy, Paddy, I mean, the pit's up for Paddy. Two snake bites. Oh, you've been... No, no, come. Oh, the reaction to run. Okay. Vitality. Potentially on the precipice of yeah, a foot winning is not here. a huge upset, a I don't think. They were a good team. We said they were a good team. No, was, but I mean, we the, the, the point that I'm making is ways. it's good that now, on paper the good matches actually can be won by both teams. Yeah, yeah. No, I agree. Really impressed with them today. Yeah, this is good. This is good vitality winning this game because that means we should have like six teams for the. Yep. Good yeah. EMEA. Six good yeah, EMEA teams. More than any other region can say. Oh, oh now, yeah. based on Maybe what they no were doing on Breeze. The problem, yeah. <laughs> based on what was happening in this match on Breeze. <laughs> and and often I think good. I think we might still be basing that off. Uh, They'll get there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Surely. Fanatic are not going to be mediocre all year. Yeah. Right is seeing what they can actually achieve. Saw all that potential and none of the results for it, but now we're See, I thought this was the kind of setup that they would use with that no, other yeah, diagonal tested. Viper wall. And then they would drop yeah, it I, to I, allow I was the gonna, I was literally going to say to you, yeah, like, oh, they're going to go for a razor behind it at some point or something. Yeah. Sorry, but why have they not cleared yellow? Did they clear it and well, it's just GG. taking space again? Bye. Yeah. Bye. Wow, okay. Vitality Bye -bye. win. Bye-bye. GG. I think they might have knifed it at the oh. beginning of the round and he dodged it and got back into the position. Yeah, I think he might have dodged it too. God damn. That was, that was nice from Vitality. Good recovery from What a great warm-up day for Koi BBL tomorrow. Oh, I will not be there for that. BBL like me what? will not be waking up early to watch that one. What are the other it's games It's the second tomorrow? game, so you won't have to wake up early. Oh. Why was the one? Don't worry, before? you have to be Team Deborah. Liquid Navi. I mean, I I might tune tune in for that one. What? Just because Why? I think, Dude, that sounds worse oh, than BBL Navi Koi. Smoke them. Well, yeah, exactly. Why you would you want you to watch have the to roll? Be, you have to be here for BBL Koi because it's gonna be so fun. BBL Koi is the muddy yeah, muddy I mud man. Start the stream late, maybe. That that that's, that's a funny game. That's I very funny. BBL Koi is gonna be very funny. I do need a mud match. It'll be a mud match. I mean, asking, screaming, BBL begging, Koi are pleading. just boring, though. Actually, yeah, BBL's a little boring. Koi, were they boring when they oh, lost Oh, wait, to tomorrow's Thursday? I have a meeting. I won't be able to go stream.
Oh, oh no, I have to shampoo my person I'm having a meeting with. Oh no. Oh, no, I am. I've, I've got a, a meeting with immigration lawyers, so. Mm. Are you getting deported again? Yeah, I'm getting deported again. I haven't paid them off. You know how it goes. Yeah. Are you going to keep streaming, Josh? Um, yes, I am. I'm going to raid you. Okay. Yeah, Crazy gonna... this is your job considering how much of it oh, how much you dread it. I mean don't get it twisted. I just dread watching shit teams. Absolutely. You dread it? I I'm kinda of... Dread it, run from it. BBL Koi arrives all the same. Yeah. I don't know. I, I feel like this two, like two I still need teams. to review the rest of the Karma Code game from earlier. You know, because as teams get better and better, we're gonna get, we should, in theory, get less and less mud as the year goes on, as the years tick on by. Raider from Finesse? Yo, what's up, Finesse viewers? How's it going? How did Finesse feel about the level of EMEA Valorant today? Because there was, there was a bit of poo going on today, chat. There was a bit of poo. Yeah. All right. Let's let's let, listen to this interview. Pansy and Hyborg, I am joined by Say from Team Vitality. First of all, huge super mid. Yeah, uh, I thought today was quite disappointing from the EMEA games. One of the best teams Everyone is super close right in the EMEA. No uh, clear number me, one. Yeah, I mean, I agree with that. Yeah. So fast, but also, I think bread viewers. Problems we welcome in. Later. Bye bye. See you. Bye bye. It's not like something very major. It's like we know we are good enough yeah, to do something. Too. It's just see you. Are still going to be streaming afterwards, Mr. Egg? Yeah, probably. We have a lot of new people in the league. They've never played it before. Are you going to rewatch? So, yeah, I mean, because your boys. Yeah. Things to yeah. learn, and I think we fixed some small stuff. Have we fun. Still saw some bye. Glimpses of it today of the small stuff, but overall it was pretty fun. Uh, what happened on that? Safe talking about some of his teammates getting a bit stressed. I felt like that happened in the Navi game super heavily. The they looked scared, they looked stressed, they looked uh, we trolled some retakes, shook. I think, and that's completely fine. I mean, one cypher wire should not stop three people, but uh, <laughs> I mean, God bless the cypher wire. So yeah, I mean, that's the only thing. I think the retakes were like, just very poor from us. Uh, otherwise, it would have looked different, probably. Now, you mentioned the, you know, some of the new blood us. we have here, but for you, mm. I don't know if you know this, but you are officially the most seasoned player we have in VCT EMEA. EMEA. You have overtaken uh, Nukia for the record, 224 games, by the way. But not just that. That's wild. You're also the first player ever to surpass 3,000 career kills uh, in VCT EMEA. No one else uh, is close to you right now. Uh, so how does that feel to be you played the most so TMV thank you for the 560 well. viewer I mean, raid everybody's in here what's up what's up not a lot of people get the chance to be in tier one not a lot of people get to where's to drew thank you for the resubs really like. and obviously you know i have my fair share of doubters pretty sick fair share of support if it, it doesn't well, feel like safe's been around I'm forever but he really has and he's played so many different roles maybe i'm trolling half of the time only a quarter of the time. Only the quarter of the time. Yeah, I'm not trolling uh, all the time. Do you feel like your experience, you know, is an advantage right run now? Run an ad redeemed? Yeah, I'm not going to so run it during the interview. Younger players. Yeah, Interviews definitely. quality I mean, content. If it's something that I can give to them, then yeah. it's definitely an advantage because some people won't have that. Like a guy that knows and like can tell you, hey, this is how you react in certain situations. This is how you're supposed to feel or like calm you down, be your dad kind of vibe. <laughs> be your dad. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, Safe you is my daddy. And uh, I'm just gonna put you on the spot. Right you know, uh, looking back at uh, your long career, you gotta you gotta be my dad. In a moment that maybe you feel huh? like is your favorite. Business goose. So Thank you for yeah, the 18 months. 11-11 against Team Vitality. <laughs> on Ascent, and I got my ace against, mm -hmm. team against them, Ascent. and then we won that to go ahead and win the playoffs. I think that was a sick moment. No? Oh, that was a guild, guild day. No, no, right? that oh, was liquid. liquid. Oh, liquid. Liquid oh, last year. Last year. Last year. Last year. Oh, wow. Uh, and speaking I don't remember that. Guild, I'm going to be honest with you, I do not remember the moment yeah. that he's so talking about. I remember the finals against Fnatic, but not bad. the game against I'll Vitality particularly. And people don't like honesty nowadays, but I'll be really honest. It's been good and bad. There's a lot of things that have changed about me. And it's like seeing your best friend after like two two years of not seeing your best friend. It's like, oh my God, you've changed so much, but I've also changed. And it's like, oh wow, let's work together. And then, you know, it's kind of a good vibe, but there are some bad things that we both work together on. And I think we're making it work so far. So what would you say is the best thing about this uh, reunion? Best thing is that guy is probably one of the smartest players I've ever played with, apart from Leo. And I'm just super happy to have him with me because he 
Like in terms of, you know, we talk about developing other players, but I need to develop myself as well. And when I have someone that contests me and, and challenges what, what I think as well, it's kind of like, okay, wow, I can take a lot from you as well. And that's huh. what I feel with him. It's like, okay, we can work together. You push each other, push yeah. each other. Uh, you, you just spoke a little about, about how you've changed too. That's uh, interesting. In I didn't expect Trex like to be there? that vocal in like terms of... I've become... Uh, Less, what he wants on the like, team. Energy high, He's talking high, about high tracks, right? And I've become more the calming Yeah, safe person. is very, very well spoken. I wasn't spoken. the calming person before. Like, hey guys, chillax, 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 do this, do that. Because I was playing duelist. Like, for example, I was just sending it everywhere. I was doing whatever I wanted. I was going to peak if I wanted to. And winning. Right now, you were so winning. Like, okay, guys, you were fucking relax. owning. We killed one. Relax. Do this. Relax. And it's kind of like, it's not me really, but I feel like I'm also like new into trying to teach people other things. That's something I've never done before personally. It's like, okay, I have these amazing like people in my team that I that I need to like tell them what I know about the game as well. And, you know, it's, it's just new but it feels good yeah I feel, was this a conscious effort you think or is this just I'm glad he likes it I think conscious it. effort yeah? because I really want to like do these new things for me so I can I can be better myself like as, as a human as a whatever I just want them you know just be a better human basically he's quite an unusual person safe he, he's oh, got the quality the and the duelist ability to be able to be a superstar player uh, on a range of different teams while playing duelist and he wants uh, to be looking, supportive or, you know, he like wants to be a support player and set other people up that's what he enjoys doing in the game even though arguably he's worse at it compared to just playing duelist and farming as well how do you think you guys are gonna fare against them super unusual trait to have in a player it's it's like taking down heretics won't make a big difference in terms of how we're gonna play against other teams I'm gonna be honest but I think that no ego we're gonna fare pretty well, well because honestly we have some scrim box yes but the the way we're practicing and the way we're doing things right now are very convincing to me and as long as we can bring that to official it's gonna look amazing well, yeah it's a fantastic the, the, from you the ideas so that they've been showing and apparently they've, they've been farming in scrims as well and I think what they showcased today we'll in terms of um, game, starting with the team ideas that they were able to execute on their attack side sleep. and Everybody some more of their like execution on their their uh, their set play kind of ideas were were very cool. They also adapted fairly well in the series, but the the start was super sloppy. I mean, maybe it's just started that sloppy because people were winning ecos all over the place. And heretics can be a bit of a challenging team to play against, but I don't think the level of this game was super high. But I'm intrigued to watch Vitality. I, I'm intrigued to watch Vitality continue because they do have some very good ideas, or at least very interesting ideas. And I think their understanding of how to play the attack side and go from um, uh, defaulting, gathering info, using that to actually indicate what they want to be doing. They've got cool ideas when they exec into sites sometimes, like what they were doing with the deadlock on bind was very cool when they were hitting onto um, A. And then their post plant understanding is pretty solid as well, I would say. Uh, yeah, they're going to be a fun team to watch. Uh, should we do the VOD review of the KC match? The problem is, now we've got a ton of viewers that watch the KC match live, so I don't know really whether I want to do the, the VOD, review, uh, VOD review of that. I might do something else instead, but to be honest, I'm not exactly sure what. New send comms video if you want to watch. Was this from like the grand finals or something? This full circle, guys. Last Voice comms that prove we're still the best. What game was this from? No, this is from the 100 Thieves game. Okay. When 100 Thieves drop in their comms video, that's what I want to know. Um, But yeah, I don't know. Let me, let me, let me run a, let me run a poll in the chat, I think. A crumb of Disco Elysium? No, you no, you're not getting Disco Elysium. You're not getting Disco Elysium until um I'm on the road with a laptop that can't do other shit, basically. Uh um what should we do? Like feed in ranked VOD review KC foot or Sen comms video and then some other random shit, I suppose. Dude, while, while you're watching the advert, have a look in the fucking port. DFM? What, VOD review DFM? I already, uh, I already watched the DFM game live. But I mean, we can VOD review DFM if you want. I already, I already went through a lot of it, though. I mean, I guess that, that would just... I don't fucking know. DFM? Why do, you, why do all of you guys want to watch DFM? Oh. Do it again? the fuck why do you all want to watch dfm stop the count 
None of us saw it. Oh. They want to watch your house blow up? They looked so good. Yeah, but what? You just want to relive the glory days? Expecting this to be the only good detonation game? Or, or, or what? This is the first time in history that this amount of people want to watch the FM? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Has Finesse been talking about the DFM game or something? Why the hell do all the Finesse viewers want to watch DFM? The game goes, they sexy till the next match. What in the Lord's name are you guys talking about? What the fuck is the next match? I mean, the next match is like tomorrow. The next VCT game is in 17 hours. I'm not going to stream for the next 17 hours. Oh, Finesse missed map two and three of this game. He only watched uh, the beginning of Ascent. I see, I see. I mean, do you guys want to watch map two and map three then? I mean, map two wasn't that great though. Map two, the, I mean, I'm down to do a VOD review of map two and map three. Because I already did a VOD review of Ascent. I watched map two and map three live. So I already VOD reviewed Ascent. But I mean, we could do that. Map one, um, let's do map three. You just want to watch DFM win, huh? Map three only. I mean, the map three one was pretty good. They did have some very cool ideas for what they wanted to do on this map. All right, fuck it. We'll give the people what they want. You guys want it, you guys get it. And then by the time all of you have left because you say you want this, but actually the view account is going to plummet into the fucking floor. So you're actually like Steve Jobs, classic quote. People say, oh my God. People say they know what they want, but actually they don't know what they want. Um, so when, when my viewer count plummets to, like, 300 people watching a DFM game that everybody else has already watched, then we'll do the KC versus Foot VOD review. Um, okay, let's have a look then. Alright, so starters on the pistol round, trip top mid, trip over towards here, running this Viper wall, and stacking over towards B. We'll see if they can master it just as well. Now, Saya, if I'm not mistaken, I think the last time he did play the Neon was actually... Uh, with T1, but not in Pacific. It this is a, a pretty hard anti. I mean, DFM were running these hard reads against T1. They realized that the trip is broken up top. That forces the reaction into B main. They've lost the entirety of side control, though, but lovely proactivity again from DFM. Only Medusa left alive, but Sai is super weak. Do they know where Medusa is? I think at this point they've got to realize that this was the A player. Side player doing a little bit of troll in there, super weak, decides to walk into the uh, position that the rotator is likely to come from, although they could have been coming from market. Very unlikely they would have been coming from B main though. And now it's just a 1v1. Rossi has a knife to grab some information, but doesn't want to give away where he is. Titanite, thank you for the tier one. Most pointless poll of all time. Yeah, I'll do the VOD review of KC4 after this map. It'll be super quick. So, yeah, they, they win it in the end. They, they put uh, they put the FM in a little bit of a difficult position after they went mid, broke the trip, and were behind them so quickly. But I do like that DFM instantly pushed into B main, got the kills there, and then also used the paranoia and pushed out towards the right side of B pillar. That's quite nice. We're going to skip this round, though, because it's an eco. All right. So trips have changed a little bit. We've got a trip uh, over towards market now. Fast play from Saya trying to get a little bit of position over towards B main. Good spam from me. And this is that knife that was thrown ages ago, which has caught two players. So you don't have to worry about paranoia. You don't have to worry about nade. They've decided to choose this timing to go for the uh, go for the hit, and Saya's gonna die. Flashing to try to peek in. Surely they get the... Oh, they didn't, didn't get the trade on that onto Rossi. Yeah. Uh, who was it that we were watching do this kind of play all the time where they walked in? It was... Paper Rex. Paper Rex were doing a lot of this, where they played B super heavily, and then they just did walk pushes into Boba, and they were getting caught doing that. That was during kickoff, where Paper X didn't look that great. And it's the same kind of thing from Sire there. 
like sunset obviously the relay boats are he's just looking to try to make a play he realizes that because they got the knife onto these players over towards market he knows that there's still going to be quite a lot of util that happens for the retake here i mean you've got like paranoia you've got all of the gecko utility as well so say wants to make something happen in the post plant now what he doesn't realize perhaps is that he's playing the most busted map for just playing offsite post plants of all time so don't actually try to do anything just uh use the map design against the retakers Fake like you're playing on site to draw out some of their utility and then drop back into B main and just play the spam because the map's broken. I think DFM are one of those teams that showcases so perfectly that if you have some good ideas of what you want to do and all of your teams on the same page, your players look so much better. Because these defensive setups actually make sense. Like the cam gets good info in these positions, trips up top here, Gecko gets util at the beginning, uh, gets info at the beginning of the round. You get the omen posted. Other people get freed up to rotate around. I uh, just sensible setups. Good stuns from Saya to try to isolate people on site and push them back. But yeah, still really good retake situations and t1 is trying to do the same thing where they push aggressive in the post to try to disrupt the retake from happening this time though they catch the timing they have pulled out a lot of utility see now if they were able to get out they could play b main he's just a little late to try to retreat 2v3 but again if they if they just got out here this would be still a great position. Isu could have used that smoke over towards B main. But, mm, not quite. So Anthem has another ult that's really, really good for retake here as well. Saya's going to pop ult. They break the trip. Immediately put in pressure. Really nice. Really nice paranoia there to just catch Saya, but Saya's aim is fucking nasty. He's just shooting everybody in the head with this. I mean, it's just... He looks monstrous. So they did this pathing on the pistol round as well, where they went up like this, and now they've done it in round 5 too. So this has got to be something that T1 are aware of. And they used the paranoia in this round to try to put some pressure and stop this pathing from being possible. But I actually really like the way that T1 put pressure from the front as you're dealing with Saya over towards the top. And this might be something where they need more people up towards the top of mid. Because there's really nobody watching top mid at the beginning of the round. They're only using it with the, uh, with the trip or one player towards top mid. So I, I, think, I think DFM are going to have to make an adaptation here to fight less heavily for the extremities. Put more people towards mid. Good job, boys. So you see two players to start the round up towards top mid. They also have the cam that isn't broken as easily as the trip. So making two adaptations against what's happening, but they have three sheriffs online as well. Slower pace from T1. They do have a lot of other ults as well, though, for things like the retake, the thrash. Now that you know that it's not a fast hit coming up through mid as well, you can probably leave this cam. Just doing its business. A lot of contacting happening here from T1. It's a lovely switch up from the previous round. It could easily bait Anthem into going for an info peak where he dies. Anthem's dropping into a hard anchor position here, which I don't think is a very good idea when he has the ult to play with. But we'll see if the rest of his team's able to play off his uh, contact. I think Anthem just dies here, though. Yeah. I think that was the, the wrong decision from Anthem there. Once he gets contact down over towards this spot, he has one of the Vandals. He has um, the ult to play around as well. He should be dropping off site and then trying to play the rest of his team in with his utility, with his ultimate. And trying to see if he can use his rifle to, you know, grab a kill on, like, maybe this angle or something before he drops back. So, mistake there in terms of how he plays the eco, in my opinion. But a very nice idea from T1 to go from running fast hits like this in two out of five of the rounds, at least, to running a very, very slow round, expecting an adaptation from DFM. 
Alright, so DFM still need to be aware of that potential mid hit. Um, so it looks like they're still going to put two people up towards top mid. Double trips over towards A to start this off. And it's going to be a fast A hit. Uh, Cancelled by the Gecko because nobody broke the Dizzy. They, they didn't realize that that Gecko would be possible. Uh, sorry, the Dizzy would be possible to throw perhaps because Rossi was going for that. So huge amounts of utility still for the retake. Crazy amounts of retake utility still available here. Actually, I think he had to abandon the Dizzy. I thought he was picking it back up, but I, I think he had to aban abandon it, didn't he? Yeah. So that paranoia is fucking goated. Sess is already in. Good cover from Excrit, but he ends up getting traded out as well. And, I mean, that is that is just an amazing retake. So, T1 now need to be thinking about saving some of the utility that they're using to be able to take the site. Because if DFM are playing retake like that, and they're able to throw the Dizzy, get off site, and play full retake. I mean, like, go back and look at, look at, look at how this comes through. This paranoia positioning is so fucking good. You're on a high ground here, because this is a ramp. So this, you, you actually have, like, an elevation downwards, which means that you're able to catch people on the uh on the box up here and you also catch people in the corner there it's so nice and when you combo that with the dizzy or sky nades mosh lineups all of that kind of stuff i mean to be honest they could have thrown more into that as well couldn't they where did the raisin go actually five players at the ready already positioned to try to go for a flood retake if they're gonna be able to pull it off Oh, they did nade. Okay, so they, yeah. They vulnerable nade the back corner. This person gets paranoid. Thrash is coming through as well. When you're scaling, you get to watch this smoke. And then when you swing around, you get to watch this smoke as well. They're mostly coming all from this side with one late lurk over towards A-Link. It just, yeah, it looks really nice. Very nice. KGR, thank you for the 51 months. Norwid, thanks for the three months as well. Alts committed there. What is this? We'll be able to find some stability without too many casual Tweet from Trex? 2-1 team heretics. Hey. Hey. It's free clout. You gotta cash in. It's free clout. Yeah, a great reaction. Free clout. They see the initial hit coming on to A main, right? The dizzy text, you saw the paranoia as well. A significant read of these ultimates. You've got the Viper's Pit, but I doubt it will be used immediately unless you're gonna... All right, so instead of putting the cam up here, they've actually gone back into running the trip up towards top mid, and they've also left top mid. So T1 have done this pathing with their Neon on rounds one, rounds five, and rounds eight. So they've actually given enough time between each instance of running this Neon uh, strat for DFM to kind of forget about how to, you know, counter it. So previously they had the cam up top so the trip couldn't get broken. That's not the case this time. Um, but they're also not breaking it. Normally these players were like swinging and breaking trip um, to allow Saya to run through it. And this time Saya's just trying to fake it. But they do, they break the trip. This pulls people over from both sides. And I think they were going to try to use that to get into A, but the pit has ruined it. And let's have a look at the pit. It's used late. It's used, like, as the trip gets broken. Not as a reaction, but just because DFM want to make sure that they have control of the A uh, side first. So they snake by, they use the... Um, the dizzy as well which doesn't get any pings if if the if the gecko utility had pinged onto players i don't think medusa would have committed this either or maybe they do commit it but like with a paranoia or something just to ensure that they can get it down a little deep so you're not gonna have a very far range of angles to choose from but either way it's a tough one to clear especially with the uh composition you have on t1 and all of these players have still been baited towards mid. Even though they must know that it's not real mid pressure at this point. But in the in the mid round, T1 are going to try and put pressure here. And I think that's... Sire player is assuming that only one person is covering this. Because it's been so long since... You know, it's been like 40 seconds since he broke the trip. 
or not quite maybe like 30 seconds but um there's still three people there so he slides in there trying to get the punish onto the the omen but he doesn't realize that there's a cypher there as well and i think this play is so nice because may is also set up to punish the people behind so you've got the you've got some people ready to punish anyone who goes for the top mid and then you've also got this line being covered too and i think this is so nice from dfm as well because they've already got a under control so it's really obvious that somebody's going to be trying to work market or top mid in this situation because if you lose a control and you don't take market and you don't take top mid what do you have just a full-on b exec into the cypher trips it's it's pretty horrible for the attack side so i think this is a lovely read from dfm especially this extra layer of may being able to swing off the back of it it's amazing how much improvement this team has made What's also fucking crazy is that they had HSK last year, who's clearly a good coach because he's doing a good job at improving Munchkin's calling this year. And yet, he couldn't do a thing with the previous DFM roster. They got A main, they got B main, they shut them down in mid. Everything is covered for DFM. Now they are spread far apart. Uh, shows that you need the right combination of coach and players, not just one or the other. Anyway, we're just going to skip this. This is just a save. Not a great... Um, oh, yeah. So this is uh, a little bit like that Heretic set play where they do the uh, pop flash over the top. But this is them with the Dizzy. Uh, unfortunately, they int the Dizzy away if they ever decide to run this play. And they're also doing it into um, a half-buy. So this seems like a weird decision to me from DFM. This is the kind of play that I would run out of a timeout. Um, if T1 at some point, when they're losing, decides to take a tack timeout, this is where I would try to run something like this, where you disrupt and control the tempo at the beginning of the game by taking fast mid control and forcing them to react and stop whatever their game plan was on the attack. This time... You're on an anti-eco, pushing in, taking a few more risks than you otherwise would, and you lose the dizzy at the very beginning of the round. It just doesn't seem like the right time to go for this, in my opinion. But it's a cool idea if you run it on another round as a surprise. It's also possible that they would have caught Saya, because Saya, I don't think, has very much support when he pats like this on Neon. So just putting that pressure... That At least not as far as I'm aware. Yeah, the previous DFM roster had uh, a, a worse roster overall, I think. The addition of Neth and May, I think it's made them better. When DFM picked up the Crazy Raccoon Corps, people said the players weren't good. Well, the players hadn't really achieved very much. And also, I think in a global sense, yeah, these players, apart from May, really aren't that great in a global sense like playing against the best players in the world but you don't need incredible player quality if you're gonna build up such good ideas and team play you'll actually become known as good players just by making good decisions within your team system nice uh just a, a nice play there as well actually just to point this out so they're, they're in a we take situation here, DFM. The paranoia angle is lovely. And then they get one way off, right? And they jump past the one way with Medusa. <laughs> and then they manage to swing through. Actually, no, sorry. That was... Yeah, 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 sorry. Getting confused there. It's this paranoia afterwards that I was talking about. This one. Yeah, which is a nice angle for it. Because you, you don't catch your own team who's trying to jump through the one way. It's not perfectly executed. And Isu also hits ridiculous shots. Considering that Isu's stat lines are not good, he is still hitting some bonkers shots. So this is where DFM themselves are forced to take a timeout too. Yeah, May is, May is pretty nasty. Yeah, and that's pretty solid, yeah. 
Which is Cypher Yield Tool, the real thing that they want to fish out with that KO. He's been one of the better players on his rosters for quite a while. But he's not Laz. Like, I think in terms of the Japanese player quality, I think Zeta have got better player quality. They've just got far worse game plans and uh, prep. Why does this round end up going so, so badly for T1? Because they're, they're so, like, DFM are mega ready for this mid play. And it's the A site that ends up getting dominated instead. Yeah, there's just no smoke over here. Why is there no smoke when you're going for the A exec through A link? It's so late. It's just horribly miscoordinated. Crossfire set up. Guns down to Izu. Izu, Izu's like a thousand years late with everything he does there. He's he's super late with the smoke, and he's too late with that as well. If he had done that five seconds earlier, then they wouldn't have died to somebody A-Link, and he would have been able to swing to kill Anthem, so they wouldn't have died from here as well. I don't know what happens there. I mean, how, how does that get so badly executed by T1? Wow. Pretty, pretty bad. I think the overall macro plan from T1, though, is because they've done three rounds of conditioning to focus on mid because of this neon pathing, they're hoping that that will open up the outsides of the map. But it has opened up B. B is massively open. They're playing B for full retake. Uh, but they haven't realized that because they've been going A so much. So I'm, I'm sure they were trying to make A easier. They were hoping people would be playing like passive positions like here and here on A. And instead, they're still stacking over towards A and playing B retake, and T1 haven't figured it out. Very much getting I'm pretty sure they weren't ready to hit yet, and Saya just sent it for the kill. Yeah, I mean, there's, that's entirely possible. You can't really tell in a situation like this, though, because, you know, someone might have told Saya to, like, go and not realize that the rest of the team wasn't ready or something. It looks like Saya was too aggressive and dragged the rest of his team with him, but... You, you can't really know those kind of things unless you're inside the comms. Of course, all the crazy VCT upsets happened when I was out of the country for a weekend and couldn't watch. Yeah, I mean, apart from Fnatic Heretics, here comes Sire again. Huge amounts of utility being used in this round as well. Now that they realize that DFM are playing so heavy over towards A, they util dumped the shit out of them, and it's actually coordinated. So unlike in the previous round where they didn't have any util for Saya to be able to swing off and they pathed towards A link and it wasn't smoked, this time they're execing properly, they're pathing towards elbow which is easier as well. And that's based on, again, the idea that they realize DFM are holding A heavily. Okay, so now do we see DFM go for the retake setup over towards A? Not at the moment. Recon being thrown there? Where does that recon go? Bounce recon off some kind of other object. I'm not exactly sure what it clears. We'd have to see a better POV of it. Carpe was getting huge recon value, though, this map. The follow-up was just so bad from T1. When it was used in an exec, anyway. So they're trying to play... They're trying to play pushed up aggressive positions. And I quite like this level of a post plant. But when there's a showstopper that you have to deal with, I just don't see how you're going to be able to survive this. Yeah, there goes Excret. There goes Sire. This is where I think T1 need to be running these B post plants. I don't think they've done this a single time. 
They need to be running like a fake aggressive post plant where they can actually fall back into B main. If they want to run a proper aggressive post plant like that, you can do it, but I don't think you can do it against the Raze ult. You might not even be able to do it against this ult, but at least you can break the Thrash. You can't break the Showstopper. The, the, the Raze just adds too much movement and infinite range with it. It lands on the palm trees close. Yeah, but does it... Like, for example, can you timing that recon by pathing like this into main? I, I, I don't know exactly where it lands. I mean, you see Cyplayer getting caught by the Thrash. And Nobody. All right, so going into the half, we have a 6-6 six, six half. And I think... Yeah, DFM were challenged by quite a lot of the stuff that T1 went for. Uh, but they did manage to play some very good save every piece of utility for the retake setups. So DFM so far, what their success has been when they group up together and run heavy exec retakes. So I would assume that DFM are going to do a lot of that on the attack side too. But if you group up too early to go for big executes, you're going to get caught by early round aggression from Sire. So pretty slow beginning to this first pistol from DFM. Neff gets caught over towards B main with the knife, I think. Yeah, now his cam's back. Sire looking to grab some more information. They paranoia as well. And T1 are walking down mid. Still a minute on the clock here. There's still plenty of time for T1 uh, to get re-cleared in mid. This is a risky position for Excurate to be in. Yeah, very risky. He ends up getting caught there. Nice slow round here from DFM. And now that they've got the pick, now they can start warming up into a big site exec. Paranoia gets used. Neth finds Rossi. Rossi feels pressured because they're coming from market. And the Viper Wall separates Rossi away from the rest of the team. Nice from DFM here. Very lovely slow round. Anthem almost caught. But the rest of the team is just gone. Yeah, good setup here. Pretty sure the recon that lands on the palm tree B site where a lot of people put the cypher cam. It's been slow all the time. I mean, it's been really good poking and prodding here from DFM, knowing when they can and need to ramp things up. So they got a... <laughs> cam contact into a flash play into B. Very nice, though. Look, they've got... They, they hear the cam. Somebody gets caught, and they still have Anthem playing anti-flash. Look, Anthem is just pure anti-flash here. They know that this is a trap setup. So when they jump backwards, Cess gets... Uh, flashed. Cess actually dodges most of the flash as well because he's looking the other way. Anthem swings in anti, picks off one, and does a lot of damage to a second player too. Good work for DFM. Very aware of what's happening around the map. Most of the time you see, like, all DFM would just get caught by that shit all the time because they had no idea what their opponents were going to be doing. They, they literally, they were so focused on their own stuff because they found it so difficult that they couldn't conceive of thinking about what their opponents were going to be doing. This version of DFM just has so much awareness. They're so comfortable in their own stuff that they can be like, oh, this looks like a trap play. We've played against this before. How my T1 boys doing? Um, they ended up losing this game to DFM. This one was a game from yesterday. And... They didn't play terribly, but they didn't play that great either, I don't think. I think T1 have been playing worse than I expected them to. So, they're using the Dizzy here for B main, and the Cam for mid. I assume they'll swap that around at some point as well, just to change it up and get some variety. Um, but we'll see. 
Normally, of course, you would use the cam for B main and the dizzy for mid control. Slow round. Defense trip up towards top mid gets broken. What does it get broken by, actually? Is that just spam from Medusa? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Yeah, he catches the trip with his first Guardian bullet up towards the top mid. So good awareness again from DFM. Start of the round, they've taken B main control. They've broken this trip. Look at the pings here. They know that there could be a lurk play happening up through mid, and that means that these T1 players are forced to reclear B because they don't have enough information. I think about things from T1's perspective right now. They think people could be pathing like this. They could also be pathing like this. They also could be in B main. There are so many questions around the map, and T1 haven't been proactive enough to reclear them. They needed to do like a pop flash play into B main and properly flush that out. They've knifed and they've found Neth. But DFM are already in on the other side of the map, putting pressure on Excurate. Now Isu's just stuck, really. Very unlikely he's going to get too much from this. Might have been able to get one in that spot, right? But he wasn't getting more than one. And the round's essentially over here, just because DFM played the macro so well. Like, super well. A slow take of B main, break the trip, group up, go for the A hit. And at all times, they were ready for the counter from T1. T1 just never went for the counter because they weren't fast enough to make a decision about where they wanted to do it. They were so slow, by the time they got out into B main, the exec had already come into A. So, lovely macro. Lovely macro. Great call. T1 pretty much eliminated at this point. The schedule is so rough. It's very rough. It's very rough. They also play twice in week one and week two. They had the worst schedule out of any team in the entirety of VCT. Uh, if you're a T1 fan, you actually have good reason to be pissed at Riot. Like, if Sentinels got the T1 schedule, everybody would be losing their mind on Reddit right now. So this is going to be pretty similar to what heretics sometimes do, where they go for the paranoia, and they run the uh, run the neon up. And there's a few ways of handling this, but usually what you'll see the attacking team do is throw a smoke here, or throw like a paranoia into the mix, or something like that. And then they'll try to hold in like this position with some people out there, and use this person as bait, and then kill the others. So let's see how did DFM deal with this. So they just choose to give. They don't choose to try to play this at all. So T1 have started the round with some B main control. And they this is, a I think, probably a direct consequence of the previous round. Where in the previous round, they lost B main control and it lost them the round because they just had too many questions about what was happening. Do we see DFM break the top trip again? Doesn't look like it at the beginning here. Yep, spamming for it, seeing if they can break the trip. They break the door. They still haven't broke the trip yet. They're maintaining the information. Still trying to break the trip. And they finally break it. Trip is broken. But the macro being played better here by T1. Because they took B main control at the start of the round, and because DFM are playing so slowly, they've been able to maintain B main info for the first 40 seconds of the round. And they know that this trip has been broken as a fake. Because Sire Player is here, and he can literally see with his eyes that nobody is scaling up. So they have good info B main, they have good info in mid, it's the opposite of what was happening last time. So T T1 are in much, much better spot. Unfortunately, they still have two Sheriffs in this round. 50 seconds, Carpe gets pushed back over towards B main. He knows that the Cypher's here, he knows that the Gecko's here, that makes it much more likely that there's an actual B hit happening. He knows the raise is here, so now there's three players over towards B. The knife gets thrown, and this knife is from A. And I think DFM maybe don't realize that. Because they go into the A stack, and this is working perfectly for T1. I don't, don't know exactly how T1 are getting the read here that this was going to go into A, because there were three players B main, and they could have just picked the timing to exec onto Carpe. 
But DFM have no idea right now that they're going into a three-player stack. They think they've owned it with the macro. Now, unfortunately, Sayo's just caught out in the open there. But it's a great triple play, and even if he hadn't got the third X group, it was there. But I, I, I genuinely, chat, I don't actually know how T1 are so confident that they're not just going to run at Carpe here. I don't know what the read is. I, I, I can't tell you. Because you know the Cypher's here, you know the Gecko's here, you know the Raze is here. How do they not rotate anybody off A? I don't know. Maybe just because DFM have been rotating a lot? I think this is just a gamble, but maybe there's some kind of read that I'm missing. But whatever it is, they, they owned it. Because DFM had no clue that they were running into a three-player stack there. It feels like DFM played the macro well. Doubling his kills in that round when T1 needs it. Didn't he recon? Who, Carpe? No, I mean, he. No, the. the well, the timing in the round that you would be sending the rotate is when you hear three players in B main and nobody moved on T1. The most. The KO knife? What do you mean? The yeah, but the KO knife. Okay, but the KO knife comes through. Yeah. The, the KO knife is good. And look, they deliberately get Anthem tagged by it. You see how Anthem moves back into the KO knife there so that two of them get tagged by it? So that's deliberate so that they can then try to get the hit onto A, right? But what I'm saying is, I think earlier in the round, like even five seconds ago, when Carpe heard three and B main, I would be expecting one player to rotate away, and uh, the T1 players were just like, nah. <laughs> but two, yeah, two players still get caught by that, and as far as Carpe is concerned, there could be play people behind that box as well. Uh, there could be one there, there could be one there, one there. Uh, you know, another player over here, possibly. Uh, there's, there's absolutely no reason why that couldn't be a B hit, in my opinion. But, yeah, it's, uh, it's a smart gamble. I just don't know how they quite got the read. May is a generational talent, do you agree? Um, in a literal sense? He's very good. Don't know about generational talent. Both smokes and rays aren't in the knife. They're already playing full retake B, and Carpe alone can can have enough impact to win t to win time. What? Carpe alone can have enough impact to win time and get an advantage. Yeah, I mean, like I'm saying though, I don't think the knife really tells you much because they can be behind the box as well. But yeah, I mean, I guess if they're just committed to playing the B retake completely, then it just ends up working perfectly for T1. I mean, if that's the case, then it's just good luck for T1, right? They were going to play retake, and they just happened to hit into the stack instead. So DFM, off of that previous round, what they'll have to recognize is, okay, just our typical fakes, right? And then leaving the cypher, things like that. Was red. So no trip. They've been running this top trip all the time, and now they don't have it there at all. Here comes market control. Everybody on T1 dominating over towards A, and now DFM trying to take market. The cam, though, sees them. Home video style. Commit on the Omen ult. Stacks people over towards B. 40 seconds left, and DFM are hitting. Recon. Oh! Mm, 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 mm. It's such a sick recon. And he's just spraying the wall. It was so tragic watching x on this map, actually. But he did say that his uh, hand was hurting, which obviously... Having a hurting hand doesn't make you shoot the wall, but I, it can really distract you in these moments. But yeah, he just doesn't doesn't realize he's peppering the fuck out of the wall here. Because otherwise, that was a guaranteed kill onto Cez. And instead, he does get the kill on Cez, but he ends up getting traded immediately afterwards as well. And not only that, Anthem also manages to trade Isu. An incredible round from Anthem. Because he, all, yeah, I mean, he also gets Carplay. Just fucking crazy from Anthem, really. All by himself. He's not ready for this one. The May was very Perfect. No whiffs. We delayed on that as well. No whiffs. In sight. T1 
T1 decided to go for a four stack on A to begin this round. So dangerously low on cash. Like they throw a stun. There. They throw a one way. So they're making it feel like it could be an aggressive A setup and then rotating back to B. So they're trying to disguise the setup here, right? T1 are trying to make it feel like it's that same, like three players fighting over A main when instead they've got a trip, they've got a cam, and in, they're actually trying once the sight hit comes through to stack four players over towards B. So pretty good defense side play in this round from T1. But honestly, Medusa's getting all of this info. Like, Medusa just realizes that that was all a fake at the beginning of the round. And so he reads the fact that the defense is setting this up. Now, why does Medusa feel confident enough in this round to lurk up behind his uh, orb when he hasn't done previously? I'm not sure, but it works out perfectly for them. He just wasn't scared about the stun in the one way. The Viper Orb is fantastic, of course, as well. It really cancels out the Omen one way. You can't get very much value out of that Omen one way when Medusa has the Orb there. It's such a good Viper Orb. And here they come, back over towards A. They've read the play happening completely. They've called T1's bluff. They know that that early round pressure was all a fake, and they know that they've dropped off to play retake on this map, uh, on this site, because of the info that Medusa found. So now they get in, and now you have to think to yourself, right, we didn't use a huge amount of utility to take the site, but we actually used quite a lot. I, for example, they used the Paranoia. I'm surprised they used as much as they did, to be honest with you, because they, they saw the cam here, they know that that early pressure um, with the like Neon stun was a fake. So I'm surprised they used as much utility rather than saving it to try to stop the retake from happening. But they need they know that they're in like a full retake scenario right now. They're trying to fight the retake. And this is where I think the follow-up from T1 when they're in retake scenarios just kind of sucks. This paranoia from Isu is so fat. And the recon dart is lovely from Carpe as well. They flash reconned almost to perfection here. And yet, look at the scaling right now. Like, look how they actually follow up on their retake util. With from here. Saya takes damage, gets vulnerable, they're like bumping into each other. I know that they win the round, but it just looks a bit flustered to me. The, the retakers that came from spawn look nice though. We'll see if they go for that again. I think there was another example. So this round, Rossi goes for a flash through here, which I think is um, what they do sometimes when they set up with this play. So they'll like neon push here and then they'll paranoia onto the player there. They have like a big A main push exec and they're doing the same flash from Rossi that pops through the window. But this time they're actually pushing mid with Isu and Saya player. So DFM are being faced with an aggressive play, but one that's being disguised by utility coming through to make them expect something else. A bit more time. And Medusa walks into that. It's also comboed with a recon, which allows them to get a better follow-up onto Anthem. This is just a lovely round from T1. It's super nice round from T1. And if they decide to react forwards, like they, they're going to be scared about this because this is normally where Sire player would be pathing. And so you see Medusa walking up tiles because he thinks it's safe. He walks into the mid push, which he's not expecting. He's expecting the push to be coming out A. And if they do somehow manage to re-hit A, that's where all the Cypher util is. I thought that was a really well put together round by T1. And D... DFM still with enough money to force for the next round with some scrappy stuff, but yeah, I thought this was lovely. The fake on the A exec into a walk down mid into a flash recon Sova ult. Gorgeous play by T1. Caging to take some B main control. Four players caught by the knife. Did you see Rossi's face cam there? <laughs> Look at his face cam down here. When he catches four in the knife. I can't imagine how frantic the comms are. But like, four, 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 push. <laughs> push A. I think he comes to push A. He wants them to try to take A control, I think. Because four people have been caught in the B knife. 
Tips on strafing and shooting? I'm new and struggling. Um, I would say go into the range, spawn some practice bots, put them on strafe mode, and don't allow yourself to spray. You have to keep moving, keep shooting, and make sure that you're hitting shots. And you want to be... I mean, when you're A and D, when you're, pr when you're pressing A and D, try not to hold W or S. Just use A and D. And when you go from the middle point of holding D and then about to press A, when you let go of A and hit D, try shooting then. Because you're stood still at that point. So if you just get that going... Dead zoning, the cool kid coaches call it. Just practice that a little bit, and then you don't have to do that all the time, but just incorporate it into your game a little bit. Sajo's never gone into the shooting range to warm up. I play TDM to warm up. I don't use the range, but I used to use the range quite a lot when I was first figuring out the Valorant mechanics. Like, I would use the range to practice, like, spray control and stuff. We all know he's not really emo. I can't escape the fraud allegations. Solo queue myself to Immortal 2. Not really emo. Fraudulent player. His wife is emo. I'm not getting boosted by my wife. Don't realize that Neth is in such an advanced position there. And Excura is... Uh, really unaware in this situation. Like, when when Isu dies here, and Excurate is in cam, and just super focused on elbow, Excurate is not thinking at all about the player's A-link. He literally is just walking backwards. Like, just brain overwhelmed. Your wife's boyfriend is Immo. Whoa, 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 whoa. I am my wife's boyfriend. Wait, that's <laughs> that's a bit weird. They're trying to punish this because there's only five seconds left. And it it does end up coming down to a one v one. The Carpe has a good chance of winning, but. Sess gets it. Takes his head off. I, I can't believe Sess just she did say you're her sideshow? Yeah, she did. And at this point, I mean, DFM are in a great position. They, they've just won a really close round, exploiting T1's mistakes, um, getting Neth into an advanced position before T1 realized it. Neth's cracked it open for them. Excret looked a bit lost, like his setup. Uh, he didn't know how to play around it. It's not like it's a bad setup. He just didn't understand what to do when A-Link gets taken. Because he's just expecting most of the time there that uh, Isu's one-way keeps them back. Normally, teams path elbow rather than A-Link. So Excret looks like he just doesn't really have his own protocol developed for what happens if A-Link is taken. Once more, side player, operator in play. Go for retake. Does have that overdrive as well, but for now... FM not playing in towards that op whatsoever. Has Anthem taken ult orb yet? I don't think he has, right? Have a very strong idea that he could take ult orb and get the so far he has not get the ult. Maybe not. Maybe he already took the orb. These recons are finding a lot of value from Carpe. Anthem dies and gets the ult. Now, there's the wingman, but yeah, the wingman also goes down. Isu getting a lot of value from this position. Cease uses the ult to be able to get the spike back. And now it's a 4v5 for DFM to try to get things up to match point. May dies, and this is just looking less and less and less likely. I think Neth was the big difference maker for DFM in the series. May was always going to put up numbers. The difference between them winning and losing important rounds was quite often on Neth, and he stepped up big time. Yeah, I mean, he, he had some really important rounds. Yeah. I actually, I think the difference maker was not a player, though. 
Uh, I think it would be wrong, in my opinion, to put it on a player. I think it was that the whole team knew what they were doing in every situation. Like, they knew what their game plan was when they were flood defending B. They knew what their game plan was when they were hitting A. They had good macro. They had good, like, we go now, we cancel now, we wait. Like, all of those kind of higher level team concepts were very well executed by DFM. That, to me, was the biggest difference maker between old DFM and this one. But yeah, Neth played a great game. Great game. T1 gonna try and make something happen here again. That recon dart is quite a nice um, thing to send into this play. Normally when teams are going fast like this, somebody gets stuck in this corner and this recon dart would light them up and allow you to pre-aim them, uh, even if a smoke was used. So for example, if it was Neth that had walked into B main there, he throws his cage, but he gets stuck in the corner. He's probably going to get lit up by the recon dart, and you're going to be able to kill him. So I like the usage of the recon there from Carpe. I think they're getting good use out of running a Silver on this map. Uh, but Neth is not actually taking B main aggressively that often. Uh, T1 are controlling B main at the start of this round. Ember does get cleared. But with that paranoia coming out into B main... They've also, they've broken the trip look. B mains camera does get cleared but with that paranoia come so uh, in this round they've put a trip wire here with the cam above it so when dfm break the trip in mid they might think that mid is open but there's still a cam watching this i like the idea of this but i feel like yeah you don't need you don't need sire to be coming back to watch this as well just because the trip gets broken, if you're tripping, camming, and you have two people watching it, you're putting too many resources into mid. Coming out into B main. Gotta wonder if DFM's gonna slow things down a little bit. Bring Pujan back on plat chat for a DFM guarantee. Who does DFM play next? Is there gonna be a DFM guarantee? Who's their next game? Now T1 has a bit of a crafty adjustment where it's not the Gen G? No, that's not happening. Who do they play after that? It's not a no. No. Who noticed the gun in his hands is the question, but either way, that thrash is not recoverable. Then they play against Bleed? Unless Bleed look really, really good this week, don't think that's gonna happen. That game is gonna be a DFM guarantee. And then it's global? Oh no, then secret. Or is it global? Global and secret. <sighs> Not gonna lie to you, DFM might have a couple of plat chat guarantees this season. Yeah, the idea is always to go back to B right now, but the do Put something else on the line for the DFM Gen G game? I've literally put blowing my house up on the line. What? What else? What else do you want? My life? What more can I give? Why does May yeet his nade back into mid? The fuck? That was supposed to be a bounce off the wall, surely, right? That's just because he's stunned and his crosshair's flying around. I've never seen somebody stunned miss utility. That was a lovely, again, more value out of the recon, uh, out of the Soviet util. And this was really nice as well from T1. Using the drone to push Medusa off the angle and then posting Excurate up onto the angle, really nice. Now, when I was watching this live, 
I was in Sliggy's chat and I was saying, I think X Group buying the operator here is a really good idea because DFM were going for a lot of late round contact A pushes. And I thought, oh, the op is going to absolutely destroy this. DFM are contacting into A, T1 have read it, and they're going to get it. But actually, this was like they used utility to exec A, and Execute still managed to find value out of the op. So, yeah, big round from Execute. He's a great op player. You just can't use the op all the time in on every map with every agent. Genji is really tough, but you have to consider Genji also have to play Paper X this weekend. That is true. That is a trap game for Genji. It is a trap game for Genji. No, I don't think it'll happen. I don't think it'll happen because I think the Genji players are just too good. I think even if DFM have really good game plans, Genji are going to just frag their way out of bad situations if they find themselves in them. I don't think there's a single DFM player that I would rate above the Gen G version of them on the roster in terms of their ability to shoot. But there's not one. May will diff. May will diff texture. No. Calm down. Calm the fuck down. To DFM to unconsciously waste a lot of time. Anthem not better than Lakia? That one's possible. But Lakia played pretty damn well in some of the maps at Madrid. His utility's good, but then so is Anthem's. Anthem's utility's good, and Anthem's been able to get a lot of fragging, uh, fragging done. That one's the closest, probably. But the others, not even close. Unfortunately. Deep lurk here for Medusa. Execure it just around the corner with that operator. Maybe Medusa versus Munchkin is close when Munchkin's having a bad day. But then sometimes Munchkin just fucking owns. Munchkin's a little bit like Angel. Neth over Meteor? No. 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 There's big value from Rossi, but May does a great job there of not only getting the entry onto the op player, but then turning around and trading out Rossi. And then he ults and gets another. Like, this is such an amazing round from May. 3v2. The overdrive available for side player. He's up close. Another recon, but this time doesn't get anything done. And as soon as the recon gets broken, that's a troll from Sire. I, I think Sire's tendencies on Neon, it kind of brings out the worst in him, to be honest. There's there's a lot of spots on the attack side and defense of this map. There's not, not every time, but there's a lot of times where he's just like YOLOing and throwing either his life away or the round away. Like if he... If he slides there off the back of the recon dart tagging somebody, then I don't mind that too badly. Um, it's still, I think, a very YOLO play. But when, uh, when the recon gets broken, just wait for Carpe and slide and then let Carpe trade. Because Carpe's got no chance of winning this now. L analysis, you are just hating SMH my head. You like the you like the Cyaneon? He's no mini boo, I don't think. Incredible endurance, incredible preparation. And once again, it's May with some heroic mechanics. Who's the VCT Pacif Pacific Ascension team? Bleed. And DFM, they're going to change the pace. They've been playing pretty slowly the entire game. 12-11, round 24, and they've got the cojones to go for a fast hit. Medusa goes for the swing through. Excret does get one onto May. But now they have pit. Their ult, like, instincts are so good. Rossi was too far away to try to deny it with his ultimate. And Sire's got an... Oh, he's got the ult, actually, to go for the retake. Sire probably needs to save his uh, stun there until people are ready to push into B main as well. Like, if Sire had saved his stun until now, 
he's actually got a chance of putting the pressure on some like if he saves his stun and then you tap you stun and you go they've actually got a bit of a chance of making this work but i i think there's a lot that t1 are doing suboptimally they've got some really nice rounds in here too i very much like the defense push out of a that they had i think they were adapting to what was going on fairly well as well but this defense side they i mean and on the attack side too they just they had a couple rounds they had like the round where they path like this where there was no smoke here and saya just sent it that round was fucking troll from t1 the retake where saya just sends it like this a little bit troll it looks like they need to work a lot on their retake uh timings and yeah overall dfm just playing a, a great game their attack side calling i thought was very very nice on this uh it was actually their defense on ascent that i thought was better uh they just had so many cool wait was it their defense yeah it was yeah their defense side on ascent was so nice and then their attack side here on sunset was super good too yeah pretty sick all right let's uh let's go back and have a look at the kc foot game shall we Carmen Core versus Foot. Dude, I I, I'm going to do the Wordle first, though. I'm, I'm staring at the tab. It's open. I want to pop the fuck off. Give me a word, chat. Give me a word. What are we beginning with? Someone posted this already, but check out this VCT connections. Ooh, wait. What is this? Ooh. Wait, what? Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Right. That's going to test our actual Varan knowledge, huh? Throw? Okay, I like that. We'll start with throw. What the fuck? You cheating or something? What is that about? Um, I mean, we should be able to get the word in like one here. Is the word north? God damn it. So the word is broth, right? Oh, I put the R in the same place. I'm so th I'm so fucking thick, bro. No. All right, we'll go from this connections into the Valorant connections. Uh, peanut, brown nut, head nut, coconut, peanut, dog's nut. That's just a fact. Um, where's the rest of the nut? Where's the rest of the nut, chat? Coconut, peanut, chestnut, and hazelnut. There, there they are. There they are. Words before nut. Um, yeah, I won't tell you what my words were before I nut. Um, grounds, lawn, field, and green. Words for grass. Grassy area. Um, hmm. Hmm. Now we get to the trickier ones, eh? I mean, fiction's a genre. But we don't really have others. Unchained. Unchained. That's such a strange word to have in there. Unchained. Um, a director, a head, a chair, and a chief. Those are all uh, the top, the head honcho, the top person, top dog, person in charge. So we've got brown dogs, fiction, unchained. Are these um, Pulp Fiction, Django Unchained, Reservoir Dogs, and I'm not a movie head. What's his brown movie? What's the brown movie? Oh, wait, are these all of the... There's a character in Reservoir Dogs called Mr. Brown. Is this... Something to do with that? Or is there a movie called Something Brown? Has Quentin Tarantino done a Mr. Brown or a Something Brown movie? Reservoir Dogs, Pulp Fiction, Django Unchained. What's the brown? What? 
What? I'm I'm getting I'm getting boggled here. No, you're gonna come in and you're gonna solve it in one second. Yeah. I've already done all the hard work. Yeah, there's only four. I've done all the rest. There's only these four left. Yeah. But what is the what is the connection? Mr. Brown from Reservoir Dogs, Pulp Fiction, and Django Unchained. Right, but why? Are... Jackie Brown, Reservoir what? Dogs. Jackie Brown. Reservoir Jackie Dogs. Brown. Who the fuck is Jackie Brown? It's a Tarantino movie. Oh, I've never heard of it. Well, I was never. I mean, I, I knew what the I knew what it was, but I have never heard of J Jackie Brown. That's not carried, chat. That's not carried. Um, what is Jackie Brown good? Meh. It's good, yeah. But it's not one of his best. Not to me, but yeah. Uh, especially because you like um, like newer stuff more, don't you? Newer stuff more. Well, because uh, don't know. What's the movie that we watched not that long ago that I had actually never seen? That was like Hateful Eight. No, that I've seen. Uh, thingy, uh, uh, Unglorious Bastards. Yes. Ah. Yeah, it's not like that. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm not sure that if you. I'm not it's sure not, not like that. Is. Oh, great! That that's a great your, reference point. If that's your reference for Tarantino movies that you really like, it's not like that. I'm right. not sure. Does it have feet? Ultra violence. Yes. And is it very cinematic, like owed to other people? Uh, other yeah. directors yeah yeah the classic tarantino yeah yeah do we see jackie's feet i don't remember oh uh, chat do you know time. do you know <laughs> can you do the name 100 women challenge i would only be able to do that if i w didn't have to do surnames because i'm so terrible with celebrities I could name a hundred women that I like know, absolutely. But you wouldn't know them. You wouldn't be able to verify it. What about history? History? Yeah. Do you know surnames of a lot of people like Lady Jane Grey? Yeah. But yeah. could I do um I'm trying I'm trying well the problem is all of the women that I know, I know the names of, so I'm trying to think of people that I don't know their surnames of. But I feel like you could rattle through a hundred women's names if you knew uh actresses singers like pop culture things and i'm just so bad with pop culture mm -hmm. could you name a hundred historical women yeah, probably. from before the 20th century why is that the category no i mean but the but when you say historical i'm thinking pre 1900s why why i don't know because historical means in the past so i'm thinking that far in the past five years ago yeah. The, the 1900s were 25 years ago. I mean, for example, I I d would some would saying something like Catherine of Aragon count, or was her name Catherine Aragon? I think it was, it was of, Catherine wasn't it? Of Aragon. Does that count though? Because that's not Can her you full not name. Name a hundred women from the 20th century. A hundred women from the 20th century specifically. Yeah. I mean, I guess anyone who's alive now, who I could name, is mostly from the 20th century. Yeah. But I'm not very good with 20th century history. So, I'm just, probably not. It doesn't have to be history. It doesn't have to be actresses. Can you name a hundred famous women? My Why do they have to be famous? I don't know a hundred famous people. They can be esports famous. Esports famous? I'm, Notoriously I'm, discriminatory against women? I'm, How am I going to do that? I'm not saying that women from esports. I'm saying they can count. Oh, fucking hell. Just read the rules, egghead. Oh, dude, Beth's going to fucking troll me. I'm so annoyed that you can't name 100 women. I, I haven't even tried. <laughs> I haven't even fucking tried. I don't, even, I don't know what the rules are. Read the rules. Okay, here's well, the rules. So, like, Here's the rules. Name one can okay cannot use chat okay, okay. can be dead women. <laughs> Why would you phrase it like that? <laughs> I don't know, but I would boss that. Honestly. Can be dead women, right? Well, Caroline Duffy is going to be top of the list. 
um, can be streamers. By the way, I'm gonna I'm gonna say the names of women right now to you, and I won't be able to remember them in three minutes from now. <laughs> <laughs> Remind me of Catherine of Aragon, Lady Jane Grey, Rosa Parks, and Caroline Duffy, please. Those are the first four. Remind me of them. Can be any version of their name. E example, Marilyn Monroe, aka Norma Jean. Why is this in Comic Sans and fluorescent pink? Who the fuck is Norma Jean? Marilyn Monroe. Why did she have two names? Is that her real name, Norma Jean? That does make sense. Marilyn Monroe does sound very, like, celebrity name. Yeah, it's 50 studio culture where everybody had to have a fake name. Why do you have two names? I don't have two names! Wait. You mean Sideshow. <laughs> oh, oh, this is going to expose me as a moron. Spelling doesn't count as long as your heart is in the right place. Yeah, it actually might be. No family, friends, or ex-girlfriend, or neighbors, or any of that shit. They have to be Googleable women or public figures. Okay, no fictional characters. Must be someone with real ass blood in their veins. Who's got ass blood in their veins? I guess everyone has ass blood in their veins. It does go around your body. There are veins in your ass. No repeats. Timer starts as soon as you type the first letter of the first name. Ends when you type the last letter of the last name. Must be typed out in a list labeled 1 to 100. Have to say their name, not a description. Example, Michelle Obama, good. Obama's wife, bad. Yeah, okay, that's, okay. I think I can do this. Give me a sec. I'll set up the spreadsheet. I'm, I'm going to pop off. What's the what's the world record? Actually, I'm not going to go for the world. <laughs> I'm not going for the world record. I'm just going for... No, I did. I, 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 I never said that. I, I said that I could name 100 women if I was allowed to do people in my life. I don't know a hundred famous people. No, I think I do though. I think it's just difficult to, I think it's just difficult to like come up with them under pressure thinking of a hundred names. All right. Oh, well, no pressure. It's just your wife sitting here getting real annoyed with you. I'm real annoyed. I haven't begun. I'm annoyed that you don't think you can do it at all. Okay. How do I, how do I move? Let me move the chat to start with. Let me move the chat uh, over here. You guys are getting moved over here. You're in a timeout. You need a timer? Can you guys not do the timer? What the f- Okay. Just use the stopwatch on your phone. Use the stopwatch. My phone's run out of battery. Of course. Um, wait there. Uh, timer. You know who doesn't let their phone run out of battery? Wait, no. T stopwatch. I need a stopwatch. Okay, this is perfect. What, who? Women? Yes. All women in the world don't let their phones run out of battery, huh? Not as All right, we've got our timer. The most scuffed way of doing this ever. Now, the rules say... Okay, can I zoom in? You can read that, right? The rules say the time begins as soon as I write the first letter of a name. Now, I'm gonna not write names. I'm gonna start by writing prompts. Histor historical wow. figure... Then, uh, actresses, then singers, and this is not cheating! This is literally by the rules! You told me! Also, if the point is to expose you for not knowing women, having prompts to make you think of women that you already know is not- that's not in any way against the, the, the idea of it. You're not testing memory recall. You're supposed to be testing misogyny. Yes? Legit? No. no! I don't think this is in the spirit of the test. No, in the spirit of it? What do you mean? The spirit of the test is that you don't need this much preamble to come up with a hundred fucking women. This much preamble, this much fucking preamble. Jesus Christ. Okay, we're going. Who did I say? Who did I say? Rosa Parks. Start, oh fuck, start the timer, start the timer. Rosa Parks, who else did I say? Catherine of Aragon, I don't know, th th that's like a fucking Lord of the Rings character. Um, then, who else did I say? I've, my mind's already gone blank, I told you, I, I said these people. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna cheat and take Marilyn Monroe because we just said that. No fic- no fictional characters? Catherine of Aragon's a fictional character! Catherine of Aragon was- 
I'm not going to refer to her as the wife of Henry VIII. I'm going to refer to her instead as one of the members of the aristocracy and monarchy in Spain, I believe. Yes, and she was the Queen of England. And yeah, became the Queen of England. Yeah. All right. So let's go for other queens of England. We'll go for Queen Elizabeth uh, the first, Queen Elizabeth the second. Um, the I mean, can I get the Queen Mother? I don't know her name, though. Oh, fuck it, Al. Princess Diana, um, uh, Meghan Markle. I don't know why I've started with <laughs> UK royalty, but here we are. Because you're a fucking Tory. No, because I began with Catherine of fucking Aragon. That's why. That's why I've gone down this bonkers route. Um, who else have we got? What's that? Kate Middleton? Middleston. All right, now let's try some other... Um, uh, there was uh, Catherine Parr was also um, a queen of England. Then we've got uh, Bloody Mary. I mean, a lot Bloody Mary was no, Bloody her first I name. Know her name. Lady Jane Grey. Yeah, I knew I'd forget her. Um, I know her last name. Mary. Her last name was Queen of Scots. The oh, other one. The other one. Yeah. yeah. Can I get that Queen of Scots? Absolutely. Yeah, but can I get Queen of Scots? Because if I'm getting Queen Elizabeth, I mean Elizabeth Windsor. Yeah. But what's Elizabeth the first last name? Oh fuck if I know. We don't refer to them with their last name. I know them. You know you don't oh you know them like that, do you? Yes. You fucking know them like that. I'm British and I know who the fuck we're talking about. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Alright, let's go for some other actresses. No. Let's go for some other historical figures. Uh Florence Nightingale. Um, let's go for, um, uh, Mary Curie. Um, let's go for, um, dude. Oh, what if I, <laughs> not dude. Oh, oh, woman. Oh, um, what if I can picture their face, but I can't remember their name? Can I, can I imprint their face? No. Oh, Dude, I'm, I'm so fucking stupid. That's the problem with this. All right, let's <laughs> let's go back to historical figures. Um, there are many more wives of Henry VIII to crack through. Um, but you have to know their actual names. Jane Seymour. Boom! There you go. Jane Seymour. Uh, then we'll go with um, Who came Anne Jane? Boleyn. There you go. Bo, 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 Anne Boleyn. Bo, Anne Bull, Anne, Anne, Bo Anne Bull in, Anne Bull in. <laughs> Timer reset. Oh, it did. No, I just went to the stopwatch. Don't worry, the timer hasn't reset. Don't worry, don't worry, chat. Don't fucking worry. Don't worry. You are failing this. They can't just be wives of someone else, and they have to be alive. No, you have read the rules wrong. They can be dead. Do my fucking list. Do my fucking list. Do my fucking list. Okay, do my fucking list. Um, all right. Let's go for. Uh, all right. I I'm I'm full transitioning. Let's go for Billie Eilish, <laughs> from Anne Boleyn to Billie Eilish. Also, how the Lord's name do you spell Eilish? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Uh, let's go for Ariana Grande. Let Let's go for Beyonce. Knowles? Hey! <laughs> Let's yeah, go for... Actually, her last name's Carter now, but that's fine. Oh, her last name's Carter? It's fine. Knowles is her... It's fine. Nay Knowles? Yes. Yeah? Yeah? yeah. Okay. Um, why Carter? Who did she marry that's Jay Carter? Jay-Z's last name isn't she's, Z. She's Mrs. Carter. Keep going. Okay. I mean, I would have fa failed with men as well. I would have written down Jay-Z and not known his name. Um, right, wh uh, where was I? Where was I? Uh, let's go for Florence Pugh. Oh. Let's go for Anna de Armas. Let's go for Kira Knightley. Listing my crushes now? Yes. Let's go for... Oh, speaking of Beth's crushes, <laughs> what the fuck is the name of Ginger Spice when she's at home? <laughs> don't know! I don't know! What the hell is her name? <laughs> don't expose me like that. Can I just write down Ginger Spice? <laughs> Am I allowed to do that? <laughs> Just use the stage name. Ginger Spice is allowed. 
Ginger Spice, uh, Scary Spice, was her name like Mel B or something? Mel B, um, fucking, I never listened to the Spice Girls. Why am I down the Spice Girls rabbit hole? <laughs> Why have I gone here? This was a terrible place. Now I've got to dig my way out. Right, Beth's crushes. <laughs> Fuck, um, let's go for, uh, what's the name of, what's the name of E from V for Vendetta? Who, um, uh, Natalie Portman. Natalie Portman. Let's go for a, um... You're just fucking exposing me to the internet. Yeah. That's the only way you can come up with women. Oh, I'm gonna write down cunt, and that means, uh, J.K. Rowling. Oh. Um, and, I, you know, just, just to throw that one in there. Thank you. Um, so, number 25, um... Oh, sorry. In America, cunt's very uh, yeah. gendered, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, let's go like, with let's go with dickhead. Sorry, you know. let's go with dickhead Two because it's so yeah. That's that's like a very very um, very masculine term of of calling someone a prick. Um, <laughs> yeah, I think that might be the that might be a first. Name a hundred women and I've called one of them cunt. That's probably really bad PR, isn't it? I think it gets saved because J.K. Rowling. What a dickhead. Um, okay, sorry, we're wasting time. We're, we're wasting time. We're wasting time. Uh, where was I? Where was I? Where was I? Um, right. Well, let's let's think about some authors. Daniel, I was not calling women cunts. I was calling transphobes cunts. <laughs> Danielle Steele, um, we've got to know uh, many more women authors. Let's go for, uh, who was the one? Jemima Puddle Duck author. Jemima Puddle Duck author wrote, ah, uh, uh, oh, Jesus Christ, what's her name? What's Jemima Puddle Duck? Jemima, dude, you don't know Jemima Puddle Duck? Chat. She doesn't know Jemima Puddle Duck. You don't know a hundred women. Yeah, that, no, I'm, I'm halfway. Well, no, I'm quarter of the way there. Who's, who's, who's fucking Jemima Puddle Duck? I don't understand what you're saying. It was a British author with beautiful watercolor uh, paintings to go along with it. Are you talking about the like rabbit? Yes, with Peter Rabbit. Yeah. Peter Rabbit as well. Fuck, I can't remember her fucking name, and now I'm stuck. I'm just fixating on that name. All right, let's move on. Let's go for um, uh, the Bronte sisters. Let's go for Charlotte Bronte and Emily Bronte? Is that correct? I don't think so. Isn't it? I don't think so. Was it not Charlotte and Emily? I don't think Emily Bronte's person, but... Is it not Emily Bronte? I don't know the Brontes that well. Uh, chat, can I get a verification on that? Is it Emily Bronte? I think it is. Yes, that's right. Oh, okay. Cool. Dominated. Okay. Um, all right, let's think of uh, some other famous women authors. Um, all right, let's let's no, let's move on to when I was I was popping the fuck off when I was going for uh, actresses actually. So we're going to continue with actresses. We're going to go for. Um, Oh, what's her surname? Are you throwing for content? No, 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 I'm not throwing for content. The The woman who plays Jessica in... Um, I'm not allowed to help you. I'm oh, yeah, I know. Actually, but, like, but, but I need verification. The person that plays Jessica in Dune, is her name Rebecca Carpenter? Is that correct? I think you're not supposed to go to chat. No, okay, it was Rebecca Ferguson. Fuck, I'm wrong, so we'll scratch that. I'm not allowed to use that. Right. Well, I forgot her surname, chat. Uh, let's go for... Um, Margot Robbie. Margot Robbie. That's a person. That is a person. And also, let's go for Tina Fey, because I'm thinking Barbie connection. Then, um, unfortunately, I don't know the names of many... Other people that are on. Oh, let's Lucy think Taskmaster. Oh, okay. Wait, Taskmaster. Lucy. D ah, Davies? Lucy Davies? Is that her name? Fuck me. I'm so not sure about people's surnames. I don't think with surnames, chat. What's your favorite Tina Fey movie? Full of women. Dude, I well, Barbie is the one that I was thinking of. Oh, uh, Greta Thunberg. Uh, 
is what my head said because the director of the movie is also called Greta mm -hmm. and I don't know her surname. Nope. Greta What do you mean Barbie was your favorite Tina Fey movie? No, I don't know that Barbie was my Tina, favorite Tina Fey movie. It's just the one that sprung to mind immediately. Why? Why? Because we watched it most recently. It was the, it was the most recent Tina Fey movie that we've watched, isn't it? She's playing Barbie. No, she directed it. She was part of the like director producer team, wasn't she? She didn't direct it. No, not directed. I swear she was involved in it, wasn't she? It doesn't matter. Keep going. Okay, keep I going. Keep going. Keep your going. Favorite Tina Fey All right. Movie. Like your favorite Stevie movie. Stevie Nicks. I don't know whether that's how you spell her name, but we're gonna go with Stevie Nicks. I think that is actually it. Um, let's go with. Um, the other singer was Stevie. Uh, let's go with. Um, dude, I, I can picture their faces. What the fuck are you called? Um. The why have you just popped into my head, Hillary Duff? <laughs> Who the fuck? <laughs> because I'm trying to think of other people's names, and other people's names are coming into my head. Lindsay Lohan is who I was trying to think of, because I was thinking of the connection to other people's names who I can't remember either. Dude, I'm terrible with names, man. All right, um. Who else can we... Where else can we go? Where else can we go? I'm sure there's more historical figures that we can pluck. Um, let's go for... Right, give me a... Ca let, let me think in terms of categories again. In terms of the wider historical figures category, we have... Um, we have politicians! Yeah. What an area that I haven't even gotten close to! Angela Merkel... Well, I don't know how you spell I'm her name. I'm so glad that I assumed... Hillary Clinton. I assumed I knew who the first female politician that was going to pop into your head was. And I was like, what, you knew it was you? Angela Merkel? No, I thought it was... Oh, you Trump. assumed it was going to be Margaret Thatcher. I did, yeah. Margaret... Why did you assume it was going to be Margaret Thatcher? Because earlier... Don't spam Tory chat. Because earlier today you were talking about getting a Margaret Thatcher painting for the new house. That's not true! <laughs> That's not true! She's making that up! <laughs> She's making that up, chat. She's making that up. That's not true. We the new, oh my God, the new house. My office is going to have a fireplace in it. And Beth said, you're going to look so fucking Tory with a fireplace in the background. I'm going to get a pet. She said, no, I'm going to get a painting of Winston Churchill for your background. Yeah. And I said, oh yeah, oh, uh, we could go even further and go Margaret Thatcher. I did not really mean I'm going to get a fucking picture of Margaret Thatcher for, the, for, for my office. I'm not going to do that. Right, politicians. Do I need to get AOC's full name? Anastasia Ocasio-Cortez? There you go. Okay, can I just write AOC, well, though? Because I don't want to type Alexandra, all of that out. But what? It's Alexandra. Oh, it's Alexandra. Like, fine, you had it. Okay, yeah. yeah, my bad. I got a surname correct, though. Yeah. Not Anastasia. Sh shut the fuck up, chat. Shut the fuck up. Alexandria, shut the fuck up. Alexandra. Alexandra, shut the fuck up, chat. <laughs> um, oh, speaking of which, let's go with Cleopatra. Because <laughs> that just popped into my head because of the Library of Alexandria. Uh, can I get the Queen of Sheba? I don't know. I mean, the Queen of Sheba, very famous historical woman, Queen of Sheba. I don't know. No? What do you mean, no? I think that's a, I think that's valid. Still no VCT talent. Oh, my colleagues, they're all Googleable women. Yeah. I was trying not to pick people from my life because I assume they're not Googleable. No. It said streamers are fine, so I would assume esports famous. Okay, I'm just going to write down VCT streamers, and then I'm going to come back to that later on. Overwatch. Um, what, sorry? And Overwatch, you know more women than just VCT? Yeah, 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 OW as well, yes. Okay, but where was I going? I was in politician mode. Right, so politician. Let's oh, think... <laughs> let's think UK politicians. Okay, so we've got uh, Margaret Thatcher, we've got... Um, and some prime buffoons in office. Let me think. Big what? Brexit. Yeah, we've got Liz Truss. Um, we've also got um, uh, fucking what's her name? Ah, oh, I can picture her face. She she was running through wheat fields. What's yeah. the worst thing that you've ever done? Oh, I used to run through the wheat fields. What is your bastard name? Um, your name is Minnie Margaret Thatcher. 
Um, Jesus Christ, why can't I remember the name of a former prime minister? Um, this is shocking because I'm not even English. Yeah, I know, but, but, but names escape me very often. What was her name? It's really completely vanished from my head. I can't remember what her name was. Um, okay, let's 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 move on. Let's go with, um, dude. What was the name of the Finnish prime minister? Don't know. Don't know what her name was. Let's go with, um, oh, Jesus Christ. That was a man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but speaking of which, let's go with Mary Magdalene. Oh, she's a character from a book. God damn it. No, actually, I'm a die in the fucking... I'm a, a die in the paint. Die in the paint? Die in the wool? I'm a die in the wool Christian, and actually, that's offended me terribly. Um, okay, we won't go for biblical figures then. We'll leave out the biblical figures. Um, I must be able to name more women politicians than this. Come on. There's some absolute fucking jokes in the UK. Uh, Diane Abbott. Diane Abbott. Um, let's go for... Um, 17 minutes. It's 17 minutes because you're chirping away, yeah, distracting me. I could have cracked all of these out. I could have cracked all of these out. No worries. Um, okay. Uh, Eve. She's from the Bible. Um, no, let's go with... Um, Wow, wow, I really thought the politician hole would go deeper than this, but my brain, my, what? Nothing. You don't like the phrase, the politician's hole? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I should probably, probably not go there, to be honest. All right, well, let's start, let's start going, I'll, I'll refresh my memory by going through some of my other colleagues. Let's go with Zoe Gushwint Pinsky. That's not how you spell Schwint, actually, there's got an H in there somewhere. Though it's probably not there. <laughs> put uh, fuck it. Put the age anywhere. Um, the, the, uh, actually, that might not be her surname anymore either. But uh, okay. Um, let's go with. Um, oh, I don't know Liz's surname. She's got a very long surname. I don't. I don't know. It begins with an M, and it's very Italian. And I don't know the surname. I don't, I don't, Let's go with Mimi Wormkrantz. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, I don't fuck. Even know the women I know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, I know them. I just, I can't listen. I don't know all of their fucking every part of their names. You don't even know every part. Well, I mean, can I do Liz M? No. No, I have you to know more than that, don't I? Name. I don't. Oh, you can, it's just stage name. You can use usernames for esports coworkers or figures. That seems disrespectful. It does. I don't think, I, I don't think it's acceptable to use stage names of people you know in person. I, I, I don't think that's, I don't think that's acceptable. <laughs> that I should hold myself to a higher standard. Jesus Christ. Okay, so let me try and think. The people that we worked with in Overwatch, we had Zoe on the desk, and we had, um, did we have, uh, we had Lemon Kiwi, who I only know as Lemon Kiwi, I'll be honest with you. We also had, um, oh, the problem is the newer Overwatch people that came in as I was leaving, I only know them by their stage names because I don't know them in person. Yes, I know, but oh, but they're not Googleable. That like people behind the scenes. No, they're not Googleable, so no, I can't use that's them. That's not who I'm talking about. What do you mean? I then? can think of at least one person that's or I can in Overwatch. Of, yeah, two people that are Googleable. Two people in Google. What like like Gregory, no, the player? No, I mean that you worked with. That I worked with. Oh yes. Jesus fucking Christ! Well now, now this is the worst case scenario because now I can't remember my colleagues. I can't remember who I've worked with. That's terrible. I, uh, oh, oh, oh. Wow. We're right. Like 20 minutes and you're not even halfway through. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine, actually. You think it's fine. I am horrified. No, this is, this is actually fine. This is fine. 
Um, so, right. Um, the problem is as well, there's so many esports people that I, I've met and I only know them by their stage names. Um, well, I was thinking Shocks, who I've actually never worked with, but I also don't know her name. Is her name Shocks? I don't think her name is Shocks, but I, I don't know what her... <laughs> Dude, Beth is fucking melting. I don't have to do the cat. <laughs> Beth is fucking dying. Dude. Okay, Gregory. What's what what was Gregory's name? I think it was uh Georgina Eggery. I think that was <laughs> I think that was her name. Um okay. Um E if -E Is that Shock's name? E if if E if I think that's her name. Something something like that. But uh, can I can I go with shocks? Yeah. I'm gonna go with shocks. Okay. Um, we've also got Mika Burton. There we go. That's one of the people. Boom. Thinking about. Boom. And then we've also got. We cycled through a lot of Overwatch talent. Um. <laughs> Did you cycle through a lot? A no. Lot of Overwatch talent. No, I'm cycling <laughs> through my brain. What I mean is we 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 worked with a lot of Overwatch talent. Um. Uh, dude, I, I, I need it, so I'm gonna go with Lemon Kiwi, because for the life of me, I can't remember what Lemon Kiwi's name is, and that's so embarrassing. Oh, um, uh, okay. Then, uh, Vicky Kitty, as well. Now, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say Vicky Kitty's name is Vicky, um, but, uh, I have never learned what their surname is, so I'm gonna go with Vicky Kitty. And, um, uh, then... I'm gonna go with uh ba 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 da ba. Who else did we have? Uh, Geo as well. Now, what the heck is Geo's name? Is that Geo? Maybe it's Geo. I'm gonna go with Geo. Um, then what else we what else did we have? Um, now let me think. Do you reckon Ashley is Googleable? Middlebrook. No, but I'm gonna I'm gonna send that. I I uh, listen. Beth thinks it's Googleable, so I'm I'm gonna I'm Ashley gonna go away for that. And probably very famous. What? Sorry. I said Ashley's a boss bitch, and I'm sure she's very famous. Yeah, and then um, then we had Danny doing the Korean interviews and Emily doing the Chinese interviews. Um, whose surname is Tang? Is it? Emily Tang? And we also had, um, somebody come in that could do French translated interviews in the Overwatch World Cup, um, who also did comedy stuff and some modeling, I think, as well, whose name was... And still probably is. <laughs> hmm. We'll return back to that. We'll return back to that. We're going to do some VCT ones. We're going to go with Yin Su. I know her last name. What the fuck? I'm blanking, I Beth. I know it. I'm blanking. <laughs> I'm fucking blanking. I, 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 the knowledge exists, but Lord knows it's escaped me. Yinsu's surname is. Survey says. Oh my god. Her name's Yinsu. When do I ever refer to her by her fucking surname? Uh... Yinsu. Hey, Chad, do you know of a good divorce attorney? Okay, but also, I don't know Mitch's surname. I don't know Tom's surname. I don't know Hypox's surname. Fucking hell. How am I blanking on that? Yinsu. What the hell? Okay. Um, right. Uh, then we've also got Kukuka. Now, Kukuka's name is B. Oops, fuck. Uh, Bayer. And her surname is... <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Her surname is K 
Kakuka. Bea Kakuka. <laughs> Am I Liz Truss? Says Elizabeth, Elizabeth Marquini. Marquini! I mean, I got it from the chat, but like, where is, where is Liz? Where did I put Liz? That is absolutely cheating. You're not, You're supposed, not supposed to, to read chat. chat? But come on, I said Liz earlier, and I said Liz M. I put Liz M. I just couldn't remember Marquini. You can't go to chat. But I, but I named her. That's intensely cheating. Oh, fucking hell. Well, I, well, I, I can't remember Bayer's second name either. I don't know people's surnames. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cheat and put Kakuka. All in caps. <laughs> Kakuka! Kakuka! <laughs> right. Okay. Then also, there's, uh, I mean, there's Jen who does the Korean interviews. Would you like a surname? Would I like it? Because I can't provide it. I can't provide it, but it's Jen. <laughs> she has an English name and a Korean name. Yeah, well, I, I, I know her as Jen. I know her as Jen. Jen isn't fucking Googleable. Well, I'm not saying that these people have incredible SEO. I didn't set up the SEO for them. Oh, okay. And then, um, right. And then we've also got, we've got Pansy. Now, Pansy's real name is... Are you shitting me? Stop! Because all my brain is coming up with is Jackson. That's because she played Jackson when she inflicted psychological warfare upon my fucking person. Pansy's name is Lauren. How the fuck do you get through the day? <laughs> <laughs> do you know your own surname? Yes, I know my own surname. Do you know mine? Yes, I know yours. <laughs> You took mine. Her name is Robert Paulson. Lauren. Lauren. Her name is fucking Lauren. I call her Lauren. I don't call her Mrs. Something. Oh, Lauren. Pansy. Pansy. <laughs> um, then, um, uh, then we've also got, uh, yeah, we've got. We're at almost 30 minutes and you're on 54. <laughs> <laughs> you're distracting me. You're distracting me. Right. Other people in VCT that we work with. Okay. We've got Dan Dryad and no, her, I know her first name is Dan and her stage name is Dryad. I I don't know surnames. Um, um, fuck it, dude. I I am I'm I'm just outing myself as a terrible colleague. You really are. You nailed it going through pop stars and actresses earlier. You don't know any because, of your actual friends. No, names. because when you talk to your friends, you only talk to them with their first name. You don't say, "Oh, Elizabeth Marquini, please, could you do this interview?" I know because you see them written down, maybe. I talk to them. I don't know. Oh, where do I see them written down? On the work schedule? <laughs> Are you high? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. 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 Um, right. Let's move on to uh, streamers. I mean, streamers, I'm just never go, getting their yeah, surnames. I'm never getting their surnames. All right. Well, we'll go with Cutie Cinderella because that was the person that nominated the challenge that I'm currently fucking abysmally failing. Pretty bad. Um, then we've also got, um, we've also got Quarter Jade. The name you put in should be Googleable. The names the Yinsu and Pansy are Googleable. Google Jen and see what happens. Okay, well, how about you Google Jen Valorant interviewer? You'll come up with the answer, Alpha Crash. The, the the people are supposed to be Googleable, not the names. Not the names. Stop looking at <clears throat> Okay, okay, okay. Um who else? Who else have we got here? Uh we've got what other streamers um do we see? Uh streamers. What sorry? You've come up with two streamers. I don't watch streams. They don't have to be good. Uh Alexandra Botez. 
uh, then her sister Andrea Botez. Um, speaking of which, because they're chess, we also have Judith Polgar, um, greatest women's chess player of all time. And then we have, now my knowledge of women's chess players is appalling. It can't be but, worse than your knowledge of your coworkers. But women's sports players, now we're starting to get onto something. However, my knowledge of sports players is also terrible. By the way, we tried to do this before. I could not name 10 players in the NBA. All time? All time. No, current, current. I couldn't name 10 players. I know more than 10 players, but I couldn't name more than 10 players. Maria Sharapova, Serena Williams, Venus Williams. Um, uh, oh, fuck. What's the name of um, the... Uh, the player that you really like. I'm not sure who the player is that you really like. Yeah, that's what, who I'm trying to think yeah. of. The Tunisian player. I know her name. Uh, oh, but what? How are, some people are just able to conjure names better than others. I, I know that her name is like short and round sounding. <laughs> Jesus Christ. But it is, isn't it? <laughs> I mean. It is, it's got like an owl kind of vowel in there. Or like an O kind of vowel in there. I just can't remember the, the, the pieces that put it together. Okay, then move on to someone else. No, because now I'm stuck on this. Tunisian tennis player, goated, extraordinarily good. Her name is... It's short. It's real short. It's real short. Her name is... Her name is... Move on. I'm not moving on until I remember this. I'm not... Re Her name is... This is painful. Yeah, because I can't fucking remember the... Pe the name. Dude, I know the person. I can't remember their goddamn name. Okay, uh, I must know some other tennis people as well. Um, although I'm not that... Uh, down with tennis. I don't watch it that often. Who else do we know? Uh, who's been making it to all of the finals? Uh, women's players uh, in the UK. There's um, Brown, I think. But I can't remember what her first name is. And... Listen, move the fuck along. Move the fuck along. I'm lost. How can I only, how can I only remember the names of three women's tennis players off the top of my head? Yep, this yeah. is shocking. This is shocking. What is the name? I can picture her face so accurately. What is her name? I'm stuck in a rut. Put you out of your misery. No. Okay, yeah, I'm not gonna use the name. Just tell me her name. Ons! Ons! God damn it! I knew it was short and round with an O in it. I can't remember. Oh, okay. Can you stream the divorce? Uh, no. <laughs> uh, thank you for the. Worry, thank you for the hundred bits. Income. Thank you for the hundred bits. <laughs> what? Sorry. I said I'll need an income to pay her lawyer. <laughs> I'll start streaming. Okay. Okay. Um, right. Where were we? We were. We were going nowhere. Right. Other famous sports players. Um, Driver with Williams. the one that does interviews for uh, people when we're watching F1 as well? No. That wasn't who I was talking about. Oh. Never mind. The one that had won a shit ton of stuff and they were talking about her breaking into F1. What? Oh, wait, do you mean... I don't know who you mean. Just keep going. Just Okay, well, there's... Um, I'm not going to try and walk you through this. Is it... Is her name... Uh, is it Susie? Susie Wolf? Mm -hmm. Susie Wolf. And then, that's not how you spell wolf, surely. W Is it double L? It's, no, it's double F. Double F? Is that correct? Yep. Um, and then, 
the um what's um shit Shit. No, the woman who's fantastic at breaking down the analytical stuff on the F1 oh. broadcast, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, who is super knowledgeable and used to work for the teams. Yeah. Her name is. You hear her voice all the goddamn time. Names don't stick with me, motherfucker. I I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, right. Um, let's go for... I know you're never going to get it. It's Bernie Collins. Bernie Collins! <laughs> oh, I know these, but my brain can't remember them. Um, okay. Right, where else are we going? Uh, what's another sport? Um, uh, football players. The Lionesses team... Um, has somebody from around here, doesn't doesn't it? Somebody from Whitby, mm -hmm. and her name, her surname, is like, it's like Moore. It's got like a double O, or, or like a, it's got like a double thing in it. It does, it does. It's uh, it's it Beth. Like it, but it's her not. name is Beth. I know. And then I her know. surname. Yeah, I know her name. Yeah, her, her, her name is like Beth. It's something like Beth Womb. But it's not Beth Womb or Beth Moore, no. but it's something like that. Uh, not really. It is. <laughs> <laughs> In my head it is. Her name is... God, she's so fucking good. Yeah, she is. Um, why her name is notable. Yeah. Her name is... <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. I'm afraid we're not going to be able to get that one because I just can't remember surnames. It was Mead, by the way. Mead. Yeah, it sounds like a double E. And it's like more Mead. Oh, it's so... It is. It is. In my head, that those are connected. More Mead. Beth Mead. Fuck's sake. Okay. Um, so it's E-A. It's not even a double E. Right, but it sounds like the double E. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, though, I don't think I know the names of anybody else on the Lionesses squad because... <laughs> Okay. I d I listen, I, I don't think I could name a single player from the England football team no, of the men's. It's that slabhead. Would I be allowed slabhead if I was doing a list I mean, of men's I players? Know, I would know who you meant. And I'd be shocked if that was actually true. But anyway. Um, right. Uh, what else? Uh, badminton, I don't know any women's players. Um, I don't know any men's players anyway. I don't know why I said that as if I... Yeah. I don't know any players. You follow badminton. I, I think there's a top Chinese player called Lin or something who's incredible. I, I've watched like one video about it. I don't watch uh, pro badminton very often. Story. Yeah, well, um, what other sports are there in the world? Football. What are some other sports? <laughs> um, there's... What are some other sports? Squash. I don't watch professional squash. I don't watch professional enemy sports. How am I going to know any of these? Why am I going down the sports route? I don't know any professional sports. Um, what about... Um, what about... The, there's got to be so many categories that I haven't gone for yet. What are some categories? Um, well, there's more than four streamers. Oh, streamers. Yeah, but the problem is I don't watch streamers. Who do I watch? Um, not many, but who are people around the Valorant scene who do co-streaming? Okay, Kaide. Um, who are some other people around the Valorant stream who do co-streaming that I run into all the time? All right, well, we could go for Valorant pros as well, but Lord knows I'm not getting their full names. I couldn't name the, the any Valorant pros full names, really. <laughs> Um, un unless it's Charles Neddington. Um, so can we go with like G2 Mimi? And also, by the way, don't want, don't analyze game changes. So that's, this is going to fuck me right up. Um, then we've got, uh, Athena. We've got, um, I mean, I should just be able to rattle through some of the rosters though, surely. We've got, 
Um, you know what? Actually, I'm not even going to go down this route because I'm going to miss out so many people and just get exposed as a fucking fraud. Babe, you've already been exposed. <laughs> <laughs> We're at 40 minutes. No, 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 no. Don't worry. Don't worry. I, I, this will be fine. This will be fine. Um, this will be fine. This is reminiscent of like Romney's binders full of 40 women. minutes, 65 <laughs> women, over a minute and a half per woman. I can't think of categories. I can't think binders. of names. You have like an index card. An index card? Instead of binders. Full yeah, of instead women. of a binder. Yeah, I absolutely you could. You post it. Okay. All right. Let me write. Okay. Let's go with, um, let's go with, uh, fluorescent. Let's go with Bob. Let's go with, um, I'm thinking star players. Oh, Gregory as well. Yeah, Gregory. We'll go, we'll go with Gregory too. Um, based Bob. Yeah. Okay. Um, right. I, the thing is though, I need another category as well. Um, uh, oh, singers. I gave up on singers because I immediately transitioned to actresses. Yeah, go um, with singers. Right, let's go with some... Bob who, the fucking builder? Bob the goated player from... Well, not even Game Changers, actually. Bob the goated player from uh, Challengers. Um, uh, singers, singers. The Australian. Um, right, okay, singers. All right, uh, so wh what, had I, what had I done? I'd done... Um, <clears throat> Billy... Uh, uh, no, I did. I did Billie Eilish. No, don't say that on the internet. <laughs> get, get, get your head in the game here. Get your head in the game get here, Beth. Get my head in the game. We are at 42 minutes. Get your get, 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 This is fine. You, you keep distracting me. That's the main reason that the timer keeps going up. That's, 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 that's the main that's, reason that the timer keeps going up here, Beth. That's not how time works. Yes, but, it is. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> right. So, what was I talking about? Um... Right, let's go with, um, what, what's the surname of Florence from Florence and the Machine? I, I don't Am I allowed just Florence from Florence and the Machine? <laughs> <laughs> Florence of the Machine. Yeah, Florence of the Machine of fame. Uh, <laughs> okay, well, okay, I don't know, well, that was, that was my, where my head went first. Um, uh, what, um... Uh, Tina Turner. Hey. Um, uh, Elizabeth Fitzgerald. No, Eli no. <laughs> Ella Fitzgerald. Hey. Holy shit. I knew that was wrong as soon as I said it. <laughs> Ella Fitzgerald, let's go with, um, let's go with Nina Simone. Let's go with, um, Kate Bush. Let's go with um uh who the fuck is um oh god what's her name? This is so bad. Why can I not remember her name? The um uh Hannah Montana came in like a wrecking ball. What's your name? It's oh why am I so bad at name recollection? Your name is It's gone completely. There's other people in the world. You don't have to remember her name. Yeah, but I've got but 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 how? How can I not? That's crazy. I have been That's crazy. Myself that many times. Um what we were talking about them earlier, and now their names completely vanish out of my head. You know what this is as well? I'm a serial choker. I choke under pressure. I choke under pressure. I saw it in my TF2 career. I see it every time I stream playing Valorant. I choke. You put pressure on me, I fucking choke. Stop ranting and play the goddamn game. Uh, right. Um... I'm trying to think of the person's name that we were talking about earlier that um plastic bag you're like a plastic bag floating in the wind ba 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 her name's like kate isn't it or katie or something um but yes you're on the right track lord fucking knows it's just disappeared from my head completely 
Um, all I can think of is Katie Price, but I don't think was You're that close. Was Kate was Katie Price um, the model from the early two thousands? Jordan, is that Kate Price? I have no idea. I think I think that is chat, isn't it? Katie Price, yes. Okay, well I'm getting Katie Price then as well. Um, right. Uh, all I can think of is Kate Bush, but that's not Kate Bush. Plastic bag. There's other figures. Yeah, but as soon as my mind gets set on one person, then I can't think of anybody else because the, my mind's stuck. I don't have the bandwidth freed up. I'm I'm too busy thinking about Dolly, other people. Dolly, Dolly. Okay, Dolly, Dolly, uh, Dolly, oh pa Dolly Parton. Oh, okay, yeah. It is Dolly Parton, isn't it? But I'm yeah. second guessing everything now because you're because you're mocking me. If you fucked up Dolly Parton, I might. Have but also, you. Dolly Parton's not a real name, right? Marilyn Monroe's, not Marilyn Monroe's real name. It's fine. It's yeah, fair enough. It's fine. Yeah, fair enough. That is fine. That is fine. Okay, who's the... Um... God. Why can I not remember the first name of this person? Um, they, they starred in Funny Face. They are unanimously known as, like, the world's most, no, not the world's most, but, like, historically, like, at the, the conventionally beautiful woman. And their name is... Don't know. What are you, what are you, what are you putting on there? Uh, they can't see that. They can't see that. They still can't see that. You've written it too small. Okay. Um, right. What uh, other other they other saw, singers? They saw it just other fine. singers. Okay, I I couldn't see it. Um, <laughs> uh, Aretha 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 Franklin. Close enough. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I? <laughs> Why are I? <laughs> no, urethra no not urethra no no not urethra no chat no that's not what i said that's not that's not that's not what i said you gotta show your urinary tract a little respect no no chat <laughs> Aretha, isn't it? Yes, it Franklin, is. yeah. That's not what you said. That's no, but I said Aretha, but I put in an extra R. Urethra. No, it wasn't Aretha. <laughs> Fucking hell, dude. Um, oh, geez, okay, God. okay, okay. Um, singers, right. Very famous women singers. Uh, Taylor Swift. How have we not got Taylor Swift yet? Um, uh, Olivia Rodrigo. Rod Rigo. Um, then we'll go for Gre Greta Gerwig. Is that her name? Yeah. Oh, you see, I'm using up parts of my brain thinking about other ones that I should have given up on. Yeah. That's the fucking problem. I can't think once I get stuck on something. They just the brain keeps churning and blocking other thoughts you from have coming to in. I will, I will, I will finish it before an hour. I will finish it before an hour. I need two per minute. I need two women per minute. It should be very simple. It should be, it should be really simple. Um, Cutie does a podcast. Cutie Cinderella does a podcast with Maya. Don't know what their surname is, but streamer. So don't need to. Um, I mean, uh, we've also, okay. We've got Amaranth. I mean, me famous, like streamer. I didn't, famous streamer. Famous streamer. didn't say anything. I was famous okay. streamer. Stop. Famous streamer. You are running out of time. I'm not running out of fucking time. I'm I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay. 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 Other very famous streamers on At Twitch. Alinity. What? <laughs> no, no, no. 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 Okay. Um. Other. Uh, right, singers. Let me get back on the singers track because the singers track was was doing okay. So what else have we got? We've also got we've got singers. Um, what what's some of the music that I listen to? Uh, da -da 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 -da. You listen to mostly men because you're a woman. 
you're a chauvinist. <laughs> Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Um, unfortunately, I don't know many... <laughs> Any uh, unbelievable, names? Unbelievable, um, true, but unbelievable. Mm. <laughs> mm. Rushed up. Thank you for the gifted sub to divorce attorney. There we go. That'll that'll start the uh, that'll start it. Um, okay. What about? Get me. Okay. Get me back on the uh, Joe Brand on the UK comedian train. There you go. Joe Brand. Um, then. Again, Lucy Davis. Is it a Le Lucy Davids? Is that not her name? I think it is Lucy Davis. Lucy Davis? Davis? Davies? Davids? Like that. I, know I mean, the mean. spelling is okay. I know who you mean. Yeah. Um, then we've also... Uh, we've got... Um, fuck me. Uh, They're not at this rate, no. Who else? Thanks. Okay. Uh, wait, Nicole Kidman just came into my head. Who is Nicole Kidman? Is that an actress? She's definitely not on Taskmaster. No, she wasn't on. But uh, but I was just generating names in my head, and one of them was like, boom, correct. Okay. Um, then we've got oh Z Zendaya, Zendaya. There you go. That's good. Don't know what don't know what her surname is. No, that's fine. Does that's she have like... yeah? Um, then uh, what else? Uh, Rihanna. There you go. Um. A women with one name, okay. Madonna. There you go. Um, then um, uh, Eve of biblical fame. Nope. Uh, <laughs> um, okay, okay. Uh, women with one name. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. We're drawing a blank there. That's Let's fine. go back. Go back to go back to um, uh, panel shows. We've got um, I'm not gonna remember last name. Okay. Rachel Riley. Rachel Riley. Oh who is on countdown then in dictionary corner her name is don't know but i've just thought of joanna lumley uh joanna lumley you okay a piece of the desk that's smashed in what never mind i was trying to help you oh no i'm no i'm out. sorry i'm lost I'm lost. Okay, no, we. Uh, this is this is fine though. This is no, fine. No, it's not. It's fine. It's fine. Um, then we've got. Uh, <laughs> let me think. We're going on panel shows again. Panel shows. Panel shows. Panel shows. We've got. Um, uh, who? I've got a lot of faces. I don't got a lot of names. Got a lot of faces. Don't got a lot of names. Um. Uh <laughs> Um We've got uh <laughs> Give me a second here. I need to get onto a good track again. Let's let's go. <laughs> Just give me a moment, okay? You're not giving me enough time. This is the problem. I'm always being rushed. I'm constantly being rushed. Um, let's go for. Let's go for. Let's go for. Um, what 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 track is gonna work for us here? What track is gonna work for us? Let's go for. Porn stars are your only hope. No, no asp, no. What are we going for here? Um, what are we going for? We're going for... Uh, let's go back to actresses. It should be so simple. There's, I definitely know way more actresses than that. Um, we need to just start with a movie and then make connections. That's, that's how the brain functions. So let's start with... Um, somebody... Let's start with... Uh, uh, nope, I've immediately gone for a person that I don't know their surname, so that's fucking stupid. I went for the, um, I went for the herbology person from Harry Potter, whose name's Merriam, uh, and, and I can't remember their surname. And they wrote a fantastic book recently, and I can't remember what it is. There's other women in those movies. I, yeah, I know. Um, including, uh... 
including Emma Watson. Okay, that wasn't what I was thinking of. Um, and also including... It's another Emma. Yeah, Thompson. Emma Thompson. Um, then we've also got... Um, we've also got... Uh, who else? Who the fuck else have we got? We've also got... Oh, come on. We only need seven more people. Sure, this should be so simple. Right, back to historical figures. Back to historical figures. We've got... What are some categories of historical people? We've got royalty. Uh, there's no way that I've expended all of the royalty. Did, did, I didn't have uh, Mary, Mary Queen of Scots. I'm allowed, sure. right? At this point, yeah. Mary Queen of Scots. I mean, what the, what the hell is the surname? Like, Mary Scott? Mary... The, the Mary... Mary Scotland? Scotland person? Um, okay, then we also have, I mean, then we have bl writers, Bloody Mary, that's their stage name. <laughs> I'm allowed Bloody Mary. Come on, we've got to be allowed Bloody Mary. That doesn't count? What do you mean we're not allowed Bloody Mary? It was a, I can tell you exactly who they were. That's the same woman, you dumb fuck? No, is it? <laughs> Wait a second, is it really? Is that the same person? Uh, I thought Mary Queen of Scots and Bloody Mary were two different people. I think they are two different people. It counts. It's not the same person. No, yeah, thank you. It's a, it's, a, it's a fuck you, chat. Fuck you, dumbasses. Bloody not understanding your Tudor history. Okay. Bloody Mary was Mary Tudor. Mary Tudor. Of course, because they're called the Tudors. That makes so much sense. Okay. Um. Then, who else have we got? Um. We've also got. Uh, Famous writers. Okay, I went through some famous writers. Poets! Carol Ann Duffy! Did I not say Carol Ann Duffy? No. Literally the person that I said I would forget the name of, who was going at the top of the fucking list, and guess what? Didn't do Carol Ann Duffy at the very beginning. I lost to Super. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> oh, I lost to Super. You have three minutes, four names. Liz is ahead of you when she started ten minutes ago? Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> um, did I write Liz's name? No, I didn't. No, you didn't because you couldn't remember her whole name. Oh, but I'm allowed Liz. Name. I'm allowed Liz M. Am I not allowed Liz M for Liz Marquini? Okay, go f go faster, go faster. What other poets do I know? Poets, poets, Hope poets, poets. Poets. What's right? Hope is a thing with feathers. Hope is a thing with feathers? Liz I don't know. Done. Don't know that one. Liz one? Oh, for fuck's sake. Hello, it's me. Adele! There we go. Adele, um, see, all I need to, I just need to be prompted, man. I don't have the memory recall for this. Frankenstein. Frankenstein. Mary Shelley. I know the names. I just can't think. Um, what else? What else? Um, what else? What else? What else? Okay, let's think of other famous. Lucky you. Um, uh, oh, the one that I'm trying to think of is, um, the one you you literally bought a book of theirs today. Yeah. Very famous poet, incredible poet. She knows why the cage bird sings. Yes. I can't remember their name. You know, where I don't uh, don't try. Okay. I, 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 I famous TV personality with just one name. Famous TV personality with just one name. Oh you lord knows. You get a car. You get a car. Um. Jesus Christ, Josh. I can picture her, but I've never watched her. What's her name? She's super rich. Um. <laughs> okay. Forget Oprah. I got Oprah. Oprah Winfrey. <laughs> Oprah Winfrey. <laughs> you did. That doesn't count. That counts. I just said it. I just that said fucking it. counts. I just said that. Are you fucking kidding? I was so fucking cooked. I got twenty seconds for the final three. Come on. Come on, this is so doable. No, it's not. It's chalked. It's over. It's done. It's out of here. It's gone. All right, if I was allowed ginger spice, then I'm allowed sporty spice. And if I'm allowed sporty spice, and I've done crazy spice, sporty spice, ginger spice, posh spice, what's her name? Victoria Beckham. Um, And then we fucked it. We fucked it. We fucked it. Um, We fucked it. Uh, is that the royal we there? 
Well, yeah, yeah, it absolutely is the royal we. All right, final one. We'll go for... Um, now that the pressure's off, they're all coming flooding in. I mean, who should we go for? Let's go for um, Lizzo. What, sorry? Miley Cyrus. Miley Cyrus! May. Theresa May! Theresa May! Dude! I am so bad. Yeah, wait, Sporty Spice is Mel B? No, that's, that's, wait, isn't Sporty Spice? Sporty no, that, Sporty. Mel B was Crazy Spice, wasn't it? There's no Crazy Spice. I don't know who the fuck you're Oh, talking like, about. no, there is! Mel B is Sporty. There is, there was Mel B and Mel C. Yeah, that was, uh, Scary Spice. Scary, not Crazy, thank you, you Scary Spice. You did actually put Sporty on there twice. No, I didn't put Sporty. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. did I really? You put... Mel B. Is Mel B Sporty Spice? Yes, I just Shit, said that okay, well Mel C then. Sorry, Mel C. Mel C. Call Liz on Discord, see her list. I do I have Liz on Discord? I don't I don't I don't have Liz on You're friends on Discord. Fucking worst, Josh. Uh, yeah, I am. Uh Liz, where's Liz? Liz, 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 Liz. Is um why? Why are you not in the Discord, Liz? Wait, is that you? That's not you. Why are you not in the Discord, Liz? Fuckers! Mary, Queen of Scots is a dupe? No, it isn't! Wait. Is it? No. No, it's not. You're trolling. You're trolling. Oh, didn't list Melange? Oh, dude, so fucking dumb of me, actually. Zenzi, thank you for the gifted. Oh, that was dude, I'm so brutal. fucking I'm dumb. Collins! Yinsu's surname is Collins! I know, we all know! Ah, oh, Martha Stewart! You guys get me with the Martha Stewart tweets all the time, and I didn't think of Martha Stewart. Oh... I have really terrible memory recall. Anyway, I need personal space. I'll talk to you in like four days. Bye. <laughs> Can I get a kiss? No. <laughs> it's Lauren Scott, by the way. It's who? Pansy. It's Scott, I think. Their last Scott. Name. Lauren Scott. I think so. Oh. Emma Stone. Yeah. Why did you bait me into this, chat? Why did you bait me into this? I like watching our lives go up in flames. What the fuck? You really, really are the biggest mis misogynist on Twitch. How what the fuck? Honest? Wait, why did I write Ariane Grande? I said Ariana. You know, it, it's fine. You're upset about that, but not Anne Boleyn. Anne Boleyn? Well, well no. I, uh, I, did, I fucked around with Anne Boleyn. I think it's spelt like... That isn't it, and B O L E Y N. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Liz is calling you. Oh, nice, nice. Hey, Liz messaged me and said, "Hey, what's up, ally to women everywhere?" All right, here we go. <sighs> Agatha Christie. Oh. Wait. Is that my favorite ally? Hello, Liz. Hi. I couldn't remember your surname. They wouldn't let it's, me have Liz. It's okay. It's okay. I saw you pronounce it correctly, though. And that's already step up. Marquini? Marquini, yes, it is. Yeah. Yeah. Um, May so I'm I You got close, <laughs> but not quite. <laughs> I couldn't remember her name. You couldn't remember Oprah. I couldn't remember no, Oprah, no. All I could think of when you were saying Oprah was Obama. That's all I could do. And I didn't even write down Michelle Obama! I'm so fucking dumb! I can't tell, dude! Dude! Unbelievable! No, listen, you tried, and that's what's important, okay? I didn't try. I trolled. Oh. Memory recall is like... It's just stabbing a knife into my side and twisting. Oh. Listen. Can, oh, can I, can you, fucking hell. Shit, let me look at your list. Let me look at your... Oh. Okay, Florence Pugh, and it's Armas, Kieran, and we think you're based in LC. Dickhead, yeah. Jake Carolyn, correct. Oh. 
Lady Jane Grey. What's well, right? Lady Jane yeah. Grey after Catherine Parr is fucking crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Shock, speak of her in me. Where is Sorry. Ness Delacroix? Well, I, I, I don't know whether Uber Chain counts as Googleable. I was trying to stray away from people I knew because I don't think that's really the point of the exercise. Yeah. Uh, uh, Emily Bronte, though. Okay, we got some classic literature in here. Okay. Yeah, Rosenberg. we did. But we also forgot some literature greats. Like, okay, who the fuck wrote Jemima Puddle Duck? That's gonna kill me. Chat, who is that author? Sylvia Plath. Great shout. I, that, the thing is, Beatrix fucking Potter! Oh! Isn't that a fictional character? No, Beatrix Potter's a very famous UK author that I couldn't remember. Isn't that the name? Oh, this Jane is a character Austin. in Harry Potter named Beatrix. Oh. I've never seen it. No, All Sylvia right, Plath, though, I don't think I would have remembered. <laughs> Sylvia Plath, I wouldn't have remembered. It's just not somebody that I've really ingested much of their uh, writing. Didn't name it's, Potter? I, okay. Christine G. I, yeah. I didn't name her either. Yeah. All good. <laughs> yeah, that was stupid. What? What did you, can you scroll down for me? So I can oh. see what you actually got to. And no, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. I couldn't it's remember okay. Yinsu's surname. That's how bad I am with memory recall. That, Holy listen. shit. All good, all good. We, we, we learned- Katie Perry, Oba, I couldn't icon. remember Perry. Yeah, but then I got you stuck at three tennis players and I know fucking tons of them. I just couldn't think of them. Okay, question for you, because I watched this happen. Do you remember Pansy's last name? I mean, and Beth. Beth told, told me. Scott. Yeah, Beth told me it was Scott. But to be honest with and you, I'm not sure that I really knew that. I mean, I'm. I'm. I know that I did because I've seen it. But I also don't know Hypox's surname. I know his name's Mike, but but is his name Mike like Robbins or something? I think it's Robbins. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I could have pulled um, that out. Liz, what was uh, your time? Uh, ten minutes. Did you have your significant other judging you and snarking at you the entire time? Distracting no, you? No, I, I, I had my best friend cheering me on, <laughs> telling me to not, because I was getting really upset that I wasn't like doing it fast you enough. And then Ali kept on telling me to do that. <laughs> Don't get stuck in it, you can do it. Um, 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 no, no, to be clear, I, I just, I just want to be very clear. I am not blaming a woman for me not being able to name a hundred women in under an hour. I, no, I'm not blaming a woman for this. My wife was doing. My wife was. No, no. B, you helped. You were very, very helpful. Thank you. <laughs> Listen, listen, all good. Do you want to know some of the names on my list? Yeah, what were some names on um, your list? So I started off with Serena Williams and Venus Williams. Yeah, the classics. The then goats. I went to Kim Ong, who was one of the first women in Major League Baseball to be like a one of the top managers. I would um, never have got that. Never in my life. I would just Well, you don't watch you don't watch baseball. I, I couldn't right? name I, you a single baseball player ever. No, I could. Babe that's Ruth. Not true. Babe there Ruth. You go. I, I like, could you name you name one. I could name you one baseball player ever. No, two. Michael Jordan. <laughs> And that's where my baseball knowledge ends. Um, do you know what sport Michael Jordan actually plays? Yeah, basketball. But then he, he didn't he play some baseball as well. I know that because I, mean, I watched. Yeah, I know that because I watched Space Jam. <laughs> <laughs> do you understand um, the level of my pop culture knowledge? It's it's fucking <laughs> atrocious. Um, do you know, when I say the name, uh, Caitlin Clark, do you know who that is? No. But okay. you've immediately uh, made me think of Amelia Clark, who I should have remembered. Okay. Okay. Caitlin Clark, uh, is a college basketball player in the NCAA for women's basketball right now and recently sent the all-time scoring record. She's yeah, the, I, also six foot and taller than both of us. I couldn't name 10 current NBA players. I don't think I could either. I only started watching basketball recently because my aunt got me into it. Um, do you know the names? Uh, I named a lot of wrestlers also. I couldn't I like name you a single me wrestler. Cute. I mean, no, I, went... I could I mean, I could name The Rock. Okay, that's that's a wrestler. 
Um, I need. I went from Ava Perone into naming ten. Saoirse Ronan, Iggy Azalea, Rita Ora, Dua Lipa. Oh my yeah. God! So many people that I've forgotten. All these people, like this, is like a whole. This is a theater group that I went to, like singers, and then I was like, remember? Oh yeah, she did a cover of her, oh. and she also interviewed these Kelly people. Kelly Clarkson. The go. We found one American Idol first season. We went out. Oh, here's me uh, knowing Yinsu's name right off the bat. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> um, we got, but I said Elaine Chao who's our former Secretary of Transportation in the Bush administration, uh, the second Bush administration. And then, yeah, no, I wouldn't have known that. Uh, Liz Truss, Kathy Holchels in New York, uh, Governor. This is my, where is she? Where's Tammy Murphy? There she is. Governor's wife who tried to run for Senate and then didn't work. She dropped. Yeah. I was named Princess Beatrice. I couldn't name give you her last name. Is it fucking Windsor? I don't know who Princess Beatrice is. She's one of the royals. In the UK royal family? Yeah. Never heard of her. Sure. Never heard of her. Isn't, isn't who was your first one? Did, who did you name at the number one? Serena Williams. The Williams. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. But I also went into gymnastics, and I went Barbara Streisand next. So like, don't I don't know where my train of thought. Horrendous, <laughs> absolutely <laughs> horrendous from me. I named uh, two figure skaters. I named someone who played as figure skater. I named someone who directed that actress, and then I went through the movie. I just, it's such an ADHD like brain pathing my i just got i I got as soon as i the problem was i was thinking of faces first and then as soon as i thought of a face and i couldn't remember the name just got stuck couldn't think of another person and then i'm just stuck forever i was trying to remember the ousted president of burma um whose name i can see in my head but i'm like struggling with burma Former president, Bernie. She was a military coup. Asked her. Um, right. Okay. Yeah. And... Well, that's that's not where I was going. <laughs> um. And... Arden, it's gone. Arden, Arden, I got absolutely mogged. Arden, I couldn't even remember the people I worked with's names. <laughs> I don't know who I work with. I couldn't remember Liz's surname. I couldn't remember Yinsu's surname. I couldn't remember Kakuka's surname. Name. I don't even know Kukuka's first or last name, so that's Kukuka's okay. Kukuka's first name is Bayer. Beautiful. But, dude, I'm just going to get obliterated by Yinsu and Kukuka when they find this. Listen, listen. Oh, it's over for me. I actually, I need to give up my job and go into hiding. Okay, well, being an allied woman doesn't stop here, Sideshow. It, do- it, it hasn't begun. It hasn't started right. here. What are you going to do in this moment? Give up. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Josh, listen to me. Listen to me. Being an ally is when you see mistakes and you make mistakes, you say sorry and you continue to be better. This is your chance to be better. Yeah. Oh, who's the woman? Amelia Earhart. Er, er, Earhart? Earhart? Er, Earhart, yeah. Earhart. Earhart. Oh, I should have gone for that as well. Oh. She is a, she is a class. I, when I asked Screwface to name a woman, the first thing he said was Amelia Earhart. Yeah. And yeah, didn't, didn't think of her in my top 100. There um, we go. Well, one time I asked John QT, and he immediately went Sydney Sweeney, and then a Sydney few weeks later Sweeney. I was like, asked okay. again. He went Anna de Armas. So, who both Anna de Armas was on my talent. list as well. Yeah, I mean, both are excellent actors in their own right. So, um, I think I asked Baby Bay, and he went not Jessica Alba. Oh, who would he? I... Some actor. Arden, I, I remembered the person that you're talking about. The teenage girl who did the school striking for climate change, Greta Thunberg. Greta Thunberg. I didn't even name her. I, I got her on my list. Just how about those 2010s? Oh, um, do you God. know who... I also named just... I named her Jenica, but Jacinda Arden, who was the former prime minister of New Zealand. No, I was, try, I was cool. trying to think of the name of the prime minister of Finland, former prime minister. I think she recently uh, came out of power, but I couldn't remember her name. I can't even put on Angela Merkel. I'm such yeah, a fake poli sci degree holder. I, I put down Angela Merkel, but um She was there for a while. I couldn't even remember the name Theresa May. Unbelievable. Well, Unbelievable. That, you know what? It's what I heard you put like Mar- Mar- uh the author of Frankenstein Shelley. M- Mary Shelley, but yeah, but yeah. I only remembered that when my wife said Frankenstein. The thing is if you if you like name associations i'm getting the name but if you right. if i have to pull it off the top of my dome i got nothing i got absolutely nothing i got air up there 
absolutely nothing. Well, that I think that's the thing I was really nervous about was like I definitely know 100 women. Everyone knows I'm uh, I me and women are like this, but in Dude, the moment I, I love women. <laughs> I love women. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> I, I, me me and women we're like this. <laughs> <laughs> Name a hundred men? Men? No, because here's the problem. If I do the list in under an hour, I'm a misogynist. And if I don't do it in under an hour, I'm a verified wait, wait, stupid if, ass. No, we can do it together. And therefore, they but can't get mad at you. No, no, no. Because if if I did name 100 women with you, we would have completed it in five minutes. Because we would, we would have, have bounced off each other. And it would have been so much quicker than either of us doing it on our own. That that's the, uh, yes. the 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 time problem comes when you have to pull it off the fucking top of your head. I don't oh. want to make you feel worse about it, but my time would have I been couldn't. shorter. Would have been shorter, but I was naming their achievements as well. Oh, naming their achievements <laughs> as well. God, damn. I was like, oh yes, like um uh, uh like Tammy Murphy, a recent uh, run for Senate in New Jersey, uh, uh got wife's gov uh, gov wife of governor, but dropped it to Andy Kim. Let's put him out of his misery. I, look, Ali, oh, Booth, he's, a, he's an ally. Uh, Ruth Bader, oh, what's Ginsburg. her fine? Ginsburg, yeah. I mean, I probably wouldn't have been allowed that anyway because I couldn't remember her full name, but that's, yeah. yeah that's I, a, I just that's wrote RBG, so I wouldn't be able to tell you. I went, and her and Sonia Sotomayor. Oh, fucking hell. Elizabeth Holmes, that is a woman. Oh, do we, God. I mean, do you, do you, listen like women it's okay yep. love them yep yep no great we love people women. we love women here great people. great people who you you like you, you're married to one <laughs> you work with them you know them this is giving off and very i can't be racist because i have a black friend vibes <laughs> it's i mean yeah I'm I'm Honestly. fucked here i'm absolutely fucked um, there's no way okay, out of this hole you got to 99 no uh, what? Uh, what in under an hour? Yeah, yeah. You got, got like to... your hour mark was ninety nine. Yeah, I got to ninety nine. But also, I don't think that counted because I did actually say Spotty Spice twice because I mixed it up. I thought Mel B was Scary Spice, but apparently it's Mel C. So in fact, I actually only got ninety eight in an hour. There are two Mel's in the Spice Girls. Yeah, Mel B and Mel C. Oh, I didn't know that. The more you know. Like I know, like things like I oh. know Victoria Beckham, right? I could not tell you well, what Spice Girl she was. Racist. Name one hundred black people. I'm Can not. You name what Spice Girl she was. I'm not doing any more challenges like this, Asp. I'm not doing any more challenges like this. This has already told me instantly that this was a bad idea. It, I'm not doing listen, it. It's. Can okay? Let's 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 try this way. If I asked you to name like. 100 like historical events i don't i think that would take a while too historical events a hundred of them i wouldn't yeah. know them i don't know a hundred um, historical events well i don't have to say to that homie i'm not gonna lie to you like um there's no like there's no been way through a lot there's, you've been through a lot. Not saying you're old. You've been through but a like, lot. No. You've been through a lot. Well, I, I've lived through a hundred distinct historical events. I mean, no, I no, guess. No, no, no. I mean, like, you. Jurassic I mean, period. I, I, Cretaceous I, I, period. Ah, uh, yes. Remember I, them well. I've, I've been through a lot too. Like I'm, listen, I'm, I was born in 1980. I've technically been through 9-11. I've been through the great recession. I've been through the first black president, black president being elected to the United States. Like I've been through just in the United States, a lot of historical I wouldn't events. even think about those. I wouldn't have been able to, mem r r r I wouldn't well, have been able to American. list those. No, I just wouldn't have thought of them. I don't think When did them David Cameron being... become prime minister? Wasn't it like 2011? It was 13 years ago, I think. 14, yeah, 2010 maybe even. It was around that time, yeah. Like there's, there's, the, the, you, you have a much, where you're from, not to be like, you have a much longer history than me. Yeah, I mean. You could be like. I mean, yeah. 1066. Mm-hmm. The mm -hmm. Battle of Hastings. That's 1066. Mm -hmm. And then from then, fucking, I mean, 
coronation of William the Conqueror shortly afterwards. I don't know whether that counts as a separate historical event. I think, um, if, I think if it has two different Wikipedia pages, it is a separate event. Oh, well, then I'd, uh, then I'd own it. I mean, if we're just going based off Wikipedia yeah. pages, yeah, that'd be fine. That'd be fine. The Black yeah. Death, the Great Fire of London. Um, fucking, yeah, we'd, we'd be fine. We'd be fine. Yeah, see? would be fine. And that's only within where you're from. See, you can, you see, it's it's pressure. Pre it dude, happens. I crumble under pressure. I crumble. <laughs> I'm a I'm a Jenga tower that's been built badly. You put any pressure on me, and I fumble and fold. <laughs> it's oh. listen. You tried your best, and that's what matters. You even here's the other part, best part. You attempted this. You you went for it. You were like, you know what I'm gonna do? Put myself out there. I wish I had. And that's that, and that's part of being brave, Josh. Um, You're brave. Uh, from now on, cowardly. Okay, that's okay. It's over. It's okay. Be you. Be you. You do you. I'm not here to yuck anyone else's yum, but you yeah. do you. I think. How do we? Sorry, someone in your chat just said, how do we feel about Sideshow getting unpaid emotional labor from Liz <laughs> to excuse his shambolic performance? It wasn't, it's not that shambolic, though. It's not that shambolic. <laughs> it was, I mean, uh, what other people can't, I mean, what was Super's time, chat? What, I mean, I consider myself to be about on the same intellectual level as Super. What was his time? Okay, wait, sorry, Josh, did you say Urethra Franklin? No. No. I said... <laughs> Aretha and accidentally said Aretha, but I fixed it afterwards and said Aretha. I did not say Urethra Franklin. I did not. No, 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 no. No, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. Oh my god. Oh. What? What else did you say? What else did you like? Not. I need to know who you didn't get. Uh, well, like who I forgot, like who you like you couldn't remember. I couldn't remember Katy Perry. Okay. I couldn't she remember. Been for a while. Couldn't remember Theresa May. Eh. I couldn't remember deal, Oprah. I uh. Mm. <laughs> um. You've got no excuses for that one. I don't. I couldn't remember Jesus Miley time. Cyrus. She just won a Grammy. Couldn't remember. Couldn't remember. Oh. Northern um, Lion did, you... did it in seven minutes. Yeah, that's because he's a fucking movie trivia. He's got connections. Connection. Connect. 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 Me. Me. Me a dumbass. <laughs> me a dumbass. It. <sighs> Listen. Did you? Did you like? Who were some people from the UK you named? I'm sure you named a lot of them, right? No. I said. I said oh. Caroline Duffy, who's a famous poet. Um before we even started listing people. And then I said to my chat, I'm going to forget these people three minutes later. I started the timer and I forgot Caroline Duffy for 50 minutes. <laughs> that's that's how bad my... It's just gone. It's absolutely gone. And then I couldn't remember opera because I was trying to think of her surname. So I was thinking like Oprah, oh, oh Obama, oh, oh. And then I couldn't, I didn't even think Michelle Obama. Just thought, can't think of who Oprah is. I'm gonna. He just mispronounced it, chat. It's fine. Not You're Oprah, just pronouncing. No, Oprah, Oprah, <laughs> not Opera, Opera. Oh, yeah, he said it hell. literally two seconds before, y'all. Oprah, <laughs> oh, Oprah. Oh. I have a speech impediment. Sometimes we mispronounce things. All right. Oh. I'm, listen, listen, listen. I listen here. I have a. I have another challenge for you. Also, wait. Sorry. A side note. Do you think Caroline Duffy is dead? I know that she attempted suicide by sticking her head in an oven i have no idea whether she is still alive or dead but i thought she was still alive but i don't know well that's a thing I that was know. sylvia plath <laughs> <laughs> um um <laughs> li listen 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 that's okay that's a listen where did you go? Where did you go? Where did you go? 
Wait, what time is it where you are? What time is it in the UK? Maybe it's late. It's 1 a.m. Yeah, it's late for you. You started this at 12. Oh, dude, I love That's the late. amount of excuses. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my I, God. Listen, I I bet. Listen, oh. here, here's a here's a fun here. Fun challenge to name five different game changers players that aren't from Shop by Rebellion. Go. Liz, don't do this to me. You've just seen how bad I am at naming people. Don't do this to me. Don't just don't don't do that to me. Don't do that to me. I'm not I'm not good doing any more of these lists. I'm not doing any more of these lists. You can name like a hundred movies though, right? No, I couldn't name you a hundred movies. No. I could probably I, I I think it would take me over an hour to name a hundred films. I think me. I haven't seen like any movies ever, which is true. I genuinely have not seen any movies, so I feel like I couldn't do it either. That's because I was a theater kid. I don't know if you have that excuse. I couldn't name every agent in Valorant. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. No, I couldn't. Bro. How many agents yes, are there in can. Valorant? It's literally my job. I couldn't do it. With well, time, with, you can. I, I don't. I think with like maybe not within like ten seconds. I don't. That thing would be really, really hard. But th I, there are twenty four. Right. Wait there. Um, not I including mean, Agent E. Because just 25, just to show but... how fucking stupid I am, I'm gonna try it. Okay. Okay. Astra. You got this. Cipher. There you go. Brimstone. Okay. Omen. Okay. Sky. Sage. Clove. Killjoy. Um, <laughs> right, wait there. Uh, chamber. Uh, <laughs> um, wait there, wait there, wait there, wait there, wait there, wait there. Um, Viper. Duelists, duelist, Rays, Jet, Phoenix, Yoru. Um uh, Initiators, Sova, Sky, Gecko. Um Oh my god. Um other 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 agents smokes agents duelist agents duelist agents jet rays phoenix your rainer rainer um uh, there's got to be more initiators than what i've said isn't there there is yeah hate to be that guy but you are mostly missing the female agent <laughs> No, he's missing a man. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Not getting away from the misogyny allegations. <laughs> Not getting away from the misogyny allegations even here. Okay, you know what? I know, I know where to get it. The first woman to win wait, a Nobel wait, Prize. Wait, Who was it? What? First woman to win a Nobel Prize? Was it? I don't know. Yes. Was it Marie Curie? Yes, it was. There you oh, go. Yeah, See? I, Women. No, no I, had Mar I had Marie Curie on my list. Somewhere, didn't I? I swear I had Mary Curie around here somewhere, didn't I? I did. I, I said the name. Like, right at the beginning. Yeah, there they are. Number 12. Okay. All right. Wait, wait, wait. So, wait, wait. Agents. 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 Uh, there must be more initiators. KO. Yes, there are. KO. Um, you brought me a peace offering. It's me that's supposed to be making peace to you. <laughs> Women will do always do that for men. Don't worry about it. That's not a peace offering. That's asking me to sleep in the office. <laughs> oh, I like that. I like who I share a name with. <laughs> it's okay. Oh. It's all. So oh, you look so cozy. Oh. Fucking oh, hell. it looks like you skinned a polar bear. I'm not gonna lie. 
Okay. How many? I'm mi I'm missing six Valorant agents. You are. You are. Okay. Let me think about this. Fade. Maybe do like maps and metas. Fade. There we go. Okay. And then what else have we got? We've got... I think I've got all the smokes agents, right? Brim, Omen, Astra, Clove, Viper, Harbor. 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 Okay. And then we've got... That's got to be all the smokes agents, I think. And then... What else? Sentinels. You've got Cypher, Killjoy, Chamber, technically Sage. Is that it? I think that might be it. And then Initiators, Sova, Fade, Sky, Gecko, KO. Is that it? No. Do you let? Oh fuck! That's not it. No. Oh shit. Um. Oh crap. Not gonna lie, you don't cast this person too well, agent too often. Um. Initiator. Do you want a hint? No, I don't. Okay. This is my job, Liz. I should be able to name twenty-four <laughs> people. Oh, 24 fictional characters that I see all the time in my job. You do. There's another initiator. Neon. Neon is another one. It's not an initiator. Just sprung it in my head. Um, I think there aren't any more. I think that's everybody in Valorant. I think that's it, chat. Are you sure there's 24? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Would you like hints now? No, no, no. Okay. No. Okay, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, G, L, A, Astra, <laughs> B, Breach. There we go. <laughs> C. Cypher Chamber D I don't think there is one beginning with D E Don't think so F oh, I don't think there is G Gecko H Harbor Um I mean F F F fade I realize I've just missed fade So maybe this isn't a good system Harbor. Oh, you have it. You have, I mean, yeah, yeah. It's fine. I don't know. J. J. K. Killjoy. K. O. L. Ligma. L. L. M. L -M <laughs> N. Neon. O. Omen. P. P. Phoenix. You are Rays, Rainer, S, Sage, Sky, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. What the hell are the rest of them? There's two left? <laughs> There's two left? Yeah. No, no, there isn't. <laughs> yes, there are. No, there isn't. All right, wait, let me think. The first five mm -hmm. you get in the game, the first five you okay. get in the game are Brim, Sage, Jet, Phoenix, Sova. Then, ah, oh, this is terrible. This is an awful way of going about things. What about That's if I work backwards? Clove was released most recently. Before that, it was... Fade? Gecko? I can't remember. Dude, I don't know. <laughs> I got no idea, chat. I got no idea. Wait, okay, so at this event, they released Clove. Mm -hmm. Previous event, 
at Champs, did they release an agent? Tokyo, they released Team Deathmatch. Lock-In, they probably released an agent. Was that Gecko? I think it was Gecko at Lock-In. So, did they release something at Champs? What did they release at Champs? ISO! <gasps> Holy shit! ISO! Forgot about him. One more. Before Gecko, so before Lock In, we had the previous champs. Well, I mean, that's ancient history. Can't remember any of that stuff. I remember Fade was at Copenhagen, I think. And no, Fade was at Reykjavik. Fade was at Reykjavik. What was at Copenhagen? I don't know. I don't know. I, I, chat, I just don't know. The last one is a woman? Oh, never yep. beaten the allegations. Never beaten the fucking allegations. The last one is a woman. Mm -hmm. The last agent for me to name is a woman character. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And they are called... No, oh, brother, you're about to be cooked on Twitter. You're dead. There's no... The, the, I, I'm telling you, my brain just doesn't work like this. This is just not how my brain works. I can't summon things when I want them. I, it, it doesn't work like this. I, some may argue my brain doesn't work at all, but it just doesn't work like this. <laughs> I can't just pull things off the top of my head. What is... Yeah. Right, A, I feel that we'd have though. Astra. B, Breach, yes. Brimstone. C, Clove. No. C, D. E, E, M, L, L, M, P, D. I don't know. I can't. I don't know. F fade. I've already done this before. I don't know. I don't know. Keep on doing. Start. Start again. You got that. Just clear your mind. Here, listen to me. Listen. Clear your mind. Astra. Clear your mind. Astra. Echo. Nope. That's Valor. Uh, that's Overwatch. <laughs> um. Fucking hell. Um. <laughs> I don't know. I have I have no idea what the what agent I'm missing. Let I'm me think. Check one thing, because I'm trying to see if you cast the game where they appeared. Let me think. Le so it's got to be an it's probably a niche agent, right? If I can't remember what it is, it probably doesn't get played that often. So I'm thinking Paperex compositions. I'm thinking Raina Harbor. Um. You did not I'm, cast it. I'm wrong. I'm thinking, fucking hell. Fucking hell. Deadlock! There we Son go! Son of a bitch, Deadlock. <laughs> time. Time. Chat, what was it? Time. How long did that take me? How long did that take me, chat? How long did that take me? 33 minutes! <laughs> Oh, 12 minutes. Okay, 12 minutes. 12 minutes. I, did you not hear me throw you a hint? What did you say? I was like, oh man, you're about to be cooked on Twitter. You're about to be dead. <laughs> oh, no, didn't even pick up on it. Didn't even pick up on it. He didn't also even went pick up on it. De, 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 mm, e? <laughs> yeah, no, didn't, no, didn't get it. Didn't get it. It's, it's, it's so done. It's actually so done. It's so fucking over. It, um... Oh, Christ. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's just, it's just not how my brain works. Fuck. You tried, and that's what matters. I don't think I should even attempt this. 
<laughs> Let me see. It's supposed. It's like it's like a connections because. game by Willminder about Valorant. How oh, did you ever pass a test in med school? All of my tests at med school were multiple choice, and oh, really? you didn't need to study. All you need to do was turn up and just know basics, and you could pass. I you swear to God. Do, like name anatomy and stuff like that. Yeah, you had to name anatomy, but it was like you know which one of these is vital to humans surviving like a leg a finger the liver or a tooth wow. <laughs> like i'm telling you med school's easy they don't don't believe the doctors that are trying to sell you on the fact that they're geniuses it ain't true it ain't they true didn't want women to be doctors for how long jesus christ okay all right now listen you got this okay you got this all right uh, um, I mean, why is the connection going to be here? I guess, like, people who've played Neon before or something? Like, <laughs> Neon players? Oh, I mean, this is stage one, week one. Yeah, but it's not, it's not based on just week one, is it? I would think so. Oh. It that seems only like what Will would do, he's so Oh, sad it's only about this week. Okay. So maybe it is Neon Players, but it's Sire, Minibu, Kushner, and Did MW play Neon? I'm not sure actually. Maybe it's not Neon Players though. When was Plot Chat? Feels like it though. When? Wait, when was it? When was the last plot chat you had? Like uh, yesterday. Okay. Two days ago. Two days ago. Okay. Um. Wait, Saya played Neon week two though. What week are we in? The games that I saw today are those week two. We're, we're starting week two right now. Doesn't know names of people in the game he analyzes. Doesn't know names of people in the last game he analyzed. I'll Actual check verified right Tory behavior. Thank you for the 100 bits, Lynx. Uh, d d disagree, but okay. All right. Leaf played Killjoy. Other Killjoy players in week one were... are not on this list. There aren't really many Killjoy players on this list. So what is Leaf going to be associated with? Leaf's going to be associated with... I mean, what else do you associate with if it's not the... All right, maybe it's like Leaf went one and zero. Maybe it's other people that went one and zero? Rossi went zero and two in week one. Are there other people that went zero and two? That's kind of difficult to get four people that went zero and two. I just don't know the kind of things that are going to be used here. This is where we explore the I don't mind. get it. I don't it's get fine. what They're the all associations are going to be. Okay. Takas played Phoenix. I don't think there's other real Phoenix players on here. I mean, that would have been such an obvious association. What I mean, we could just go for duelist players in general, right? Sire plays duelist, Mini Blue plays duelist, Maka plays duelist, Takas plays duelist. Is that it? It's just four duelist players? Oh, no, because MW also played duelist. So that doesn't make sense. Is this tricky? I, don't, I just don't really understand, like, what kind of things it's going to be. I, I really felt like it was Neon there, but I can't find the fourth Neon player. And also, I think... Did Sire even play Neon Week 1? Who did T1 play against Week 1? They played against... Yeah, I think Sire did play Neon Week 1. No, because he... No. He played Neon Week 2 against DFM. I don't know. Who did he play... No, because that is Week 1, isn't it? His game against DFM was Week 1. I is that week one or is that week two? Start overthinking because you can't name women, 
or agents in the game. I want you. This is your bread and butter, buddy. All right. It's not. This is not the bread and butter. <laughs> this is this is me getting fucking lost again. Okay, Mako was playing Viper. Com was playing some Viper. Um. Who else? Uh, Apparently, everyone's saying this is super hard. So don't worry. Rossi played Viper, did he? What the what the so. fuck was Shados playing? Ah, oh, god damn it. My memory recall for this kind of stuff is so poor as well. No, everyone's struggling with it. Uh, but looking at the tweet, everyone is just... There's 40 incorrect. Like, bro thinks I'm Einstein. Like, this looks like it was a really hard one. What I don't understand is why Buzz is in here as well. Because there's, there's five Duelist players, I think. Okay. What about if we just did Smokes? I mean, Shao was on Smokes. Boo was on Smokes. Tens was playing smokes as well as some other stuff. Gang. And um then Marco was playing Viper. Maybe that counts. One away. Yeah, it's probably the Smokes players, and I'm fucking it up, and it was Rossi. Let me try and think. What the hell was Rossi playing? Rossi played some KO. What were the T1 comps? I mean, was Rossi... Dude, fuck me. Or maybe it was... Maybe it's this, because it's like, Com was playing Viper as well. Okay, Havoc was playing quite a lot of KO. Um, Shados was playing KO. Rossi was playing KO. Angel, what was Angel playing against Vitality? He was playing... Uh, he was playing Gecko. And then the second map, he was playing... Why can't I remember? What was the second map? It was bind into... I don't remember. I don't remember. Who else played KO though? Tens? Are these just the KO players? <laughs> no. Got it incorrect. Fuck's sake. Those all play KO though, I think. Shados, Rossi, Tens, and Havoc. But apparently that was not the... I think maybe, you, maybe you just like... You can find connections that aren't even there like oh wow you're so much smarter you didn't even think about that like whoa apparently you know? yeah fucking hell all right angel was playing angel was playing um angel was playing the gecko who else is a gecko player here uh Did Havoc play any Gecko? What maps did Furia play? Furia played against Crew. And we watched the game. And they played... Lotus. And Furia were running Sky. And then... He also, they played fucking something else. I can't remember. Can't remember. I don't think that, I don't think there's enough KO players here, though. Dude, ain't, Leaf played Killjoy. Is that all he played, though? The KJ? Or did he play something else? C9 played against Lev. So they played, um, what maps did he play? They played Icebox, Sunset, Ascent. Icebox, Sunset, Ascent. Icebox and Ascent. He was on KJ, wasn't he? And then Sunset. <laughs> can't remember what C9's comp was, actually. But I assume he was playing... Dude, I can't remember what C9's comp was. Not C9, sorry. Dude, I'm getting fucking cooked, chat. I'm getting fucking cooked. It's okay. My brain is losing my mind. I mean, um, 
Uh, I mean G2. I'm getting fucking mixed up again. It's because Vanity was... Uh, we, we were talking about Vanity earlier. Leaf G2 was playing against EG. Hello, now we're getting on the right track. They 2 0 them, and they played um, Icebox and... What did G2 pick? What was the first map where they stomped them? What did they play? God, my memory is so bad. It needs prompting. That's the issue. Mm -hmm. G2 versus EG. Second map was Icebox, I believe. Maybe the first map was Icebox, but I thought it was the second map. Second map, second map was Icebox. And then the first map, they went for... Dude, why can I not remember what they played? Do you want a hint? Or no, the answer? No. I'm okay. going to fucking lose my mind. I'm going to go no, you crazy got this. here. I'm going to no, go you crazy. Got this. First map... It was only nature that was shooting back. And the map they played was... I can't visualize it, man. Can't visualize it. I'm absolutely fucking cooked. Right, I'm giving up on that. I'm absolutely giving up on that. Right. All right. Mini Boo. Kushina. Both played Neon. There's a neon connection here, I swear to God. There's a neon connection. Gentle mates. Takas played. I don't think he played neon, did he? I don't think so. Did DRX play neon? I don't think they did. My memory's fucked. It's absolutely chalked. I've tanked myself into a hole trying to name 100 women in under an hour, which should have been a very simple task, and I'm gone. Mm -hmm. I'm absolutely yeah, I, gone. I, I, I think your like, confidence is so shot that you're second guessing like, everything you're thinking. It's absolutely shot. Did Sire play Neon in week one? Who did T1 play against? They played against Paper Rex, and then they played against... DFM. Yeah, yeah, that was week hard. one, wasn't it? Was it? A DFM. They played two matches week one, Paper X and DFM. So then Sire did play Neon because he played it in the game against DFM in week one. So we've got three Neon players, and we need a fourth. Wasn't Rossi. I... There's no way it was MW. Was it? No. Fury are playing Neon, were they? Wait a second. Against Crew, they played on Lotus. Dude, I'm absolutely fucking boomed. My brain can't come up with all of this. Alright. Who did... The other duelist player is Takas. Who did they play against? Gentle Mates, week one. They played a game against uh, BBL, I believe it was. It was, like yes. a, it was a game that they pretty easily handled. And for the life of me, I can't remember what the fuck they were up to. Um... Let's punt for Takas. Right, played Neon. We got it. So now I think there's a played Viper in here possibly as well. Which is Rossi, Com, Mako, and something else. But I don't know who the other one is. It's not Tens. It's not Havoc. Did Leaf play Viper? What map would that have been on? Single, that doesn't... Single leaf. 
what map did G2 play against EG at the beginning? That's my problem. What was it? I don't think it's that. Could have been Koi. I can't really remember the Koi games, to be honest. <laughs> Do you, don't you watch Party of These games? Yeah, but it was a tragic game, Liz. It was uh... It was Liquid Koi, and I've purged it from my memory for the sake of okay. my sanity. That's fair. They, mental health is the most important. So, Could like, if you want to stop this for your mental health, that's completely understandable. Could it be Shao? Shao... So, Vi Navi played against Vitality week one. They played on Bind. And Shao was on... It, not on Viper, because Sugetsu was on Viper. And... Then, what was the other fucking map that they played? Um, Jesus wept. Alright, so the other Smokes player is Boo. Boo played against... Team Heretics played against Fnatic. They played Icebox, and they played Lotus on Icebox, Boo is a Sage. And on Lotus, Boo plays... Uh, he does play Omen, doesn't he? Let me think. What is their comp? Their comp is the Neon, is Mini Boo, Rien's is playing the... To the subscriber. DJ Pie Sauce, thank you for the prime. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Um, yeah, it's it's Paddy playing Viper. So it's not going to be Boo. So it's Rossi, Com, Mako. And chat, don't fucking keck W. <laughs> you're adding the TikTok. Yeah, you're, you're trying. You're trying to subway surfer TikTok them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> Who else played Viper, man? It's got. It's got to be Shower Angel, surely. Oh uh, well, it's not Angel, but is it Shower? What was the other map that they played in Vitality Navi? Bind, they had the deadlock comp. And then they went into... Vitality. Vitality, vitality. What were you playing? Little vitality. Little vitality. <laughs> what maps did you play? What ma ma maps did you play? What That's maps did I you play, you little shits? Would, um recall when i was doing lines and stuff in theater i would sing so maybe keep on singing <sighs> doesn't help. i'm being serious i'm not trying to be weird no my brain doesn't have it oh. my brain doesn't have it how have i i bet there's a ko one in here as well and it just doesn't or maybe one of them was like top fragged their series something wild like that back but that's yeah and that's hard yeah that's fucked because i i mean angel top fragged his series Shout out to Angel or Goat. I have no idea if Ten's top frag the Send Hundred Thieves game. I, I don't look at the stats like that, so I don't know who top fragged that uh, one. Did he? No clue. He did not. There's no way to have a top frag to his. Um This is the right Shao path didn't top frag it. his. So, so far, I mean, did MW top frag in the Crew Furia game? No. I mean... Nah. I... Have you, like... You haven't been looking at, like, at VLR or anything, right? No. Is that cheating? Yeah, definitely. Is it? Yeah, like, looking stuff up is definitely cheating. Well, when you... When you cast, you have notes, right? It's definitely... My ch How is it not cheating? It wouldn't help, not gonna lie. I mean, it would definitely help for this specific one. 
They're way too hard. Oh, you're not going to get help. these. You're not. I, someone just told me the connections. You're straight up not going to get these. No, I no. I what is it like third fragged on the in the match or something? Kind of. Oh, it's that right. silly. That, that's so dumb. Genuinely impossible. I promise you. That you those are some crazy. Con Will, what are we thinking? William. I mean, I feel like there's got to be a viper connection here. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna have a look at VLR then. If they're really that hard, then we're yeah. gonna yeah, we're yeah, gonna yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna have a look at VLR. All right, so let's have a look. What do we got here? We've got um, we've got MW zero. Oh my god, why am I typing it in there? MW zero played in the game against Crew, and MW uh played some. Omen. Ah. On Icebox. So, a duelist player who plays Omen? Have we got any of those? No. Not really. Um, okay. Also, didn't top frag the series. But top frag for his team? That would be a bit of a weak connection. What did... What was Shados up to? Shados played against Team Liquid, and he played Viper. Wait a second. Maybe that's the Viper connection then. I forgot he played Viper. Let's let's just check Chow. I can't why can't I remember what the second map was? Oh, it was Lotus. Because they got shit on, that's why I can't remember. It didn't make an impression. Um Oh yeah, and they were running the the, the breach gecko comp. Um, I mean, is this going to be, no, three incorrect. It wasn't Viper players. Okay. Do you want a hint? <sighs> hmm. Hmm. Because I feel like even if I told you the categories, you would struggle to figure it out. Really? Go on then. Yeah. Go on okay. Then. Got a, got a Bucky kill. Got a Bucky kill? <laughs> Died to a razel, and headshot percentage is greater than forty percent. Nah, that's fucked. That's silly. <laughs> that's at, why am I do? Why am I playing this game? You should have turned. You should have told me to turn off the game. I mean, I didn't know the connection until I asked recently, and then I was like, oh There's no, no he's, fucking way. There's he's absolutely not, no, way. no way that anyone's getting that. Got a bucky kill. Who got a bucky yeah. kill? I mean, probably some of the APAC players. Um. Got a Bucky kill. I couldn't. I literally couldn't. Even, I don't. I would be guessing if Buzz I didn't name any of one of them. Com. Fucking havoc, and leaf. I don't know. One away apparently. Buzz havoc okay. com and leaf. We were one away for what? I'm not even sure for what we were one away. No idea. Not a clue. Start with headshot percentage. Well, we could just look that up, though. That's a boring one. Yeah, like that's one where if you work backwards, vibe check it. Just vibe check you're it. Fucked. Um, who we one away with then? Maybe, maybe it was this. No. Nah. Oh, that's no longer one away. Oh, dude, I I don't know. I give up. I give up. <laughs> I give up. I. I'm trying to name one hundred men. Name one hundred uh, men. Yeah. Are you um, are you going slower than the women? No. <laughs> I'm also, but I'm kind of because I'm also trying to listen to you. Oh, don't so it's listen like... to men. <laughs> well, sometimes we're forced to, Josh. You were my first one. Oh. Uh, Fun fact. I'm um, I'm gonna give up on the world now. You tried though, and that's what's important. I've got one more thing that I'm gonna do. Oh God! Before I end my stream for the night, oh. and you're gonna do it well, I'm sure. Yeah, in honor of the horrendous, horrendous attempt that I had with naming a hundred women in under an hour where i in fact lost to super 
<laughs> in honor of that, I'm going to wait there. Give me a sec. I need to fill out all of my fucking payment information. In honor of that, I'm going to attempt the same thing that Super recently made a video about. And I'm going to try to become a millionaire. We'll see if we can We'll see if we can beat who wants to be a millionaire. I love this game! <laughs> <laughs> I used to watch this all the time growing up. Guys, I love lifelines. I would never take any because I'm a strong woman. But just so you know, I play along like all the time. Just last week, I was playing along. And I went to the million. Not going to lie. I was pretty smart. But I'm also naming uh, men. And now I'm stuck. Because I haven't been thinking. I, last I don't know where I put my June. wallet. JYP. Are you... Wait, you're using money? Well, find your wallet. That's more important. You can't hear me, can you? Um, I guess I'll have to think of men. There are so many. Jared Leto is one of them. Um, um, there were other men. I'm not going to lie. I don't think about men super again. often. Yay! Are you like spending money though? Yeah. I'm I'm buying the Steam game Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? So that it's so that it's fair and safe. You know? Okay. Okay. I I was telling your chat while you were gone. I watch Who Wants to Be a Millionaire growing up all the time and I literally still play along with it. You still watch it? Yeah. I love watching. I love it's it's a good way to keep up um like trivia and stuff. I want I, I my dream is to walk into a like trivia quiz bar thing and absolutely smoke everyone. Yeah. And then everyone be like, "Oh my god, she's so smart." And be like, "I know." And then leave mysteriously. So they can like be like, "Oh my god, who is that girl?" Okay. You know? <laughs> you'd have plenty of opportunities in um you'd have plenty of opportunities. What the f You'd have I want them to like talk about me, you know. Yeah, you would. You'd have plenty of opportunities in um, the UK to do that because people run pub quizzes all the time. Really? Yeah, my um, uh... my brother-in-law is like a trivia expert. He has won basically every UK uh, show that is out there. For, it, it, um... Did he? Did he do like? Was he was he on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire UK and did he happen to win the million dollar prize during COVID? Because that guy's a legend. Is that him? No, he he. I don't think oh. he's been on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, but he's been on like, I don't know whether you've seen like The Chase or Mastermind or stuff like that. Ooh, oh, he's like okay, he's a legend, legend. Got you. I do you guys you don't do you guys get Jeopardy in the UK? I don't think so. No. Oh my god! Every single night, my family would sit us down and we would play that game and we would get into very spirited competitive arguments oh so, okay i need to warm up my brain for this again i'm gonna you got this you got i'm gonna this. own this game i'm gonna own this you're gonna, you're gonna do game. so well yeah oh what what is this oh my God. <sighs> okay strands. strands it's all in your head it's all in your head mental there's got to be a word <laughs> mental in here uh it's simply <laughs> ment ment uh, got to a dead end mentor uh, apparently that's a word um, it's all in your head. Brain. My brain is in my head. Br brain's not in there. Doesn't exist. There's only one B in the entire board. Mental. There's got to be mental. Ever. 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 Um, what else is all in your head? It's all in your head. Cerebrospinal fluid. Is that there? Not all the not. It's actually not all in your head, though. The blood-brain barrier. Voices. Our voices and. <laughs> there are voices in my head right now. <laughs> um. What is, what is going on here? Fantasy. 
Ooh. Ooh. Fantasy. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Illusion. Illusion. Boom. Wait a second. We're making progress here. We're <laughs> making progress. Fake? No. Okay. Make believe? Oh my god. Make believe. Holy shit, I'm popping off. Wait, I'm so ready. I'm so ready. Um It's all in your head. Reverie? Rever Ooh. Reverie? Holy shit. I'm owning. I was actually pretending. All night I've been pretending. Just so that I could seem smart here. Figment? A figment of your imagination? Ooh. And a... Uh, what's the final word here? A day... Dream. God damn, I'm popping off. Wait, I'm actually going crazy. Willing to be a misogynist to show that you're good at strand. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> I'll do anything. <laughs> oh, fuck. Until now. Okay. What? What else have we got, chat? What are some other w versions of these games? <sighs> the New York Times Mini. We should be able to do the oh, New York Times one. Mini. I have a better one. Yeah. Um, it's called Pimantle. I use it to warm up my brain every single morning. A mantle? Yeah, I'll show oh, you it. No, I've got it. I've got it. Loading the... Oh, this one. <laughs> this one. Okay. Misogyny. <laughs> oh, you, you have to spell it right if you're going to... Dude, I'm... <laughs> fucking hell. <sighs> um, let's go for... Let's go for uh, Twitch. Nice. Mm, actually, Twitch, somewhat close. Twitch. Uh, let's go for Stammer. Stutter. Miles away, apparently. Um, <laughs> Twitch. Flinch. Miles mm -hmm. away. Mm. Airplane. Vehicle. Hmm. Um, history. Oh, fucking hell. History. Um, vacation. Abrasive. <laughs> Stone. <laughs> Stone is kind of close, actually. Stone. Hedge. Miles away. Rock. Rock. Music. Miles away. Fuck's sake. Um, use this to warm up your brain. There's no yeah. chance. No, I do. It's a great. It's a great exercise. I don't know, but isn't it just? Pure I do that, work? and then I do the. Oh, I'll send you. I'll do. I'll send you the Starfield Digipick Simulator. That's also a great brain brain warm up. Really, really good. And there's no I, words involved, so. All right. There you go. My closest one is stone. So what about if we went for drug? No, miles away. Ooh. Um, stone. What are the definitions of stone? Do we know stone, rock, um, a pebble? Oh, pebble is similar. So let's go for pebble like stream. No, a pebble, a chip. No, a pebble, smooth. No. What else do we associate with the word pebble? Um, pebble, small. No. Erosion. Ooh. Miles away. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Oh God. Um. Sand. That's a great one, chat. Sand is close. <laughs> Beach. Miles away. How can sand be kind of close? What about sandstone? Oh, kind of close, Ooh. actually. 
All right, so what about um, sediment? Kind of close as well, but further away. The closer we're getting to rocks, the better it's looking. Stone, pebble. So we can... Stone and pebble. What about like a fossil? Fucking miles away. Um, what are the four quadrants? North, south, east, west. Oh, do you mean like in here? <laughs> <laughs> I love that I've been so stupid today that you responded <laughs> like that. You just told me the cardinal directions like I didn't know them. Oh, it's uh, up, down, left, and right, actually. Just in case you didn't know. Oh. <laughs> Dirt? Dirt's not a bad idea, chat. Oh, that's further away, though. What's 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 a pebble? Like a pebble beach? Pebble. Pe pebble dash? Pebble mm. dash? Pebble dash is kind of similar as well. So then maybe we'll do like a stone, like a, what do you call it on the front of a house? Um, the the cladding. Uh, yeah, I mean, we'll just throw in a little cobblestone. No, it's <laughs> further out. Um, hmm, what about like foraging? No, miles away. <laughs> a pebble is a small rock. Yeah, I know that. I know that. <laughs> do you? Pebble. Why would pebble be closer than stone? Because there's what's what differentiates a pebble from just a random stone? It's the Earth. fact that it's smooth, small, and cute. What about cute? No. <laughs> um. Bl building block. No, miles away. Round. Sphere, circle. Oh, circle's kind of co close on this side. Circle, circumference, <laughs> further away. So what I don't get is, why is circle to the northeast and circumference to the southwest? Is there any is there anything I'm supposed to be reading into the, the region? The semantics in? of how they're connected. Ah. So if they're coming from different directions... Ah, oh, shit. The, the, follow the path of that connection, yeah. Right, which is why all of the stone ones were getting closer along here. Yeah. And circle is getting us closer to the middle from there. Christ. Um, You're doing great. You're doing great. Right. What else do we know that's small, round, and cute? Uh, mm -hmm. Sfeel from Pokemon. True. Um, Esper from Pokemon? Yeah. Kidney stone. <laughs> kidney. No, kidney's not there. Um, the moon. It's not really small, chat. I wouldn't say the moon is particularly small. Crater. Well, it's smaller than Earth. Stone, crater, sand, back. dirt. So it's earthy, right? All right, let's go and explore some of the rest. So we had circle was kind of close. What are the words that are similar to circle? Circle, round, even, um, uh, one line. <laughs> uh, ball. Ball's a good one. Oh, ball. Wait. We're narrowing in. Circle. <laughs> ball. Bouncy. No. Bouncy. Ball. Tennis. Tennis. Ball. Okay. Uh, racket. Racket's really close. Wait, wait a second. Badminton. Further wait, away. Wait, you're a Gemini? And... Never mind. I went for tennis again. Uh, twins. <laughs> wait, what was, what was so fucking close there? Racket. Okay, strings. Strings are close. Violin. Violin. Wait a second. Viola. Cello. <laughs> um uh, uh 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 double bass. Bass. <laughs> double bass. No. Um god. So something that combines pebble, racket, 
and violin. Where's the pebble connection? Catgut. Oh, wait, Catgut is actually quite close. That's fucking crazy. If Catgut is Rosin? close, it's got to be something to do with a violin, right? If Catgut is close. Yeah, like... Resin, a bow? Hmm. Plectrum? Plectrum is close. Guitar, further away. How is Plectrum closer than guitar? Because <laughs> it's something that... How is Plectrum coming along the same thing as Pebble? Pluck? Pick? Let's just start naming stringed in instruments. Banjo. Mandolin. Ukulele. Oh, ukulele is pretty damn close. Over the rainbow. No. Um, ukulele is damn close, though. U ukulele is still further away than the plectrum and racket. How is racket close? Something you use as a racket. I mean, a tennis racket. Well, what about the alternate spelling of racket? No. Further away. Um, racket. Strings tight. Tight? No. Strings restrung. Strung? String? Quartet? I actually haven't done it today. Let me see. Jazz? Jizz? <laughs> How is jizz as similar as rainbow? What am I narrowing in on here? It has to combine ukulele, jizz, racket, and plectrum. <laughs> I'm thinking of a sexual instrument with strings that you use a plectrum for. What? What? <laughs> um, one time when I went to band camp, I uh, stuck an entire flute up my pussy. What is that movie? Oh my god, what? Do you know what did you just <laughs> No, what did you You say? don't remember that movie? That's a that's no. a reference from a movie. Is it American Pie? No. I mean, I, I, we talked about I don't, oh, I said I don't see movies. I thought you were just saying Oh, that. yeah, you don't, re yeah, you don't know movies oh, no. very much, do you? No, that yeah. was really scary. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah. Um, <sighs> flute? Oh, wait. Flute is closer than the stringed instruments. Oboe. Clarinet. Flute. Why is flute so much closer then? Flutist? Wait. It's not called a flutist, is it? It's flautist. Called a flautist. Flautist? All right. Flute is kind of close, though. Okay, so our closest are flute, jizz, racket, plectrum. Um. Oh, I got. Mm, I got it. Sorry. You got it. I got it. Yeah. How? How? It um, do you want a hint? You can use the hint button. Or I can be your hint. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, where does jizz come from? The penis. Don't. That's actually kind of close. Tube. Oh, urethra. Ureter. Um. Uh, balls. Oh, testicles. No. Uh, the vast deference. Ah, oh, fuck. Um. I don't know. I'm trying to understand the semantics of how they got to. Oh, I thought you were in bed. From where you are to where. Well, you're up crazy. You are. Love you. Can I come to bed tonight? Aww. I'm allowed to sleep in the same bed as you? Yeah. 
This <gasps> of... We did it, Joe. I can name 100 women. What, when I come to bed, I have to name another 100 women? <laughs> that's, 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 uh, chat, we got to study. <laughs> chat, we, I need lists and I need memorization <laughs> tactics. Please. Good night. Good night. <laughs> oh my god. Right. What have we got here that's close? Flute. Flute is the closest instrument we've got. What other woodwind instruments do we know? Clarinet, oboe, flute. Um. Penny whistle? A whistle. Whistle's miles away. Tune. Melody. How is tune so far away, but melody is close? I don't understand this game. <laughs> They're like the same thing. They're a synonym. <laughs> a skin flute? The one-eyed trouser snake. Um... <laughs> I don't, I don't get it. Follow the strands? I'm trying. How are we getting closer, though? I don't understand. Clarinet is here. Somehow, the closest is flute. Then, clarinet. But, like, violin is closer than clarinet, but flute is closer than that. Pick a, pick a lily. Pick a, pick a, pick a, pico. Piccolo? Piccolo? Piccolo. Pick, pick, piccolo. Pick, a, piccolo. Piccolo. Pick a, pick a, pick a lily. Pick a lily. Pick piccolo. F oh, fuck, it didn't matter anyway. It's worse than flute. Broccoli. Broccoli's further away. Yeah. I. We might. We okay. might require okay. a hint here. I've got four yeah. minutes before Who Wants to Be a Millionaire downloads. <laughs> Is it tube-shaped things? Is that what we're getting here? Because we're getting flute, we're getting penis, we're getting carrot, tube. Tube. Okay, tube. Subway. No, miles away. Eat fresh. Tube. Let me... I'm going to hit the hint button. Yeah, yeah. P pomanders? What the fuck is pomanders? <laughs> what does pomanders mean, precious? Um, I have no idea. What's a pomanda? Coronas. I love Coronas good Corona is on the Chat. same as pebble. Like solar flare? Like a co Corona is the... Corona Sun. is... Well, yeah, it's the... Uh, it's the effect of the outside of the sun, isn't it? It's la I think it's Latin for crown, isn't it? Corona? I mean, we could, uh, crown? It's my favorite. No, thing. I don't know then. <laughs> Fuck me. Pomandas. <laughs> Coronas. What are these words, dude? Barfly? Barfly? What do you mean, barfly? What the hell words is it giving me here? <laughs> Pomanda's Corona's Barfly. Oh, great. Oh, wonderful. Wonderful. I do want to let you know that I took nine years of Latin and I forgot what Corona meant and you knew what it meant. So that's cool. Uh, yeah, I mean, useless facts. Start listing out things you need to make a cocktail. A coop. Uh, uh, alcohol. Of some variety. A mixer. Ooh. Mixer is warm. Right. Mixer. Nice. Katie Reeve, thank you for the 20 gifteds. Wow. Thank you very much. That's very kind of nice. you, Katie. Now, if your name's Katie because <laughs> you were born Katie and are I a woman, I wouldn't mixer scroll back in the vault. But thank you very much for the 20 gifted subs. Um, right, mixer. So mixer, I'm nice. thinking a party, um, like a uh, icebreaker. Nice. Oh, icebreaker is apparently not a word. Uh, oh, because I spelt it wrong. 
Icebreaker, no, not correct. Mixer. All right, so let's go Mixer. Let's go Coke. Coca-Cola. Um, what other mixes are there? Like ginger beer? Bed Mixer. Pff, what other mixes do we have? Tonic? Ooh, tonic's kind of close. Gin. Wait a second, rum. TMI.twitch.tv USERNOTICE hashtag sideshow. Pluggers! What? What the fuck? Uh, what? What did somebody just read out to me? Pluggers! Soda. Soda's kind of simple. Water. Where? where uh, sorry. The, how is cat gut, tube, and mixer? On the same semantic chain. And rum, gin, Buggers. soda. So we're getting closer. You don't make sense when you see it. I don't think it will. Glass. Oh Buggers. my god, glass is so fucking close. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good work. So, oh, so that's the connection from pebble. Why was sand so fucking far away Buggers. from glass? Um, right, so glass tumbler. <gasps> the word was tumbler. How is flute Good similar work. to tumbler? How is flute <laughs> similar to tumbler? How is the word penis similar to tumbler? How is the word barfly similar to... Oh, barfly because the word bar. How is racket similar to tumbler? Oh, because it would be like gymnastics would be along that maybe. And it would go out to like more and more sports. Oh, God. I guessed tumblers, and it was only 65 points. Oh, really? <laughs> That's terrible. Well, you okay. got it. I got it. I got it. Good work. Yay. High five from New Jersey. Woohoo. Oh, my wife sent me a message saying, sorry I roasted you. Love you bunches. She's Aww. so sweet. She's so sweet. Okay. Now I should go to bed. It's 2 a.m. All I've done all yes. day is embarrass myself. It And tomorrow is a new day. And that's what's the most important thing. What's most important is winning a million dollars. Oh, you're actually going to... Oh, my God. That's what's most important. Do you, <laughs> I... Do you want? I'm totally fine because I've been here for a while to peace out and let you do this through chat. Sure, if you if you want. But I'm also down to watch and just watch this. <laughs> <laughs> I think whatever you want. <sighs> what do I think? I think. I think I'm doing better with you mentally supporting me. I think, for for clarity's sake, I should do it on my own. I okay. should mute and do it on my own. Okay. I, I, it's not that I don't want your support. It's no. that I need your support, and I need to remove the crutch <laughs> from myself. That's the problem. Okay, I will be watching, though. Okay. Good night. So, no pressure. But the support will be there. Good luck, homie. Bye-bye. I'm not silencing women. I'm not silencing women. Holy shit. United Kingdom. It really is quite loud. That is really quite loud. That's really, really, really fucking loud. Okay. Chat? I actually think I'm gonna own this. I watched Super's video, and Super was so stupid. And I know I'm less stupid than that. I know that Super named 100 women before I did, but barely, barely. And that's like the worst part of my abilities. If I'm given multiple choices, I nail that shit. I fucking nail it. This is how I passed med school. I'm going to dominate this. Solo. Normal. Because I'm not a fraud. Oh shit, you have to like download extra questions. 
in order to get the additional questions. Wait, what's going on here? What's it telling me? Are you sure? What am, what am I signing up for here? What does this do? What? Neurons? Wait, every time I click this, it takes a neuron? I've got a lot of neurons to spare, though. I've got tons of neurons to spare. Let's just go... Let's go for... Okay, chat. I can't go for manga. I don't know manga. I don't... Like, I don't... I, I, I can't go for manga. I can't go for manga. But we do? Cheating? You can't pick and choose, just do everything? Okay. We're gonna go with everything. Choose your character. Alright, who looks the most like me? Where's the bald guy? Where's the bald guy? Where's the bald guy? There's gotta be a bald guy. There's always a bald guy. Pablo's old. He's balding, but he's not bald. Where are you? But fucking knew there'd be a bald guy. There's always bald representation. There's always bald representation, man. Okay. Oh, this is the British version. It's got pound signs. I'm gonna win a million pounds. I actually think... I think I can do this in less than 10 tries. I think I can do this in less than 10 tries. And a cash prize of 1 million. Welcome to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Let's start right away. Put something on the line then? If I can't get a Good million evening. pounds Good evening, in less special. than 10 tries... I hope you'll bring me good luck. DJ Pie Sauce, thank you for the prime. Make some money? If I can't Who wants to get be a, a million pounds in less than 10 the tries... To reach the million. We will climb this money ladder together, step by step. What do I go for? What do I go for? You, you have four lifelines at your disposal. Phone a friend, the 50-50, ask the audience... Have you seen the show before? Yeah, I've seen the show before. It should be fine. It should be fine. Eat a handful of alive bugs? No. Eyebrows? I'm not doing eyebrows. I'm not doing eyebrows. I don't want to shave my mustache. Um, name a hundred more women if you fail. Done. Okay. If I fail ten times, what does a snooker... Wait, whoa, whoa. G give me a second. Give me a sec. Game paused. If I fail to get a million pounds in ten tries, I will name another hundred women. On stream. All different. A hundred completely different women. <laughs> but not today. Next stream. What does a snooker player usually rub on the end of his cue? A rabbit's foot, olive oil, lemon juice, or chalk? It is the same as me tonight. It's chalked. We're going to say A, okay? Do I need to, like, click it again? Oh, yeah, so I have to click it twice. Your final answer? That's my final answer. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. Fucking hell, you're taking a while. Yes, you are right. Thank you, thank you. Easy beginning, easy beginning. 100 pounds. Good stuff. Go for a whole new question. Oh, all good. Complete the name of the great Renaissance artist, Leonardo... Da Vinci, <laughs> Da Pinci, Da Zinci, or Da Vinci? It's Leonardo Da Vinci. Right is that your final? What is this easy mode? Okay, the um, questions ramp up. That's the beginning are supposed to just be gimmies. They're supposed to be gimmies until you hit a thousand pounds, and oh, then they start to get more difficult. The well done. It's Leonardo DiCaprio. 
But that wasn't an that, that wasn't was an answer. Right answer. Awesome. You shouldn't be surprised about that. It, literally, it said your specialty is ancient art. You a new question. What was the job of Contrary Mary in the traditional nursery rhyme? What? Who the fuck is Contrary Mary? I know Mary had a little lamb. Who's Contrary Mary? This is the third one. Contrary Mary. The traditional nursery rhyme, Contrary Mary. It's not Mary had a little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, it's wool was white as snow, and everywhere that Mary went, the little sheep did go, blah, 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 blah. That's not Contrary Mary, is it? Maybe it is. It's the only Mary that I know in a nursery rhyme. Why is it always about women? Why, why is it always about women, chat? Dude, I did, <laughs> Oh. <gasps> Wait. Mary, Mary, quite contrary, how does your garden grow? ba 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 da ba da ba da ba da ba da ba da Mary, Mary, quite contrary, how does your garden grow? It was a gardener. It was a gardener, chat. I'm popping off. Mary, Mary, quite contrary. Yes. That's all I remember. How does your garden grow? That's all I remember. Now it's time to find out. It's gotta be correct. Thank fuck for that. Thank fuck for that. How many of you in the chat knew that? How many in the chat knew that? There's no way. That, that that came from the base of my skull. Complete the famous quotation from the 1966 World Cup. They think it's all over. It is now. Legendary broadcast moment. Legendary broadcast moment. See, that's the right choice. And now to the Everyone in the UK would be able to answer that question. Is this your final answer? Yes, I teach nursery rhymes for a, a living. Answer. I'm goated at that. It's coming home, it's coming, football's coming home. Don't put the Harry Kane missing the penalty yes. in the... You are right. Oh, Harry, Pe Harry oh Payne, Harry Payne, Harry Payne. Bastille Day is celebrated on which date? Ooh, we got ourselves a problem here. Immediately, my brain is thinking July the 14th, but I don't know why, for no good reason. The Bastille Day. Now, is that the celebration in France where people were broken out of the prison during the revolution? Or am I getting all of the information incorrect there? That might, Every part of that might be, might be wrong. Every single part of that might be wrong. Now, as for when in the year it was, I have the vaguest a hint of an idea what the day celebrates. As for when it is in the year, not a fucking clue. Wait, how do I... How do I... I need to... I need to ask the audience. I don't think the audience would know. It's an English audience. They're not going to know this. I've got to phone a friend. Okay, let's get a friend. I've got to phone a friend already. I don't know Bastille Day. Okay, my aunt... My childhood friend, my colleague, or my wife? No. I mean, that, that name sounds kind of French. My aunt, my, I have a French aunt. That's crazy. Good evening, Noor. I need your help for a really hard question. Oh, George. I really hope that I'm going to be able to... Stop wasting time, I auntie. Think this is really one of your areas of expertise, yes. I know the answer, and it's C, of course. Oh, exactly what I was going to pick. Exactly what I was going to pick. July 14th. That'll be my final answer. Let's fucking go. Okay, the computer validated your answer. Nice. Nice. Nor is an Arab name, bro. So not French. Trust yourself and mm. your acquaintances for this new question. Mm. Mm. Who was the longtime presenter of BBC's Record Breakers? 
Bob Holness, Leslie Crowther, Ed Stewart, Roy Castle. Well, I have not wow. heard of any of them. I've not heard of any of them. Not a single one of them, chat. That's an ask to the audience. Hey guys, this is an important question. I've, I've never heard of record breakers. I've never heard of it. Uh-oh, there's a little spurt of C, but most people think it's D. I'm choosing D. Roy Castle. Are never heard sure? of him. Who's Roy Castle? That's my final answer. All right, let's find out the right answer together. Just let's fucking go. Go on, audience. Go that on. I've used right two answer? of my lifelines already. Awesome. I've used two of my lifelines already. What, in, what about instead of doing Ask the Audience, you just read the chat? No, because you guys would troll me. I'd get it wrong every time. Bar and horseshoe are types of what? Magnet. Immediately, magnet. Too easy. Too fucking easy. Bar magnet, horseshoe magnet. I'm locking that shit in instantly. I'm choosing A. Magnet. I know you are waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? Shut the fuck up. Of course um, it is. That's my final answer. I know it's correct. If this is your final answer. Let's hope it's the correct answer. Great patter. Great patter. The banter is immaculate. One right Unbelievably well dialogued almost. this. The voice acting perfection. Will you be able to answer this new question as well? <laughs> this, this, this dialogue's so stiff. Apiculture is the breeding and care of what? Uh-oh. My brain is saying bees. But let's think. It's going to be it's going to be a Latin beginning to a word. So if it was horses, it would probably be like equi something for equine. It's not going to be apes, apiculture. That's just thrown in there as a red herring. Birds is normally like avian. Birds is normally like ave or um, orno, like ornithologists or avian. The only one I wouldn't know is bees. So I think it's probably bees just because I don't know it. We gotta take a gamble. I can't be using all of my lifelines. I've just gotta go for it. This is the first one I'm guessing on though. Convinced, but is this your final answer? Yes, that's my final answer. Now it's time to find out the correct The tension's answer. never been higher. Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! One Let's fucking right go. Answer for me. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Now let's go to the next question, if you don't mind. I, I don't mind. Get the next one up there. According to George Bernard Shaw, which two countries are divided by a common language? Shit. George Bernard Shaw. Divided by a common language. Divided by a common language. Well, it makes sense for America and England. I mean, it makes sense for all of them in theory, but I think with his name being George Bernard Shaw, no idea who the motherfucker is. It, with his name being George, very English sounding. Divided by a common language. Sounds like he's molding over the fact that America's changed a lot of English words. I just don't see why he would be commenting on France and Belgium or Spain and Mexico. Divided by a common language. What would, what would the context of a quote like that be as well? The point being that the common language is the division point. I don't see how that would be specific to Scotland and Ireland. I think, it, I think considering they have said it in English and they sound like an English person's name, I think it's got to be American England. Divided by a common language. Yeah, I'm going to send it. See, that's the right choice. Well, I wouldn't sound that confident. 
It's a punt. Are you sure? No. That'll be my final answer. Context okay. clues. The computer validated your answer. That's correct. Okay. Yes! Let's fucking go. Let's fucking it. go. Dude, we're actually gonna first try this chat. You guys think I'm so fucking dumb, and I'm about to first try to a million pounds. Get me on this show. Get me on this fucking show. I'll never have to stream again and, uh, and give away how- Oh no. What is the official language of the African country of Burkina Faso? Oh no. Let me think. Oh no. Burkina Faso. Intuitively, I'm thinking French. The French did a lot of colonizing in Africa, and the Belgians did a lot of colonizing in Africa as well. Now, that's not to say that the English didn't. They did. But uh, my gut is saying French here. Now, I think this is a good time, though, to go for a 50-50. Because I'm feeling like it's between French and... Dude, I don't even know. I might just punt on French. Burkina Faso. Burkina Faso. I don't have a clue. I don't have a fucking clue. The official language of the African country of Burkina Faso. Burkina Faso. Is the name itself in one of these languages? Does Burkina Faso mean something in Spanish? I'm going to use the 50 50 because I might just lose right here. Okay, let's take away two incorrect answers. Please knock it down to that. It's French. I, I mean, it might not be, but I'm going to go with French. I, I had a gut feeling for French. Spanish Portuguese got taken away. I'm thinking French. Yes. I'm thinking French. That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. Shut up. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. 32,000 pounds secured. First try. First try. Is now waiting for you to be answered with flying colors. Where is the Venus Rosewater dish awarded annually? Oh shit. Um Oh bollocks. Oh bollocks, bollocks, bollocks. I don't have a clue. Uh oh. Uh oh. Where is the Venus Rosewater dish? Now, is it named after somebody called Venus Rosewater? If it is, then. Hmm. So, Wimbledon, I know that second place gets something that looks like a dish. In Wimbledon, first place gets, like, a, a trophy, and second place gets a silver kind of plate dish-looking thing. But I have no idea what they give for the rest. Racing, it's normally like a... I mean, F1 gives out trophies. Indy 500 gives, like, a thing of flowers around you, and you pour a pint of milk on your head. Le Mans... What do they give you? Fuck knows. But it's the Venus Rosewater dish? Probably not. I'm, I'm feeling the Kentucky Derby. For no good reason. Unless it's the second place prize at Wimbledon. But I don't know who Venus Rosewater is. Again, don't know women, apparently. That's what we're learning today. Jesus Christ. We've got to just take a punt. We don't have any lifelines left. Feels like the Kentucky Derby to me. I think that the right answer is B. I know you are Do you pronounce it the Kentucky Derby in the US? Is this your final answer? 
That'll be my final answer. It's for the women's competition in Wimbledon? If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. I have to announce to you that this is not I can't right believe answer. it. Sorry. I can't uh, believe you, it. I, shouldn't have I failed tried. on the question named after a woman that gets given to women's sports athletes. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Okay, we go again. We go again. That's the first attempt down. First attempt. That's just the first attempt. We're okay, chat. We're okay. This is actually fine. It's actually fine. It's it's so fine. You only got to 32k? What do you mean only? Do you have 32k? Have you ever won 32k in a fucking trivia game before? Suck my balls. Un unless you're a woman, in which case, uh, I apologize. You're correct. And I would never ask you to do that on the internet. <laughs> I apologize for my behavior. And... I will make it up to you by doing better in the next game. <laughs> Solo, normal, um, le yeah, let's just send it again. <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay, come on, bald ass. Come on. Come on. Come on, baldy. Uh, Sideshow asked for exclusively men to suck his balls. Actually, that's playing into the gender binary. I only said women. I'm not asking. So, anybody else, right? Basically. He's 42 like you as well. Um, no. I'm not 42. <laughs> I'm in my 20s. That's why I don't know very much. I'm not experienced. I'm not old and experienced. Oh, fuck. Hello Jesus Christ. Who wants to be a millionaire? No good shot. Evening, everyone, and Calling being 29 in your 20s is cope. It's technically, literally right. true. Let's That's not cope. That's not fucking cope. It's just a fact. I'm 29. I'm in my 20s. Yes, I turned 30 in 40 days. I'm still in my 20s. To help you, you have four lifelines at your disposal. I'm skipping this shit. Which of these is a common term for serialized television dramas? A soap opera. We're going to say... I, I, uh, listen, okay. listen, skip, skip. I know it's correct. Skip, skip. Come on, George. Complete the proverb. Don't count your chickens before they are plucked. Hatched. Don't count your chickens before they're hatched. I'm fucking, I'm nailing it. In which of these buildings is someone most likely to make brass rubbings? In which of these buildings is someone most likely to make brass rubbings? You make a brass rubbing? I mean, I've done it at museums. Why? The only thing that makes sense to me is a church, but why would you make a brass rubbing at a church? A brass rubbing is where you have something underneath that's textured. You put a piece of paper on it and you scrub, let's say, charcoal, crayon, whatever, over the top. And it makes a, 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 a picture on the paper of the metal, the textured metal underneath. Why the fuck would someone do that in any of these places? What? Why would you make a why would you have a factory for brass rubbings? Is it something you would use in a factory to get the outlines of something else? Like you have a piece and you do a brass rubbing in order to get the proportions of it that you could then use for something else? What the fuck? I am I am losing my mind. I need to 50-50 this okay, shit. Please take away two random wrong answers. Leave the right answer and the one remaining wrong answer. 
It's got to be church. I mean, what would you be doing with a brass robin in a the theater? Why would you brass robin a church anyway, though? I'm going to pick A. Why would you brass robin a church? Yes, that's my. Just final because it has old relics and stuff. The choice is made. Just Why, chat? I don't. What? Why? What? The, who the fuck is doing brass robbings in a church? Your new question is old right. church Good graves luck. had pictures of knights on them, etc. So what? But why are you why why are you out there rubbing? You're in a church to pray and praise God. A tremor is a small earthquake. Oh, um. A tremor is a small D earthquake. Seems pretty good. I'm gonna say D. Is that? That's an answer I can get behind. One this, more right answer for me. It's. Where is Colleen a traditional name for young women? What? Where is Colleen? Oh, oh I'm never going. Oh, I am never dodging the allegations. Where is Colleen a traditional name for a young woman? A traditional yet name? What do you mean for a young woman? If, it, if it's someone's name, they keep it when they grow older, too. I don't understand the question. Where is Colleen a traditional name for a young woman? Like you would say, this girl, this Colleen. I've never heard it before. Colleen? Col Colleen. Oh, Colleen. What? Where is Colleen a traditional name for a young woman? Well, I've never fucking heard of it, so I don't think it's England. Colleen. I, I... I've no fucking clue. A traditional name for a young woman. What does that mean? What does that mean? So, like, you would say, I was a Colleen. Like, my colleague is a Colleen. Saying my colleague is a young woman. They've made this up. They fucking made this up. This isn't a thing. I, 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 I'm out of protest. I'm not even using any of my lifelines. I'm just going no with Wales. I'm gonna say this D. is bullshit. This is so fucking this bullshit. Is your final answer? This is bullshit. That's my final answer. If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. It's the wrong answer. Ireland. Don't calls young women Colleen. Really? What? What, a shame. You're what do you mean? How am I losing to the women again? Colleen is an English language name of Irish origin, right? But what do you? But 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 uh, but if you call somebody, if you name somebody Colleen when they're born, they keep the name Colleen when they grow older. It's just like how up north we say our lass. So in Ireland they say our Colleen. Even though it's not. Even though that's not their name. What? That's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. Right. We're going. <laughs> we're going again. <laughs> we're going again. We're fucking going again. This is. I, I'm getting this. I'm getting this. This is attempt number three. Attempt number three. Alright, uh, skip the shit. Skip the shit. Skip the shit. I'm already pissed. Skip the shit. By what common name is the harmonica also known? The mouth organ. Mouth organ. I'm certain that it's B. What? That? We popped off. What is the capital of Australia? This one, trick question, it's Canberra. I'm choosing A. It's well done. Uh, People go for Sydney. Which of these television series featured Kermit the Frog? The Muppet Show. I'm choosing C. Popping off. Come on, Which George, former England football us. captain is a regular on They Think It's All Over? 
What the fuck is they think it's all over? Is that a UK TV show? Oh no. Which former England football captain is a regular on They Think It's All Over? What the hell? I mean, Gary Lineker and Alan Shearer are on Match of the Day, aren't they? So is it maybe one of the other ones? My brain cells are melting five heads. Shrubbery, thank you for the four months. What the fuck is they think it's all over? I mean, it's a football show, obviously, but the only football show I know is Match of the Day. And Match of the Day has Gary Lineker and Alan Shearer, so it's probably one of the others, but I don't even know who the others are. I don't know who Brian Robson is. I don't know who Emlyn Hughes is. I mean, I've, I've just got no, I've got no hope. I've got no fucking hope. The audience will know, though. Okay, audience, big one. Gary Lineker? Well, he gets everywhere, doesn't he? I think that the right answer is B. And what will be? You don't know Brian Robson? Who's Brian Robson? Oh, yes. That. That's what we were looking for. Of course, it's B. How am I supposed to fucking know? One more. What? Right what the hell is that me. show? What is that show? It ran from 1992 to 2006. I've never watched it. According to the proverb, what does the hand that rocks the cradle do? The hand that rocks the cradle. Uh-oh. The hand that rocks the cradle. The hand that rocks the cradle. Well, I mean, Wakes the Baby is the only one that fits the theme. The hand that rocks the cradle. Yeah, because rocking the cradle means to, like, rock the boat, doesn't it? Even though that doesn't really make sense. A lot of babies do like the cradle to be rocked. The hand that rocks the cradle wakes the baby. That just sounds too stupid. The hand that rocks the bait. The hand that rocks the cradle counts the cost. The hand that rocks the cradle counts the cost. The hand that rocks the cradle rules the world. No. The hand that rocks the cradle rules the day. No. The hand that rocks the cradle counts the cost. That kind of sounds valid. The hand that rocks the cradle wakes the baby. I mean, the thing is, the hand that, the only one that works with the hand, I mean, the hand rules the world, doesn't make sense. The hand rules the day, doesn't make sense. The hand wakes the baby, kind of makes sense. The hand counts the cost. That makes a lot of sense. We got to take some punts. We can't always be, we can't always be, fucking we gotta guess we gotta guess some of them this i don't know why this makes sense i don't know what the proverb means i've never heard the proverb before the hand that rocks the cradle counts the cost it kind of makes sense i guess if you if you if you upset the boat then you have to the hand that rocks the cradle rules the world sorry what does that mean what i shouldn't have even tried this was about motherhood and showing the influence of women That's, a, that's kind of a misogynist fucking proverb, honestly. Why is it always the women that are rocking the cradle? Why, why is the hand that rocks the cradle supposed to be an analogy for the women? I mean, fucking men can rock cradles. Dude. Oh my god, I'm, I'm, I'm getting fucking bogged out here. Okay. Okay, okay. This one, I focus up. In the nursery rhyme, who lost her sheep? Little Bo Peep. I'm choosing C. Sh skip, skip, skip. I know I've got it right. Guess what? Woman. Question. Which word can mean a Scandinavian or a vegetable? Swede. Show me Swede. 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 I'm try C. Okay. Commonly known in the U.S. as a rutabaga. Who wrote Murder on the Orient Express? Agatha Christie. Woman. Didn't remember her name? Woman. Woman. 
Are you ready for this new question? What is a slang term for a police trap set to catch criminals? Uh, a sting operation. Yes, a sting. A sting. A sting. Skip. Sting. 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 Popped off. Come on, George. Complete the title of the Julia Roberts film. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. I think Julia Roberts was in my was, was Julia Roberts in four weddings and a funeral? Is that why they've put that in there? Or have they put that in there because it's my best friend's wedding? My best friend's wedding. That sounds right. My best friend's wedding? It sounds right, chat. It sounds right. I'm gonna go with it. It sounds right. It sounds right. To make a choice. Is that your final answer? It sounds right. That's my final answer. It sounds correct. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct answer. Only if it's correct. Let's fucking go. Popped off. Popped off. In fashion, what do the initials DK stand for in the abbreviation DKNY? Oh, no. 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 <laughs> No, 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 you, no, 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 gonna have to ask the audience about that one, gonna have to ask the audience about that one, and enter your votes now, DK, DK, C, Donna Karen, really, okay, I'm choosing C, you better be right, final answer, you better be right, yes, that's my final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. This guy's got such a punchable mouth. You nice. Donna Karen. Okay. Oh, that, that's perfect. <sighs> we got past it somehow. The questions follow each other and are not alike. Shut up. According to the song, what did the soldiers of the First World War pack up their troubles in? Pack up your troubles in an old kit bag. Pack up your troubles in a rubber. Pack up the trump. Pack up the troubles in a big glass. Of I mean, the only one that makes sense for the meter is old kit bag, doesn't it? Blue ditty bag, dry duffel bag, big Gladstone bag. Pack up your troubles in an old kit bag. Soldiers of the First World War. Dry. Pack up the troubles in a dry duffel bag. I don't fucking know. What do the soldiers of the worst First World War pack up their troubles in? It, the only one that makes sense is old kit bag, surely. Don't forget you have a fourth lifeline. Skip question. There's no fucking way. You have a skip question? <gasps> oh my god, I had no idea, Mortaray. Oh my god, why did they add that? This was the, the, there used to be only three lifelines in this game. I'm going to take a punt, though. No, 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 you know what? I'm going to phone a friend. Okay. I'm going to phone an old friend. person. My aunt. You, you probably lived through the First World War. Good evening, Nor. No, you popped off last time. Really hard question. Oh, George, I really hope that I'm going to be able to help you. I think that this is really one of your areas of expertise, yes. I know the answer, and it's C, of course. It's always the one I think. It's always the one I think, and I just don't have enough confidence. I need more confidence in myself. I need more confidence. It was the only one that made any sense. An oologist is an expert in what? Now, immediately here, I'm thinking bird eggs. Because... Because egg. O. Oologist. An oologist. Oologist. Now, a sommelier would be an expert in wine. 
An expert in Jupiter. What the fuck would an expert in Jupiter be? I don't know. An oo <laughs> Stop spamming oo chat. An oologist. I think it's going to be bird eggs. I th I'm going to go with my gut. I'm going to go with my gut. I'm choosing B. I'm going to go with my gut. I know you are waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? I think so. Yeah. Oh. Yes. That's my final I think I've answer. I think I've done this. You have given your final answer. I think I've popped off. Now is the time to see the right one. Let's fucking go. Of course it is. Bird eggs. Let's go. Right answer. Easily. Easily done. Easily Why done. I have to be the one to According to a question. quote by Alexander Pope, a little something is a good thing. Ah, who is Alexander Pope? A little loving is a good thing. A little spending is a good thing. A little learning is a good thing. A little searching is a good thing. A dangerous thing. I misread the question. I misread the question completely. According to a quote by Alexander Pope, who I don't know who that is, a little something is a dangerous thing. A little loving is a dangerous thing. A little spending is a dangerous thing. A little learning is a dangerous thing. A little searching is a dangerous thing. I think this might be a little learning is a dangerous thing. A little learning is a dangerous thing. A little loving is a dangerous thing. Dude, the problem is I have no idea who Alexander Pope is. I think we, we've got to go. We've got to go with 50-50. Take away two incorrect answers. I don't even know what I'm hoping to see here. I think it might be learning. A little loving is a dangerous. Th now, if it's a, if it's a song quote, if Alexander Pope is a songwriter, it's much more likely to be a little loving is a dangerous thing. A little loving is a dangerous thing. I think it's going to be learning. I think it's going to be learning. I've got, I'm going with my gut. Are you sure? I think this That's is going to be a quote answer. about like either when people know a little, okay, they feel like they know a lot, like a bit of a Dunning Kruger thing, or maybe it's going to be like a something like that. It's not GG right chat. It's not me. GG. It's not GG. Um, In Greek mythology, who held up the columns that hold the heavens? That. Is Atlas. I'm certain that it's B. Final? Well done. We popped off. What is the meaning of the Latin word thesaurus? Bollocks. What is the literal meaning of the Latin word thesaurus? Okay, saurus. What do we know about saurus? Dinosaur? What does dinosaur mean? Dinosaur means like big lizard, doesn't it? Something like that? So does saurus mean large? Is saur large? Okay, maybe I'm coming at this the wrong way. Maybe we need to start with the thes. I mean, we've got like Theseus, but that's that's Greek mythology, right? So that's not going to help us. Latin word thes thesis, a thesis. Well, it's either going to be collection or comparison, isn't it? It's going to be collection because it's like a collection of similar words, or it's going to be comparison because it's um, you're literally finding synonyms. You're comparing one word to another. Those are the only things that make sense. It's not going to be treasure. It's not going to be gift. Surely. So it's going to be collection or comparison. Comparison makes the most sense in terms of being closer to the word synonym. What's the meaning of the Latin word thesaurus? Thesis. Hmm. Dinosaur. Dinosaur. Dinosaur means a large lizard, doesn't it? Dinosaur in Latin. Big lizard? Saw? Big? Big collection? I don't have any lifelines left. Thesaurus. 
I mean, comparison makes the most sense because it's synonyms. What other words have saurus? Saurus, porous, borus, horus, chorus. I'm going about this wrong. I'm trying to find different prefixes, not 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 rhyming words. Um, I'm just gonna I'm gonna lock in comparison. I think that the right answer. I'm gonna lock it in. B. I don't know. You seem this is a punt. Things, I think it's A or B. I think it's A or B. I'm going to go with comparison because it's yes, so similar to synonym. It makes sense. The choice is made. You can't always win. That's the wrong answer. Why have they called it that? Well, no big deal. Why the fuck have they called it that? Congratulations. You are leaving here with Why did they take the book of synonyms and go, "Oh, what should we call this? Oh, treasure." What? Sounds like treasure in French, but why? Why would they do that? Why would they do that? You had another lifeline? Oh, fuck, dude. What? Oh, fuck. Okay, I've got to remember the skip. I've got to remember the skip. Why? Does anyone know why they called the thesaurus the thesaurus? Like, why is a book that contains a lot of synonyms named treasure. Treasure, a treasury, a storehouse. Ugh. Well then, how is that not collection? Fuck, fuck it all. Fuck it all. If I have to listen to this smug cunt across from me, have a, another word come. Which Puerto Rican singer sings Despacito? I don't know, chat. I don't know. Beaten by women in vocabulary. Tough day. Iowa 42, thank you for the 50 months. I don't know, chat. I don't know. I mean, I've heard of Ricky Martin, but I don't know why. I know the name. I don't know the name of any of the other three. I don't know, chat. I have no idea. Despacito? Chat, I have no clue. I can't, I, can, I literally can't use a lifeline on the first question. I can't do it. That's, it, it, I can't do it. The biggest song in the world a few years ago? Yeah, I know. I didn't listen to it though. I didn't really like it. Louis Fonzi? Have I heard of that? Louis Fonzi, Despacito. Despacito by Louis Fonzi. Despacito by Ricky Martin. Despacito by Cheyenne. Despacito by Carlos Ponce. I'm asking the audience. I don't have a clue. This is a hundred dollar question. We need a little help here. I can't believe it. Pick up those I can't believe it. Enter your boat. Louis Fonzi, apparently. I think that the right answer is B. Fuck me. And what How be outrageous. Outra right. I had no clue. Ricky Martin did Live in La Vida Loca? Oh, yeah. What type of instrument is a ukulele? It's a stringed instrument. It Come is a on, string George. instrument. D seems pretty good. Come on, pop D. off. Come on. Come on. I know I've got that one correct. Oh, Move on. Uh, Which of these palindromes is used in an Olympic aquatic sport? A kayak. I'm going to pick A. Yeah. In which of these hobbies is a kiln likely to be used? Pottery. I'm choosing D. What is the home of a beaver called? A dam? A dam? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. What is the- Oh, fuck. What is the home of a beaver called? And it's not a dam? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's gonna be cabin or lodge, isn't it? It's gotta be cabin or lodge. A beaver in a lodge. A beaver's lodge? A beaver's cabin. A beaver's lodge. The beaver lodge. The be Beaver Lodge. That sounds better. That sounds better. The Lodge. It's going to be a Lodge. We, po we popped off. We popped off. We popped off. 
Which of these plural nouns is the only one that has a singular noun form? Measles, a measle. Thanks, a thank. Tidings, a tiding. Greetings, a greeting. It's got to be greetings. Greetings, greeting. A greeting. You can say a greeting. Which of these plural nouns is the only one that has a singular noun form? Tiding. You can't wish someone a good tiding. You can't... You can thank somebody, but that's a verb, to thank. Singular noun, a thank. A thank? He gave me a thank? Doesn't make sense. He gave me a measle. What, you only got one, bro? You missed out? Gotta be greetings. He gave me a greeting. See, that's the it's right gotta choice. be. It has to be. You I popped off. I popped off. Which word is used for weatherproofing the joints between a roof and other parts of the building? Flashing. I'm certain that it's B. Got it right. Well done. I don't want to tell you how I know that. Approximately how long does light take to reach us from the sun? Approximately how long does light take to reach us from the sun? So, light can go around the circumference of the earth in around i can't even remember but it's something like 200 milliseconds now if we take the circumference of the earth that's 200 milliseconds it's a long way it's many circumferences of the earth to the sun it's a fucking long way away For some reason, I think it's eight minutes. Because I think I remember somebody saying if the sun blew up, you'd only know about it eight minutes later. But does that make sense? Right, well, let's think about it this way. If light goes around the circumference of the Earth in, let's say, 200 milliseconds, then five times around the Earth would be one second. 45 times around the Earth would be nine seconds. Do I think 45 Earth circumferences are between me and the sun? No, it's way more than that. It's way more. It's eight minutes. I'm choosing C. It's, it's eight minutes. Are you absolutely sure? Is that your final answer? Oh, yes, that's my final answer. All right, let's find out the right answer together. Let's, let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. And there we have the fuck it. are you on about with the circumference of the Earth? What do you mean? What do you mean? I'm, I'm, I'm using my frame of reference in order to logically figure out the answer. Josh, you're great, but I'm on my second margarita. I could do with one. I could do with one, Liz. Aldous Huxley's novel, Brave New World, takes its title from which Shakespeare play? But why did I have to be the one to get this question? I'm thinking that all the time, George. All the fucking time. Aldous Huxley's novel, Brave New World, takes its title from which Shakespeare play? Brave New World. Now, I can remember the plot of all of these apart from Twelfth Night, and I'm getting it mixed up with some other ones. Which one is Twelfth Night? Twelfth Night. I can't remember what Twelfth Night is. 
Richard II, self-explanatory. Macbeth, everybody knows Macbeth. Tempest, they're on an island, uh, you know, fucking, I watched it live in London. I know the plot of that. I don't really understand how Brave New World would be. Brave New World. Brave New World. Fuck, dude. Fuck. I'm getting exposed as a fake Brit not knowing my Shakespeare. Holy shit. I'm so stupid and illiterate. Um... I'm gonna... Do I send the 50-50? No. I either phone a friend or I change the question out. Let's phone a friend. I'll tell you who'll know this. Never better served. I, I'll tell you who'll know this. Tina, my wife. B would know this. this is my wife would know this. Yes, good evening to you. I must admit that I'm kind of impressed. Who says good evening to you okay, to their snap out of it. partner? Our contestant really needs you right now. Tina, this time you're going to get me out of a tight spot. I'm counting on you. Why did he... See, I'm confident about it. It's Tempest, right really? Answer. The Tempest is probably the one of these that I'm most familiar with, and I don't remember this reference. Uh, no more hesitating. I'm gonna say D. Did you did you hear the emphasis? You sure? Did you hear the Did you hear the emphasis? Um, that's my final answer. This time you're gonna get me if out of a tight spot. Answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. Holy! Of course. I knew Tina would know Shakespeare. I knew Tina would know Shakespeare. Twelfth Night is the sibling shenanigans? Dude, he's got like fucking four plays that are sibling shenanigans. Is Twelfth Night where they... Um, is Twelfth Night the one that She's the Man is based on? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I was mixing that one up with... Uh, God knows. Mary Shelley's novel Frankenstein has the alternative title, the alternate title, sorry, sorry, the modern what? It's the modern Prometheus. Seems pretty good. I'm going to say D. And what will be your final answer? That'll be my final answer. That will be my final answer. I know I've got it correct. Move the fuck along. What nationality was you thanked the UN Secretary General? You could hear a pin drop in this fucking studio. Let's flip the question right now, hoping that the new one will bring you luck. I've got zero chance of that chat. Burmese wouldn't have got it. Get a new one in there. Get a new one in there. I hope you have recovered from your emotions because here is your new question. What is the administrative capital? What is the administrative capital of Brittany? Uh oh. Uh oh. Breast. Uh, no more hesitating. I'm gonna say D. Final? I can't resist. Oh. Yes, that's my final answer. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct answer. Fuck! Oh, no. You were so close. Fuck. Well, no big deal. It's a game, after all. Fuck. Oh, that was the wrong answer. It's not a fucking game, George! This is my reputation on the line. You're guaranteed cash prize. I know that Brittany's in northern France. I just don't know which other places are in northern France. Oh. <laughs> All right. Come on. Come on. This is so doable. This is so fucking doable. This is so doable. I need to be guessing more. I need to guess more. I need to not burn through my lifelines that quickly. I need to trust my gut. Anything where I have any clue at all, I need to trust my gut. Okay. Come on, 
which Focus. is a river as opposed to an island? Amazon. I think that the right answer is B. That, but why a slice of which of these fruits is most likely to be put in a cup of tea instead of milk? What? Who the fuck is putting fruit in tea? I mean, I assume it's lemon. But, like, what are you doing? I'm gonna try C. You had to make a choice. <laughs> Who the fuck is putting fruit in tea? Uh... In the title of a Jules Verne book, how long did it take to go around the world? 80 days. See? That's the right choice. Are you... Come on, According George. to the title of a 1986 Matthew Broderick film, which of these did Ferris Bueller have? A day off. I'm certain Ferris Bueller's day off. Is that? Yeah. Chow is a greeting in which language? Ciao. 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 Italian. Italian. Ciao. Well Italian. I just, I second guess myself for a moment. I second guess myself for a moment. Which prehistoric period came first? Oh, shit. The Bronze Age, Mesolithic, Neolithic, Paleolithic. Okay, paleo as a prefix means fucking way back. Neo means new. Bronze Age, I would assume, is after these things. My gut is paleolithic. What does meso mean as a prefix? Medium? It's D-B-C-A. Uh, no more hesitating. I'm gonna say D. And now to the most important question of all. Is this your final answer? Um, it's Mezzo. It's I'm done answer. with this stream. Oh, fuck. You have made your choice. Oh, sh oh, it was correct. You little prick. Oh, wait, you were making a joke. Me so done with this stream. Me so, me so done with the stream. I thought you meant the answer was me so and you were done with me. Good luck to you. <laughs> oh, I'm cooked. I'm absolutely cooked. Arabica is a high quality grade of what? Arabica. Ar Arabica? Ar Arabica. Ar Arabic. Arabica. Arabica? Arabica. Arabica coffee bean. Arab Arab Arabica. Arabic. Arabica coffee bean. Tea leaf? I think it's coffee. I'm going to go with my gut again. I, it feels like a coffee bean. I don't drink coffee, though, so I don't really know. I don't drink coffee. I don't drink tea. I don't think it's a high-quality juice. And I don't think it's a high-quality... I mean, it could be a high-quality white grape. In theory, it could be like wine made with the finest Arabica grapes. This might pop off with the 50-50. The 50-50 will remove two wrong answers. To get you it's coffee bean. It's 100% coffee bean. I should have gone with my gut. I wasted it. I wasted it. I wasted it. Again, I'm always wasting it, chat. I'm always fucking wasting it. I just need to go with my gut. Chronologically, which of these actors first played the role of James Bond? Sean Connery, Roger Moore, Timothy Dalton, Pierce Brosnan. First played the role of James Bond. Yeah, I think sh I think it's Sean Connery. Choosing C. Yes, absolutely. On a standard dartboard, what number is directly opposite twenty? I think it's three. It's directly at the bottom of the dartboard. It's three. I think the it's next right to the nineteen. Is B. And what? In George Orwell's novel, 1984, where does the worst thing in the world reside? Room 101. I'm choosing D. Well, 
Edith Bowman. Oh, no. Oh, no. Woman celebrity? Oh, no. <laughs> Edith Bowman is best known as what? An opera singer, an impressionist, a comedian, or a disc jockey? Oh, fuck, chat. Oh, fuck. I don't know. I've never heard of this person. Edith Bowman. Edith Bowman. Edith Bowman. Edith Bowman. No, I don't know. I don't know. The audience will know. The audience will know. Some help here. If you would pick up those keypads and... There's no way the audience also doesn't know. Oh, I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. They don't have a clue. They don't have a they don't have a damn clue. They think Edith Bowman is a disc jockey. A disc jockey? Who even says that? A disc jockey. Edith Bowman, famous DJ. Edith Bowman. Famous DJ? I'm gonna go with a phone a friend as well. Uh, I'm fucked around. It, it's owned me. My childhood friend. Let's go for Jennifer. Yes, hello? Who is this? Hello, this is Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? And we need your help. Well, I hope I'm up to the task. Anonymous gifter, thank but you for the we'll gifted sub to sure. one. Let's go. I would say D, but it's risky. Oh, what do you mean it's risky? D seems pretty good. The audience said D. D. Phone a friend no. said D. That'll be my if it's final wrong, answer. I'm going to flip a table. The choice is made. It's time to discover the right answer. Oh, let's go. I've never heard of Edith Bowman. D does anyone in chat know Edith Bowman? Is she actually a famous DJ that I should have heard of? No, fuck no, no. No, most... She's Scottish. Ah. The stable isotope du uh, deuterium is also known by what other name? I believe it's heavy hydrogen, isn't it? Deuterium, deuterium. The stable isotope deuterium. Heavy, heavy hydrogen. Deuterium. Ah, uh, the more I'm thinking, the less I'm confident. The stable isotope. I don't even know how to pronounce it. I've only ever seen it written down. Known by what other name? And I've used all of my lifelines. Deuterium. I'm gonna go with hydrogen. I'm gonna try C. I that might be so stupid. You know what my next question is, right? Is it's gonna be fucking oxygen, answer? isn't it? Um, that's my final answer. The choice is made. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Okay. Shanghai, Scram, and Golf are variations of which game? Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Golf. Shanghai, Scram, and Golf are variations of which game? Well, it's not poker. I know poker well enough that it's not poker. 
for some reason I'm thinking darts because of golf, but I don't know why I would even think golf darts is. I know there's a game, we call it round the clock, but but where you go one, two, you have to try to hit the one, then you have to try to hit the two, then you have to try to hit the three, you try to hit the four. And that that's a that's a variation of darts. Is that golf? Golf normally means one to eighteen. Is that relevant in any of these games? Croquet. Shanghai Scram and Golf. I think this might be a uh, this might be a swap. If I'm honest with you, this might be a swap. Because guts saying darts, but I am not confident at all. I think it's a swap. Because I just don't know billiards or croquet well enough. I also don't know darts, but I, I mean. I really don't know billiards or croquet. Shanghai. Scram. And golf. Variations of which game? No, I'm going to have to swap. I'm going to have to swap. I think it was darts. Let's see whether darts was correct. But I'm, I, I, I'm going to have to go for swap. The answer's billiards. No, it was darts. I should have gone with my gut. I should have gone with my gut. Fuck. The questions Fuck. Each other and are not alike. The proof with this mm. new question. Cape Breton Island is part of which Canadian province? It's over. It's fucking over. It's just it's just it's done. It's just done. It's just actually fucking completely cooked, I'm and I have no idea. Me. I've got no clue. You are waiting for me to ask you. I've got no fucking so clue, chat. Go. Is this your final answer? Yes, that's my final answer. I've got no clue. You have given your final answer. Now is the time to see the right one. Yes! 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 You son of a bitch! One you fucking lucky son of a bitch! Let's fucking go. I win those. I win those. It was there in the back of my mind somewhere. Short work of this new question. I'm a genius. Which 19th century explorer published the Arabian Nights? The only person I've ever heard of is David Livingston. Only person I've heard of there. Don't know the others at all. Maybe I've heard of them because they published this. Just go with the gut. Just pick the first one that comes to mind. Just pick the first one. I noticed your hesitation. You should have listened to that voice. That's the wrong answer. No. Dumb mistake on my part. Really? Oh, fuck. Congratulations. You walk away with your guaranteed cash prize. Good for you. What did I get to? What did I get to? Oh, shit. 250k? That's so close. That is so close. We just we just need to trust the gut a little bit more. I should have gone with darts. I shouldn't have used the lifeline. I shouldn't have used the fucking lifeline. Seven? This is not seven. There's no way this is seven. This is six. You've missed, you've lost count. Chat, you've lost count. This one is six. This is six. No, you're wrong, chat. You're wrong. You're wrong. I've been keeping track perfectly. It's six. Come on, George. When Goldilocks went into the three bears house, what did she find to eat? Porridge, pork chops. She ate pork chops in front of the bears. Which parts of the body are affected by fallen arches? Feet. Going to say A, okay? Are you just Which of these sports is played on horseback? Polo. I'm <gasps> no! Oh my fucking god! Jesus fucking Christ, I accidentally misclicked cricket! I know you are waiting for me to ask you. Holy okay. shit! Is this your plan? Yep. Uh... By what name was the Wild West character James Butler Hickok known? By what name? was the Wild West character James Butler Hickok known. Wild Bill, Mad Will, 
Crazy Billy, Willie the Insane. Why was he called any of these things if his name was James? What about Crazy Jim, Mad Jim, Wild Jim, Jimmy the Insane? I mean, Wild Bill sounds like the, the best one, but why Bill? Is James Butler Hickok the real name of, like, Buffalo Bill or something? And he also went by Wild Bill. It's not going to be Willy the Insane, is it? Mad Will, Crazy Billy, Wild Bill. Wild Bill just sounds like an actual name. The others don't. I, I'm, I've just got to trust the guy. Again. I can't be using lifelines this early. Are I can't. I've, sure? I've got no clue. Is I've got no fucking clue. Answer? I've got no clue. Oh. Yes. That's okay, apparently that's correct. What? Who the fuck is that? Who is that? According to a familiar saying, pride goes before a fall. I'm certain. I think it's pride comes before a fall, isn't it? Pride goes before a fall? Which country launched an attack on Pearl Harbor in 1941? That would be Japan. Okay. Which of these is a name of a renowned British sculptor? Well, it's not Roger Moore. That's... James Bond. I'm going to try and game the system. If I go for a 50-50 here, even though I have no clue, if it's Roger Moore and somebody else, I'll know it's the answer. Let's take away two incorrect answers. Bollocks. Okay, the other three all had their surname spelled Moore. Now, if the real answer, his name was M-O-R-E then they would have found people with surnames M-O-R-E. So I think it's Henry Moore, because otherwise Roger Moore and whatever the fuck the other one is don't make sense as red herrings. I'm going to pick A. Is that your final? That'll be my final answer. Well done. We popped off. We popped off. Good test taking. We're popping off. In what field is the Booker Prize awarded each year? Fiction? The Booker Prize. The Booker Prize. He won the Booker Prize. He won the Booker Prize. The Booker Prize. Am I just getting confused because the word book is in the prize? He won the Booker Prize. I've heard of this. He won the Booker Prize. There's no way I would have heard of it if, if it was for fashion. The Booker Prize. I don't think I would have heard of it if it was pa for painting. Invention. I think it's fiction. I think it's fiction. That's the right choice. I I I know more books than other stuff. I think it's Booker. Yeah, there we go. According to a Beatles song, who keeps her face in a jar by the door? Who keeps her face in a jar by the door? Eleanor Rigby. It's got to be Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. D seems pretty good. I'm going to say D. Oh, I'm so sorry. Well, no big deal. It's a game after all. Congratulations. You are leaving here with your safety net, and I'm glad it paid off. If Zen wasn't supposed to blank, oh God! Quanta level gameplay. No way! Fuck's sake! You literally hummed it? Yeah, I don't know the words. Was defeated by his two greatest enemies, British history and women. <laughs> 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 thank you for the 100 bits, Sarkin. Anonymous Gifter, thank you for the gifted sub to female. God, the word female 
You know, you know, I was watching a video recently. I was watching a video recently of, um, it's, it's actually an incredible video. It's asking landlords why there's a housing crisis right now. A YouTube channel called Politics Joe interviewing landlords just coming out of a landlord conference about why there's a housing crisis and their answers are so unbelievably oblivious. It's crazy. And one of them said, a woman in her probably 50s said, you know, a lot of landlords are females as well. And it just, ah, oh, ah, oh, even, ah, oh, skin crawling. This bloke keeps threatening to blow up the house. Yeah, they interviewed my landlord. Yeah. Can you do the American version on your last try? Uh. Yeah. A lot of moderators are females as well. It's just so weird to say they're females. A lot of women are females, yeah. A truthful fact, but a weird statement. <sighs> okay. Which of these is a sport involving horses? Show jumping. I'm choosing D. Which of these is someone who assists at a baby's birth? The midwife. We're going to say A, okay? After tonight, Beth might be a part wife. Yes. We'll have to see. Hopefully I can make it up to her. Oh, that. Trust yourself and your How many community cards are dealt in Texas Hold'em? Community cards. Five. I'm going to pick A. You pick Which two letters make the abbreviation for the word ounce? O Z. I'm choosing C. I'm popping off. That is Complete this proverb. Love me. Love my... What? Complete this proverb. Love me. Love my cat. Love me. Love my dog. Love me. Love my heart. Love me. Love my work. Shit, I have no idea. I mean, the only one that makes sense to have as a proverb is work. Because love me, love my cat. I mean, that's not a, that's not a proverb. That goes on like your fucking wall with, alongside live, laugh, love. Same with love me, love my dog. It's not, it's not a proverb. That's just, it goes on a mug. Love me, love my heart is, 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 is strange. I think that's been thrown in there because there's a concept of love. Love me, love my work, I think kind of makes sense as a proverb for some reason. But I can't really understand what it would mean. If you love me, you've also got to love the work that I create, perhaps? If you profess to love me, then show appreciation for the things that I, that I do. I think that's the only one that makes sense as a proverb. Dude, if it's one of these, if, the, if it's one of these, I'm out of here. I'm fucking out of here. If it's love me, love my cat. I'm certain that it's B. Is that your final answer? That's on Etsy. That's not a proverb. That's my final answer. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct answer. What no fucking shot. Well, no big deal. Love me, love my dog. Oh my gosh, it's the That's not a proverb. I'm so sorry. Anyway, good luck to you. Ah. <sighs> There's no fucking way. There's no fucking way. How do I get onto the American version? Oh, that's a fucking... Wait, what is going on here? I don't I don't understand what's happening. How do I get onto the American version? I just quit the game. Uh, 
holy shit. I'm going to scream. Where's the American version? Formation, thank you for the gifted sub. Can I, okay, chat. If I play the American version, because I'm not American, can I please get five tries instead of one? Five tries with the American version, equivalent to one US version. Three? What, you're haggling? You're fucking haggling with me? What kind of power do you think you have? Okay, I agree, three. Three. Three, I take it, I take it, I take it. I take it. Solo, normal, everything included. Let's go. Three more tries. On top of the one that I already had, right? Which of these villains is not one of Spider-Man's enemies? Oh, shit. I'm not a Marvel head. Is Spider-Man Marvel? Yeah, Spider-Man's Marvel. Okay, Scarecrow? I think that's a Marvel villain with a bag on his head, but that might be from DC. Venom, I know, is Spider-Man's enemy. Scorpion is a villain in some kind of pop culture. I reckon it might be Vulture. I mean, it's Vulture? I think it's I'm Vulture. That it's I think it's I think it's Vulture. I have to announce to you that this is not the right answer. Sorry. I knew it. I shouldn't have even tried. Uh, oh, <laughs> Scarecrow's a Batman villain? That's what I said. Dude, I fucking said that. I fucking said that. Oh, I'm so dumb. Uh, no, I'm not going back to the UK. I'm not going back to the UK. I'm, I'm just pretending. I'm just pretending. Uh, I've got two tries left. I, I, I'm taking this one seriously, just in case I can't get the final one. But, you know, I, I'm, I, I, now I'll take it seriously. What is the last name of Han, the smuggler who teams up with Chewbacca? Han Solo. We're going to say A, okay? So far, we've got two mega, yes. like... Movie trivia. A new question for you. Hmm. From what plant is pesto primarily pri primarily made? Basil. Basil the for the Americans. The the Basil, pine nuts, olive oil. One more right answer for me. Parmesan. It's Which is the northernmost U.S. state? Well, it's got to be Alaska, doesn't it? Is it a trick question? We're going to say A, okay? Final? Well done. Okay, it wasn't a trick question. Hallelujah. Which of these was a long-running TV game show? Supermarket sweep, grocery gamble, laundromat lottery, restaurant race. Ooh, they ran around. I've seen clips of it. They ran around supermarkets with trolleys or shopping carts, if you want to be American, and put as much stuff in as they possibly could. And I think it was called Supermarket Sweep. I'm going to pick A. Yeah. Yep, it was. What is the name of Milwaukee's Major League Baseball team? I, uh, I, <laughs> chat, if I get any of these, it's done. It's done. The Milwaukee Major League Baseball team. The Milwaukee Tankards, the Milwaukee Barrels, the Milwaukee Canners, the Milwaukee Brewers. Canners sounds like one, because you put things into cans. Like, a canner doesn't have to be alcohol-related. You can can a lot of things that are just canned food. The Milwaukee Canners. 
That, it, it, it sounds feasible. I'm going to ask the audience. It's an American audience. They'll know. They'll know. Oh, bollocks. Brewers. The Milwaukee Brewers. Really? I'm going to say Really? You got there. Shit. What does panacotta mean in English? Panna cotta. Panna cotta. Panna cotta. This is not good. I mean, panna makes me think punk, which makes me think bread. But I don't know how... What is a panna cotta? What the fuck is panna cotta? It's like, um... Panna cotta. It's like, um... Panna cotta. It's, it's, it's like white, creamy, yogurty stuff, isn't it? Panna cotta? Panna, panna cotta? Panna, panna cotta. Terracotta. What does terracotta mean? Terracotta means terra, earth, cotta, cooked, terracotta, clay cooked, cooked clay, terracotta. So panna cotta is cooked cream? Chat, I have no fucking clue. I'm choosing D. Chat, I have no fucking clue. Sure? I'm lost already. Um, that's my final answer. I'm already lost. You have made your choice. But is it the right one? Oh, it was the right one, dude! Incredible, incredible reasoning. Incredible reasoning. If the obverse. Or it, if the obverse is the heads of a coin, huh? If the obverse is the heads of a coin, what is the name for the tails? The reverse? I've never heard the word obverse before, but maybe it means the side facing you rather than the side not facing you. I think that the right answer is B. I mean, it could be inverse if it's referring to the definition, but I think it's more likely referring to the spatial placement of you it. You know what my next question is, right? Is this your final answer? That'll be my final answer. The choice is made. It's time to discover it's the right answer. It's not GG. Is it GG? No, it's correct. Stop baiting me, chat. Which of these is the name for the catkins of the hazel tree? What the fuck are you talking about? What, what are you talking about? The catkins of the hazel tree? I think I've heard of the phrase lamb's tails before. I'm choosing B. I think I've heard of that. Yeah. Which of these is not one of the red colored properties in the board game Monopoly? We have different ones in the UK. I mean, I just genuinely never played US Monopoly before. Wouldn't have a fucking clue. I don't even know whether red is like, is red good? Is red the end? Is red is red halfway through? I I, I mean, there's no, 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 no. We phone a friend, phone a friend, phone a friend. My colleague, actually Peter, Peter, he's a nerd. He plays Monopoly. Hello? Yes, Peter, it's George. As expected, I need your help for a question. <laughs> awesome, I'm on television. Okay, let's go. Obnoxious American. Best. You can count on me. C is the right answer. I'm sure. 
Okay. C is the right answer. Let's fucking go. That's the right choice. All right, we got it. Final. Yeah. Which statesman popularized the term the Iron Curtain in a 1946 speech? Oh, fuck. I'm not exactly sure, sure who popularized the term. I don't really know who talked about this. A 1946 speech... I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'm I'm leaning towards the Americans because the divide between East and West Germany was more important to the way that America conducted its foreign policy than the way that UK did in the years after World War II. So it makes more sense that they would be discussing that. But at the same time, my gut says Winston Churchill. But that's probably just because I'm British as fuck. I do not know the answer. Is it, This is the second try, isn't it? This is the second try. I'm, I don't know. I'm going to go for Winston Churchill. Right I don't know. B. I really don't know. Are you absolutely sure? Is that your final answer? Don't know. You got it was Churchill. Halla fucking knew ya. On what planet was Jedi Ki Adi Mundi killed via Order 66? My Gitu, Malakor, Moraband, Ryloth. I've never even heard of these four. I've never heard of the Jedi. I've never heard of these four planets. There's no chance. There's just no chance. On what planet was Jedi Ki Adi Mundi? Kai Adi Mundi? Kai Adi Mundi? I mean, is that... Right, what happened with Order 66? Order 66 is where they kill the younglings, isn't it? Execute Order 66. Is that... Is that episode 3? Who is Ki Adi Mundi? On what planet was Jedi Kiadi Mundi killed via Order 66? No. No, there's no way that I'm going to get to the logic here. There's actually no chance I'm getting to it. We've got to swap the question out. I just don't have a clue. It's time to I don't have a clue. And change the current question. Bro doesn't even know what Order 66 is. There was the order to kill all the Jedi, wasn't it? Was my Gito, was my Gito the planet that Jar Jar Binks came from? Because that's what I was Will thinking. Be able to answer this new question as well. Who was the first U.S. vice president to temporarily assume the role of acting president? Who was the first U.S. vice president to temporarily assume the role of acting president? Don't know. Don't fucking know. Um, when JFK was killed, was that? I don't know U.S. I don't know U.S. history, so don't get up in my case here. Was it LBJ that took over from JFK? 
I don't know. I just don't know the answer to this. The first US vice president to temporarily assume the role of acting president. I've never heard of you. But that also might mean that it is you because I don't know the answer. Lyndon B. Johnson. Lyndon B. Johnson. LBJ. Leg before wicket. Leg before Johnson. I don't know. I'm I'm That's gonna sure. go. I'm gonna go for LBJ. I have no idea. Sure? I've got no idea, chat. I've got no fucking idea. Yes, that's my final answer. I just don't know. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. Oh no, you were so close. Not a oh, fucking no big clue. Deal. It's a game. Not a all. fucking clue. Congratulations, you are leaving here with your safety net, and I'm glad it paid off. Not a clue. Who uh, who took over when JFK died? LBJ just became the president, not the acting president. Oh, so my logic was correct, but I just missed the fact that George H. W. became acting president for a while. Ah, right. That wasn't. Ten I was meaning. I thought they meant temporary until the next election. George H.W. Bush was temporary because Reagan got shot in the 80s. That's fucked. That is fucked. That's, dude, that's such bullshit. I should get another try for that. That's bullshit. That's some bullshit. All right, final try. Final try. Final try, chat. Okay. Here we go. I should do my final try on the UK one, surely. Repeat question, we'd love to see that. Give me, an, give me another few of those. Give me another few of those. Proverbially, a bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. I'm choosing B. Which of these is the name of an American Olympian who won gold medals in 1984, 88, 92, and 96? Oh, shit. Oh, we are fuckoed here, I think, chat. I think we are fuckoed. We've immediately started with... <laughs> it's Richard Lewis. Which of these is the name of a <laughs> journalist who won Esports Journalist of the Year in 1984, 1988, 1992, and 1996? I think... I, I mean, I think I've just got a... Huey Lewis. Okay, Richard Lewis, name of an actor. Most, most people would know that as the name of an actor. Then... Huey Lewis, I think, is a musician? And then... I don't... I, my, my, I'm leaning towards Carl just because I don't recognize the name. Do you know what I mean? Because I just... think the others have been thrown in as red herrings, basically. But I... It's too, uh, it's too early to use a lifeline. Uh, think about it this way. If I use a lifeline now, there is no chance I'm getting to a million. So either I guess this or I've lost anyway. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to uh, guess Carl. No more hesitating. I'm going to say D. Is that your final? Yes. It's not Huey That's Lewis. It's not Richard answer. Lewis. I don't think it's going to be Jerry no, Lewis, is it? Find out the correct People were called Carl in the 80s. Let's fucking go. Right. Let's fucking go. One right answer found. Let's go for this new Which name is the rhyming slang for tea? What? What?
There's no way, bro. There's no fucking way. Why is this so difficult on my final run? How is this so tough? Is this Cockney slang? Cockney slang for tea? Oh, the first, my first, my gut instinct is Rosie Lee. Just because it rolls off the tongue a little better than the others. But I... I really don't know. I, uh, it's the only one that I think makes sense. The, the, Carrie G, that doesn't, you can't say that quickly. Annie D. It's not really how, it's, it's not really how it functions. Josie me. Annie D. Annie D could be it though. Can you get me a cup of Annie D? Can you get me a cup of Rosie Lee? Rosie Lee just sounds, Rosie Lee sounds like what it would be. Get me a cup of Rosie Lee. Just because it rolls off the tongue. Get me a cup of Carrie G. It's not going to be Carrie G. Get me a cup of Josie Me. Ah, uh, that's very... Josie Me's a weird name. Annie D. Get me a cup of Annie D. Annie D. Annie D. Sounds like anabolic steroids. Annie D. Rosie Lee. Rosie Lee. Rosie Lee. Rosie Lee. I think it's got to be Rosie Lee. I think it's got to be Rosie Lee. your final answer? That's my final Rosie answer. Lee. It just rolls off the tongue better. You have made your choice. Let's fucking go. Holy shit. Give me some easier ones, please, for the love of fucking God. Here's a new question for you. No. No. Which part of the US was once known as Russian? Oh. Russian America. Actually, America bought Alaska from the Russians. Didn't they? I might be making that up, chat. It's the only one that makes sense, though. I'm choosing it's the only one that makes sense. It's the only one that makes sense. Your final answer. Yes, that's my final answer. I think it's gotta be. The others just don't make sense. All right, let's find out the right answer together. Come on. Let's fucking go. Come on. God, get, please give me some easier ones. What is another name for a spit used in cooking? Rotisserie. A chicken on a spit is a rotisserie chicken. Yeah, it's a rotisserie. I'm gonna try C. It's a rotisserie. Okay, we got an easier one. Which of these French players did not appear on the mythical FIFA 100 list drawn up by Pelé? And there's no chance. I'm not even... Uh, uh, there's no way I could possibly guess this. I think it's... I've heard of this person. I've heard of them. I haven't heard of the others. Would an American audience even know this? I don't think so. But does that even factor in? I don't know if that's how the logic of the game works. It's now up to the audience to choose what they think is the right answer. Mm. Good luck. Come on, please. Please, Americans, please. You don't have a clue, do you? That's so spread. That is so spread. Less than a 50%, less than 50% of people going for it. Yuri Jorkev? We'll we'll go with it. I guess we'll go with it. D seems pretty good. Oh no. I'm gonna say D. If the audience fucks me on this. If the audience fucks me on this. So this is your final answer? Oh. Yes, that's my final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. Yes! Come on! Come on, you smart motherfuckers! I got a bunch of Europeans in the audience today. Bunch of French people in the audience. Jesus Christ. Which- What are these questions?! 
These are just ridiculous. Dude, Super was getting questions like, which letter follows Q? And where's Real Madrid from? What the fuck is this? Which one of these teams has Diego Maradona never coached? Has he coached any of them? I don't, I don't, how the fuck am I supposed to know? How the fuck am I supposed to know? How is this a $4,000 question? There's just no way. I've got to swap. There's absolutely no way. I guess maybe he wouldn't have coached a juniors club? That would have been my guess, I guess. Ready to face the traps of this oh. next question? Good luck to you. Oh. And the next one's a manga. In the manga Berserk, what do the apostles have to sacrifice in order to receive their powers? Come on, man. Come on, dude. Have some mercy. Uh, have some... Okay, it's not going to be their social status. It's not going to be their social status, right? Because that's not... It, how would you even sacrifice that? Like, how does that... How does that make sense? So, it's going to be... It's probably going to be... It's not going to be one of their members either. Because then every time they added a member, they'd have to get rid of a member. The, the, the math wouldn't add up. So it's either going to be their soul or what is dearest to them in the world. And I feel like for something that's interesting, um, for like, for it to even be an interesting, like, idea in the book. Oh, not in the book. Jesus Christ, in the book. In the manga. For it to be an interesting idea, it's probably what's dearest to them in the world. Because that would allow you then to go into, like, the backstories of the characters, what they care about. It would be a good plot device. So... I don't... I think that makes the most sense as a plot device. Which means, here's the thing. I don't think it's going to be one of their members, and I don't think it's going to be their social status. So I think we go for the 50-50, and we hope it isn't A and C left. Let's take a punt. Okay, let's take away two incorrect answers. I think it's A or C. In the manga Berserk, what do apostles have to sacrifice in order to receive their powers? It's not going to be one of their members. That doesn't make sense. What do the apostles have to sacrifice in order to receive their powers? One of their members. Oh, wait there. I've just thought about this. What if the apostles ha each have their own followers? And what it means is they have to sacrifice one of their followers to get their powers. I just feel like A is a much better plot device. Oh, I, I got exactly what I wanted from the 50-50, and I still don't have a clue. I, I can't use another lifeline, though. I, I've got to just take... I've, I've got to just take the gamble. I've, I've got to just take the gamble. I, I've got to just take the gamble. What is dearest to them in the world, or one of their members? Is Berserk a good manga chat? Should I read it? <sighs> I 
think it's got to be what's dearest to them. It just makes the most sense as a narrative device. I'm going to go for it. I'm going to pick A. Oh, fuck. I can't believe this all comes down to manga. My final choice comes down to manga. You know what my next question is, right? GG? The manga heads are in the chat um, saying GG. That's my final answer. Oh, no. What the fuck? You have given your final answer. Now is the time to see the right one. The weebs. Ooh! Dude, what incredible reasoning just to get that 8,000 fucking measly dollars. These, this has been the hardest run so far. It off to a good start, but you shouldn't stop there. Here is a new question. What is the nationality of Mujik Boichi Park, the artist of the manga Dr. Stone? Back-to-back -back manga? Back-to-back -back manga? Okay, but the surname Park is huge in South Korea. Mujik ba Park? I mean, Park is enormous in South Korea, isn't it? It's like Kim is the largest surname, and then Park, I think, is like the second. I've got, I've got to take a punt. I'm only on, I'm only a bloody 16,000. I've got to go for it. I have to go for it. It's B. I, I don't know, but just judging off of the person's surname, so let's go. it's got to be South Korean. Final answer. Doesn't it? Oh, yes. That's my. Am I getting answer. baited? Oh, it's Kim, then Lee, then Park. The okay. I missed the Lee. Yeah. The right Surely this is correct, though. Yes, okay. All right, we used, uh, we used some knowledge. Oh, um... What the fuck is wrong with the American version of this game? It's giving me pop culture... At one after another after another after another. All in, all I've done is do fucking Jedi's and do fucking who who are you? Which of these Jedi has the first one to be killed on screen by Palpatine? I don't know. I don't fucking know. Okay, I know that Mace Windu has a purple Mace Windu was played by um by By... By... Mace Windu was played by... It's not just women, chat. It's not just women. What's his name? What's his name? I don't know. I, uh, anyway, anyway, the point being, the point being, purple lightsaber, I think he, like, falls out a window or forces Palpatine out a window. I can't remember. Something like that. Anyway, it's not Mace Windu. There's no way it's Mace Windu. So it's one of the other three. Okay. Kit Fisto. I think I know the name of. So it's going to be, if it's a Jedi... Who's the first one to be killed on screen? It's going to be a minor character. I think I know the name Kit Fisto for some reason. Don't know why. So I think it's probably going to be Sacy Teen and Agen Cola between them. Unfortunately, I've already used up my 50 50. So I kind of fucked it. And I've only got one lifeline left. And I've got no clue what the correct answer is. I think it's a 50-50, though, between B or C. I'm, like, 100% sure it's not Mace Windu, because I remember that fight scene from episode 3. I'm, like... 10% sure <laughs> that it's not Kit Fisto, because I remember the name for some reason. I don't know why, but I wouldn't remember the name of a character that gets killed immediately. 
So it's between these two. Mm. I don't think there's any logic I can use here. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to go with Aegon Cola. No, I'm not. I'm going to go with Ceci Ting. I'm going to... I don't fucking care. The go it's, go it's over. Right Chat, it's over. Is B. Chat, it's fucking over. You know what my next question is, right? Is this your final answer? Chat, it's fucking over. Final answer. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. It's not Mace Windu, I know that. Oh, Fuck. Well, I thought deal. it was between the it's two game, of them. Oh, that was the wrong answer. Oh, fuck. Is, you are walking out of here with your guaranteed cash prize. <sighs> I lost the 50-50, bro. I thought it was Mace Windu. Samuel L. Jackson! Samuel L. Jackson, I can't remember his name. I'm gonna be honest, dude, you kinda suck. No, I don't. No, I fucking don't. No, I don't. Go to bed, apologize to Beth, tell her she didn't have to apologize. I will do all of those things, but I'm not gonna talk to her when I go to bed because I'll wake her up. She sleeps when I go to bed. Chat, I'm actually not going to bed until I get a million. I'm not I'm not going to bed until I get a million. I'm going I'm going back to the United Kingdom though, because the United States ones fucking suck. I lost the challenge. I'm carrying on anyway. I'm gonna get some food, I'm gonna top up on water, and I'm getting a million pounds. I'm I'm getting there. It I'm getting Sam there. Wasn't supposed to play. Liz is calling. Pick up. Footsteps. I am seated. Holdy, honey. Thank you for the sixty months. Buddy. Hello. Buddy. I heard you didn't do it. I failed. You failed. I failed and. Name I have to, 100 other women. I have to name 100 other women tomorrow. No, you don't. I'll do. I'm going to do it. It's, is it like 4 a.m. for you? Yeah. Do you think I can't name 100 other women? I can. I No, you can. Absolutely, you can. Don't worry. I can. It might be a 12-hour stream, but I can. <laughs> but you, listen. Who wants to be a millionaire is built for people to fail, right? Otherwise, everyone be millionaires. I'm gonna Is be it a, a little a funny that um, you got the women questions wrong? Yes. But we laugh about it, Josh. We laugh about it. Ha ha hee hee. So funny. I'm laughing. I, I got lots of women questions correct. Lots of them. Like what? Agatha Christie. <laughs> Okay. There we I, go. I knew who Agatha Christie was. You did, and that's what's important. And you got the, I believe, the Marie Shelley question correct, no? Yep. Yes, I it's... did. Mm-hmm. 
I'm not going to bed until I get a million. Are you fucking kidding me, Josh? I'm I'm dead dead serious. Josh, I'm no. dead serious. Can I take manga out of there? No, I'm gonna do it actually with manga in. I don't give a fuck. Oh my god, Josh. I'm doing this. I'm okay. getting a million. I I think in the future you will. Not at 4 a.m. when you've already failed at many things. I'm gonna keep it 100% with you. You've done a lot today. You haven't done them well. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> and so I think now it's the time I'm we pack it up. We think about it. And we move on. <laughs> <laughs> Second question is... I'm certain that it's <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, Josh. What was even the right answer? <laughs> what was the what was the right answer? Listen. Another failure we're adding to the list, right? And I mean, no shade. I'm just telling you how it is. Listen. You know what tomorrow is? A brand new day. Yeah. And you can do so many cool things on a brand new... My mom always told me, Mama Marquini, nothing goes well at 4 a.m. Are you going to tell my mom that she's wrong? A woman? Do you going to tell the woman that she's wrong? No. She's very correct. Thank you. She's right. And I listen to women. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Panda so JJK, thank you for the prime. It means that this is going to be harder than usual. Oh, my God. D seems pretty good. <laughs> I'm going to say D. Bro. Is that I... <laughs> oh, my God. All right, do you we... ever think about how you're, like, you're keeping 1,300 people hostage? They're not hostage. They can leave whenever they want. They can leave whenever they want. They're not addicted you know to this. Not do that. In the nursery rhyme, what was Wee Willy Winky dressed in as he ran through the town? The only thing that rhymes with town is nightgown. It's a, it's a nursery rhyme. It's got a rhyme. In which of these games would you strike a puck? Ice hockey. What is Jialai? In what year did the events take place in the manga Legend of the Galactic Heroes? <laughs> Why are these fucking manga <laughs> questions in here, bro? Why are these manga questions in here? Why are these manga questions in here? <laughs> um, listen. I mean, it's not 1586. As... How do you know that? Because th they're not exploring the galaxy in the past. It's got to be the you future. Don't know that. Mm. You don't know that. Wait a second, and it can't be 3596 because the others all have 86 in order to bait you. Therefore, it's between 2586 and 4586. I... And the answer is that people are more likely to keep it within the same millennium in order to make it feel more relatable. It's 2586. I'm B. I know you are waiting for me to end. No fucking way! That doesn't make any sense! Who sets these questions? Who sets these fucking questions? Really? We had to play the card of caution. Come on. Oh, no, I'm sorry. For Listen, you. you've been streaming for nine hours and 34 minutes, as the kids say. Those are rookie numbers. Those are rookie numbers, you're Th saying? Those are rookie numbers. We're going to need to pump those up. Oh, my God. Those are rookie numbers. At this point, it's a subathon. Guys, don't forget to use your primes if you have them. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what about I, your wife? My wife will sleep better without me in the bed. I cannot believe you do this to a fellow Elizabeth. That's crazy. I'm assuming her name's Elizabeth. Uh, no, it's Everybody not actually. Said. It's Bethany. Oh, oh. Mm. pretty. That's cool. Spandex, thank you for the prime. Um, but Bethany, Beth, if you will. Mm-hmm. 
would she what i need you to like okay listen i'm not married i'm single as we know maybe he has reminded me over and over again i don't know what married life is like i just cannot imagine this conversation at the dinner table honey i'm assuming why would you why did you stay up so late i was trying to win who wants to be a millionaire on steam is your response um yeah 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 that's gonna be my response okay um we're also we're moving in the next week oh my god josh you need to get rest and like we have to have everything packed in like a week so i need to hit partner plus before the end of the week oh my god so we're so we're going the whole we're going all the way oh my god all right poots xd thank you for the two months of prime hot take hot take if you're still playing this shit you should let me 1v1 you in elden ring for vip the artist role doesn't let me talk anymore only mode and i desire nothing more than to yap freely I'm not going to launch Elden I mean, Ring. Real. You play Elden Ring? Yeah, but I'm not going to launch Elden Ring. I'm in the middle of I'm in the I'm in the middle of something incredibly important. No, you're not. You're in the middle of trying to do something incredibly important and it's not going to work. <laughs> they would have given him That's an important distinction actually, yeah. Mhm. Mm Sonic, thank you for the 3 months. That's what you keep me around for. <laughs> it's just <laughs> making give sure Wolf you understand VIP? where right. you are right now. We'll give Wolf And it's VIP. not winning. He wants to be millionaire is not a question directed towards you. Okay? Uh, what sort of animal is Lagoshi, the main protagonist of the Beastars manga? It's the first question for $100. Mm -hmm. I've got no idea. It's going to be a bear or a wolf, isn't it? If it's a main protagonist. I'm going to say it's a wolf because it's edgy. No more hesitating. I'm gonna say. D. Are there two wolves inside of you, Josh? You seem to be convinced. Uh, there's not even one. <laughs> It's a wolf. It's a wolf. There we go. Uh, ah, woo. Jordan is a country say. found in what region? The Middle North, the Middle South, the Middle West, or the Middle East? Hmm. I'm gonna try C. Hmm. Oh, I thought you didn't know that. They're actually saying. Hmm. <laughs> I'm going to pick A. Turtle facts. I go crazy for turtle facts. <laughs> How did Carl want to fly his house to Paradise Falls in Up? How did Carl want to Gita fly his Gita. house to Paradise Falls? With balloons, yes. See, that's the right choice. That is, it's time to move on. To Poots, thank time. you very much for the two months. Got another for you? Oh, thank you very much, Poots. Wait, you have two Twitch accounts and both have Prime? <laughs> what, what have you got? That's, that's rigged. What the fuck is that? Who created the Sorcerer's Stone? Oh, fucking Harry Potter. Created? Is it? I, I didn't think that Listen. anyone created it. I thought they had it. Yeah, I, I read it when I was a kid. Okay. And obviously, Fine fuck JK Rowling, but I genuinely did not. Who is that? Nicholas Flamel. He was the, he's the really old guy. And then they're like, oh, we're going to have to get rid of the stone. And then they're like, isn't the old guy going to die? And they're like, yeah. Oh, they're like, yeah, sacrifice yeah. force <laughs> Who created Spawn? What the fuck is Spawn? Is this manga again? No. It is. Because Stan Lee is Marvel. Alan Moore is like the comics, Watchmen no? and stuff. Yeah, it's like comics. Yeah, comics, manga. What's the difference between manga and comics? Aren't they the same thing? The manga is a specific type of Japanese comic. Yeah, so it's still, it's still in the genre manga. <laughs> yeah, it's like American manga. I don't know. I don't. I don't read comics or manga. Ha mm. ha he he. I don't know who Spawn is. This this isn't gonna this isn't gonna fly. I'm gonna need to ask the audience. Oh my god, a thousand dollars. Todd McFarlane. <laughs> yeah. For which football club did Dennis Law play his last league match? Don't know who Dennis Law is. Don't know who Dennis Law is. Oh my god! Look at yourselves! Sure you KD Reeve! Okay. 
Let's go. Thank you for the 50 gifted yes. subs. That's crazy. Wait, thank you very much. That's that's very kind of you. Fuckers. Um, I don't know what I've done to deserve that. I don't think I do deserve that. But thank you very Fuckers. much for the gifted. That's very kind of you. Shake their hand. Fuckers. Thank you. Thank you. That's very kind. Yeah, gifteds don't count for partner plus, unfortunately. But I, I mean, they still, they still give money for me. That's that's extremely kind. Thank you, No Man's Wolf. Thank you for the nineteen months as well. Hope moving goes well. Now, yap 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 yap. Go yappa 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 yappa. No Man's Wolf. All right. Which football club did Dennis Law play his last league match? Now, I don't want to be sexist here, but I feel like Peter is statistically more likely to know that than the other three. But maybe that's me being sexist. <laughs> <laughs> no, why, why is that, Josh? Because if you look at the demographics of people who are interested in football, there's a larger male demographic. Fuckers. And with no other data to go on other than their names, I must make the assumption that that's Fuckers. going to be factored in. <laughs> you're never beating the allegations man i don't know i don't you're yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah uh, right done. okay okay i'm going <laughs> for jennifer i'm going for jennifer my colleague who's a diehard football fan <laughs> hello this is who wants to be a millionaire and an ally well i hope i'm up to the task but we'll get through it. She's American. She's American. <laughs> oh, she knows. She knows. She's a Manchester City fan. Wait a second. She's a Manchester City fan. Fuck. Dude, women are so smart. I'm so fucking stupid and dumb and every woman is so smart. I, uh, why do I even... Just close your mouth. Close your fucking mouth. Who plays Valkyrie in the movies? What movies? <laughs> the movies. Who plays Valkyrie in the movies? Huh? I don't know any of these people either. No, not because they're women, chat. Because I don't know fucking actors or pop culture or, or comics or, or anything. Uh, who plays Valkyrie? Wait a second, wait a second. Valkyrie. Isn't Valkyrie the name of... Um, Gal Gadot's character. No, that's Wonder Woman. That's Wonder Woman, yeah. Fuckers. Is it related? I'm gonna. I'm gonna change the question. Fuckers. I don't know. Let's flip the question right now. Tessa Thompson is my child's guess. Bring you luck. Oh. Tessa Thompson. I don't know. I don't know. In the movies. Is there a Valkyrie movie series that we just don't know about? In what year did Arthur Guinness open his Dublin brewery? Fuckers. She's in Thor. And their idea was just to call it the movies? Bruh. Fuckers. Guinness. Oh, it's, it's so nice. It's so gross. As someone who's a good chunk Irish, I disappoint my Irish Catholic mother every day by saying that. Uh, you you tell her every day you don't like Guinness? No, no, no. But whenever <laughs> she's always just like, "Why?" Guinness. And I'm like, "Sorry." It's, you know, yeah, it's it's, I don't like Guinness. it's got like a harp on it as the logo for some reason. It's associated yes. with toucans. It probably has the year written on the can or the glass or something. Yes. I think it's either going to be 17 or 1859. I'm thinking more 1859. Try C. So this is your final answer? When was the That'll famine? That'll be my final answer. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. Aww. 
I'm getting the most difficult the questions. On my part. I'm yes. getting some ridiculous questions yeah, out here. Imagine what would happen tomorrow when you got some rest. No Man's Wolf, thank you for the resub. And LeBron's James, thank you for the new tier one sub. I appreciate the 50 gifters again, Katie. Thank you all for all the gifters today. That's extremely generous of you. No, I'm, ju I'm just gonna... Okay, I'm gonna stop pretending and I'm gonna win. You've been pretending. Yeah, I've been pretending this whole time. I've actually been pretending. I've been pretending. Wow. I know lots of I know lots of women. I could have done it super quickly. And also, I could have been a millionaire if I wanted to. Name um, 10 women right now. Go. 10 women? Um, Go. My mum, my auntie, no. uh, my sister, my other sister. No, 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 Oprah, um, Good evening, everyone, and fucking to the audience, uh, Gal Gadot, um, luck. Agatha Christie, um, 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 you know the money um, steps. uh, Ons uh, Jabor, um, uh, who else did I not name from previous ones? Um, uh, uh, Fucking Christ, four more, four more women. We can do it, we can do it, we can fucking do it. Theresa May, um, um, we, we, Michelle Obama, um, uh, fuck, um, Jesus Christ, uh, fucking Ruth Bader Ginsburg and, uh, Rita Ora. Holy shit, I popped off, I popped off. I popped off. There we go. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Which of these is not a triangle? A pentagon. That, I mean, if you get that one wrong, you're, you're, you're in the doghouse for a while, aren't you? I learned recently the way the pentagon is built, you can reach um, certain sections of the building in only uh, like a certain matter of seconds. Is that cool? The way it's built? What? Yeah, but like the way that the building is built, you can walk from one section to another. Hope in a well. allotted no. amount of time because we wanted it to be quick. So. But I'm American. I'm talking about the defense. The yeah, defense yeah, yeah. But 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 any building is built so that you can get from one place to another in a fixed amount of time. That's how. That's but, how time works. It doesn't tend to vary <laughs> unless there's no, it's traffic. Like it's, it's it's the way it's built, like the actual Pentagon. It's a certain amount of time that you can reach from like point A to point B and it won't take super long. You've scrambled my brain and it was already on its last cell. I had one synapse left. You, okay, 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 let me put it this way. You know how Crocs have like normal mode and sport mode? The Pentagon is in sport mode. Does it have like those floors on airports where it speeds you towards places? Is that what you mean? No, it's, I think it's all. I think it's just walkable. Um, building. Well, then it's just a small building. How no, do not. you build a pentagon? It's the shape of the pentagon. Is it's possible? See, it's possible off between any two points in the pentagon. Sorry, not uh, seconds, minutes in less than ten minutes. Well, that just means that it's a building that is that size. Wouldn't that just apply for every building that size? If it was like a. It's no. It's so a, big. Well, then, if it's that big, how can you walk from one side to the other in 10 minutes? Because it's designed that way. The Pentagon is designed in a way. <laughs> the shape of the Pentagon, the way they figure it out. <laughs> let me, let me, <laughs> let me, let me go through something here. We've got a Pentagon. We've got a fucking Pentagon shape, okay? We've got ourselves a Pentagon, yeah? Yeah? <laughs> if yeah. I want to get from here to here... You're telling me max 10 minutes. Let's assume that's the furthest distance in a Pentagon. It's not, but let's assume it is. You're yeah. telling me I build another building that's the same size, but it's a circle. It'll take me longer because I built it wrong to go for the, the same distance. What I, do you mean? I mean, that's what the Pentagon is built for. <laughs> but if this length takes, I mean, time is proportional to distance and speed speed is distance over time so 
if the time is 10 minutes, then, then time is distance over speed. So it should just be, the, it's just related to, if I'm going the same speed, it's just related to the distance. If it's the same distance, it's the same speed, isn't it? We can't see your epic pen. Oh, I'm drawing fucking crazy drawings out here. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. If I I mean if I draw if I've got a circle, it's just if this distance if this distance x shouldn't have made it x when I've already drawn x's everywhere. Let's make the distance y. If that if these distances are the same, how is it going to take me more time in any other building? <gasps> because there's things in the way in other buildings, like walls! I forgot about the walls! You're telling me they've built passageways that optimize for speed inside the Pentagon? Yeah. Yeah. I was thinking about an empty building! <laughs> they optimize the interior design for speed. I understand now. I was thinking an empty pentagon shape. I was like, well, there's nothing in the way. We can walk, you know. Well, <laughs> that's fine. Well, technically, the, there's an open courtyard in the pentagon as well. So you could go through the, uh, the courtyard as well. Right. But... Right. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Flash belongs to which team of superheroes? I know this one is the Justice League. What is Jeff Winger's original job in the series Community? I've never seen Community. I don't know who Jeff Winger is in Community. 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 Probably ask the audience. It's A. It's Lawyer. How did Carl want to fly to it? balloons i've already seen that one i've already seen that one we're getting repeat <laughs> questions in theory this is a fixed game if i play it long enough we're, what is the name of the continuation of the 2016 series the young pope the it last the pope show. the new pope the best pope young pope forever it's not gonna be young <laughs> pope forever that's crazy it's not gonna be the last pope because there's always more popes it's got to be the new it's pope. A really good show because the the you young watch it, watch it. the young pope is like young pope learning from older pope, so they probably became like the, the it right be, probably became the new pope. Are you, are you yeah. Show? Okay. That that just makes sense. What anime has as its ending theme the song "Heroes" by Brian the Sun? <sighs> you look so tired. I mean, if it. If it's got hero in the title, it's a good punt. Pretty good. I'm gonna say D. That's what okay, okay, the logic prevails. Which of these <laughs> is a town in North Yorkshire? That's literally where I live. If it isn't Skipton, I'm gonna skip to bed. Okay, it was Skipton. Reebok and Springbok are v different species of which anima? Animal? Antel... A Springbok... Antelope, Springbok, Reebok, Springbok. Spring. Wait a second. Why would it be antelope though? If you're designing a sports brand, Reebok, Reebok has stripes. It has three stripes as the logo. So does that mean it's the zebra? A Reebok zebra, a Springbok zebra. Also, if you were designing sportswear, you would want it to be based on an animal that was fast. And what's the fastest animal that walks on legs? That isn't the peregrine falcon who also flies, that also has legs. But I mean specifically is a mammal that runs. That's right, the cheetah. It's not monkey. I know it's not monkey. Reebok. I think it's an antelope. I think a springbok is a type of antelope. No more hesitating. I'm gonna say D. Is that yeah, it was Antelope. There we go. go In what season it. of American Horror Story does Shelby and Matt Miller host the show My Ronicky? What are you talking about? I have no Roanoke. idea what you. Roanoke. I have no idea what you're talking about. Let's call your friend. Roanoke have, is uh, was the. Uh, Jennifer will know. 
technically the first colony of the United States, but it failed. Yeah, and it's been the biggest mystery of where, where did they it? go? Because oh. they all disappeared. Who wants to be a millionaire? Oh. And we need your help. Well, I hope I'm up to the task. Goblin God, you do not like well, me, homie. I'm just trying to. I'm sure. just here. Let's Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to be, but it's not a sure thing. You know? They want me to fail. That's why they don't want. Wait, what did they say? <gasps> I didn't listen. I, I, I didn't listen. I don't know what they said. Oh, shit. They said B. They said B. Oh, that's why there's a big B on the screen. Ah. I yeah, that makes sense. It's B. That makes sense. What a pity. This is the wrong answer. Are you fucking kidding me? I even tried. It was an incredible run. Great game. What? The one time I listened? Trade offer. I bet ten gifted subs. I bet ten gifted subs. You have three tries to answer five manga only questions. If you lose, you go to bed. Ten gifted subs versus me going to bed. Can I answer five manga questions in a row? So you're saying I untick everything apart from manga. Oh my god. And I just have to get five in a row correct. I think that's super easy. I think this is a guaranteed 10 gifted because they're going to start easy. Okay. And you're going to go to bed, right? No, 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 no. When I win, I'm going to get 10 gifted and, and win. If I lose, if I lose in three tries, then I go to bed. Okay. Come on, George. What is the competitive Focus. game at the center of the Hikaru no Go anime? Manga series. Hikaru? Like Hikaru Nakamura? <laughs> Surely it's not based on Hikaru Nakamura. What is the competitive game at the center of the Hikaru no Go? Manga series. Now it literally has Go in the title. Am I allowed to use lifelines? Am I allowed to use lifelines? Chat? Uh, and specifically, not chat, formation. No lifelines, no you life cheesy lines, prick. You cheesy prick. <laughs> Well, it's either Hikaru Nakamura or Go, because it literally says Go. And I, I think I'm overthinking I'm it. I think I, I'm just going to go Go, because it says Go. Okay, we popped off. There we go. What competition? No <laughs> oh. What competition is spotlighted in the manga Initial D? What competition is spotlighted you get one lifeline. in the manga... Liz is your lifeline phone a friend. I have one lifeline. And it's me? <laughs> yeah, it's you. Um Hmm. What competition is spotlighted in the manga Initial D? What would initial D even mean? Initial D I pulled out of that one. I didn't I didn't commit to that one. I pulled out of it. Um Initial D. What competition? It's not going to be chariot racing. That's madness. <laughs> Is it going to be bike racing? It's probably going to be car racing because it's the sexiest. I'm going to go with car racing. It's just more, you know, it's more... It gets the juices flowing more. That's my final answer. It was I've been watching a lot of F1 lately. We popped off. With what oh. weapon does the main character of Kenshin the Vagabond fight? A wooden stick. A reverse blade sword. What does that even mean? Seis with non sharpened ends. I don't know what Seis means. Plastic nunchucks. Kenshin the Vagabond. If he's a vagabond, then he probably doesn't have something... Um... Fancy, like a sword. Kenshin the Vagabond. I mean, a wooden stick would make sense, right? Something simple, 
plain, understated, vagabondy? Hmm. I'm not sure about this one, chat. I'm not sure about this one. Kenshin the Vagabond. Um, Kenshin, Kenshin. What is a Seis? 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 I believe it's a type of sword. I think. I mean, I doubt it's a sword, though, because it says non Oh, it's like a... It's going to be like a trident or a spear or something. Yeah. Yeah, it's like with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I don't know Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I think... I think it's probably going to be a wooden stick here. Is it worth... A go could it be plastic nunchucks? It could if it was just supposed to be funny. I'm going to go with wooden stick, though. I think it makes the most sense. I think it makes the most sense to create a character with, that would fight with a wooden stick. It was a reverse blade sword. What does that mean? What does a reverse blade sword mean? I just ignored that completely. The, the blade, the blade it, instead of hold, out, it's in, I believe. You're leaving with nothing at all. What? Thanks for coming. So the lethal part today. of the weapon is not facing the enemy. So... Huh? So So when you know when you hold a sword, the blade, the sharp part is facing your so enemy. So here's a sword. <laughs> There's a sword. <laughs> so you're telling me a reverse blade sword is this. No. Not and the blade. this is where your hands go. No. The blade. Because the blade is on one side. Versus. Like a, like a katana. It's a pen, no? So the blade would be on the other side. The blade would be on the other side. Because you know how katanas are curved? Yes. Yeah. Oh. So curved sword. Like this. Right? Let's let's yeah. just draw the sword like that. But this part is the sharp part. Mm-hmm. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that's a pirate sword? Yeah, that's a cutlass. <laughs> you are learning a lot today. I will give that to you. I'm I'm how much of it is gonna stay in? I could name another ten women pretty quickly, so you know. <laughs> Right, attempt number two. Attempt number two. George, come on. We've been failing so much tonight, George. You've had more chances than anyone deserves at getting a million. And you fucked it, George. You fucked it every time. A wolf. A wolf. A wolf. I got a freebie at the beginning. I got a fucking freebie at the beginning. In the manga One Piece. Wait a second. I know stuff about One Piece because of memes. In the manga One Piece, what is... This famous, uncoveted One Piece supposed to be. I don't know. I don't know. I kind of, I think it's something to do with like pirates though, isn't it? So it's probably a treasure. Okay. One Piece is probably a treasure. D seems pretty good. I'm going to say D. Yes, let's fucking go. Two for free. Two for free. Only three more. I only need three more. What is the name of the prequel to Osama Tezuka's manga Black Jack? Before Black Jack, Young Black Jack, Black Jack Zero, Past Jack. Mmm, that's a problem. That's a problem. Because I don't even see how you would logic this at all. What's the name of the prequel? I don't think it's going to be before Black Jack. Blackjack Zero? That sounds more like an anime manga title. Past Jack is... I don't know. Um, I'm going to use my lifeline. Liz? Uh-huh? Do you know what the answer is? Um, no. Fuck. But... No, okay, but... Let, okay. Fuck. Let's... Let's work on this. Let's work on this. Yep. Because. Any inclination? I'm leaning. Um. Just from a writer's perspective, past Jack, 
I don't like that title, so I'm Xing that one. Out. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Pass Jack is a bit too twee almost. Um, I, I'm thinking Blackjack Zero. That's per, but I don't want to listen. I don't want to influence you. Me? Oh, am I the answer? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You're I my mean, lifeline. Oh my god. B b uh. What is the I... name of the prequel to Osama Tezuka's manga, Blackjack? Oh, wait. Maybe Blackjack is not Jack. Like, a person called Jack. Maybe it's... Maybe it's the game Blackjack. No. Why not? No, because every, because er, every, mostly everything here besides C, which is linked to actually make me cross out C, is talking about temporal Things, right, right. Black yeah. Black Jack, Black Jack. So, actually, yeah, I'm gonna cut out Z, C. I don't like C. You don't like C? No. Oh, because right. All because three, it's... three of these has written uh, Yes, yeah, yeah. I see what you mean. These are like the these are the the three that they're trying to bait you into. Well, then, if it's between yeah. these, I think it's got to be Young Black Jack. Because I think before Black Jack, that just doesn't it doesn't roll. If you're between A and B, I'm gonna go for B. Go for it. I think that the right answer is B. I, I kind of think Blackjack Zero pops though as a name. It does. It does kind of go off. No. Your final answer. If they need another prequel. That'll be my final answer. You have given your final answer. Now is the time to see the right one. Let's fucking go, Liz. Let's fucking go. <laughs> one more <laughs> for me. <laughs> this is a genius. Okay, I've used my lifeline for this run. What is the name of the movie adaptation of a manga oh my God. <laughs> by Yukito, Yu, Yukito Kishiro? Yeah. Oh, Christ. Oh, um... Movie adaptation of a manga by Yukito Kishiro. Well, I've heard of the first two. I haven't heard of the second two. Um... Do I think re okay, Ready Player One? Can that even be a manga? Would they have the? They wouldn't have the rights to use like all of the characters and stuff. So I don't really understand how that could be an, a manga. I'm feeling like I'm leaning immediately to Elite Battle Angel, even though I know nothing about it, like absolutely nothing about it. Um, Ready Player One was. Oh no, I'm not a lifeline. Bye. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. You're not the lifeline. You're not the lifeline. <laughs> um. Because my problem is, if you if you had a manga of Ready Player One, I just don't see how... I don't see how they could have incorporated the characters that they used, although the characters might have only been there for the movie, because I, obviously I didn't read the manga. So I don't know whether they... I don't know whether they did. I just think I've only ever heard of Ready Player One and Alita Battle Angel. So I'm go I've got to go with one of them. I can't go with the faculty or Sin City. I've, I've not got a fucking clue what those are. And I just don't think that they would have the rights for Ready Player One. So I, I, I mean, I've logic my way into Elita. I don't know anything about it except that they had big eyes. Is that your final answer? Um, which That's honestly, that does kind of fit the manga style, right, I suppose. Let's find out the right answer together. Let's fucking go. Wait, Sin City is great? I've never heard of it. How many have we... How many so far? How many so far? You get four, no? Is this the final one? Is this the last question that I need in order for my ten gifteds? Oh Alita Battle God. Angel was actually a good manga? Oh. You've never heard of Sin City, no? We've heard of Sin City, though. <laughs> I have. Way by the fucking bundle. <laughs> ah. Ah. Okay. Ramor. <laughs> in Pluto, which I've never heard of, what is the name of the first victim in the case assigned to Detective Gashis? Gashis. Okay. Well, Mont Blanc is an is is a thing. If you were going to make a reference to like something else that already exists within the zeitgeist, it would be Mont Blanc because that's the name of a mountain. I mean, I guess it could be subverting that by calling it something else, like Mont Jean or Mont Rouge or Mont Ver, 
Mon Vert. But, but, but I think it's got to be Mont Blanc. I mean, just, yeah, I mean, it's just, why would it be any of the other ones? I guess it could be Mont Rouge in the sense of, like, red as in blood? If it's a victim? But I, th I think I've just got to go with Mont Blanc. Uh, no more hesitating. I'm going to say D. It's just, just the most obvious one. Sure. Is that your final answer? Oh, yes, that's my final answer. The gotta be right, right? It's gotta be right. You've Let's fucking go. Did it? They said yes. it wasn't possible. <laughs> they said I couldn't get five. I didn't even need my third try. I didn't even need it. I'm a fucking genius. You a hard time? I'm a fucking yeah. genius. Who's the main character of the manga Black Butler? Um... This one's got the coolest name, so it's probably this I'm one. Certain that it's Why are you still going? You want to the game? It's Fuck. Game, it's the game. This is not the <laughs> oh no, you got it wrong. Uh, yeah, but that's, but no, I don't go to bed. I don't go to bed. All. Formation lost. I got five. Here with your safety net, and I'm glad it that was the fifth one, actually? No. No, it wasn't. No. 100, 200, 300. Oh my god, wait, was that really? Did we? Did we? Did I fuck it up? No, those. We don't. No way. No way. No <laughs> fucking way. One hundred, two hundred, three hundred, five hundred, a thousand. Yeah, and I went home with a thousand, so I won. Yeah. Yeah, we got five. Why are you being mean to Josh? Don't be mean. It's five a.m. and he's stressed. Don't yeah. do that. Oh, it's five a.m. It's five a.m. Josh, you need to go to bed. I need to get a million. Oh my God, Josh! No, you don't. I need to get a million. No, you don't, Josh. I, I've got what to the get fuck a million. Are you talking about? I've got to get a million. No, I've, Josh. No, you don't. I've got to prove no, I'm better than stop, Super. Stop I've got to get a million. Me. I've got to listen, get a million. Listen. There are people who like. I watched a TikTok today that someone saw the flag of the Philippines and thought it was the Italian flag. We. This world is gone. We're done. There's no saving us. We don't need to prove how smart we are. How? Why okay? the Italian flag? I mean, I'd get it if it was know. more like the Texan flag or something, but Italian. I don't know. Formation, thank you for the five gifted subs. Was it supposed to be 10? It was supposed to be 10, but you know what, I'll take five. Okay. I will, you said 10. Six your deal. Oh. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'm gonna speed run this. Okay. Touchdown, oh football. Going to say a. Okay. Also, that should be American football, because okay. this is the UK version. A comfortable life is often described okay. as a bed of better roses, I would assume. C. Sure? Formation, thank you for the other five gifteds as well. There we go. Thank you very much for not reneging on the deal. I've been scammed? You haven't been scammed. I owned it. Which position goes around the other team's defense on the sides? A winger? Ooh, it could be a sweeper. Wait there. Which position goes around the other team's defense on the sides? Oh, shit. It's gotta be a winger. I think that the right it's gotta be a winger. Is B. It's gotta be a winger. It's a winger. Which of these might you be proverbially forced to eat after being humiliated? Humble pie. That's the right choice. Humble pie. Well Come on, what is the maximum number of players focus. in a standard game of Scrabble? Four? Yeah. Chubby Checker is best remembered for which dance? Chubby Checker? Chubby Checker is best remembered for which dance? Chubby Checker? Okay, the locomotion was... I mean, there was a song, The Locomotion. That wasn't somebody called Chubby Checker, was it? I don't think it's the salsa. That's not going to be associated with Chubby Checker, is it? The twist? The twist? Possible. Possible. The conga, though. Somebody called Chubby Checker sounds like they would have been inventing a simple dance like the conga. Josh, before you answer this question, yeah. a couple things. Yeah. 
you know how how you've gotten pretty much almost every single question about women wrong yeah no oh, no wait them. sorry no i'm i mean no that's i'm gonna how did i just agree I don't, I don't with the assumption <laughs> i agreed with <laughs> the premise i agreed with the premise. A, a lot of them though a lot of them okay right some of them there will be more questions about women i know get them right be, mm, history shows us that might not be true was chubby checker odd... a woman no <laughs> but <laughs> what i'm saying is you're probably not gonna become a millionaire this early morning because there will be questions about women i can answer That's questions about women liz <laughs> give me a question about a woman i'll answer it um any question about a woman any question about any question women, about any woman i'll answer it any question about any woman how old am i <laughs> i've played myself uh <laughs> uh Oh fuck. <laughs> twenty three. Um no, I'm twenty five. <laughs> fuck <laughs> Oh fuck. I played myself. <laughs> you Chubby checker. Okay, wait there. Chubby checker is the clue in the name because in the conga you grab people by the waist. So, is the idea that it was like a character? It wasn't even a a real person. It was a character who was checking somebody's stomach, grabbing them around the waist, and doing a dance. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. I've got the logic. I've got the fucking logic, chat. And unfortunately, this is the wrong answer. It's the end for you. Well, no big deal. It's a game after all. I thought my logic was sound. <laughs> no, Josh, stop. No. No, no. I'm, I told you I'm not stopping until I, I'm not stopping Have until. It, has it occurred to you you're not listening to me, a woman? I am listening to you. I'm listening. <laughs> I'm just not obeying you, but I'm listening to you. I can repeat what you've said. Okay. You said... <laughs> you said, has it occurred to you that you're not listening to me, a woman? Yes, that is. Yes, that is. See, I'm active listening. <laughs> but Josh, are you actively listening? Or, which is, requires participation and, you know, activation in a conversation? Or are you just receiving information and processing it? Um, How are you participating in my words? Are you just listening to me? One that's in, an one interesting ear out definition other? of active listening. Let's discuss that further. Oh my god! <laughs> no, it's yes. <laughs> <Dude>. <laughs> me, an active listener. <laughs> what is the name of Harry Potter's father? James Potter. I'm gonna try C. In the manga One Piece, uh, it's a great treasure. I know everything about manga now. I literally, I know everything about every manga now. Which of these phrases means having nothing in common pulls apart. And it's nothing to do with being Polish. What is the title of Dan Brown's best-selling book, The Da Vinci Code? This is going to be it, the speed run. A signet is a young of which animal? A swan. I'm choosing B. Which was a group of British anti-establishment writers in the 1950s? It's got to be the angry young man. Right Has to be. The others are just stupid B. names. <laughs> you miffed youngster, doesn't hit. In the fall of 2004, <laughs> which volcano erupted for the first time since 1986? If Zen wasn't supposed to plank, they would have given him footsteps. Is Sideshow cosplaying a black person in Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Does this count as blackface? Oh, I remember this. What the fuck? What the... Urkel. 
Thank you for the 39 months. Those are not the same thing in the slightest. <laughs> I know that, hey, with the, with the, with the funny, well, misogyny stuff, but whoa! <laughs> in the here, full... here, here. Let me bail you out really quickly. You should it's... know this. Who was the first woman inducted into the Esports Hall of Fame? I don't know what the Esports Hall of Fame is. Who was the first woman inducted into the Esports Hall of Fame? <laughs> Why, why are you throwing me in the volcano right now? You know that. <laughs> how you know am it. I, how, how do I, what do you mean I know it? You technically work with them. <laughs> technically work with them. Technically, yes. You watch their work every time you work. Hint, hint. Is it Potter? No. Is it Zoe? No. Is it... I watch them every time I work. Yes, you watch every their work time. every time you work. I watch their work every time. Oh, it's going to be... It's going to be... Somebody involved in, like, the game dev. It's going to be somebody involved in Riot, is it? No. No? I watch no. their work every mm -hmm. time I work. Um, it's what? Sapphire, aka Heather. Oh, you watch her every time you work. fuck! <laughs> wow, yeah, you've trolled me. No. You've absolutely trolled me. I think this is. I don't know I'm what this is. Is it Mount Saint Helens? I don't know. I believe so. Yeah. yeah. On which date is Canada's National Day? Oh, huge for the Canadians. Any Canadians in the chat? Any Canadians in chat? I, Tim fuck, I sucks. fucking hope not. I hope there aren't any Canadians in the chat. It's not going to be January 1st. You wouldn't put it on January 1st. That's just stupid. You wouldn't put it on April Fool's Day either. That's dumb. It's either going to be July 1st or October 1st. I think it's probably in July so that they can celebrate it at the same time as Independence Day. I think they've basically copied Independence Day. That's my logic here. <laughs> That's the right choice. The blueprint. So, yeah, and I'm correct. All right. I hope you ever <laughs> that is not true, someone said. Is your new <laughs> Graphite is a form of which element? Carbon. There we go, see? I'm, 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 I'm actually so smart. In Greek You're mythology, so with what or whom did Pygmalion fall in love? Pygmalion. It's not his reflection. That was Narcissus. Mm -hmm. It's not his... Uh, well, I don't think it's his mother. I mean, there, there might have been a lot of mother loving going on in Greek mythology. But, I mean, the classic story of fucking one's mother is Oedipus. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, I mean, Midas is who I would associate with gold but pygmalion mm -hmm. might also be gold that is a very that would make a very classic fable falling in love with money or it could be his own statue but that's a strange one i think it's more likely to have some kind of moral tale of not being falling in love with your own wealth you have life but to be honest i don't oh yeah i forgot about the lifelines I completely forgot about the lifelines. Okay, please Let's 50-50, and hopefully it isn't B&D. Okay, it's got to be a statue. It's not his reflection. That's Narcissus. Isn't it? I think that the Do you want me to help you out? No, I, I've sent, I've sent it. Yeah, yeah, it's a statue. Okay. They carve a, a, they carve a woman. Oh, it's not a statue of himself. Yes, I have heard of that uh, tale, actually. What is the name of the cruiser commanded by General Grievous during the Clone Wars? Malevolence. It's the only one that makes sense. It uh, Star Wars is so cheesy. They call the bad guy the bad guys always have bad guy things. 
malfeasance. There's no fucking way it's malfeasance. Credibility. Why on earth would it be called credibility? So it's either going to be Twilight or Malevolence, and I feel like it's probably Malevolence. I'm just going to send it. To I'm, I'm going to send it. I've got a good feeling about this. Yeah. Speedrunning it. Okay. Which good, comedy good, good. cop sported a car sticker proclaiming, I love violence? I've never heard of any of these. This is this is an ask the audience time. I've never heard of any hey, of these. Audience. They've fucked it. They've absolutely mm. fucked it. They couldn't have done a worse job with that, honestly. <laughs> they couldn't have done a worse job. I'm going to have to use my phone a friend as well. Who's going to know comedy cops? Tina. I'm married to Tina Fey. Oh! That's oh, crazy. I skipped all the dialogue. I don't know whether they're confident or not. That's dumb. I'm gonna try C. Is that your final answer? That'll be my final answer. <laughs> oh, you've popped off, Tina. You've popped off. <laughs> I can't believe I skipped the woman talking again. <laughs> Come on, George. Focus. What is the name of the company where Elliot Alderson works as an information security engineer in the series Mr. Robot? I don't know. I've never seen Mr. Robot before. The name of the company where Elliot Alderson, I assume that's the protagonist, works as an information security engineer. E Corp, F Society, All Safe Security, Wellick Incorporated. Oh, you did now, win an Emmy for it. Do Sorry, I... I just <laughs> I, I mean, I either just punt. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm feeling drawn to E Corp because F Society is there. Because it's just so silly to put something in that's called F Society unless you're trying to, you know, unless the real answer was E Corp and you were trying to throw people off with just letter with something afterwards. I'm drawn to E-Corp, but I think the safe thing to do, because I'm close to the end, is to swap. You choose okay. to use your flip lifeline. You are careful. Well done. I think it's gonna be A though. That would be that would be my guess. Oh, it was B. Oh, thank fuck for that. Thank God I used my skip. He's a hacker in the show. This yeah. question is now waiting for you. Played by Rami Malik. From what world do the first Sith come? Nah. <laughs> I did once do a stream of me reading. It was when I lost my eyebrows. I dressed up as Emperor Palpatine and did a reading stream of some, like, the the beginnings of Emperor Palpatine of like how he took over from I think the the one the Sith before him was called like Bane or something. That is a crazy sentence you just said. Yeah, yeah. None of those words were in the Bible. <laughs> um. So, do I do any of the? Okay, Malakor sounds like an evil planet. Mal. Ake, Ica, or Ica, I suppose. You know, it's got a lot of, like, just bad stuff in there. Zyost sounds like a good planet. It's like... Jaguada sounds like a car company. And Korriban sounds like somebody ran out of names and just went, how can I change the Caribbean into a planet? I'm gonna guess Malakor. Do I have any lifelines left? No, I'm gonna guess Malakor. It's it, it, yeah. I'm gonna guess it. It's it's got a, it's got a bad sound to it. I think that's yes, how authors that's tend to come up with names answer. like that. The choice is made. Ah, oh, it's Korriban. It's, okay. it's the end for you. It's okay. What a dumb mistake on my part it's okay really you see oh. how oh, that was the wrong answer. oh someone sounds tired is, you are walking out of here with your oh. guaranteed cash prize. <laughs> oh 
I got to 125,000. I was so close. I was We're so close. There. Now, I mean... Getting closer tomorrow. No, Josh, stop. Josh, enough. But if I if I got close this time, then I'll win the next time. You sound like a like a like a person in Atlantic City who was like, I got it this time, boys. Like Yeah, 99% of who wants to be a millionaire players stop before they win their first million. Right before they're about to win their first million. 99% <laughs> of them stop before their first big win. I'm gonna make a breakthrough and I'm gonna go to bed as a virtual millionaire. Beth, you'll never believe it. Eventually, if I play the game enough, I'll know all the answers because they'll have come up before. Oh, no. Which of these <laughs> are a type of narrow-legged trousers? Peace pipe, hose pipe, drain pipe, water pipe. I mean, a drain pipe is like a tube. So, but I mean, so is a hose pipe. But a hose pipe, a drain pipe is stiff and a hose pipe isn't. So I assume, I don't know. I'm, I'm going drain pipe. I don't know. Are you sure? It is, it's C. Okay. Interesting, I didn't know that. How many Harry Potter books are there, including the stage play sequel? Okay, I think there were nine Harry Potter movies, but they split the final book into three parts. Or two parts? Two parts. I don't fucking know. I, I'm gonna go for eight. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the answer to this. It's eight. Let's fucking go. Which of these superheroes was not an orphan when they put on their costume for the first time? Spider-Man was an orphan. Batman was an orphan. Batgirl, they probably made an orphan. Superman's parents are still alive, but on a different planet or something? I'm choosing B. You I noticed your hesitation. Superman's you also an orphan. Who the fuck He's killed orphan? Superman's parents? Who killed who, Superman's parents? Who Dumb kills Superman's parents? Really? Who kills Super His planet blew up. How did he survive? How did he survive? Did they send him away before? The planet exploded, that's why he left. Well, you can't leave a planet once it's exploded. He got launched to the Earth. He got sent away on an alien ship moments before. I have no- I don't know this kind of shit. I'm gonna okay. speedrun. I'm gonna speedrun from now on. I'm locking no, the fuck Josh, in. I'm locking Josh, the fuck in. Josh, you're acting- What common name actor. is given to the mustache in the back of the neck below- But What common name is given to the mustache in the back of the leg below the knee? Muscle! Muscle! muscle. You what can't even read! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. What common name is given to the muscle? The muscle in the back of the leg below the knee. The calf muscle. The calf muscle. The calf muscle. The calf muscle. I'm locking in. In what manga does Tanjiro try to restore his little sister Nezuko's humanity? Demon Slayer. I think that the right answer is B. You make it. Oh. I know manga. To escape a situation without any injury is to remain unscathed. I'm certain that it's B. I was a pure guess, chat. Well that was a pure guess, that previous manga one. Which class had the most different professors during Harry Potter's six years at Hogwarts? Defense Against the Dark Arts. I, I, literally every motherfucker wants to be the C. Defense Against the Dark Arts person. Um, Which Shakespeare play features the line, But soft, what light through yonder window breaks? I think that's Romeo and Juliet, isn't it? No more hesitating. I'm gonna say D. Yeah, it was. Yeah. What was Lumiere's job at the Beast Castle before he was transformed into a candelabra? B, I'll guess. B, I'll guess. But I'll say this to the. Les poissons, les poissons. How I love les poissons. They just use the same song for both, by the way. <laughs> it's exactly the same song. <laughs> what was Lumiere's job at the Beast Castle before it was transformed into a candelabra? <laughs> but 
Butler. I'm gonna try C. Are you what is a maitre d? Not the right answer. He sings it and be our guess. That's why I say what, it's what, 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 what is, what is, what is that? What it's is like a, a maitre d? Like a host, essentially. Oh. So basically a butler. No. I mean, they sound very similar. How about me? Where did the Battle of Christophesis take place during the Clone War? Christophesis. Uh, no more hesitating. I'm going to say D. Are you absolutely sure? That's what we were looking for. That's right. Is the game feeling sorry for me? Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Complete the title of the children's TV series from the mid-1990s, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Uh, I'm certain. Who is the main character in Riverdale? Riverdale? Oh my god. Riverdale? What is Riverdale? It's a show on the CW, but it's also a comic strip. So I wouldn't... Oh, too. so it's a manga. Is this part of the manga genre? Technically, yeah. Sure, it's a comic. But, um... It's not going to be Hermione. Nobody right. was called Hermione before Harry Potter. It's gonna, you know it because the main character is called I'm Elizabeth. Try C. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. We go again. Fuck. No, you don't. Oh my god, it's been 10 hours and 37 Fuck. minutes. <laughs> <sighs> oh my god. This is, this is so doable. This is so fucking doable. No, it's not. It's so bro. doable. When Goldilocks went, porridge. Porridge. I see Goldilocks, I click Porridge. Wolverine does not have which of these superpowers? Laser eyes. I'm gonna try C. I know that one. Well In physics, which of these is not a light source? A mirror. I'm choosing C. I mean, not just in physics, in, in life. In uh, the universe in which we inhabit. Right answer? <laughs> which of these countries has a red, white, and blue flag? France. C. That's huh. the right choice. Who's excited in total, for Paris how many millimeters are there in a meter? 1,000. 1,000. I'm choosing C. Hank Pym has never been which of these heroes? Who the fuck is Hank Pym? <laughs> Who the fuck is Hank Pym? Okay, wait there, wait there, wait there. Ant-Man, Giant-Man, Goliath. Those all might be... Okay, Hank Pym might be not the name of an actor, as I originally re thought, but in fact might be the name of the character that turns into one of the superheroes in the comic. If the actor turns into Ant-Man by having some experiment and turning small, they might have an experiment that turns them big into Giant-Man. Or into Goliath. But Ant-Man and Iron Man are different heroes. So there's no fucking way that Hank Pym is Ant-Man and Iron Man. It just doesn't make sense. It's got to be Iron Man. There's no way that it's Iron Man. Dude, logic. Logic. Reasoning. Logic. What is the name of the bounty hunter's hero... What is the name of the bounty hunter hero's ship in the Mandalorian? I don't know the answer to this. But the audience will. But also... Yeah, the, okay, the audience will know. The audience didn't know. Oh, no. The audience had no idea. You bastards. You sick bastards. The audience has women in it. <laughs> yeah, and guess what? All of the women voted for the correct answer, and all of the fucking men voted for <laughs> the incorrect answer. <laughs> And I have no information about what the rest of everybody else did. Um, Ebon Hawk Razor Crest. Which one do we think? The Ebon Hawk Razor Crest. What is the name Would of the bounty like hunter hero from ship? MCE? From MCE? MCE knows, MCE yes, knows like it. Right yes. Would you like a lifeline? Wait, let me think about this. If MCE knows it, MCE loves birds. Big ornithologist. It's the Ebon I'm Hawk. Fuck! 
Fuck. Fuck. Oh, fuck. MT, buddy. No, brother in Christ. Fuck. End the fucking stream. No. No, I won't. I won't. I won't. <laughs> I'm ending it when I get to a million. We're popping champagne bottles when I get to a million. <laughs> and then we're ending the stream. Who did American actor Angelina Jolie marry? Brad Pitt, wasn't it? Going to say yes. A, okay? It was Brad Pitt. According to the Aristocats, what does a cat know? Because only a cat knows where it's at. D seems pretty good. I'm going to say D. Everybody wants to be a cat because the cat's the only cat who knows where it's at. From what country does Harissa come? Ooh, shit. Oh shit. It's fucking awesome, I can tell you that. Harissa goes crazy. As for where it's from? Couldn't tell you. Don't know? Gonna ask the audience. Okay, audience. Tunisia, I'm apparently. Okay. Didn't know that. Which of these is the term for any rosé or pink wine? Question. My favorite. Gotta be, gotta be, favorite, gotta be blush, doesn't it? Which of, th which of these is the term for any rosé or pink wine? I mean, it's the only one that's red out of... The well, I suppose lipstick is, but you wouldn't call wine lipstick. That'd I'm be so weird. Tea. It's got to be blush. That's a, a cult classic murder mystery series of 1990s was called Twin Peaks, right? Twin Peaks? I'm choosing C. Mm -hmm. Twin Peaks? Which of these phrases associated with the term of office of James Callaghan? This is our winter of discontent. D seems pretty good. I'm going to say D. I don't know why I know that phrase, but according to the title of her 2009 single, where was Katy Perry waking up? Waking oh my up. God. Waking up. What? It's what, genuinely what, what? a pretty good song. One of her songs is called Waking Up in Reno or Waking Up in Vegas or Waking Up in New York or Waking Up in New Orleans. I mean, yes. you would only title a song Waking Up in Vegas, wouldn't you? It's got, I feel like you would. Me. I feel like that's the only one that makes sense as a song title. Yeah. What chocolate frog did Harry find when he first met Ron? Dumbledore, because it's how they introduce the character, isn't it? Uh, no more hesitating. I'm going to say D. I don't even know who the others are. Yeah. Who created the character of Kamala Khan, a.k.a. Ms. Marvel? I mean, I would assume it's Stan Lee, because Stan Lee is the Marvel D dude. Seems pretty good. I'm gonna say D. <gasps> <laughs> no! I was speed running! I was fucking speed running! What? No! 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 <laughs> you didn't pick a woman. <laughs> that's, what I'm that's what I said to you. You're Put it down. Put the game Wait. down. Was the was the right answer a woman? I, I didn't even look at the other answers apart from Stan Lee. What if what if we stopped? What is the name for putting up advertising posters in a it's fly posting? See, that's the right choice. <laughs> Come on, what is the name of Ariel's focus. best fish friend? Flipper. Flounder! <laughs> Ariel's best fish friend. Flounder. I nearly got baited. I nearly oh got baited. Oh my god. Who's Harry Potter's godfather? <laughs> Don't know. Uh, uh, no oh no! I'm gonna say Don't care. Who is the rival of Mashiro and Tagaki in Bakuman? Who is the rival of Mashiro and... Ask the audience. Any manga fans? Yes, lots of manga fans. So many manga fans. <laughs> what kind of animal is Timon? Timon. Prairie dog. Ooh, or a meerkat. Ooh, shit. <laughs> Ooh, shit. Ooh, fuck. They're so similar. They're so <laughs> damn similar. These damn animals are so damn similar. He like... <laughs> it's a meerkat, isn't it? That's a meerkat, isn't it? Yeah. What's the name of Andrew Lloyd Webber's cello playing brother? James Lloyd Webber, Julian Lloyd Webber, Jocelyn Jeffrey Lloyd Webber. Don't know. Don't know. Who? Uh, phone a friend? Uh, 
Uh, my aunt. My aunt will know this. For sure, my aunt will know this. Good evening, Noor. Sir Andrew Lloyd Webber. B. It's Julian. I'm Julian Lloyd Webber. I'm certain. That's a Who made the prophecy that a child born at the end of July would defeat Voldemort? I don't know. I'm choosing A. By what name is the writer Charles Ludwig Dodgson? Better known. That's, that's Lewis Carroll. answer is B. According to George Bernard Shaw, which two countries are divided? That's America and England. Which toy do Woody and Bo Peep want to save at the beginning of Toy Story 4? Oh, I've never seen Toy Story 4. Shit. Getting owned by not watching a Disney movie. That's fucking foolish of me. That is foolish of me. Which toy do Woody and Bo Peep want to save at the beginning of Toy Story 4? It's not going to be a spaceship because they anthropomorphize things. It could be the remote control car. Because that is one of the previous um, characters. Could also be toy soldiers, but it says which toy. So toy soldiers would be weird because it's plural. It could also be... Is Toy Story 4 the one where the stuffed... Bear ends up being the bad guy? Is that the stuffed animal they're referring to? But then why be so vague, a stuffed animal? I'm gonna go 50-50. It's a remote control car. It's not gonna be a spaceship. That's just that's just insane. It's not gonna be a spaceship. What is the official language of Pakistan? Can I give it to you so you can just keep on going? No. Uh. So, a lot of people in the UK do Urdu as a foreign language, but for some reason, Farsi is screaming the correct answer to me. And I don't know why. Official language of Pakistan. I mean, it might be neither of them. I, I'm, I'm ignorant, but... <sighs> Fuck. This is easy, dude. I don't know it. That's the problem. <laughs> oh, I don't know what the official language is. Oh my god, it's your lifeline, Liz. I can help you um, answer it. I could swap questions. What What am I on? I'm only on 32. I might as well take a punt. I'm going with Farsi. I'm it's just my gut. It was Urdu. Oh, Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. The end for you. Oh, no, I'm so stupid. Oh, Farsi's oh, Iran. Dude, I'm so news, dumb, man. You are walking out of here with yeah, I'm so oh, dumb. Oh, no. That's so okay. You can dumb. tackle it. You tackle it in the afternoon when you go to bed. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's a great idea, actually. I think I think I should call it there. Yes, there we go. Yeah. There. What are you doing? Just, I mean, I should call it there. I agree with you. I agree. I agree. That I should. But should and will are very separate concepts. <laughs> oh. I'm speedrunning this. I'm actually I'm I'm done pretending. Which of these is fuddy duddy. No more hesitating. I'm gonna say D. Final <laughs> What's the name of the thoroughfare? Wall Street. I'm certain that it's B. That's during which World Cup year was the v VAR system introduced? Uh, it's pretty recent, wasn't it? We're I think it was quite recent. A. Okay. You, you really well now. What is the name of the hero from the series 24? 
I knew his name was Jack, and that's not helped me at all. I think it's Jack Bauer. I think that the right answer is B. You big... In Money Heist, who is Rio? I would like a new question. I do not even know what that question was. What is written on the cookies that make Alice bigger when she eats them? Eat me. C. That's the right choice. You agree. Nemo's a clownfish, but what kind of fish is Dory? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. And they didn't know about the woman fish? That's crazy. Oh, the, come on. Nemo was... <laughs> Nemo was... I don't know what... A clownfish. I don't know what gender Nemo was, though. I have no idea. He, 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 was, he was Marlin's son. Oh. Um, what kind of fish is Dory? She's blue? <laughs> it's between these two. I think it's a blue tank. I think it's a blue tank. I popped off. Beyonce was featured on Telephone, a 2010 hit single for what artist? Telephone. Hello, hello, baby. You called. I can hear a thing. That sound familiar? No. Oh. I think it's Lady I'm Gaga. D. I popped off. In a book, what would normally be printed on the fly leaf? Fly leaf. Fly leaf. The fly leaf. Fly leaf. Fly leaf? There is often a page at the beginning of a book that doesn't have anything on it. It's not going to be the index. Could it be the title that would be possible i think it's gonna be nothing or title it might be notable because there's nothing printed on it i feel like this is a trick and it's nothing i'm gonna try c <laughs> yes dude i read through those i read through those as what is the austrian born fritz lang remembered i don't remember him I just, I don't remember him. <laughs> Fritz Lang. Fritz Lang. Uh, that's an Ask the Audience. An explorer. I knew that, actually. Austrian-born explorer. <gasps> you fucking lied to me! No big deal. You fucking lied to me! Well, at least you didn't lose... Oh, man. I see the audience wants to see you go to bed. Isn't that crazy? Let me ask you something before you try hitting play again. Do you like democracy? Do I like democracy? Do you like democracy? I'm obligated to say yes, I think. Yes, and you. so you see how everyone in chat is when I ask them, hey, chat, would you like to see Josh go to bed? And they're going to most likely say, go to bed. Yes. There's a poll running at the moment. Go okay. to bed, yes versus no. No is currently winning. No oh is God, currently God. destroying. Guys. <laughs> no is currently fucking destroying. Oh I, God, love I love democracy. <laughs> I love democracy. I love democracy. Oh, I love democracy. <laughs> I love democracy. Oh my God. <laughs> I love democracy. God damn, I love democracy. We go again. <laughs> I cannot believe I just walked into that. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. All right. Wait, do I have stuff to do early tomorrow morning? Oh my god, now you're checking? Let's go for this new eliminatory question. <gasps> <laughs> yeah. I do. You do? Hmm. That's crazy. I arranged to go and see my grandma. Josh. I can't bail on my grandma. 
<laughs> I've got to get a million quick. I've got to get a million quick so I can go to bed. I've got. I've got to get a million quick. Okay. I've got to get a million quick. Which of these characters actually exists in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? Uh, 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 Jean Louis Halliday, Jean Michel Mitchell, Jean Pierre Polnareff, Jean Luc Lama. I don't know. JPP. I'm gonna try C. Oh my god, what a guess. Which of these is an informal name for a violin, a fiddle? What a fucking guess on the manga question. I'm popping off. Complete the title of the popular hymn, Onward Christian Soldiers. It's a... Mm, 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 mm. In total, how many pints are there in a gallon? Okay, a gallon is four and a half liters, which means there are nine pints in a gallon. That's a problem because nine is not an option. But I think the closest number to nine here is eight. Just doing some quick maths, but I believe the closest number to nine is eight. So I think it's got to be eight I'm pints in a gallon. This money is Primarily, what type of ingredient makes up minestrone? Ooh. Minestrone. <laughs> not me not knowing the Italian food question. I assume it's Italian. Minestrone. Minestrone. What type of ingredient makes up minestrone? I think that's probably... A vegetable <laughs> soup? Minestrone. It's a vegetable soup, a minestrone. I'm choosing D. Final. That is, is it? In which organ, organ, is insulin produced? Now, I'ma get fucking destroyed if I get this one wrong. I'ma get absolutely destroyed. Now, now, unfortunately... Why are you, why are you, No, Josh, don't say what you're about to say. <laughs> 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 you to say now, Josh? again, as I mentioned earlier... I basically didn't study at all in med school, but this <laughs> should be a gimme. It's the pancreas, right? Dude, if I'm wrong, if I'm wrong, I've absolutely fucked it, chat. It's the pancreas. In what season of the series Spartacus does the character of Gannicus appear for the first time? Okay, audience. Don't fuck me here. That's a crazy question. <laughs> <laughs> you are you pricks you absolute pricks in the audience oh my god in roman mythology bacchus was the god of what oh wine i believe oh i'm not sure it could be poetry but i think it's wine i think i've seen something on a vase about bacchus being the god of wine what is the name of harry potter's friend I'm going Hermione. To on, Which George. Prime Minister made Focus. the famous Wind of Change speech? Ugh. Wind of Change speech. I mean, we got one right with Churchill's speech earlier. I would imagine it's Churchill again. Chamberlain, I don't think, was famous for his speeches, but... I'm gonna... I'm gonna guess it's Churchill. It just has to be, right? I, I think so. Wind of change. I just don't know. I just don't have a... I, we... Uh, where am I up to? I'm up to 32k. Let's let's call. I hope you're not. My wife will know. 
My wife, the American, she'll know. Hello, this is who wants C, Macmillan. I don't know who the fuck C. that is. You are so goated, Tina. From which modern day country <laughs> did the Celtic tribe called the Scotty originally come? From which modern day country did the Celtic tribe called the Scotty originally come? And it's not Scotland. Josh, what does Celtic mean? Well, there are Celts in Scotland as well. I mean, I'm, the, the obvious pick here is Ireland. But I'm just saying, there's an obvious one that's missing here. Say a. Okay. That is a. What was Al Capone's real first name? I mean, Alphonse sounds the most likely. Alphonse Capone? It's a great name. I'm, I'm going to send it. Alphonse. What is the name for a small country completely surrounded by a larger one? It's not concave. It's not enslave. Enclave or conclave? I think it's an enclave, isn't it? Enclave? An enclave? I think it's an enclave. No more hesitating. I don't really I'm going to say D. It's an enclave. Like Lesotho. When was the magazine Weekly Shonen Jump first published? Nah. Nah, mate, you can't do that to me. You absolutely can't do that to me. New question, please. You, you. Wait, what do you mean, last question? What do you mean, last question? Wait, what do you mean, last question? Is this the final one before I get a million? Yes. Holy fuck. How many letters were in the original Armenian alphabet? I mean, I should just okay, use my 50-50. 32 or 36. How many letters were in the original... <laughs> I, I can't get fucked here like this. I can't get fucked here like this. I, can't, I just... I don't have it in me. I've got to go to bed. I've got to go to bed. I've got to go and see my grandma in the morning. I, I, I've got to go and see my grandma in the fucking morning, man. I can't do this. I can't do this. How many letters were in the original Armenian alphabet? Ah. 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 I don't know. I don't know. I think, okay, here's, here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm thinking is that there are 26 in our alphabet, probably 36 in theirs. Because it's got a six in it. That's my only reference point. I don't have any more lifelines, do I? No, you're out. C. That's the right choice. Final answer? You sure? Yes, that's my final answer. If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. Yes, 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 yes. Let's fucking go. I'm a millionaire. I'm a fucking millionaire, chat. I'm a millionaire. I'm a fucking millionaire. I know there's 36 letters in the Armenian alphabet. I studied Armenian. I fucking know that shit. I lived in Glendale. I know that shit. Holy fuck. Wow, no questions about women and you can do it. That's crazy. There were questions about women in there. No, where there weren't. Um. One there? No. <laughs> there were no questions about women in there no. at all. <laughs> there were no questions about women. <laughs> <laughs> oh listen, no listen 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 i'm gonna have to do it again i'll have to do it again no, until no, i get some no, questions about women no you're not gonna get them right josh I, i've got i've got to prove it i've got to prove it <laughs> no you know what i've accomplished my goal support women see uh, your grandmother in the morning that's so true actually that's so true look at that 
brilliant work, everyone. GG. GG. You did it. You did it. I'm going to head out. Are God you, bless, Josh. <laughs> are you carrying on streaming? Uh, yeah, I'm going to play a little bit again soon. Okay. But, yeah. I'm going to send people in your direction. Oh, God bless. All right, y'all. Come on. Come on in, friends. Get rest. Go to bed. Okay, bye. How, does, does Liz spell Elizabeth with a Z or an S? Fuck. It's probably a Z, isn't it? What's an S? You're fucking up her name even now? Oh my god. Stop, chat. Stop. Stop. I... I'm never living this stream down. This, in some sense, was worse than the Pokemon Smash or Pass. This was appalling, a travesty. I think it's done more. I think this is going to have more repercussions. I think once word gets to Yinsu and Kakuka that I couldn't remember their surnames, it's fucking over for me. It's actually so over for me. Oh. 